A man awakens the world's strongest super armor, which can be obtained by breaking others' armor. However, this invincible armor is ridiculed and despised by everyone, all because of the global distortion that has arrived, turning all global flora and fauna into man-eating monsters, and humans will awaken the power of armor to fight against the terrifying demon race together. In the previous life, although I awakened the strongest human super armor, I was still framed by my girlfriend and perished here, spending a lifetime in a dark prison cell. But in the last moment of my life, the energy of the armor in my body suddenly exploded. My consciousness gradually blurred, and when I opened my eyes, I found myself back three hours before the distortion. In this life, I return with the super armor, destined to stand at the pinnacle of the world. Just as I was rejoicing, a mocking voice sounded in my ear. Su Hao, go to the cafeteria and help us get the food. At this moment, another person sneered. Remember to pay for yourself, or I'll break your lackey legs. I watched them leave in silence, clenched my fists silently. Shannon, the number one lackey of the rich second generation Lin Yi, served as the minister of security of the Huaxia Mecca Alliance after being his lackey in the previous life. As for Lin Yi, he is the person I hate the most and want to strangle with my own hands. In my past life, I married the school beauty Bai Lu. In my eyes, Bai Lu was perfect elegant in the hall, skilled in the kitchen, simply the embodiment of a goddess. But in secret, Bai Lu was a tool for Lin Yi and her marriage to me was just a task given by Lin Yi. Thinking about this, the cruelty faded from my eyes, revealing a hint of contemplation. In another three hours, distortion would come. Bai Lu, Lin Yi, your good days are about to end soon. I clenched my fists, quickly planning in my mind. First, Bai Lu must be killed. Not only for revenge, but also because Bai Lu's mecha talent, called overclocking, had reached S level. Such a high level talent must be devoured and made my own. Lost in thought, I dialed by Lu's number. When the call connected, a soft voice came through. Su Hao, what do you want? By Lu's voice was restrained, as if she was doing some exercise. I sneered inwardly, knowing that at this time, Bai Lu should be with Lin Yi, pretending nothing was wrong. I said, come to the school warehouse in two hours. I have prepared a gift for you that will definitely surprise you. With that, I hung up the phone and headed towards the school warehouse. Two hours passed quickly, and the warehouse door was pushed open. A beautiful woman walked in. Is he sick? Why did he invite me to such a place? Bai Lu muttered softly, but immediately put on a smile. Su Hao, I'm here. Where are you? At that moment, the door slammed shut, startling Bai Lu. As she turned around, a figure rushed out from the shadows and wrapped a rope around her neck. The rope tightened suddenly. Bai Lu's eyes bulged, blood vessels visible, her face turning red and purple from the pressure. As Su Hao, Bai Lu struggled to speak, but I just laughed. You and Linny are having a great time. Did you really think I wouldn't know? Bai Lu panicked. How did he find out? Just then, my alarm clock went off, and suddenly the energy inside me erupted. Strange black patterns spread across my body, like ethereal gas, more like colorful mysterious substances. Name, Su Hao. Talent, demonization of all paths. Level, F. Note, unlimited growth talent can devour the talents of others' mechas when fighting against them, making them my own. Seeing this, a smile crept up on my lips, then I exerted all my strength to tighten the rope. Bai Lu looked at me in disbelief, the choking sensation in her neck making it hard for her to speak. Seeing her expression, I just smiled cruelly. After releasing the rope, I looked at Bai Lu, lifeless, without a hint of mercy in my eyes. This kind of woman deserves to die. I placed my palm on Bai Lu's head and commanded in my mind, devour. Instantly, a black light enveloped Bai Lu, and this was my talent. In an instant, it upgraded from the lowest level F to S, and I successfully devoured by Lu's talent. Overclocking, a hint of madness appeared on my lips, the pleasure of revenge. At that moment, my energy erupted again, and I let out a long howl, my body covered in a layer of hard armor, resembling Iron Man from a Marvel movie, exuding an indescribable artistic beauty. When the last piece of armor was assembled, white steam emanated from the mecha, displaying a majestic and ruthless metallic aura. Engraved on the chest plate was an inspiring character. Zero. Then, the mecha information appeared in front of me. Codename, Unit Zero. Level, B. Quality, Normal. Mecha Talent 1, Demonization of all paths, can devour the opponent's talent and make it my own. Mecha Talent 2, Overclocking, enhances all attributes of the mecha by 10% within 30 minutes. I looked at my hands, trembling with excitement. And in my mind, I saw the ugly face of Linny. In my past life, I worked in the intelligence department and knew the information of most people, including Lin Yi, whose name is Lin Yi. Talent, Blasphemy. Talent level, SSS. It has three effects. Effect 1. 
can blaspheme the corpses of dead enemies multiple times, with a chance to drop more materials, crystals, blueprints, etc. Effect 2, resurrect the dead bodies, turning them into undead to fight for him. Effect 3, can absorb life energy from surrounding living beings when they die, and it was precisely by virtue of blasphemy that he became a high-ranking figure in the Chinese Mech Alliance, with an overwhelming influence. If I could make blasphemy my own, I would have the capital for rapid development in the early stages. Thinking of this, I opened Bai Lu's phone and saw the message Linny had sent to Bai Lu, Ixing Hotel. Seeing the message, I crushed the phone in one hand, and my figure disappeared instantly. At this moment, in the room of Ixing Hotel, Linny stood in front of the French window, with his upper body naked and his lower body wrapped in a towel, talking excitedly on the phone with his family. Dad, I have awakened. Still at SSS level, the heavens have eyes. There is hope for both of us to return to the ancestral home. On the other end of the phone, Lin's father was even more excited. The Lin family is one of the top three families in China. Years ago, due to some incidents, Lin's father was expelled from the clan and had been living in obscurity in the city. He had been looking for an opportunity to restore the family's glory and vent his past grievances. Now the opportunity has come, with the new era approaching and Lin Yi awakening his SSS talent, undoubtedly allowing the Lin family to stand firm and become the elite of China and even the entire Blue Star. Before the two could finish their conversation, there was a knock on the door. Linny turned to look at the door, thinking Bai Lu had returned, and a wicked fire surged within him. He quickly said, Dad, I will go back tomorrow, and hung up the phone. He walked towards the door, habitually looking through the peephole. The other party was wearing a black hooded sweatshirt, his head lowered, and he didn't say a word. Linny frowned. He wasn't stupid either. A new era had come and a stranger suddenly came and didn't give his identity. There was definitely something wrong with this, but without waiting for him to react, the stranger outside violently raised his foot and viciously kicked at the door. There was a thud, the entire door of the room slammed down, and Linny couldn't dodge in time before he was knocked out and fell heavily to the ground. You, just after uttering a single word, Linny felt himself fly. More accurately, his entire body was grabbed. Within sight, a thick white mecha with a hint of yellow grabbed his ankles in a death grip and threw him into the bathroom tub. Instantly, Cold water washed over his brain. The sharp pain in his body and the coldness in his flesh made Lin Yi's entire being incomparably awake. Friend, there's something to discuss. We don't have to get physical. Lin Yi was furious inside, but remained calm. He needed a moment to summon his mech so that he could reverse the situation. Su Hao looked at Lin Yi's face, a face he had hated for decades, and all his resentment and anger was completely ignited at this moment. Without a word, he raised his hand and shattered the ceiling, ripping off the wires that were flickering with fire and took a step towards the bathtub. Lin Yi's sweaty hair stood on end as he said in horror. Don't 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 don't. Would you talk nicely to a dead man? A mocking voice came from within the mech. Lin Yi thought the voice sounded familiar, and his pupils suddenly contracted. Su Hao, it's you? The Zero's head armor retracted, revealing Su Hao's face, his expression clear and cold, his eyes violent. That's right, it's me. Su Hao's voice was like a devil returning from hell. With that, he threw the wire into the bathtub. Linny was shocked and angry. He couldn't figure out how this punk dared to come and kill him. In desperation, he began to roar inwardly. Change. If he didn't summon his mech, he really was going to die. Buzz. Ghostly blue ruins spread out from Linny's chest. But at that moment, a huge mecha iron fist came crashing down heavily, cracking all his teeth and forcibly interrupting the mecha summoning. Bai Lu is already on her way. You follow her. Su Hao grabbed Lin Yi's head and pushed his entire body into the bathtub. Crackle. All of a sudden, lights flashed and sparks flew everywhere. Lin Yi's body convulsed, like a fish struggling for survival. His eyes were filled with fear, and he didn't know if he was regretting what he had done, or regretting that he hadn't gotten Su Hao killed earlier. One second. Two seconds. Three seconds. Time passed slowly. Lin Yi's eyes rolled white, his skin became reddish, and he kept twitching violently accompanied by a burst of white smoke rising up. Su Hao coldly watched the scene. He felt very cool, very comfortable, very pleasurable. The cycle of karma, retribution. If Lin Yi hadn't planted evil causes, he wouldn't have borne today's evil fruits. Soon, it was all over. Su Hao fished Lin Yi out and directly activated, I transformed the 10,000 paths. Devour. Black light instantly enveloped Lin Yi. Your level is changing. S class elevated to SS class. SS level elevated to SSS level. Devouring successful. A separate crystal appeared in Su Hao's hand. A ghostly blue color. Flickering with an unspeakable dark light. Crystal. Blasphemy. Effect 1. Heresy. 
active can desecrate the corpse of a dead enemy multiple times, with the probability of dropping more materials, crystals, drawings, etc. Currently at level 0. Remarks, 22% chance of successful desecration, level 1, 32%, level 2, 42%, level 3, 52%, level 4, 62%. Level 5, 70%, each corpse consumed consumes 1 point of energy value, range is 20 meters, increasing the level of crystals expands the range. Effect 2, army of the dead, active at my command, die again for me, can summon back from the dead enemies, creatures, spirits, for your own use, lasts for 1 minute, currently level 0, remarks, level 1, 2 minutes, level 2, 3 minutes, level 3, 4 minutes, level 4, 5 minutes, level 5, 10 minutes. Each summoning consumes 50 energy points. Effect 3, Black Blood, passive if there is death around you. You can draw life value from it. After reading the introduction of, Desecration, Suhao couldn't help but suck in a breath of cold air. I finally understand why Lin Yi was the face of the Chinese Mecha Alliance in his previous life. As long as he's around, there's never a shortage of materials and props. However, I prefer being a lone wolf. As long as my own battle power is strong enough, I can completely replace the entire team. Su Hao smiled coldly at Lin Yi, your crystals are good, they're mine now. Afterwards, he made a slight movement of his mind. Army of the Undead. A black, tattered cloak appeared behind Zero's back, the armor covering his head fluctuating slightly, like a ronin walking the earth. Shu, a ghostly blue light wrapped around Lin Yi's body, as if ghosts were hijacking his shell, and he staggered to his feet with a wooden expression. Master, at your service. His voice was hoarse. Su Hao walked outside and smiled. I'll go downstairs. You, jump. Yes, Lin Yi replied woodenly. After saying this, he turned around and slammed into the landing window. Clang. The roiling glass, mixed with the cold wind, fell straight down from the high floor. Bang. The heavy object landed on the ground. Screams then rang out on the street. A dead body was lying at the entrance of the Upper Star Hotel, blood flowing continuously, staining the ground red, as if telling of the sins he had committed. It's the young master of the Lin family. Why did he jump to his death? Shocked voices rang out. The entire street was in chaos. As for Su Hao, who was the one who started it all? He just coldly glanced at him, then turned around and didn't enter the crowd. He came only to kill. All the strife. All the commotion. What did it have to do with him? Su Hao didn't go back to school, but found a random shortcut hotel. He waved at the table and wrote down a large page full of names. All of these people are either carrying a felony or have bullied me before. And moreover, all of their, independent crystals, are of great use to me, since I decided to become a chess player, I can't have mercy, Su Hao's eyes were resolute, with the advent of a new era, everyone had a chance to turn over a new leaf, the Huaxia Mecha Alliance belonged to the official forces, untouchable, but behind it, there were countless civil organizations, for example, in the Cherry Blossom country, there are forces such as the Shadow Village, the Great Pirate Corps, and the Saya Combat Clan, then, for example, in the United States of America, there are the White Regiment and the Upright Regiment. There were also Bear Country, Tianju Country, and other countries with notable existences. Many foreigners were also put on Su Hao's hunting list. But now that the awakening had just begun, his main focus was still on Huaxia. Citizens don't panic. Everything is under control. Only adults over 18 years old will hear that voice, as well as awaken the so-called Market Mark. The country will find a cure as soon as possible so that it can be completely controlled. The sound of a news broadcast came from the TV. Su Hao couldn't help but shake his head. This was just the beginning. When the market realm officially descended, it would be the real chaos. After the market realm descends, the trial copy opens. I want to level up to 10 as soon as possible. Be the first one to break through extreme sublimation and open the level cap. And also, stock up on supplies in advance. Su Hao wrote and drew on the paper, planning in detail. After reaching level 10, the level would be locked and one had to enter the illusion of beings and complete a specific copy in order to lift the level cap. The so-called extreme sublimation was an important location to open the level cap, unbind oneself, and strengthen the mech. After level 11 opens, the blue star will change, obelisks will rise from all over the world, and at the same time, the land will lose 50% of its nutrition. Thinking of this, Su Hao looked at a name on the paper, Zhao Hong. Zhao Hong is in the city, not far from here. After the novice copy ends, he is the first hunting target, Zhao Hong, Mi City's chief philanthropist in the open. But secretly, he was an underground emperor who manipulated pornography, gambling, and drugs. After he awakened the suffocating wormhole, he was like a fish out of water in the future world. 
Turning into a big shot to save China in one fell swoop, Zhao Hong had a lot of power in the city, it was not realistic for Su Ha to hunt him now, it was best to start acting after the novice copy had improved his strength. 2035, January 1st, the moment the second hand pointed to the last second, a voice rang in everyone's head, after one hour, all humans who have successfully awakened will enter the strange shadow of decay, please survive for 24 hours, the two sentences were like a bomb exploding in everyone's mind, for a moment, the world panicked, rush rush rush, I'm going to enter the unknown world in an hour and I'm still a virgin, what should I do, whatever, I'll go find my family's Wang Kai, Decaying Stranger's Shadow? Sounds like a copy of the game. Will it kill people? I've only just turned 18, and you're letting me go to my death? A large number of posts instantly appeared on the internet. Su Hao ignored these and focused on, Decaying Stranger's Shadow. Please choose your own location to enter. Dark Dungeon. Biochemical Crisis. Anaconda's Plague. Su Hao immediately chose the Dark Dungeon. As for why, he had his own plans. Time Countdown 3, 2, 1. Welcome to the Decaying Stranger's Shadow. The void was like cracking open, swallowing Su Hao in. The originally noisy world became quiet at this moment. Location, Dark Dungeon. Difficulty, Trial, Only Once. Task, Survive for 24 Hours, Just a Reminder. Please pay attention to your torch. Don't let it go out. World Description, Darkness, Dampness, and Coldness are synonymous with this place. I hope you don't have rheumatism, or you'll die a particularly painful death. The moment the sun fell, people knew that they would never see the sunlight again and would only be able to walk on the dark earth while facing those abominable monsters. Please ignore the murmured whispers ringing in your ears, and please don't attack the thing that taps you on the shoulder as the firelight dims. The dungeon, the only place where you can unearth the secret of why the sun fell, he, perhaps, is in, a dimly lit dungeon with a damp floor, not knowing if it was water or some creature's liquid. A torch stuck in the wall was whistling and burning. A white with a hint of yellow mech stood in place, its shoulders draped in a black tattered cloak resembling an ascetic ronin. Suddenly, the head armor lit up. A beam of light shot into the dark dungeon. Graveyard of newbies. Dark dungeon. Su Hao revealed a smile. The difficulty of the dark dungeon was far above Monty Python in Resident Evil. In the dark dungeon, you had to keep an eye on the torches at all times. High brightness had positive buff, while low brightness would stack negative buff. In other terms, that's, San is too low. Ak is coming. Of course, the higher the difficulty, the more generous the reward. This was why, Su Hao would choose the Dark Dungeon. In addition to that, the Dark Dungeon had a lot of small monsters. For Su Hao, who possessed, profanity, the more monsters there were, the more materials, props, and crystals would be popped out. This trial copy was simply made for him. Rustling. Suddenly, a strange sound rang out ahead, like some kind of arthropod knocking on the old and smelly ground. A pale yellow spider the size of a calf appeared. Poison Spider. Attributes, Strength 5. Defense 3, Agility 7, Characteristics, its 8 legs can be very sensitive when moving, and its saliva carries a fierce toxin, so be sure to kill it with a single blow, weakness, everything, evaluation, battle scum, the poisonous spider immediately locked onto Su Hao, a piercing sound coming out of its mouth, its spider legs bending and bursting out, directly pouncing on Zero's head, heresy, mecha reinforcement, Su Hao's gaze condensed, bloodline patterns like the human one surfaced on machine Zero's body, and all its attributes instantly skyrocketed. The thick iron fist swung and blasted out with full force. Put. The poisonous spider was blown into mud by the punch, splattering against the wall. Ten experience points gained. A trace of market world aura surged into Su Hao's market tattoo. At the same time, a ghostly head emerged from the corpse of the poisonous spider, and was grimly gnawing on the broken pieces of the corpse, as if enjoying it very much. It didn't take long for a glittering crystal to burst out from the corpse. Su Hao took it in his hand and laughed. Good luck. The desecration was successful. Attached crystal, life force, quality, ordinary. Effect, enhances the life value of the mech. Currently at level 0. Increases life value by 40% after loading. Up to level 10. Description, feel the temperature of life sublimation. Mechs can be loaded with three types of crystals. They are, core crystals, accessory crystals, and, independent crystals. Core crystals, extremely rare. Once loaded can drastically change a mech's appearance. Attributes and abilities. Attachment crystal can be viewed as a numerical extension of the mech, increasing a certain value or giving it an attribute attack. Independent crystal exclusively belongs to the human who owns the market pattern, can't be copied, can't be exploded, and can't be traded. Suha looked at the life force in his hand and immediately chose to load it. All of a sudden, he only felt the life breath of his flesh, mech, skyrocket. 
Codename, Machine Zero, Infinity. Rank, 1. Quality, Ordinary. Life Value, 280, 200. Life Force Bonus. Energy Value, 100. Armor, 50, when the shield drops to zero. The armor serves to protect the mech from reduced damage. Shield, 100, shield can be automatically restored. Material, Metal. Attributes, Strength, 11. Defense, 11. Speed, 5. 5. Brief Enhancement from Overclocking Reinforcement. Increased life value by 80 points. Not bad. Suhao nodded slightly and reached out to take down the torch on the wall. He chose the dark dungeon not only because there were many monsters, but he could also get the accessory crystals he wanted. This was the advantage of having a raider. Every step was an optimal solution. Leaving the cell. The light emanating from the torches shone brightly outside. Abandoned benches. Western style walls. The firelight swayed as if there were some kind of ghosts and monsters peering in. Suddenly. Three figures appeared at the corner in front. Cult Fighter. Attributes, Strength 7. Defense 7. Speed 3. Characteristics, their claws will deal shield sustain damage to you until lifesteal. Weakness, Chest. Comments, understand the concept that the less clothes you wear, the more pain you get from a beating? Three pugilists wearing long black dresses and steel masks resembling Dark Tong De Wei. Wearing rusty, sharp claws on their hands. Their upper bodies naked and covered in scars. The eyes behind their masks were as scarlet as blood. Waving their sharp claws and killing Su Hao straight. Su Hao didn't panic. His speed embrace reached 5. 5. Much higher than the cult fighters. With a sideways turn, he easily dodged away. The huge iron fist rolled the moldy air and smashed heavily into the head of a cult fighter. Boom! The cult fighter's head exploded on the spot. Su Hao moved more than that, raising his mechanical thigh and sweeping it out like a battle axe. Boom! The second cult fighter was swept out. Smashing tables, chairs and benches. He spat out blood furiously. The entire process did not take more than a second. The two cult fighters were directly killed in seconds. At this time, the third cult fighter finally killed over. His sharp claws stabbing Su Hao's chest. Zila. An ear-piercing friction sound rang out. The sharp claws only left a white mark on the top of the mech, not able to break the defense at all. Su Hao's expression was a bit wonderful. After the human machine unification, when Zero was hit, it was like being scratched by the flesh. This feeling was unspeakably marvelous. The flesh will eventually wither away. Why don't you fly up with my machine flesh? Suha looked down at the cult fighter and smiled coldly. Afterwards, he grabbed the cult fighter's wrist, reversed his sharp claws, and penetrated the latter's neck. Kill cult fighter. Gain 15 experience points. Kill cultist fighter. Gain 15 experience points. Kill cultist fighter. Gain 15 experience points. The cult fighter's ruins realm breath was absorbed by Suha and materials exploded on the ground. Obtained tainted flesh and blood asterisk 3. Dropped one Rhone crystal stone asterisk 6. One Rhone crystal stone was mainly used to raise the level of crystals. In unusual copies, this was a rare commodity. Only trial copies with generous rewards could increase the burst rate. At this moment, visions of spectral licking appeared on the surface of the three cult fighter corpses. Desecrate the corpses. Heresy. Activate. Gained, life force. 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 3. Tainted flesh and blood asterisk 2. Torch fuel asterisk 2. Suha looked at the new, life force. Instead of the 40% life bonus at level 0, it showed 45%. Obviously, this, life force, was of a better quality. In a normal situation, the quality, life force, would be loaded onto the mech, and the inferior, life force, would be eliminated. However, Suha was different. He secretly said in his heart, harmonize the Tao. Harmonizing the DAO was the third effect of, I transform 10,000 ways. It could perfectly merge the same subsidiary crystal and take the maximum value. If there were two subsidiary crystals and one had a value that was too low, merging the DAO again would increase the original crystal by 0. 0.5%. This was tantamount to reusing waste. The life force was integrated into Suhao's body, and his life breath soared again. Continue. Don't stop. Suhao cleaned up a little and continued to go deeper into the dungeon, passing through the corner. Su Hao saw a group of cult fighters kneeling on the ground, their mouths seemingly chanting scriptures, and he immediately rushed in, his fists swinging like the wind, completely interrupting their rituals. Sawa, a woman in a revealing dress stood up, a long black dress, a mask on her head, a scepter in her hand, and an eerie voice coming out of her mouth. The scepter shone with a dark light, turning into an invisible fluctuation that silently enveloped Su Hao. The brightness of the torch instantly dropped by a notch. Su Hao, on the other hand, felt in a trance and his body became weak. However, not only was he not angry, he instead showed surprise on his face. Cult Monk, Attributes, Strength 1, Defense 1, Speed 2, 
Spirit 3. Characteristics, they revere the ethereal he and specialize in attacking others with their spirit. Weakness, melee, evaluation, in a group battle, kill the milkmaid first, you know? A group of cult fighters rushed up like crazy, Suhao didn't flash or dodge, and with zero strength of up to 11 points, he directly launched a savage charge. Boom! The cult fighters were knocked to pieces. Suhao, on the other hand, came to the front of the cult monk and blasted out an iron fist, smashing the cult monk's head on the spot. Obtained, weak electricity. Scepter fragment asterisk 3. Attachment crystal, weak electricity, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Effect, adds electric elemental effects to the mech. Probability of paralyzing enemies. Increases damage by 10%. Effect, adds electric elemental effects to the mech. Probability of paralyzing enemies. Increases damage by 10%. Description, power. Description, power. I feel power flowing through my body. After the market world breath was absorbed by the market pattern, it exploded into a new subsidiary crystal. It was exactly the electric attribute that Suha wanted. Absorb. Suha drank lowly in his heart. The next second, silver-colored electric aura surged out from the surface of Machine Zero's armor, resembling a revived ancient machine in the dark atmosphere. At this time, the cult fighter charged over again. Die. Suha's eyes were filled with cold aura. With a clench of his iron fist, electric light overflowed and stormed out. A group of cult fighters were electrified and trembled. The paralyzing effect was triggered. They couldn't make any movements at all before they were blown apart by the iron fist. Killed cult fighter and cult monk. Gained 80 experience points. Gained one room crystal asterisk 13. Tattooed bone asterisk 5. Tainted flesh asterisk 6. Level 1 level 2. Zero's entire attributes have risen slightly. Life value plus 20. Energy value plus 50. Armor plus 10. Shield plus 20. Strength plus 2. Defense plus 2. Speed plus 1. A ray of clear and cold ghostly light enveloped Su Hao. He clearly felt that his body seemed to undergo a metamorphosis. With an indescribable sense of pleasure. Clang. But without waiting for him to savor it, the door in front of him was kicked open. Four figures rushed straight over. Four people rushed out from behind the broken gate. They were holding torches. Some had blonde hair and blue eyes. Some had brown hair and black pupils. And they were all wearing attire from the medieval era. The one in the lead was wearing armor and holding a battle sword that was dripping blood. The one in the second position wore a three-cornered hat, covered his mouth and nose with a black scarf roll, and held a dagger in his hand, his eyes staring at Su Hao. In the third place was a blonde girl with freckles on her nose, holding a medicine bottle in her hand and shaking a green liquid. The last one was a green-clothed archer, also looking at Su Hao. This was a very typical combination of warrior, assassin, apothecary, mage, and archer. Su Hao subconsciously wanted to make a move. When he saw these people clearly, he immediately relaxed and secretly said, the copy plot is triggered. At this time, the other four people stopped. They looked at Su Hao with a somewhat puzzled expression. How could there be a big steel guy in the dungeon? The warrior in armor gibbered as if it was ancient English. Have you seen this child? He hurriedly pulled out a portrait and inquired. Su Hao, who had passed the English specialization 8, said that there was no pressure to translate. He immediately said, haven't seen it, but we can cooperate and go deeper into the dungeon together. The warrior was filled with gratitude. However, the assassin, apothecary and archer were always on guard. The sudden help was by no means kind. The warrior looked back and said seriously, I can feel that he possesses an aura very similar to that of the adults, very powerful, and can help us retrieve the child. The four of them discussed carefully and were grateful for Su Hao's joining. Su Hao wasn't being kind. He just wanted to use them to lure out a monster and burst out crystals. The five people formed a temporary team, with Su Hao as the leader, and continued to go deeper. The deeper they went, the darker and more humid the atmosphere became. The brightness of the torches gradually became dim, and strange sounds began to appear around them. Rustling. It seemed like the sound made by someone slightly stroking his pants with his hands in the uninvited dark night. Aha. Uh -huh. The weak, worm-like sad sound drilled into Su Hao's brain, one by one, as if he had taken an electric drill to break open his solar plexus and poured it in hard. She's talking in my ear. The pharmacist suddenly screamed, saying that she would soak my flesh with potion and then tear it off piece by piece. Shut up, shut up. The assassin grumpily lowered his voice. Bitch, do you know that your voice will attract a lot of monsters? Su Hao didn't say anything. Indifferently watching all this, he knew very well that the torture buff was coming. When the brightness dropped to a certain level, the torture buff would affect one's judgment and also hallucinations. Even Su Hao was enduring it with his willpower. Trust the holy light. Suddenly, the warrior put down his battle sword, grabbed the apothecary with one hand and the assassin with the other, his torso haunted by a dust-colored light. 
and his pious voice echoed. The torch in Su Hao's hand increased in brightness quite a bit, and he raised an eyebrow. Virtue buff is here. Virtue buff would appear by virtue of one person's words, one action. The apothecary and assassin were sweating like a pig, and also slightly relieved their state. Dang, 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 but it wasn't over yet. The sound of hitting the ground resounded around them. Without saying much, the archers drew their bows and shot arrows. Shoo, the arrow was shot, but it hit something hard, sparks flying and delicately illuminating the surroundings. A man covered in bandages, with a hideous face and dark pupils, his ten fingers clasping his head, half kneeling on the ground, constantly hitting the ground. Knocker, attributes, strength 5, defense 5, speed 2, spirit 6, characteristics, the moment he tries to smash his head, it will be the most horrifying moment of mental shock, weakness, whole body, comments, it hurts, it really hurts, he says, I'm everywhere, the secretive spirit shock filled the room like a tidal wave, at the same time, cult fighters and cult monks and poisonous spiders came killing like mad, fight, the warrior picked up his battle sword and bellowed. The apothecary pulled out a bottle of yellow potion from his small cloth pocket and slammed it into the ground. And with a click, a layer of sand and earth armor covered the five people's body surface. Effect of sand and earth potion, get temporary armor 20. The first wave of mental shock shattered things around them. The five people immediately felt a headache. Suha was the first to react. The surface of the zero's body flashed with electricity, and the mechanical biped erupted violently. The speed surged. He was like a steel beast directly toppling the incoming cult fighters and cult monks. Paralysis triggered. A large portion of the cult fighters were covered in electricity and stood in place twitching violently. The fighters seized the opportunity and quickly swung their swords forward. Su Hao, on the other hand, rushed towards the cow towers. He raised his hand and grabbed it, then slammed it into the ground. Bang, bang, bang. The dark dungeon version of Hulk smashing Loki. The cow towers were like a piece of Play-Doh in Su Hao's hands, swinging and smashing from side to side. Blood and flesh flew around until it turned into a puddle of mush. Kill cult fighter, cult monk, poison spider, and knocker. Gain 210 experience points. The four fighters saw the scene and their jaws dropped. It wasn't that they hadn't seen violent images before. It was just that. The scene in front of them was more or less inappropriate for adults. Gained, kawaii, demonic spider, kowtowers bandage asterisk 1, tainted flesh and blood asterisk 4, scepter fragment asterisk 2, torch fuel asterisk 3, Core Crystal, Demonic Spider, Level 0 slash 5. Quality, Excellent. Effect, 1. Toxin Attack, Passive Any of your attacks are accompanied by a powerful poison that can inflict pain on creatures. 2. Spider Transformation, Passive you are free to climb anywhere, by raising the crystal level. The mech will have additional changes. Description, Why don't you listen to me? Ha, huh? Why does this spider leg of yours have an autonomous consciousness? Attachment Crystal, Kawaru, Level 0 slash 5. Quality, Excellent. Effect, increases the maximum value of energy value, currently up to 20%. Description, an unending stream of energy is being poured into my body. Unceasing flow, it was exploded from the cow towers. Devil Spider, was popped out from Poison Spider. Devil Spider, is exactly the second crystal Suha wanted to get when he entered the dark dungeon. Capable of forming an elemental reaction with, weak electricity. Poison plus electricity equals corrosion. Absorb. Abruptly. Zero trembled strangely. The original white with yellow color of the mech began to be slowly covered by a purple-green color. In the dim atmosphere, it added a bit of mystery and evil, especially the weird purple light of the head armor, as if it was a black knight spider. My lord, are you from the Legion? The warrior and the others walked up and asked excitedly. Su Hao glanced at them, but didn't answer. Or, it was inappropriate to say how to answer. But in the eyes of the warrior four, the tall steel monster just glanced at them and then turned his head back, his demeanor deep. Understood. My lord is on a secret mission. The archer said sullenly. The other three agreed. Su Hao sighed. How come there are brain monsters everywhere? Tired. Whatever. Continue to advance. Along the way, they kept encountering cult fighters, cult monks and poisonous spiders. Without exception, they were all easily harvested by Su Hao. A lot of materials and crystals popped out. Not long after, Su Hao's warehouse was piled up with a small half. Inside the atrium, the unconscious children were lying on the ground. Blood was flowing from their wrists, flowing into the blood trough on the ground. The blood trough was a very weird pattern, like a squid, covered with tentacles. Great Lord, remember the gifts we have given you. A cult monk in revealing attire laughed maniacally and insanely. The second floor of the atrium. Suhao's five people just arrived and saw the scene. Suhao frowned. His joining allowed the copy plot to be triggered. Once the evil god was resurrected and summoned, 
he was afraid that he wouldn't live for more than 24 hours. Do it. With a low shout, he jumped up, but his hands and feet were glued to the wall and climbed on the ceiling, pouncing on the cult monk. Cult monk captain. Attributes, 10 strength, 8 defense, 6 speed, 10 spirit. Characteristics, don't look into her eyes. They're like an abyss that swallows you up. Weakness, all naked parts can be bludgeoned. Evaluation, 3000 feelings are no match for two breasts. How do you think she became a captain? That's because of her high spiritual power. Of course. Second floor. Fighters launched their charge. Archers took care of fire support. And apothecaries weakened the cult fighters with attack potions. The assassins lurked. Waiting for an opportunity. Disrespecting my lord's sacrifice ceremony. You all deserve to die. The cult monk captain screamed as her black eyes flashed with a bizarre light. She raised her hands high. Presenting a ring-shaped fluctuation with herself that enveloped the cult fighter and other companions. Dark Aura, Strength and Defense Enhanced by 5%, Roar, The Cult Fighter, Cult Monk, and Poison Spider hissed as they killed out, Su Hao, on the other hand, was like a spider climbing on top of the head of the Cult Monk Captain, finding the right opportunity, his huge iron fist blasted out angrily, Heretic, the Cult Monk Captain screamed, and a black aperture emerged from his hands, blocking in front of himself, Overclock, Su Hao drank lowly in his heart and a layer of sturdy metal shell emerged on his body surface, as if it was a halo game, and he continued to smash down angrily. There was a click. The black aperture instantly shattered. The cult monk captain was smashed out, continuously spitting out blood. She was just about to get up when a purple-green steel-armored iron fist once again killed her, interspersed with a thick and terrifying strong wind. There was a bang. The cult monk captain stiffened and his entire head exploded like a watermelon. Kill cult monk captain. Gain 50 experience points. Without hesitation, Su Hao turned around and droned. Save the children. Leave them to me. His torso was suffused with silver-colored electricity, and his arms unfolded, hardening the cult fighters that surrounded the warrior. Bang bang bang. A fresh life smashed into the stone pillars, emitting heart-pounding sounds, as well as the chilling sound of bones breaking. Although the warrior was injured, he still rushed with his companions to take the children away from the altar. At once, the eerily patterned trough of blood stopped pouring out. The ritual was aborted. The warrior was instantly relieved. Luckily I caught up. But as he spoke, in a corner where no one could see, a cult monk lay on the edge of the blood trough, smiling eerily. Exalted master. Slay these heretics. She raised her scepter and ran it through her head, pouring her brains and blood into the blood trough. Suha was the first to notice the difference. He picked up the broken pieces of wood on the ground and threw them, running through her canopy, but he was still one step too late. Rumble. Abruptly. The entire atrium shook violently, and the blood in the blood trough was boiling violently, haunting with dreamy colors, followed by endless darkness. It's not a complete toddler's blood. The one summoned over might not be him. Su Hao looked at this scene and said in his heart, if it was 100% toddler blood, just according to the pre-copy battle power, he, a level 2, couldn't block it at all. The warrior whacked his head in chagrin. My lord, it's us who dragged you down. All go behind me. Su Hao's tone was calm. The warrior several people hurriedly hugged the children and hid behind Su Hao, probing at the weird pattern of shining black light. The next second, a black tentacle seemed to come through time and space, swinging slightly, constantly extracting the life breath of Su Hao and the others, and even their torsos became heavy. There was a tree made of a combination of blood and flesh growing up in the black tentacle, and there were layers of cracks on the surface, and when the cracks were propped open, it was a blood red eye full of violent emotions, staring at Su Hao and them with a deadly stare. There were emotions in the eyes that seemed to be mocking. It was as if they wanted to tease these little things. Hobbler, weak. Attributes, strength 15. Defense 18. Speed 0. Spirit 20. Characteristics, confusion. Control. Weakness, eyeballs. Evaluation, it won't talk. It will just slowly eat away your life until the moment you close your eyes. The four warriors trembled violently. Their expressions horrified. Waddler, my lord. Let's go. They shrieked. Suhao smiled. Why should we go? Doesn't an experience pack delivered to the door smell good? His palm lingered with a ghostly blue light, like a passport connecting to the underworld. Army of the undead. The moment the ghostly blue light fell into the ground, the dead cult fighters, cult monks, poison spiders, and cult monk captains in the atrium levitated as if they were puppets on strings, and then stood. Even the cult monk captain, who had lost his head, wobbled and stood up. The warrior and the others were dumbfounded. My lord still knew dark magic? The hobbler also froze at that moment and seemed to be thinking, isn't he a human? How does he still know this kind of magic? Kill. Level 0, profanity, s, army of the undead, could only be maintained for one minute. 
Therefore, Su Hao immediately issued an order for the cult fighter, cult monk, and poison spider to kill the wanderer. The cult monk captain danced his hands, and a wave of black light filled out, sweeping towards the hobbler. The hobbler's eyes glowed with an eerie light, trying to take control of their souls. However, after death, they were just corpses. Where was their soul? Where did the souls go? In Su Hao's hands, pfffffffff, the sharp claws, the scepter penetrated an eyeball, and blood flowed all over the place, and the hobbler shook violently, as if it was in pain. In the end, it was hardened by its own believers. Although your attributes are higher than mine, I have more people. Su Hao looked at the fallen hobbler, the corner of his mouth slightly raised. One minute was up, the summoned cult fighter and the others all died again. True, dead and alive. Killed cult fighter and others asterisk 21. Gain 320 experience points. Kill waddler, weak. Gain experience value 800. Level 2 level 3. All of Zero's attributes go up slightly. Life value plus 20. Energy value plus 50. Armor plus 15. Shield plus 30. Strength. Defense. Speed plus 2. At the same time, the market realm breath is being absorbed. Heresy, unleashed. The corpse is being desecrated. Game tainted flesh and blood asterisk 19. Tattooed bone asterisk 10. Scepter fragment asterisk 7. 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 250. Tentacles of the wanderer asterisk 1. The ghosts were licking the corpses, and the materials kept dropping. To Su Hao's surprise, the desecration of the hobbler's corpse actually exploded drawings. Maniacal poison drawing, a shotgun with a highly poisonous, controlled shotgun, it only needs to explode at close range, and will surely be able to make a big hole in the enemy's head. I can't believe I popped out the mad poison. Su Hao was overjoyed. In his intelligence, some rare crystals, drawings existed in the dark dungeon. Among them, the drop rate of mad poison was 0.8%. In the pre-awakening period, the drawings and finished products of mad poison were enough to sell for a sky-high price. After I get out from the copy, I'll go brush the casting barn. Su Hao excitedly put away the mad poison drawing. In his previous life, he had never really touched mad poison. In this life, he was the first. The 24 hours were about to end. Su Hao was a good person to the end and sent the warrior and the others out of the dungeon. Creak. After the heavy door was pushed open, what came into Su Hao's eyes was not some colorful world, but a darkness. The dark sky dome. As if there was a thick layer of clouds blocking all the colors, with a weird blood-colored half-moon hanging above it, draping everything in the world with a layer of ghostly red aura, which was frightening. Thank you, my lord, for your help. The warrior and the others were grateful. Su Hao shook his head. It was just a matter of raising his hand. Moreover, he had also utilized them to burst out the Chuan Luyu and Demonic Spider. Everyone was considered to be drag-free. The apothecary hurriedly said, Please, my lord, take a nap in our town. We will treat you with great hospitality. No need. Su Hao was just about to refuse, when three figures in front of him were rapidly approaching. Heavy armor with blue stripes. Serious full-coverage helmet gauntlets. Nearly three meters tall, like three small mountains running gave Su Hao a huge sense of oppression. It's Lord Lantidas. The warrior's eyes were full of worship. When the comers stopped, the male at the head slowly removed his own helmet, his short blonde hair, and his cold eyes showed a hint of tenderness after seeing that the children were safe and sound. At his forehead, there was a metallic sheen that appeared to be a brass nail. The warrior immediately explained things over, which made the Lantis drop their guard. My friend, you are a true hero. The blonde man with the copper nail said sincerely, this gift is also for you to accept. After saying that, he pulled out an ancient bronze ring with marvelous words carved on it that contained a strange power. Ring of Lantidas, type, props, effect, suppresses the bleeding effect by 50%, grants the mech a continuous blood return, returning zero, one life value per second. Description, Mu Di Hui, holy like glory. Su Hao was slightly surprised, he didn't expect to get props after helping them. An unexpected surprise, I'll take it. He smiled, when the blonde man saw this, a hint of relief appeared on his ancient face. Friend, go to the town with us. No, I have other things to do. Su Hao refused. Lantidas did not force himself and escorted the warrior for as well as the children to leave. The warrior and the others reluctantly waved their hands towards Su Hao. Congratulations for surviving. Trial evaluation, SSS. Calculating, settling rewards according to your performance in the dark dungeon. Successfully rescuing the missing children. Obtaining Wanlong Crystals Asterisk 1000, successfully rescuing the missing children. Obtaining Wanlong Crystals Asterisk 1000, kill the waddler and get the drawing of the Stygian dog mech. Did not clash with the warrior group and completed the mission. Awarded, Life Force, Asterisk 3, Transcendent Shield, Asterisk 1, 
successfully stayed alive. Rewarded with market coin asterisk 20, 000, being out of the decaying stranger's shadow, the rewards were very generous, especially 10 million fusion crystal stones, which was enough for Suha to strengthen a wave. Most unexpectedly, a mecha drawing was also rewarded. Without waiting for Suha to examine it carefully, a weird crack appeared in front of his eyes once again, and the whole person was directly sucked into it. 24 hours ago, all the people over 18 years old and Blue Star were sent into the decaying stranger's shadow, and their lives and deaths were uncertain. 24 hours later, all humans who stepped into decaying stranger's shadow were evacuated, because it was a trial level copy. As long as one was willing to be meticulous, it was perfectly possible to survive. But there were people who didn't take it seriously and lost their lives in it. From this moment onwards, Blue Star's originally stopped gears were slowly turning. A new era had finally arrived. Inside the Express Hotel, Su Hao had already returned. He could predict that it was bound to be chaotic outside, but there was no need to worry. The government would also be pacified at the first opportunity. While starting to control the decaying stranger shadows that appeared everywhere, Hua Xia was always the fastest to cope with disaster situations in this area. 3. Life Force. 1. Transcendent Shield. It's good enough for the only novice copy. Su Hao smiled slightly. Transcendent Shield Level 0 Slash Level 10. Quality, Ordinary. Effect, Increase the Upper Limit of Mech Shield. Currently Level 0. Increase Shield by 10%. Description, This is the shield that can be infinitely recovered. Su Hao glanced at the effect of Transcendent Shield and directly loaded it. At the same time, he merged 3 Vitality directly into the path. The original level 0 vitality only had a 45% life value bonus, but now it directly jumped to 58%. This wasn't the end. Suha immediately utilized the 10,000 fusion crystals to strengthen the life force, transcendent shield, desecration, overclocking, weak electricity, demonic spider, streaming. Whether or not to strengthen life force, select yes, has been strengthened by level 1, 58% 106%, loss of man young crystal asterisk 100, market coin asterisk 1000. Whether or not to strengthen, Transcendent Shield, choose yes, has been strengthened by level 1, 10% to 0%, loss of Wanron Crystals asterisk 100, market coin asterisk 1000, whether to strengthen, blasphemy, choose yes, has been strengthened 1 level, loss of Wanron Crystal Stone asterisk 150, market coins asterisk 2000, whether to strengthen, overclocking, choose yes, has been strengthened 1 level, the loss of Wanron Crystal Stone asterisk 150, Market coins asterisk 2000. Whether or not to strengthen, weak electricity. Choose yes. Has been strengthened level 1. Electricity elemental damage 10% to 0%. Loss of one Rome crystal asterisk 100. Weak coins asterisk 1000. Whether to strengthen, tarantula. Choose yes. Has been strengthened level 1. The crystal has changed. The loss of one Rome crystal asterisk 100. Market coin asterisk 1000. Whether to strengthen, Chuan Yu. Choose yes has been strengthened level 1, 20% 40%, loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 100, market coins asterisk 1000. After an operation, Su Hao felt a substantial enhancement appear in all parts of his body, as if he drank a mouthful of chilled sour plum soup on a 3-volt day, soothing from the inside out. The armor on Zero's back appeared to be assembled automatically, extending two purple-green spider spears, with fine fluff clearly visible and inexplicable light flowing from the tips, as if they could easily pierce through the enemy's body, becoming Iron Spider-Man. Su Hao laughed out loud. He glanced at the attribute panel. Codename, Machine Zero, Infinity. Level, 3. Quality, Ordinary. Life Value, 494. 6. Life Force 106% Bonus. Energy Value, 280. Kawara 40% Bonus. Armor, 75. When the shield drops to zero, the armor plays a role in protecting the mech from reduced damage. Shield, 180, 20% bonus to Transcendent Shield. Material, Metal. Attributes, Strength, 14. Defense, 14. Speed, 8. Crystal, Tarantula, Core Crystal. Level 1. Desecration, Independent Crystal. Level 1. Overclocking, Independent Crystal. Level 1. He nodded in satisfaction. Now that's right. Finally a bit of an open party. With that, he sat down to think. His next target was particularly clear and that was Zhao Hong of Rice City. After experiencing the novice copy, his strength had increased greatly. Even if Zhao Hong wasn't weak, he would never be his opponent. Settle Zhao Hong. After that is the Foundry Warehouse. I remember it's in Wanjia Footwash City in the east of City. There's also the Phantom Dog Mech drawing. I've already fused it with the Zero. I don't know if I can cast other battle armor, 
One question surfaced in Su Hao's mind, thinking about. He fell asleep. Night, slight rain, evening news. As we entered, decaying stranger's shadow, there was a mutation across the globe, and bizarre existences similar to copies descended to various places. The most serious was the Sakura country, which suffered a beam of light from the sky. Nearly half of the land was destroyed, and there were countless deaths and injuries. I would like to advise all awakened people here. It is recommended that multiple people team up for a copy, and the country will also help. For the follow-up, please pay attention to our public number. The TV was broadcasting what happened, and the host was also quite excited and clenched his fists, not knowing whether he was happy because a bunch of people died in a certain country, or because of his own awakening. Su Hao glanced at it, eating the food delivered by the express hotel, and thinking inside his head. At 12 o'clock, he was going to hit Zhao Hong's territory. He wanted both Zhao Hong's independent crystal and his money. And by the way, he would eradicate a future scum. I still have a gap from level 10. After I finish Zhao Hong, I can brush materials, casting bins, and experience in the infected land in Wanjia foot washing city to quickly upgrade. After drinking and eating, Suha checked out of the room and walked silently through the slightly chaotic streets. Please stay inside your home for now. Don't do anything stupid. The issue of the copy will be discussed after we figure it out. The police were maintaining order. The local armed forces were also out in force. Suha looked at the rainwater dripping off the brim of his hat, lowered his head and walked forward, silently into a dark alley. Zhao Hong, one of the rich and powerful people in Mi City, was a philanthropist in the open, and secretly dabbled in anything that could make a lot of money and fast money. This also led to a lot of broken home situations in recent years in Mi City, but he had someone above him, living a very nourishing life. Recently my side got a number of female anchors, long legs, big breasts, buttocks, but also all just micro-contouring. Don't worry, open a live broadcast platform, earn those losers money, ha ha ha. Zhao Hongda was about 40 years old, short hair, glasses, his eyes were smiling when he spoke. After he hung up the phone, his eyes immediately revealed a vulture-like shade. When I familiarize myself with my independent crystal, I'll immediately go solo, so I won't be working for you. Zhao Hong smiled coldly. After he learned that he had awakened his S rank, suffocating wormhole, he had begun in planning his grand endeavors. What could a separate space without air do? Stockpiling all sorts of food and selling it off at critical moments. Zhao Hong was the savior and everyone's beloved saint. Even the country had to thank him. Zhao Hong leaned his back against the chair, that smirk at the corner of his mouth, as if he had already foreseen the future. At this time, noisy voices rang out from outside, as well as the sound of fighting and clashing. Eh? Zhao Hong opened his eyes and took out a silver pistol from the drawer. Transformation. With a low shout, the blue-white mech wore up, and a detector-like architecture appeared in the head armor, which could clearly see the enemies within 10 meters around. Only within the detector's range, a red dot was like a fierce tiger rushing inside a circle of blue dots, killing it hard. Zhao Hong's expression instantly froze. He was just about to pick up his phone when he saw the ground shaking violently, followed by the wall shattering, accompanied by a mech broken in two, sparks flashing and blood flowing inside. Your people are in my way, so it's a bit unpleasant. A purple-green mecha walked in and let out a faint laugh. Zhao Hong's face was horrified. He didn't hesitate to raise his hand and fire. Bang bang bang. The bullets that could have easily taken other people's lives hit the body of the Zero and instantly turned into flaming fragments, not even leaving traces on the surface. How is this possible? Zhao Hong was incredulous. Not long after his awakening, he had tested the hardness of a level 1 mech. As long as there was enough ammunition, it could be completely crushed with the armor. Suffocating wormhole is really condescending when placed on your body. Su Hao said softly. Zhao Hong only felt a cold chill all over his body. How did this person know about his independent crystal? Before he could speak, Su Hao rushed over. The spider spear behind him was as sensitive as an arm, piercing through the air and picking the person up. The spider spear went through the mech, and together with Zhao Hong's arm, he nailed it to the wall, and immediately let out a miserable scream. Shut up if you don't want to die. Su Hao's tone was icy, I'll ask you to answer. Zhao Hong immediately clenched his teeth, his cold sweat wetting his whole body like a flood, and he shivered in pain. How much money do you personally have? Just a few hundred thousand. Dollars. Ha. Huh? Thirty million dollars. There's thirty million that I can move around at will. There's some cash here too. Call. Purchase a large amount of food and store it inside your private warehouse. Tell me the location again. When Zhao Hong heard this, he was slightly stunned. How come his thoughts are exactly the same as mine? World another me? However, even if Zhao Hong had the mind, it was useless. So he could only obediently make the call and spend the thirty million dollars in flesh. Brother, no, 
Big brother, Zhao Hang's head armor retracted, revealing his pale face. We can work together. I have money and people. I can definitely live in this new era. You're right. Su Hao grinned. I can be better off without you. After saying that, two big purple green steel hands gripped Zhao Hong's head. In his fearful and trembling gaze, it suddenly tilted to the other side. Ka Ching. His head was twisted off and he died on the spot. His eyes filled with gray. Su Hao didn't push and directly launched devouring. Devour successfully. Crystal, suffocating wormhole, level 0 slash level 5. 1. Blank wormhole, a space with no air, no sound, and only capable of storing dead things, currently level 0, with 50, 000 square meters, level 1, 100, 000 square meters, level 2, 200, 000 square meters, level 3, 300, 000 square meters, level 4, 400, 000 square meters, level 5, 500, 000 square meters, Two air stripping, unstable wormholes will extract the air and suffocate all creatures that need to breathe, currently level 0 with a range of 10 meters, level 1, 20 meters, level 2, 30 meters, level 3, 40 meters, level 4, 50 meters, level 5, 75 meters. Seeing the introduction of choking wormhole, Su Hao was overwhelmed with emotion. No wonder he was able to make a good living in his last life. He revealed a smile, but well, it's mine now. Su Hao looked at the corpse. Bursting out a collateral crystal and directly loading it. Detection radar, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Effect, can mark companions as well as enemies on your detector. Description, oh exempt. Are you two blue dots playing bumper cars one after the other? Not bad. He nodded in satisfaction. Then suddenly remembered something. After level 10, the blue star land started to lose nutrients. Should this matter be reported to the state? Between thoughts, Su Hao looked at Zhao Hong, who had his neck broken. Army of the Undead. Zhao Hong levitated like a puppet on strings, and his gray eyes took on an eerie color at this moment. Mumbling, Master, may I serve you? You are related to the mayor, right? Su Hao asked. He didn't believe that the mayor of Ami City would not know what Zhao Hong did, and must have his help behind the scenes. Zhao Hong replied, Yes, I will regularly send him funds and women. Tell him to tell Hua Xia to start stockpiling food. Although I know the country has experience in this area, the more stockpiles the better. After Su Hao finished speaking, he left the spot. Zhao Hong nodded sluggishly and immediately picked up his cell phone and dialed the mayor's number, telling the matter directly. What? Buying grain? Crazy. You a businessman shouldn't come and get involved in this kind of stuff. Settle down lately. The mayor's voice was a bit sharp, and then he lowered it quite a bit. Zhao Hong didn't answer and directly hung up the phone, then sat on the chair, slowly losing all his strength. Su Hao didn't leave Zhao Hong's territory but looked at the blue dot displayed by the scouting radar. A blue dot meant that it was a friendly party, or an innocent person. Clang! The iron door flew out. An ear-piercing scream emanated from inside. So it's the people being held here. There were about close to a hundred people inside. Zhao Hong had dabbled in pornography, gambling, and drugs. So naturally, he would sell these small netizens abroad for fun. And once they were useless, he would dig out their entrails and sell them for money a second time. It can be said that Zhao Hong has done all the bad things. On the surface, he was a good person. But secretly, he was bad as pus. Go home, Su Hao said. The person inside saw that it was a tall purple-green mech and immediately stopped crying and hurriedly thanked him. Su Hao looked at the people who walked past him. All of them were particularly depressed in spirit, and guessed why they didn't resist. Even if there was a market tattoo, summoning a mech to be destroyed by someone would take time to recover, or use special props. This group of people should have had their mechs destroyed. Su Hao didn't have too much sympathy. It was just by the way. Thanks. Suddenly, a female voice sounded. Su Hao saw the last woman who came out. Her eyes were bright and godly, with a very inexplicable calmness. He nodded slightly and didn't say anything, turning around to leave. Can you tell me your name? The woman didn't expect Su Hao to be so succinct, and hurriedly asked. There's no need. Su Hao's wide back armor was flowing with rainwater and waved his hand casually. He was not willing to get involved with the woman again. Hadn't he suffered enough losses in his previous life? The woman hurriedly said, Benefactor, my name is Zhang Yao. In the future, I will repay you for saving my life. Su Hao's footsteps lurched, his demeanor somewhat surprised. Zhang Yao, this name was like thunder in her previous life. She had awakened the SS grade independent crystal, Nirvana. Just like the phoenix in Chinese mythology, Nirvana Rebirth. Nickname, Amazing Burning. It is said that Zhang Yao was once sold abroad, and after a series of tragic events, she has risen strongly to become the top pillar in the Chinese Mecha League. 
The gossip was that Jiang Yao had a younger brother who was seriously injured after being knocked down and needed a large sum of money, so she had no choice but to sell herself. But Zhao Hong didn't care about Jiang Yao's condition at all and sold her abroad. Nirvana, this independent crystal. The early stage is not excellent. Excellent is the middle and late explosion. Need a process of accumulation. The money inside the house. You can take it. Su Hao smiled. Not expecting to meet Jiang Yao here again. And after saying that, he turned around and left. Jiang Yao looked at the back of the distant mech, her eyes deep. But soon, she reacted and took a large amount of cash from Zhao Hong's house. The younger brother is saved. Mi City, Government Department. Early in the morning, a piece of news spread. Zhao Hong had been killed. At the same time, countless people came out to identify Zhao Hong as the one who abducted and sold young girls abroad. At this moment, the mayor stood in place, shivering, completely afraid to look up at the man sitting in the main seat. The man, judging from his face, should be around 34 or 5 years old, just in his prime. He had decent features and was dressed in a black suit. His gaze swept sternly over and a group of people once again lowered their heads. Clean up Zhao Hong's forces, the man coldly said. Also, prepare to purchase food on a large scale. The mayor's expression froze. By grain? After our speculations, the so-called new era must be a great disaster. A cataclysm means a shortage of food. We need to purchase it at this time. Although our country's food reserves let people eat for two or three years in the case of a grain harvest, this is a special time, so we have to make special preparations. The man nodded slightly and did not hide it. The mayor immediately recalled what he said about Zhao Hong last night and hurriedly said, 12 hours ago, Zhao Hong said something similar to you. Oh, the man's demeanor was startled. Soon after, he shook his head. As far as Zhao Hong's head is concerned, he definitely couldn't think of this level of problem. Perhaps, someone borrowed his mouth to tell us. It seems that something is really going to happen. The man quickly got up with a serious expression. Immediately, execute. Yes, the mayor and the others hurriedly retreated. It wasn't just me city, but other cities in China as well. The man stood in front of the window, looking at the endless stream of people, his gaze deep as an abyss. Who on earth is reminding us of this? Rumble. The iron rolled and light shone in. Su Hao's shadow stretched longer and longer. Looking at the piles of food in the warehouse, he smiled slightly. The things ordered last night hadn't arrived yet. These were left behind from Zhao Hong's previous attempt at a resale business. Unexpectedly, they came in handy now. Su Hao slightly raised his hand and, blank wormhole, appeared. Only a huge white void was seen, and strange white ripples spread out, absorbing all the food towards the ground. With food in the storehouse, there was no panic in his heart. Brush out the casting warehouse first, and come back for it in a few days. After making up his mind, Su Hao quickly left. The next place he was going to was the east of the city of Mi City, an entertainment place called Wanja Footwash City. Along the way, the streets looked a bit cold. It seemed like there were quite a few people who listened to the state and stayed at home obediently. However, there were still people walking around the streets, and also harnessing their mechs in a majestic manner. Wanja Foot Wash City. This was supposed to be one of the most famous entertainment venues in the eastern part of the city. Well, originally, at this moment, this place had already turned into a ruin. The owner of Wanja Foot Wash City looked at the mostly collapsed building, as well as the void cracks in the air, and cursed in anger. Goddamn new era. How am I going to take videos and send 91 ah in the future? At this time, a tall purple and green mecha came, and the boss immediately turned his tone. No, I mean, how else can I do business and pay taxes for the country in the future? Su Hao swept a glance at the boss and directly chose to ignore it. He came to the third floor of Foot Wash City. The void rift here was in the stage of breaking. You are approaching the infected land. Do you want to enter? Yes. Please choose the difficulty. The copy difficulties were easy, normal, hard nightmare, and hell. Suha was trying to brush the foundry warehouse, this time. The faster the better. There was no need to make it more difficult for himself. Therefore, he chose the easy difficulty. Countdown 3, 2, 1. Decaying Stranger's Shadow Build Complete. Welcome to the Decaying Stranger's Shadow. Suha's body slowly disintegrated and was eventually sucked into the rift. Location, Infected Land. Level, 1. Difficulty, Easy. Task, Within 5 Hours. Kill the elite monster, devourer. Description, the sky breaks, and the weirdness falls. A ball of flesh falls into the planet, contaminating all the creatures on the entire planet in just 24 hours, turning them into violent, raging, beastly monsters. Please do not attempt to revive them. Please do not touch them. Please kill them. In the broken world, there was a black sun suspended high in the sky, shedding eerie light. Collapsed skyscrapers and the constant honking of car sirens were urgent and alarming. There were no human cries. 
much less animal gasps. There was just that seeping atmosphere suffocating. Suha stood on an office building. Electricity flashed all around. Light bulbs bursting. Debris all over the ground. And a large amount of blood. Blackened and stinking. The infected land is a good place for leveling and brushing materials in the early stages. Suhao pondered. At the same time, it is also a rare location to brush casting barn drawings and materials. The first person to brush the foundry warehouse in the previous life would be notified globally and given a generous reward. This was because the casting warehouse was especially important. It was the breeding ground for casting out mechs and weapons. Without it, an empty mech wouldn't go very far. The first person who swiped out the casting warehouse came from the Tianju kingdom and later became a generation of masters. Clean up the monsters first, then burst the materials. Suha quickly made up his mind. ka -ching. In the next second, he jumped out of the office building, followed by a vertical descent. The steel arm penetrated in the main body of the building. Glass and stone spewed out. Using this to ease the force of Suha's descent, there was a bang. His entire body landed on the ground, splashing thick smoke and dust. After it dispersed, he slowly stepped out, looking straight at the monsters in front of him, smiling broadly. Monsters, are you ready to enjoy death? Beast Shifter. Attributes, Strength 9, Defense 9, Speed 10, Spirit 0. Characteristics, able to land on all fours like a beast, faster than when human. Weakness, Head. Evaluation, a single one is not a problem. It's the packs that are scary. A head of monsters with strange greenish colored bodies were lying on the ground. They were like wild beasts trembling and roaring. They could vaguely see that they possessed human physical features, but they were entangled by a large number of blood-colored tentacles, forcefully turning into a beast-like appearance. When they saw Su Hao, they vaguely seemed to say, Man, eats man, roar. The beast changers ran wildly, like a high-speed car. They killed towards Su Hao. Open kill. Su Hao drank lowly. The mechanical foot trampled on the ground and swept out. The mecha heavy fist wrapped with strong power, as well as corrosive effect, smashed the beast changer's head on the spot. At the same moment, the surface of the flesh of the other beast changers, a layer of constantly corroding green paste emerged. Corrosion effect, elemental fusion of electricity plus poison temporarily reduces enemy armor by 25% for 8 seconds, increasing by 2% with every attack. Stacking up to 10 layers, the percentage will increase as the crystal is upgraded. Zero is like Bumblebee from Transformers. Fists and feet, deadly moves, fully abusing the beast changers. As the beast changers became more and more numerous, they pounced on Su Hao and started tearing at the shield. Dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 dash 1, dash 2 dash 1 dash 1 dash 2. A number surfaced, yet it was so funny and ridiculous. Overclocking, mecha reinforcement, heresy, Su Hao's eyes flashed with a cold aura. The attributes were raised again. Continue to abuse the beast changers. GRRRRR. Suddenly, eerie cries rang out from the wreckage, only to see several monsters jumping up. They were very human like, but their spines were bent backward, almost pressing against the ground with their skyscrapers. The carapace was entwined with black tentacles. The right leg was extremely thick like Mr. Bodybuilder, and the left leg was as thin as a hemp pole. Jumper. Attributes Strength 10, Defense 5, Speed 11. Spirit 0. Characteristics, extremely strong legs. Weakness, left calf. Evaluation, I told you to practice deep squatting. I didn't tell you to practice only one side. Air stripping. Su Hao's expression was cold, and he pointed towards the sky. A translucent orb enveloped the jumpers. At once, they struggled up in pain and smashed heavily on the ground. When the air was completely stripped away, they could only tremble madly, continuously oozing out sticky liquid, and eventually died silently. Killed Beast Changers and Jumpers asterisk 45. Gained 780 experience points. Dropped 10,000 Fused Crystals asterisk 89. Drops Poison Flesh asterisk 50. Drops Strength Increaser asterisk 1. Drops Fey Alloy asterisk 26. Dropped Market Coin asterisk 698. Suhao nodded slightly. It's very different from the novice copy. Both in terms of intensity and the amount of materials. It's all going to exceed. The higher the difficulty, the tougher the challenge. The materials given at the same time were also very considerable. What surprised Su Hao the most was that the heretic burst out the power increaser. This was a rare prop that could increase the strength attribute. Strength increasing agent. Type, props. Effect, can only be used within level 20. Increase strength by 1 point. 50 bottles is the limit. If you drink any more, it won't have any effect. Please look for other power enhancers. Description, want to get stronger? Come to a bottle. Su Hao directly pulled it out looked at the red bottle in the mecha's big hand, unscrewed it, and drank it all. Power 1415. Good luck. Suhao smiled excitedly. 
It really deserves to be profanity. Continue. The broken streets. The sound of vehicles exploding resounded continuously. A purple and green mecha swung its iron fist like no one's business, crumbling an incoming jumper or beast changers. Army of the undead. With Zero's hands raised high, the mysterious and unfathomable power was like a monarch of the underworld, summoning the dead to return. The string puppet-like beast changers and jumpers joined the battle and became Su Hao's dead soldiers, pouncing on the enemies. Gain 1000 experience. Level 3 Level 4. All of Machine Zero's attributes rise slightly. Life value plus 30. Energy value plus 20. Armor plus 20. Shield plus 50. Strength. Defense. Speed plus 1. A new layer of metallic luster appeared on the surface of Machine Zero's armor, becoming even harder. Roar. At this moment, at the top of an abandoned house, a behemoth let out a deafening roar. Devourer. Elite. Attributes. Strength 20. Defense 20. Speed 12. Spirit 0. Characteristics. Devours everything. 1. Absorption. Cuts enemy attacks by 20%. 2. Vomit. Can regurgitate what it devours. Creating poisonous gas damage. Weakness. Corrosion. Evaluation. If you're not careful, you'll be killed in a group. The devourer has a human-like appearance, but wears a tattered suit, and its entire neck resembles a tumor growth. Extremely swollen and oozing pus. Its mouth grinned to the ear position, covered with sharp teeth and its pale eyes permeated with bizarre horror, starting to nibble at the surrounding beast changers, Su Hao laughed coldly, sending yourself to the door can be okay, air stripping, the air disappeared, the devourer's entire body was bruised and his voice came to a screeching halt, like he was being strangled, he was just about to retreat when the air suddenly returned, and at the same time, there was a huge steel armored iron fist that stormed in, bang, the devourer flew backwards as if he had been hit by a train, his body covered in green pulp and hissing continuously. Air stripping is pretty good. If Zhao Hong had used this move on me back then, it might have been a bit troublesome. Su Hao smiled. Of course, it was just a bit troublesome. Compared to beast changers and jumpers, devourers had a little bit more intelligence. However, it was just a little. Under the perverted state of machine flesh unity, it could only take a beating the entire time, with no power to fight back at all. Roar! The devourer screamed miserably. Its stomach bulged dramatically. Its throat wriggled as if it was about to spit out something. Su Hao immediately retreated and cast, air stripping, once again, heavily enveloping the devourer in it. G.A. The devourer had no breath. The vomit in its throat kept turning up yellow liquid. It eventually exploded completely inside. Kill devourer. Gain 500 experience points. A wisp of the market realm's aura surged into the market ripple. Drops, energy conversion, asterisk 1, heretic skill touch out. Drops Fei Alloy Asterisk 60. Drop, Virus, Asterisk 1. There were no drawings for the casting silo. This was expected by Su Hao. However, it actually popped out, Energy Conversion. This accessory crystal had an extremely low drop rate, and only dropped from infected monsters. Accessory Crystal, Energy Conversion, Level 0 slash Level 3. Quality, Flawless. Effects, When a mech's life value is full. The effect of picking up a life orb and getting black blood, desecration's third skill, can be automatically converted into energy value, currently at level 0. The conversion rate is 15%, level 1, 25%, level 2, 35%, and level 3, 50%. Description, does your skill have no cooldown or energy limit? Croak, there is quack. Flawless quality. This was Suha's first flawless crystal after being reborn. Still, energy conversion. It's comfortable. Individual crystals can be too damn comfortable. Crystals? Materials? It's not a problem. Su Hao turned his head to, Virus. Affiliated crystal, Virus, level 0 slash 5. Quality, excellent. Type, weapon. Effect, add 15% toxin damage to any weapon. Effect, add 15% toxin damage to any weapon. Description, this weapon of mine is coated with poison. Description, this weapon of mine is coated in poison, lick. Good. The more explosions the better. That way the mad poison will have crystals to load when it's built. Su Hao nodded slightly. You have killed the devourer. Do you want to stay on, or leave? It was worth mentioning. The scale of the infected land was extremely large. The more difficult it was, the more monsters there were. However, for the present day Su Hao, there was no need to go into deep contact. Leave. Took 3 hours and 35 minutes. Completes the quest. Rewarded with market coin asterisk 50,000. Being out of the decaying stranger's shadow. After returning, Su Hao had no time to mourn for the devourer and immediately opened the normal difficulty, infected land. It was the wrecked world again, with the familiar car horn. Rumble. Su Hao fell straight down from the tall building. The exact same scene was like a rewind. He grinned at the beast changer. Didn't expect it. I'm back again. 
Kill kill kill. He was like a tiger entering a herd of sheep, punching one and kicking a bunch. More peerless than if he had turned on peerless. Heresy, open. Desecration. Air stripping, open. Pump me. Tarantula on. Poke hard. Drops 398 molten crystals. Drops biomass asterisk 11. Drops strength booster asterisk 1. Drops defense increaser asterisk 1. A bunch of materials appeared in Suhao's market tattoo, delighting him. He wiped the non-existent sweat from his forehead. At the corner of his mouth, a smile bloomed. Labor is the most glorious. The ancients honestly do not deceive me. Roar. The devourer rushed out. Suha was prepared and directly, air stripping, suppressed it. Worth mentioning. Overclocking, can be turned on at any time, maintained for 30 minutes, with a cooldown of 1 hour. However, the second effect in, overclocking, was called, permanent residue. Triggering it 20 times would enhance strength, defense, and speed by 1 point, since spirit was 0 points. It could not be increased. Don't look at the small 1 point. It's very important in the early stages. Level 4 Level 5 All of Machine Zero's attributes have risen dramatically. Life value plus 50. Energy value plus 60. Armor plus 40. Shield plus 100. Strength. Defense. Speed plus 7. After not long, the Devourer once again drank the Northwest. Continue. Turn on the difficult mode. Su Hao said excitedly. Su Hao entered the infected land for the sixth time. However, this time, it was the difficult mode. When he opened his eyes, it no longer looked like the previous scene. The black sun had turned into a blood-colored moon, and the buildings, vehicles, and buildings were all tinted with a layer of red color, which looked especially weird. The beast changers had also changed. Their eyes had become crimson, just like mad beasts. Beast shifter. Attributes, strength 15, defense 15, speed 15, spirit 0. Attributes enhanced quite a bit. Su Hao sneered. But, it's useless. He still pushed all the way across. The crystals of mecha enhancement, plus air stripping, plus demonic spider, three sheets simply worked together seamlessly. Mecha reinforcement, strength and attributes. Air stripping, control the field. Spider attack. It was like a bulldozer-like kill that swept the field. Soon, the devourer made its appearance. The moment it saw Su Hao, it directly sent out vomit. The vomit was turbid and turned into a roiling poisonous gas, blocking all of Su Hao's vision. This time reflects the importance of weapons. Relying only on fists and feet, the attack distance is awkward. Su Hao let out a bitter smile in his heart. Without waiting for him to think more, the devourer found the right moment to open its bloody mouth and directly bit at Su Hao's mech arm. Air stripping. The air was drawn away by an invisible force. The entire area instantly turned into a vacuum. The devourer struggled frantically, its pale eyes almost glaring out. Die. Su Hao's gaze was cold. The iron fist smashed out and the spider spear penetrated. The devourer drank another and another northwest. Kill devourer. Gain 1500 experience value. Drops biomass asterisk 25. Drops virus asterisk 1. Drops foundry warehouse drawing asterisk 1. Drops life restorer asterisk 3. Finally, seeing the foundry warehouse drawings got Su Hao. He couldn't help but laugh out loud. Congratulations on being the first human to break out the foundry warehouse drawings. Please leave your name or title. Su Hao thought about it. In the end, he left the infected land after leaving his title. Global notification. Human, Doke, took the lead in exploding the casting warehouse drawings for the benefit of all humans. From now on, all the stranger shadow of decay will be able to extract the foundry warehouse drawings from monsters. This message rang out in the minds of all humans. Immediately, a huge wave was set off. Twitter. OMG. Don, this title is just too handsome. Are the handsome men of the United States of America envious? Let me tell you the answer. Doak is none other than my Scylla Kingdom. Nonsense. Curry flavor. It's clearly a genius of my Tianju. Such a zen-like character, Doak. For a while, foreign countries began to boil. Everyone was guessing who this Doak really was. Of course, there were some shameless people who insisted that Doak was theirs, and even said that the universe was created by them. Within China, apps such as Douyin, Slowhand, and P Station were also discussing intensely. Thanks to Dunn. I just popped out the casting bin drawings. Ha ha ha, I happen to have weapon drawings. Got rich. Bro upstairs. Can you sell me the casting barn drawings? I'll trade you 100g of teacher's seeds. 100g? Brother look at me. I hold 20t of knowledge education videos in my hand. He he he. No matter how noisy it was outside, it couldn't affect Su Hao. At this moment, he was resting in Wanjia Footwash City. Don't get me wrong. It's a proper rest. Ding. For the welfare of all mankind. Rewarded with one, casting acceleration roll. When Su Hao saw this message,
His expression rippled and he was satisfied in his heart. In the early stage, acceleration rolls were precious and could not be exploded at all. This was also considered an unexpected pleasure. Casting warehouse, required materials, biomass asterisk 200, xeno alloy asterisk 300, tainted flesh and blood asterisk 30, market coin asterisk 30,000, time, 24 hours, maniacal poison, type, shotgun, required material, poison flesh asterisk 300, xeno alloy asterisk 450, market coin asterisk 20,000, time, 12 hours, there is currently no casting silo, unable to cast weapons, use the acceleration roll to build the casting silo first, wait for 12 hours, and then cast mad poison, Su Hao planned, thought of doing it, only to see Su Hao's market tattoo faintly shining, the drawing of the casting silo appeared, while absorbing all the required materials into it, one should know that Su Hao had challenged the infected land, six times in one day, bursting out countless materials, the 10,000 fused crystals were as high as 3, 000, the marketplace coins were even up to 500, 000, it wasn't an exaggeration to say that there wouldn't be many people in the world who were richer than him. This was all thanks to desecration. Materials doubled. Resources doubled. Other people were still wandering around at level 2 and 3, not having enough of all kinds of materials, agonizing over how to speed brush. Su Hao, on the other hand, had long since realized material freedom. Use, casting acceleration roll. Su Hao raised his palm. The market pattern surfaced the casting silo that was being fused. In the next second, Casting accelerated 10,000 times. The casting silo was completed in a flash. Casting silo was completed. Please claim it. After claiming the casting silo, Suha began to make mad poison. During the waiting period, he wasn't idle either. Strength increasing agent. Drink. Defense increasing agent. Pour. Speed increasing agent. Dazzle. With a flurry of operations, the attributes rubbed up. Then, he fell asleep. After dozens of hours of work, his nerves had long since reached a critical point. A good night's sleep restored his spirit. The weapon casting was also finished. The dawn of a new era meant chaos. Therefore, on the morning of January 4, 2035, Huaxia announced the creation of the Mecha Alliance to control all Mets. The only way to keep the danger, the chaos away from this country. If the Mets were allowed to do wrong and act recklessly, the entire country would be plunged into endless smoke. When this news came out, it only set off some waves, and then settled down. This was because the people were still in a state of ignorance. After our investigation and research, Decaying Stranger's Shadow resembles the laws of an online game. For example, first kill, first pass, you'll be able to get rare rewards. In the game there would be a service-wide notification. We've now become a global notification. If we want China to be powerful in a short time, we need to upgrade as soon as possible. Raise the crystal level, and train those A rank, S rank and above mechs. Allow the conglomerates the big families to form organizations of mecha masters, and then incorporate these geniuses, the strong ones into the alliance, the top echelons of Huaxia never lacked smart people, soon, a directive was issued, make sure to let them pass the easy and normal difficulties, seated, a middle-aged man sat with a serious expression, starting from the hard mode, the materials will increase exponentially, and the probability of crystals popping out is higher, it's necessary to fight for every second, Mi City, Wanja Foot Wash City, Waking up with a sleep, Su Hao ate his breakfast and then collected the mad poison, maniacal poison, weapon type, shotgun, trigger type, full auto, attributes, strike rate, 10%, probability of 10% strike causing double damage, 90% causing basic damage, strike multiplier, 2, 0, magazine capacity, 20, ammo reserve, 240, shrapnel, 5, each shrapnel does independent damage, damage attenuation, 50% damage reduction from 10 meters, 90% damage reduction from 15 meters or more. Total damage, 350, poison plus impact. Current slot crystals, none. Mad poison doesn't have a high bludgeon rate, but the base damage is substantial, making it very suitable for use in the first and middle stages. Moreover, once the level cap is breached, a brand new crystal will appear that can pull up the gun's full attributes by several levels. That's why it was hailed as a newbie artifact. Of course, the mad poison also had a drawback. That is short. Note, the weapon has 8 crystal slots. It's all up to the mech to freely choose. Some choose base damage, some choose bludgeoning, and some choose rate of fire. It's not very strict. After upgrading the crystals, start challenging the nightmare difficulty. Suhao's eyes welled up with excitement and anticipation. After clearing the nightmare difficulty, I'm going to make the first pass to the hell difficulty. Codename, Machine Zero, Infinity. Level, 5. Quality, Normal. 
Life value, 998. Energy, 486. Armor, 135. When the shield drops to zero, the armor serves to protect the mech from less damage. Shield, 420. Shield can be automatically restored. Material, metal. Material, metal. Attributes, strength, 34. Defense, 38. Speed, 28. Spirit, 0. After taking an enhancer. Core crystal, tarantula, level 3 fifths. Individual crystals, I transform always, none. Blasphemy, level 3 fifths. Overclocking, level March 5th. Suffocating wormhole, level 3 fifths. Subsidiary crystals, vitality, level 2 slash 10. Weak electricity, level 2 slash 5. Kawuro, level 2 slash 5. Transcendent shield, level 2 slash 5. Detection radar, level 1 slash 5. Energy conversion, level 1 slash 3. The crystal upgrade was complete. Suhao only felt unprecedented relief and power. Although he spent all the 10,000 fusion crystals, it was cool. Afterwards, he greeted his boss and entered the infected land without looking back. Nightmare level. Beginning. Location, infected land. Level, 1. Difficulty, nightmare. Mission, kill the fissionaries within 5 hours. Description, the world has fallen. And the one who started it all, the one who infected it all, is slowly awakening, revisiting the infected land. Su Hao saw that the world was completely broken. The description had also changed. Once the hell difficulty is turned on, it's time to duel with him. His gaze was fixed, but he didn't feel worried. As long as the value is above you, I can slaughter the gods. Within the field of vision, beast changers and jumpers could be seen everywhere. Even devourers could be seen by several heads. One word summed it up, chaos. Let's try the power of mad poison first. Suha's voice was low. Click 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 click. Zero's right armored hand surged, combining into a shotgun that was greenish in color. The sharp muzzle, streamlined overall, had a highly poisonous mottled surface that extended all the way to the stock position. The cold and merciless metallic luster was particularly terrifying in the eerie blood-colored moonlight. Hearing the sound, the beast changers turned their heads and roared hideously. Suha didn't hesitate for half a second. Mad poison raised and pulled the trigger. Shrapnel splashed. Bang 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 bang. Minus 78. Minus 350. Dash 700. Dash 1400. Dash 700. Dash 350. Minus 89. The power of the maniacal poison was quite terrifying. The bullets sprayed out furiously, beating the beast changers into sieves on the spot, with blood and black liquid flowing all over the place. After one shot, the wild poison magazine automatically came off. Suhao's right hand coagulated armor pieces formed a magazine and reloaded it, gripped it tightly, and continued to fire. What bullshit jumpers! What disgusting devourer! Directly stuff his mouth with a pike, pull the trigger, and kill them all! Open heresy! The corpses were enveloped in desecration, bursting out materials in pieces, even shotgun shells. This way Suha was not afraid of running out of bullets at all. Nightmare difficulty? Damn easy difficulty! Drops, energy conversion, asterisk 1. Suha smiled. Hito! Fusion on the spot! While others were still struggling hard in hard mode, Suha was already rampaging through nightmare difficulty. Fissioneer. Attributes. Strength 35. Defense 40. Speed 11. Spirit 0. Characteristics. It's almost immortal. Weakness. Please destroy the egg pods before they hatch. Evaluation. What about you flinging seeds across the room? The fissioner was quite a bit more massive than the other infected creatures. Standing about 4 meters tall and walking on two trembling legs, while the upper half of its body was incredibly swollen like a swollen sack that was about to burst, with its heart, liver, spleen, lungs, and kidneys hanging above it, constantly dripping with yellow liquid. Its mouth was nowhere to be found, yet it could let out roars, shouting loudly for other monsters. Suhao picked up the mad venom, coldly looked at the fissioner, and then pulled the trigger. One minute later, the fissioner fell to his knees, trembling violently, surrounded by the miserable corpses of beast changers, jumpers, and devourers. Human body. It's wonderful, isn't it? Suhao smiled and asked as he felt the soothing feeling of the unity of the body. Bang! The bullet flew out and penetrated the upper half of the fissioner's body. The fissioner was wiped out, and ten egg pods fell out around it, with the sound of heartbeats constantly coming out from inside, like breeding a new monster. Suhao shot one by one, killing them on the spot. Killed fissioner asterisk one, beast changer and other monsters asterisk 176, dropped experience value 10, 700. Level 5 Level 7. Machine Zero's attributes have increased slightly. Life value plus 40. Energy value plus 30. Armor plus 20. Shield plus 50. Strength and defense speed plus 3. Zero's attributes rise slightly. Life value plus 50. Energy value plus 10. 
Armor plus 10. Shield plus 20. Power defense speed plus 3. Cool. Suhao couldn't help but laugh. With a weapon, the combat efficiency was pulled up a notch. Especially a high damage shotgun like Mad Poison. With a mech that fought at close range. It was a perfect match. Drops, basic shot, asterisk 2. Drops, million fusion crystals, asterisk 480. Drops scorch, asterisk 1. Drops poisonous flesh, asterisk 490. Narada more, asterisk 9. Biomass, asterisk 76. Active flesh, asterisk 215. Strength increaser, asterisk 2. Defense increaser, asterisk 3. Speed increaser, asterisk 1. Casting bin drawing, asterisk 2. Attachment crystal, basic shot, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Type, weapon. Effects, increase base damage to weapon by 15% effects, increase base damage to weapon by 15%. Description, lift your face up and I'll make some big holes for you. Attachment crystal, scorch, level 0 slash 5. Quality, excellent. Type, weapon, type, weapon. Effect, adds 15% fire elemental damage to the weapon. Effect, adds 15% fire elemental damage to the weapon. Description, fire cupping? Suhao looked at the two weapon attachment crystals and didn't dawdle. Immediately loading and upgrading them. The attributes skyrocketed again. Back to Wanja Foot Wash City. What came to the surface was bustling. The fear of a new era coming was slowly dissipating. It was because those who awakened the market marks would be able to enter the decaying stranger's shadow to swipe things, such as materials, drawings, and other props. It was a whole new way of life. Everyone's faces were filled with excitement and thrill because of the unknown. This is called, Infected Land. Someone just put a guide online. I heard that someone has already cast an infection class mecha. Little brother give way. We, the Mi City sisters, want to go over there. A large group of people gathered around to take pictures. There were also quite a few people entering the rift to brush materials. The scene was like a Netflix punch point. Suhao let out a faint smile, shook his head, and left in stride. He was going to rest and recuperate for a while, then kill Nightmare a few more times. And finally he was going to do hell difficulty. Oh, Suhao had just sat down when a message probed out. The Chinese Mecha Alliance was established? Hmm, the date is right. The establishment of the Huaxia Mecha Alliance did not surprise Suhao. This was because there was a need to control the restless hearts of certain people. Otherwise the country would be in chaos. I have an impression that the Sakura country seems to be restless during this period of time. Suhao suddenly thought of something, and his gaze gradually turned cold. Most of the land of Sakura country suffered from destruction, and the number of people who died was even more countless, but the elite personnel did not have much loss. In Suhao's memory, Sakura country wanted to develop secretly in China. This had to mention the ninja mechs of Sakura country. They were mysterious and unpredictable, and were good at sneaking around. Although they were finally discovered by the Chinese mecha alliance, a lot of resources and talents were lost in the meantime. Just in time, there are quite a few independent crystals in the cherry blossom country very good. Su Hao grinned, then turned his head to look in the direction of the bay. If I remember correctly, they will land at the seashore of Rice City. The date is the night of January 7th. Between thoughts, Su Hao stood up and entered the infected land once again. Even the most perfect plan needed strength as a foundation. Upgrade first. P.S. Friendly reminder. This book is extremely hot-blooded. Please carry a boomerang with you to go on fire. Sakura Country. Shadow Village. The original prosperous and lively scene was a wreck. Scorched black marks everywhere. Those who didn't know thought the little boy had come back. People were busy building houses. A piece of fiery red leaves fluttered in midair like lit fireworks, eventually landing on the window edge of an old building. Inside the house, half of the sunlight poured in, while the other half appeared dark and gloomy. Immediately after, a pair of eyes of different colors opened. The national land has been extensively damaged. I propose that we enter the countries to survey them and find a suitable location to survive. An old man wore a white-based robe with red accents, his mouth biting on a pipe as his mellow voice echoed out. His name was Sarutobi Sasuke, the village chief of the Shadow Village, with absolute command. Agreed. Agreed. I agree. The others had no objections and nodded their heads. Huaxia is a large land suitable for development, and nowadays it must be in chaos, so there shouldn't be any problems with blending in. The cold middle-aged man spoke. He was called Jiro Inoue, a member of the Shadow Village Assassination Department. The man with blonde hair and blue pupils next to him nodded, not only China, but other countries as well, as well as the ability to start a war if necessary. Vortex Boron. Sarutobi Sasuke exhaled a smoke ring. You guys come in. Creak. The door to the room was pushed. A group of young men slowly walked in. They wore mechas that were cold with a slump, and their streamlined mechas appearance gave a visual sense of machine man unity. The leader was named Maelstrom Boron, with blonde hair and blue pupils, 
With the arrogance and uninhibitedness of youth on his face, his mech was unique, with red fluff on the surface of his ruddy armor, constructed into the outline of a red maple leaf, wearing a sword at his waist, and a tail extending from the back of his mech, swaying slightly, very ghostly. The sci-fi future mecha and the Sakura Nation's ninja culture blended together, colliding to create a peculiar flavor. Huashia is the closest to us, it's the best choice. Sarutobi Sasuke looked at Whirlpool Boron, his demeanor cold. After you land, make sure to hide your whereabouts before sending the information back to the Shadow Village. Don't worry Grandpa Village Chief, now that the world is in chaos, China definitely can't take care of itself. Maelstrom Boron said smugly, with my, battle frenzy, I can fight across any level 2 to 3. Who can kill me in China? When the market realm hadn't descended, Sakura country was already in a precarious situation. The entire country was surrounded by polluted seawater, and it had long been thinking about how to break the situation. Now, the market realm had arrived. Sakura country had awakened the unique ninja mecha. Wouldn't the sky be high enough for birds to fly and the sea be wide enough for fish to leap? Wait for my good news, Ojisama. Oh, After saying that, Whirlpool Boron mechanically made a seal with both hands, and a white smoke enveloped them. When the smoke dissipated, it was gone. This world, in the end, will be in the hands of the strong. Sarutobi Sasuke looked out the window, his tone cold. China, Rice City, inside the Wanja Footwash City, Suha walked out from the infected land. He had already brushed up to level 8. Level 7 level 8. All of Zero's attributes have risen slightly. Life value plus 20. Energy value plus 20. Armor plus 15. Shield plus 20. Strength plus 2. Defense plus 2. Speed plus 2. It's time to go challenge the hell difficulty. But before that, boost the attributes up a bit. Suha took out the increase potion and started pouring it in hard. It couldn't be helped. Who made desecration so perverse that corpses could explode props? Piles and piles of increase potions were piled up in the warehouse. And he could only drink them reluctantly. Strength 4058. Defense 4469. Speed 3452. Suha burped and turned around to enter the infected land again. Please choose your difficulty. Hell. Attention. Attention. The mortality rate of hell difficulty is extremely high. And the attributes of monsters will increase dramatically. So please form a team or improve your attributes before coming to challenge. Su Hao looked calm. Enter. After saying this, his body was disintegrated by the particles and sucked into the middle of the rift. Location. Infected land. Level. 1. Difficulty. Hell. Mission. No time limit. Please kill the destroyer. Description. The world is destroyed. Everything dies. Description, the world is destroyed. Everything perishes. The true destroyer has descended. He will destroy everything he can see to the end of the universe. No one can win against him. It's over. It's over. This time, the black sun and the blood-colored moon coexisted. The combination of the two bizarre colors seemed to be able to affect the spirits of living things. The dilapidated city was already covered with blood-colored tentacles, which looked like they were eating the buildings or assimilating everything. When Suhao appeared, he saw monsters all over the place densely packed, just like mole crickets, and they stood bizarrely in place, motionless, as if they were worshipping the king. The throne composed of tentacles, vines, blood, and pieces of meat, sat an odd human. He, with cold features, purple skin, and black and red rays turning into tattoos faintly flickering on his torso, was scrutinizing Su Hao. Judging from his eyes, he obviously possessed a not-so-low level of intelligence. Destroyer. Attributes. Strength 80. Defense 80. Speed 50. Spirit 35. Characteristics. 1. Blood Demon Heavenly Meteor. 2. Soul Shock. 3. Death Form. Weaknesses. Corrosion. Heart. Comments. He only wants to return to the home that was once covered in sunlight. But how can he go back when his home is gone? When I rule this world, there will be no more humans. And you, Griffin, what did you come out of? Tell me. And perhaps I can spare your life. He was speaking. He was pitying. He was scornful. Me? Su Hao smiled. It's here to slaughter the gods. Unbridled. Kill him. The destroyer was suddenly bored. His fingers tapping on the armrest. In an instant, thousands of monsters rushed in. Like an endless tide that shook the earth. However, Su Hao stood still and didn't move. Six spider spears popped out from his back, slowly pointing at the sky at the same time. Air stripping. A semi-transparent orb-like object instantly appeared. The monsters within 40 meters all fell to the ground at this moment lying weakly at Su Hao's feet. Seek death. Su Hao coldly stared at the destroyer. The six spider spears seemed to have an autonomous consciousness at this moment, dancing crazily, hardening the beast changer, leaper, devourer, and fissioner. Poo poo poo. A corpse, 
like a pile of small mountains, accumulated behind Su Hao, army of the undead. Su Hao's palm clutched the ghostly blue light and fell into the ground, and all the dead monsters around him, like circus dolls, stood up with weird trembling. Thousands of monsters stood behind him like faithful slaves, causing a hint of shock to flow from the destroyer's pupils. Now, it's your turn. Su Hao held mad poison in his hand and smiled evilly. Become my experience value. God, how interesting. Griffins can actually enslave the dead. The destroyer slowly stood up and looked down at Su Hao. Good thing too. I hope you can give me a hint of pleasure. Boom. The black fleshy wings behind his back popped open, which were 8 meters long, wide and thick, and could almost be described as covering the sky. In a flash, a terrifying sense of oppression forced its way towards Su Hao, a god that can talk. Su Hao narrowed his eyes slightly. The so-called decaying stranger's shadow was actually a broken and failed reincarnation world. Each god was a world ruler. However, most of the gods were clueless and only retained the most basic instincts. There was also a big event involved. Of course, these were still too far away. There was only one thing Su Hao had to do now, and that was to kill the destroyer. Rumble. The destroyer's wings vibrated, and a wild wind swept through the air, hovering in midair with an indifferent demeanor. Griffin, I'll give you the chance to strike first. That's a big thank you. Su Hao smiled faintly. Swish. Zero. Whose speed was as high as 52? Maneuvered. Just like an invisible lightning. Running over the earth. The destroyer's eyes were slightly blurred. In the next moment, Su Hao had already killed. Buzz. All directions were enveloped by translucent orbs. The air disappeared in an instant. He felt that his heart was beating violently. And the blood aura in his iris kept blooming. As if death was coming. ka -ching. Mad Venom raised and aimed at the destroyer's head. The index finger pulled the trigger. Bang bang bang. One shot? Sorry. A pike. Minus 1680. 1680. 1680 to 1680. Minus 3360. 6720. 1680. 3360. Minus 350. 3360. Minus 350. 350. Minus 658. Minus 479. A series of numbers floated up from the destroyer's head. Su Hao upgraded Mad Poison's virus, Scorch, and Basic Shot to level 3, increasing them by 60%, 60%, and 60, 5% respectively. The damage directly exploded. Bang! The last shot rang out. Both sides steadily landed on the ground. Su Hao stood. Destroyer was kneeling. A single pike brought the Hell Difficulty Destroyer to its knees. The blood bar is really thick. Su Hao looked at the destroyer that was healing its head and couldn't help but sigh in his heart. It was worthy of being the ultimate boss of hell difficulty. Not only was the blood thick, the defense power was also high. Soon, the destroyer's head healed. His expression was no longer as calm as before. It was all shock and fury. I am the strongest in the world. Who the hell are you? He roared angrily. Su Hao replied coldly. I'm just a mecha master who passed by to slaughter the gods. Bang bang bang. The gun rang again and bullets flew. The destroyer frantically danced his black flesh wings to escape, but he was still hit in the torso. Another series of numbers rose. However, this time it missed the head, and the damage was much lower. Give me death. The destroyer roared, only to see his body wrapped in black light, constantly bursting with bizarre colors. Death form, his entire body will be covered in absorbed flesh and blood, rapidly recovering his life value. Roar. He let out a roar. The sound wave was mixed with spiritual shock, instantly enveloping Su Hao. Soul shock, increase all negative statuses by 50%. Continuously deduct life value by zero. One until life value drops to zero. Su Hao felt a splitting headache and could only quickly retreat. His spirit was not high. The resistance to this kind of spiritual attack was very poor. It seems like I need to find a chance to raise my spirit up, he said in his heart. At this moment, the light in the sky was obscured. When Su Hao raised his head, he saw the destroyer rushing up into the sky. I am the answer. I am everything. All of you are ants. The roar of the destroyer spread throughout the entire sky. And then, it forced its way down at extreme speed. Rumble. His body continued to bloom with blood, like a blood-colored canopy enveloping the entire metropolis. Blood demon heavenly meteor. The moment it lands, it creates a 200-meter wide pool of blood, and any creatures within it will be subjected to bleeding effects until they die. Bang. The earth shook, and the sea of blood rushed. Instantly, Su Hao was completely drowned. Even those infected monsters let out miserable cries in an instant. Their torsos continued to soar with blood, and they soon bled to death. In the pool of blood, the destroyer looked at the dead griffins and his tone was icy, Griffin, this is what happens when you anger me. 
What did you say? Can you speak louder? Suddenly, a teasing voice rang out. The destroyer's pupils trembled. He turned his head violently, only to see Su Hao unharmed. Why? Who on earth is the strongest person in this world? How come he didn't bleed to death? He didn't understand, much less understand. Su Hao swept his eyes downwards, and his afterglow fell on the ring on his finger. Ring of Lantidus suppresses the bleeding effect by 50%, grants the mech a continuous blood return, returning zero, one life value per second. However, he didn't speak. Responding to the destroyer was the gunshot. Bang 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 bang. A barrage sprayed out. The destroyer's head didn't directly explode this time, but tumbled to the ground. His chest slowly cracked open. A beating purple heart emerged inside. Weakness. Suha raised his mad poison against that purple heart and sneered. Congratulations on being the first god I've killed. Bang. Minus 10,080. A yellow number floated up. The destroyer stared in disbelief as purple blood continued to gush out of his mouth as if he wanted to remember the mole that had killed him. In the end, his body gradually solidified and faded away with a gust of wind. Level 8 Level 10 All of Zero's attributes have risen significantly. Life value plus 200. Energy value plus 200. Armor plus 100. Shield plus 400. Strength plus 25. Defense plus 21. Speed plus 19. Overflow experience will be retained until the level cap is exceeded and returned to you. Congratulations on becoming the first mech to pass hell difficulty in the blue star world. Congratulations on passing the infected land hell difficulty. But all of China's land will have its resources doubled due to your efforts for 24 hours. Reward casting acceleration roll asterisk 2. Core crystal, son of the sun asterisk 1. Weapon drawing, blade of contempt asterisk 1. Drop subsidiary crystals, steel bone asterisk 1. Extreme power asterisk 1, 10,000 fusion crystals asterisk 5,000. Poisoned flesh asterisk 980. Heart of Destruction Asterisk 1, Nerve Tumor Asterisk 17, Active Flesh Block Asterisk 544. Hearing these rewards, Su Hao couldn't help but breathe heavily. Son of the Sun, ha ha ha, it still has to be hell difficulty, and the Blade of Contempt. Shit shit shit, these two things have extremely low probability and can only appear in hell difficulty, and they actually burst out at once. Su Hao finally stopped suppressing it and laughed madly. Core Crystal, Son of the Sun, Level 0 Slash Level 3. Quality, epic, effect, 1. Light sufficiency, wherever you stand in a place with light, you can enhance your life value, strength, defense, speed, and spirit by 200%, no energy value required, currently level 0, level 1, 300%, level 2, 500%, level 3, 800%, 2. Immortality, bathe in the light of the sun, can constantly and continuously restore life value, no energy value required. Currently level 0, 10 slash S. Currently level 0, level 1, 50 slash S. Level 2, 100 slash S. Level 3, 200 slash S. 3 flight, after opening, it will continuously deduct energy value. 0, 5 slash S. Currently level 0, level 1, 1 slash S. Level 2, 2 slash S. Level 3, 3 slash S. The higher the level, the faster the flight speed. For solar flare, gathering the light of the sun in both eyes, it can fire a beam of light that deals 200% fire elemental damage, deducting 300 energy value, currently level 0, level 1, 300%, level 2, 500%, level 3, 1000%. Description, know the gold content of Superman? Su Hao sucked in a breath of cold air. It was worthy of being an epic core crystal. In his last life, Su Hao saw others with the, son of the sun, stance, practically the Superman of DC Comics, omnipotent with a horrifying battle power to the extreme, and envied himself. Unexpectedly, the first person in this life to possess the Son of the Sun was actually himself. Attachment Crystal, Extreme Power, Level 0 out of 10, Quality, Flawless, Effect, Increases the Strength Value of the Mech by 50%. Description, How can Steel be compared to Worked Out Muscles? Attachment Crystal, Iron and Steel, Grade 0 out of 10, Quality, Flawless, Effects, Increases the Defense Value of the Mech by 50% Effects, increases the defense value of the mech by 50%. Description, extreme strength, do you have the guts to say that again? In addition to the epic level, son of the sun, there were also two flawless accessory crystals. Su Hao understood that his attributes were about to have another big explosion. Drawing of the blade of contempt, type, melee weapon. Description, a giant scythe, 15 meters in length, with a contempt condition that reduces the enemy's spirit value. The description of the drawing was very short. But Su Hao knew that this scythe could be ranked in the top 100 of melee weapons. Don't look at the top 100 as being very shabby. 
As the level cap continued to rise and the copies continued to be mined, various weapon drawings appeared like a hundred flowers. It's not an exaggeration to say, the number of weapons is 10, 000 plus. Therefore, the top 100 status was already quite anticlimactic. Now, Huaxia should be boiling. Su Hao organized his emotions and smiled faintly. The moment Blue Star Global heard that, Solo, had beaten Hell difficulty, it was as if the whole planet was shaking violently, especially when they learned that, Dun, was from China. The foreign countries even went crazy directly. OMG, Dun, is actually not a white person from our United States of America. If you find, Dok, look at his ancestors, must be our Silla country people. Rounding method, he is still my Silla country. By the way, I apply for heritage. Wasia can actually enjoy the 24-hour doubling of resources? Fark, book me a ticket to Wasia. The countries were noisy and the masses were arguing. At the same time they were filled with curiosity. What kind of person was, Dok? Within China, the boiling level of this beautiful land was in no way lower than that of foreign countries. Dok, great god is actually from our Huaxia, cowardly. Thank you, Dok, dad. Thank you, Dok, ancestor. I just happen to need big chunks of flesh and blood. Doubling resources is just awesome. This, Dok, God, he's not cultivated by the state, is he? Well, absolutely. Who else would have this much power? Douyin, Slow Hand, P Station and other contemporary young peoples must install apps were all fiercely discussing the origin of, Dun. The Huaxia Mecha Alliance was even more so as all of them were dumbfounded. In the open air tent of the base, a middle aged man with a serious face asked, Long Jianchuan, is, Dun, a secret weapon that you secretly cultivated? Long Jianchuan was in his thirties, with proper features. At this moment, he was also puzzled. He shook his head repeatedly. No, my first squad is brushing materials at the Emperor's Mausoleum in the capital. Not to mention, we wouldn't take a nickname like Dun. Old Huang, you're the one who messed up. Don't slander me. Long Jianchuan slowed down and suspiciously looked at the middle-aged man in front of him. Huang Dust's days coalesced and his voice was low. Nationwide search for the whereabouts of Dun. We must get him to join the Huaxia Mecha Alliance. However, his character must be tested. Today's times are unstable. We cannot nurture a white-eyed wolf. Long Jianchuan thought deeply for a second time. If possible, raise the nation's strength to nurture him. If this, Dok, is of good character, then what if Huaxia cultivates him? Only a fool would be making moves against him. Execute immediately. As the chief commander of the Huaxia Mecha Alliance, Huang Dust directly ordered, leaving the infected land. Su Hao pulled out his cell phone, and all sorts of news popped up. He ignored it and looked at the date. January 7th. Time to go. Su Hao turned around and left Wanja Foot Wash City. Tonight, the Sakura Country's Shadow Village Ninja Mechs were going to land on China's Linhai, with the location at the Mi Chung Bay. Whirlpool Boron. His independent crystal was Su Hao's target this time. Battle Frenzy. Rank S. Effect. 1. Strike gain, attacks generate a combo number. The higher the combo number, the higher the rate of strikes. To my blood boils, blood boils. Temperature gets hotter and hotter following time. And attack speed gets higher and higher. Battle frenzy, it's good for fighting. There is no need to say how important blitz rate is. The maelstrom Boren who possessed it became the top person in blue star in his last life. Especially when combined with a ninja mecha. It killed people invisibly. After opening the obelisk tower, two people will come from the United States of America side. So I'll collect them all together then as well. Su Hao boarded the bus thinking secretly in his heart. It was a bumpy ride. He slowly fell asleep over and didn't wake up until his destination. The sea breeze blew, mixed with the salty flavor. What came into Su Hao's eyes was exactly the constantly churning waves. The sky gradually darkened. Hiddenly, there was also a flash of lightning that swept by, resounding with a muffled buzzing sound. Su Hao took out the food and chewed it slowly, waiting for the night to fall, then took down the magic spider and loaded the son of the sun. Rumble. The wind at night was very strong and the waves were noisy, constantly lapping at the coast and swirling a lot of sea fish. After a wave, five mechs were streaming seawater, spewing vapor from their slits, and were vigilantly observing the surroundings. It was none other than Maelstrom Boren and the others from the Shadow Village. There's a man on the highway. A black-haired man with bundled hair said. Maelstrom Boren nodded. Go around him and let's move on. The five men slowly stood up and prepared to ride their ninja mechs away, when one man suddenly exclaimed. That man on the highway is gone. Don't make a fuss. It's just gone. Whirlpool Boren waved his hand in dissatisfaction. The bundle-haired man's pupils contracted. Simply because, a red dot appeared on his mecha's operation panel. It was clearly behind. Them. He's behind. The bundle-haired man immediately yelled. Swirling Boren and the others immediately reacted. 
scattering the instant they did so, taking out a single shuriken and throwing it towards the dark sea. Ding ding ding. The hand swords erupted with bright sparks. Whirlwind. Everything returned to calm. After a while, a voice slowly probed out from the darkness. What you guys did just now, can I understand it as? You guys are declaring war. To me? The cold voice reached the ears of Maelstrom Boren and the others. Although they couldn't understand it, it seemed, this mech was very unhappy. Boren, what should we do? The man with bundled hair whispered. Maelstrom Boren's complexion kept changing, and then became sinister. Originally, he had planned to sneak in, but he hadn't thought that he would be discovered. Since that was the case, it would be straightforward to kill. Kill this annoying dog. Maelstrom Boren bellowed, his hands quickly forming seals, and fiery red patterns began to emerge on the surface of the mech. The four men with bundled hair clenched their teeth and swept towards Su Hawa's residual shadows. A mech's hands formed a seal, and endless darkness enveloped them like a large net. Shadow binding technique. The second mech's body was glowing with blue light patterns, and at the moment of sealing, the mouth of the head armor split open, from which sharp wind blades were spat out. Kaito. Wind blade. Fire transportation. Fireball technique. Maelstrom Boring pinched one hand into a circle, and the moment a bit of flame was spewed out from the mechanical mouth. It immediately turned into a giant fireball with a diameter of 5 meters wide, overpowering towards Su Hao. The third and fourth ninja mechs also unleashed Thunder Escape and Water Escape ninjutsu. Rumble. The blazing flames of light illuminated the beach with incomparable brightness, and the sand was even burned to a glittering glassy luster, which showed how horrible the temperature was. A moment later, the five regrouped. Whirlpool Boren looked at the blazing flames, his tone arrogant and uninhibited, although it's not clear who he is, but as long as he dies, everything will be over. As soon as the words left his mouth, the flames suddenly exploded, splattering in all directions like starbursts. A golden mecha gleamed in the firelight, the surface of its armor branded with sun patterns that extended all over its body, and its gold-traced cape danced slightly. It stood as if it was an undying sun god armor, deeply shocking the maelstrom Boren 5. Dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 dash 0 dash 0 dash 0 dash 0 dash 0. Looking at the series of numbers floating up above his head, Su Hao smiled. So damn cool. Bang hard. Can't even hit it. Trigger sufficient light. Life value 44A5. Life force 212% plus light sufficiency 300%. Strength 456. 5. Strength 50% plus light sufficiency 300%. Defense 495. Steel 50% plus light sufficiency 300%. Speed 284, light sufficiency 300%. Seeing these skyrocketing values, Su Hao's eyes filled with a hint of pity when he looked at Maelstrom Boren and the others. The copy was empty, and the boss was in blue star. Die. Su Hao lifted his mad poison and shot without hesitation. Bang bang bang. The bullets soared wildly. One of them was directly shot into a sieve. The mech shattered, and his forehead, thigh, calf, and head were all penetrated. Maelstrom Boren's eyes barely glared out of their sockets. What kind of monster is this? They roared furiously in their hearts. Maelstrom Boren had the fastest reflexes and roared. Escape! There's something wrong with this Chinese person. The other three turned around and ran. But at this time, Su Hao's eyes turned crimson, and the sunlight he absorbed in the afternoon began to coalesce out. Solar flare. Buzz. A laser cannon-like sound echoed out. The three ninja mechs were cut off on the spot. Under the high temperature, their wounds instantly scalded and scabbed over, leaving only endless wailing and screaming. The terrifying beams of the sun turned the sand of the beach into glass. The dark clouds that had originally shrouded the night were also annihilated at this moment, exposing a brief moment of light. This scene could be seen clearly by the entire Rice City. Mom and Dad, come out. It's dawn. On the apartment, a girl screamed. Countless people looked up at the laser that broke through the sky. The scene was like the descent of a god. In the sandy beach, the beams of Su Hao's eyes gradually dimmed. He saw the miserable trio and let out a long sigh of relief in his heart. Fortunately, he didn't turn on the highest power. Otherwise, he would really become a motherlander. On the side, Maelstrom Boren, who was preparing to escape, trembled with fear. His pupils were quaking. What on earth had he encountered? Susanu? Or, Amaterasu Amikami? Suhao looked towards Whirlpool Hirohito and slowly walked over. The golden mechanical hand was placed on his ninja mecha's head and gently twisted. Immediately, sparks flew and the machine burst. It was also accompanied by a sharp Sakura Nation language. My lord, please spare my life. I am willing to tell you the truth. Maelstrom Boren screamed loudly and miserably. He didn't even dare to use his independent crystal and chose to beg for mercy on the spot. Noisy. Su Hao didn't bother to speak. And with a lift of his hand, he directly slapped Maelstrom Boren's head to pieces. To be powerful was to do whatever one wanted. 
Devour. Devour successfully. Independent Crystal, Battle Frenzy, Level 0 slash Level 5. Rank, S. Effect. 1. Strike Gain, any attack is able to hold a combo for 5 seconds. As long as you keep striking within 5 seconds, you can increase the strike rate, currently at level 0, up to 25%. Level 1, 50%. Level 2, 75%. Level 3, 100%. Level 4, 125%. Level 5, 150%. 2. My blood boils, as long as the mech is able to fight, it can increase the attack speed of the mech and weapon, currently level 0, 10% increase, level 1, 15%, level 2, 20%, level 3, 25%, level 4, 30%, level 5, 35%, Su Hao's eyes lit up violently, the highest level of strike gain could actually increase the strike rate by 150%, this was simply too perverse, luckily, it's mine now, Su Hao smiled. He smoothly devoured the Sakura Nation Ninja as well. Independent Crystal, Needle Stabbing Jizo, Level 0 Slash Level 3. Level B, Any damage that harms the mech will bounce back by 1%. Level 1, 3%. Level 2, 5%. Level 3, 10%. Independence Crystal, Taunt, 0 Ranks Slash 3 Ranks. B Rank, Draws the desire to attack from creatures with low intelligence. Range increases with rank. Independent Crystal, Continuous Recovery, 0 Ranks Slash 3 Ranks. B rank, continuously recovers blood as long as it is friendly. 1 slash S, 1 rank, 3 slash S, 2 ranks, 5 slash S, 3 ranks, 10 slash S, independent crystal, windchild, 0 ranks slash 3 ranks. B rank, continuously recovers blood as long as it is friendly. 1 slash S, 1 rank, 3 slash S, 2 ranks, 5 slash S, 3 ranks, 10 slash S, independence crystal, child of the wind, level 0 slash 3, grade B. Increases the wind element by 10% damage. Level 1, 15%. Level 2, 20%. Level 3, 30%. 1S rank. For B rank. Su Hao nodded his head in satisfaction. At the same time, desecration also exploded with ninjutsu crystals. Although there were only two, it was enough. Attachment crystal, fire escape, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Effects, when loaded, it can spew flames from its mouth and hands dealing 20% fire elemental damage, and more powerful if it is willing to form a seal, level 1, 30%, level 2, 40%, level 3, 50%, level 4, 60%, level 5, 70%. Description, do you want to dance too? Attachment crystal, thunderclap, level 0 out of 5. Quality, excellent. Effects, when loaded, lightning can appear in the hand, dealing 20% electric elemental damage. More powerful if willing to form a seal, level 1, 30%, level 2, 40%, level 3, 50%, level 4, 60%, level 5, 70%. Description, have a duck neck. Go back to Rice City and prepare to break through the level cap. After Su Hao absorbed the crystals, he didn't stay idle for a moment and directly left. The commotion here was so big that it would definitely draw attention. He wasn't going to have too much contact with the officials yet. Everything could be as low profile as possible. The next morning, Su Hao had just woken up from his sleep when countless news popped up on his cell phone. Hua Xia's massive grain purchase? Laughed it by the West as worrying about nothing and being sick. Ba Tai expressed its willingness to fully support Hua Xia, and could take a bullet for it with just a word. The Cherry Blossom country has suffered heavy losses and is discussing with various countries whether they can form an alliance in Asia to support each other? Various types of news came out endlessly, especially after the market ripple descended. The picture style became magical. Su Hao didn't have any opinion about the others, only feeling a hint of relief about the grain acquisition in Huaxia. At least after I break through the level cap, Huaxia is not afraid of a food crisis. Su Hao smiled with his eyebrows, but quickly chilled down. Worrying about nothing? I hope you won't regret it later. After filling his stomach, he looked down at the market pattern in his palm, opened the illusion of beings. Attention! You have reached level 10 and cannot continue leveling up unless you break through the realm of beings illusion. Does it enter the realm of beings illusion? Su Hao knew very well what the realm of beings illusion was. The realm of beings is actually a living world civilization. Some are in danger. Some are safe and sound. And some are about to be destroyed. After stepping into that world, a mech master will be given an exclusive mission. And as long as it is completed, he will be able to achieve extreme sublimation. Extreme sublimation is an important way for mech masters and mechs to drastically increase their values and quality. The first mech master to break the level cap would create a new, decaying stranger shadow, on the civilization of the world he was in. And all sorts of mutations would appear around the world. Enter. B 
being connected to the illusion of beings. Darkness eroded Su Hao, completely engulfing. Location, Water City. Level, 1. Tasks, 0 slash 1. Only need to complete one of the tasks to end the trial. 1 survive for 7 days. 2 guard the residents of Water City. 3 monster kills, 5000. Description, Magic Mysteries. Magic airships, and magic ships are everywhere. As time passes, magic is breaking down. Is something eating away at the knowledge? Yes. More than likely it is a vast conspiracy that has left the entire world in an endless state of confusion until fear emerges and feeds on the nebulous god. Until this day, he awakens. You can quit at any time. There will be no penalties, but there will be a one-minute cooldown. The sky above Water City was shrouded in a thin, cicada-like magic shield that appeared like blue, as if it could be shattered with a light touch. The city of traffic was like a piston machine that had been injected with engine oil and was running strongly. On the streets, the carriages that could be seen everywhere were not made of wood, but were carved with magical patterns, and the ones pulling the cars were not horses of flesh and blood, but magical props. The streamlined appearance of the horse-like animal, the craftsmanship of open-work carving, the steel heart that constantly burned, accompanied by the power of magic, transmitted to every part of the torso, and when the limbs ran, the gas constantly gushed, stirring up the whole city with clouds and mountains. When Su Hao saw the scene, he couldn't stop being surprised in his heart. I came to the magic world? In his last life, he broke through level 10 of the illusion of beings by stepping into a metaphysical world and doing quests with imperial sword cultivators. This life was the complete opposite. Rumble rumble rumble. Heavy sounds rang out. Skeleton crafted magic mechs could be seen outside the alley, carrying goods along the shore. No. One tool armor, heavy, quality, ordinary. Attributes, strength 5, defense 7, speed 2, spirit 0. Description, it carries a family's food, clothing, shelter and transportation. Though simple and old, it still labors hard. Salute it. The no. One tool armor was about 5 meters. The upper half of its body was a simple, stout torso with two mechanical arms, while the lower half of its body was a track that pressed the ground into disrepair and spewed steam back and forth in motion. Ah. Suddenly, an ear-piercing scream broke Su Hao's appreciation. Mermaid. Attributes, strength 15, defense 15, speed 10, spirit 0. Characteristics, sharp teeth can easily bite through magic mechs. Weakness, fire element, electricity element. Comments, you deserve to be called a mermaid? Oh, a black fish in the west. That's alright then. A fish jumped up on the shore. It had two short legs full of scales, red eyes, a mouth full of sharp, sharp teeth, the size of a calf, and was biting the torso off of a worker. Its guts and intestines flowing out all over the place. At this moment, the sea rushed and waves swept, knocking over the big and small boats of the water market and washing them ashore, scaring the workers and making them scream in fear. Boom! A column of water rose up to the sky. Looking closely, it was an extremely thick and huge black tentacle, covered in suckers, wrapped in thunderous power, slapping down towards the water market. All citizens, don't be afraid. The magic shield can withstand. The mayor of Water City held his magic staff against his throat, amplifying his voice dozens of times, but before they could finish, the tentacles shattered their hopes. ka -ching. The magical shield shattered into crumbs like falling glass. Terrifying pressure crushed a building, and the entire city was plunged into panic and screams. At the same time, a large number of mutated creatures kept jumping out of the sea. Fish that can walk, squids holding rusty steel forks, they were eroding this world's civilization. Children go first. Men out of the line, harness the no, one tool armor and fend off the monsters. Someone roared loudly. In a flash, bloodthirsty men with red eyes harnessed their magic mechs and rushed towards the incoming monsters, not for any other reason, just to protect the homeland. Nay, the magic mechs were too weak. Facing these monsters, it was undoubtedly a mantis. But just at this moment, a golden figure rushed out, just like the sun shining on everything. It was Su Hao. He was like a heavenly god descending to earth his golden cloak dancing, suspended in midair, shedding bright light, solar flare, a scorching red beam of light blossomed, wrapped in terrifying heat, like a chopper blade, pfffffffff, the mermaids and other monsters were instantly melted and turned into ashes, however, the power of the red beam did not diminish, and chopped straight into the tentacles, instantly igniting a gust of white smoke, as well as a roasted meat aroma, lurker, attribute, strength, defense speed, spirit, Characteristics. Weakness? Evaluation? Invisible? Inaudible? Su Hao frowned. It was all question marks. This was also the first time he had seen this kind of situation. He was just about to look at the tentacle, but he saw that it trembled and instantly shrunk back into the vast sea. 
Unlike Su Hao's doubts, at this moment, the residents of Water City looked up at the godlike golden mecca, their eyes filled with shock and horror. Who are you? The mayor asked in a trembling voice. The golden mecca turned sideways and emitted a laugh. Me, an outlander, but you may honor me as, savior. Savior? The residents looked at each other with incredulous expressions. It's the savior that the magic scriptures speak of? I always thought that was just a legend. Thank you for coming. Then, someone was ecstatic and pulled out a book, instantly drawing resonance from the others. It was worth mentioning. This should be the Western world. And English was also spoken. Suhao knew some foreign languages, so he could understand what they were saying. This was not a big problem. Various translation crystals would appear in the future. And when they encountered copies or civilizations that were older in time, they could also communicate normally. I'm just talking casually. And they really believe it? Suha was speechless for a while. But soon, he was relieved. This was not bad. It saved them from being scared. The mayor held a magic staff in his hand. His feet wrapped around a whirlwind. And respectfully bent down towards Suhao. Lord Savior. May I ask what exactly is this thing? Could it be a natural disaster coming? It is both a natural disaster and a metamorphosis. Suhao spoke calmly. If you can survive, you will become a new civilization. The mayor nodded his head as if he understood. Afterward, he followed Suhao's order and let the residents of the city hide in the magic house, waiting for the disaster to leave. The night gradually deepened. The entire water city was terribly quiet. Vaguely, there seemed to be a rustling sound resounding in the darkness. In front of the magic house, Suhao leaned against the statue to check the attribute panel. After he got, Son of the Sun, he immediately chose to upgrade it. The highest level of, Son of the Sun, was level 3. However, upgrading from 0 to level 1 cost more than 10. 000, 000 fusion crystal stones and millions of market coins. Just this level 1 directly drains Suhao. Otherwise, extreme strength, and, steel bone, could also be successfully leveled up. However, there was a reward for giving. Just for the powerful killing power of, son of the sun. It was all worth it. Materials? That was all a piece of cake. As long as, desecration, was there. Materials were not a problem at all. However, if the, son of the sun, wanted to be upgraded again, it would require a brand new material called the, fire seed of the salary king. There were very few channels to obtain the, king of salary fire seed. In Suhao's memory. It was almost impossible to obtain it in the early stage. Suddenly, the magic house was noisy. Su Hao immediately got up and walked. The magic house was enchanted with magic, which could expand the internal space a hundred times, enough to protect the residents of Water City. At this moment, most of the people inside the house were holding their heads, looking panicked, their eyes full of blood, as if they had a nightmare all night. Mom, I'm so scared. Just now it seems like someone was talking in my ear. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I didn't do anything. Get out of here. All of you. The atmosphere in the room dropped to freezing point. The mayor hurriedly pacified, but to no avail. My lord, what is to be done? The mayor was sweating anxiously. Suhao's expression remained calm. This was a low SAN value, leading to mental confusion. He came to a six or seven year old boy, squatted down, and stretched out his right hand under the worried gaze of the boy's parents. The warm and broad palm of his hand was pressed against the little boy's forehead as if warmed by the sun. The little boy's panicked expression slowly subsided. The end will eventually be far away, and hope will burn like a fire in your hearts. Suhao's voice became gentle. Gradually, the injured residents began to recover slowly, their wounds healing with the naked eye. This scene caused the mayor's pupils to quake. Appalledness ensued, as well as ecstasy. You are truly a savior. The mayor bowed deeply. My lord, I apologize for doubting your attitude. You are more than just a savior. An old woman clad in purple robes stood up trembling, her lips trembling, the hand of the king is the hand of the healer, you are both savior and king. In a flash, the residents knelt down in excitement. Suha was completely speechless, you guys are still addicted to brainstorming? What about shelving this lord of the rings? He slandered in his heart and smiled on his face, get up, all of you. After saying that, Suha left the magic house, only leaving the residents in place for a while, guest from afar, thank you for protecting my offspring. And moreover, I hope you can guard it until the end of the disaster, even if it's just a little bit of a small fire. Suhao had just arrived outside the house when a majestic yet grateful voice resounded in his head. He glanced at the statue and smiled lowly, even after death. You are still protecting your offspring, how great. There were no words for the night. The next day, the sky was dark, mixed with a fine drizzle. The monsters on the coast disembarked one after another. Mermaid, attributes, strength 20, defense 20, speed 15. Spirit 0, 
attributes have been raised. Su Hao had an answer in his heart at once, surviving for seven days. Each day would raise their attributes and put pressure on the savior. However, it was useless to Su Hao. Try the Sakura country's ninjutsu crystal. Su Hao walked towards the front and shouted lowly, Transformation! The golden mech transformed into a bright sunlight, shining on his torso, as if a big sun had appeared in the middle of the water market. A golden mechanical Bigfoot stepped out. The overall metallic luster was very different, more domineering and majestic. Hiss! The mermaids let out eerie cries. Afterwards, they came running wildly or stomped on the wall to pounce. Fire escape. Machine Zero's mechanical arm raised. The armor retracted at the palm, and crimson light erupted out like two fire dragons, devouring everything in front of it in an instant. Boom boom boom. Raging flames rushed out, coloring all directions with a layer of fire. The scorching heat incinerated the mermaids and other monsters as they rolled crazily on the ground, letting out bursts of miserable cries. For a time, the smell of meat filled the air. Kill mermaids and other monsters asterisk 209. Drop 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 175. Stinking fish teeth asterisk 99. Steel fork fragment asterisk 108. There's still a gap from 50 hundred monsters. Suha glanced at the data and raised his arms once again, starting to burn the monsters. He didn't want to just complete one quest and call it a day. Although it was possible to be extremely sublimated by completing just one quest, there would be additional rewards if he completed other quests. On top of that, there were even hidden quests. If the usual, Decaying Stranger's Shadow, S was called an ordinary copy, then, Illusion of Beings, should be called an open world. Analogous to God of War 3's linear gameplay, and Wilderness Big Cousin 2's sandbox gameplay. Day 3, Day 4, Day 5, Day 6, waves of monsters were blocked by Su Hao. The monster corpses had piled up into a mountain of corpses. Seventh day. The supposedly sunny morning at 8 o'clock was gray and the temperature dropped to below zero. The residents hugged each other, and the breath they exhaled when they breathed and turned into frosty air in midair. They're attacking. One resident stood on the top floor, pointing to the shore and yelling in horror. Clattering. The waves continued to roll. Large batches of monsters landed. The sense of oppression emanating from them was not at all comparable to the first day. Finally the last day. Su Hao looked calm. Then let's put an end to all this. P.S. Welcome to Catching Bugs. 1-3 Yuan. 3-10 Yuan. The sky was dim. Gale force winds and torrential rain became the dominant colors of this world. It wasn't just destruction that was wrapped up in it, but also boundless disaster. The earth was shaking and hearts were in fear. Monsters from the deep sea with crimson eyes wanted to eat human flesh, corrupting their wills and trampling on the land inhabited by humans. Rumble. The ground shook. A building was pushed down with a roar. The smoke was dispersed by the rain before it could surface. Hiss. The mermaid let out a sharp cry. With a jump, a deep pit appeared in the ground. Like a stray arrow. Mermaid. Attributes. Strength 50. Defense 50. Speed 35. Spirit 1. Weapon Octopus. Attributes. Strength 66. Defense 55. Speed 40. Spirit 1. The surge in the monster's attributes did not surprise Su Hao. The illusion of beings was given tasks according to the overall quality of the mechs. It was just that illusion of beings was not aware that it had welcomed a perverted monster that was beyond common sense. What to do with so many monsters? Can the savior block them? He's a savior and a king. He'll definitely guard his subjects. There are too many. There are just too many monsters. The residents were afraid. In their eyes, the mermaids were as dense as a raging tide, destroying everything. Human civilization would be eaten up by them to the point where nothing was left. Very good. Compared to the panic of the crowd, Su Hao actually laughed. His voice was mixed with satisfaction. Counting these, it should be able to make up 5,000 kills. After saying that, a mighty energy filled out from the golden mech. All the monsters looked towards Su Hao, then rushed like mad. Taunt. Only dozens of weaponized octopuses danced their steel forks and fiercely stabbed at Zero's head and chest. Click 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 click. The steel forks burst into pieces, scattering the fragments. The rebound damage directly exterminated all the octopuses. Appeared. Painful attack on friendly forces. I kill myself. Trigger needle stabbing Jizo. Rebound 10% damage. Trigger continuous recovery. P.S. During these six days, Su Hao upgraded the crystals with the 10. 000 Rome crystals that he swiped out. A minus one damage number just floated above Su Hao's head. The next moment it was replenished by the returning blood. It wasn't an exaggeration to say that even if he stood still, the monster would die from the damage rebound. Taunt, plus, needle thrust geocache, equals grass cutting treasure. Su Hao scared and laughed. Ding. Has completed 5000 kills. Do you want to leave the, illusion of beings? No. Su Hao directly rebuffed. 
His goal was the main quest and the hidden quest. Wouldn't it be in vain to leave now? Boom. Zero raised his big hand, and blazing flames erupted out, like a fire dragon devouring all the monsters in front of him. This scene caused the residents to burst into tears. Thank you savior, he said the end will depart, and hope will turn into fire to remain in our hearts. At this moment, he is the one true god. In their eyes, Suha was like a firebearer walking in the darkness, dispelling the gloom and sprinkling the bright sparks of hope. Ow dash. Suddenly, a whirlpool appeared in the sea, accompanied by a beastly roar that resounded through the clouds. A tentacle as thick and huge as a ship surged out, seemingly dragging the entire city into the endless deep sea. It was also at this moment, it was completely exposed to Suha's vision. North Sea Giant Kraken. Attributes, Strength 300, Defense 400, Speed 50, Spirit 0. Characteristics, Entanglement, High Pressure Water Cannon, Corrosive Pus, Weakness, Flames, Intense Heat, Evaluation, If the Iron Plate Squid had it, Three Sweets up north would be a good deal. Deep Sea Monster Kraken? The Mayor's expression stiffened. Endless fear surfaced in his eyes. The magic scriptures had said that if the Kraken appeared, it meant that the world was about to be destroyed. Boom boom boom. The Kraken let out a roar as dozens of tentacles fell from the heights, as if it was going to completely slap the entire city to pieces. Boom. A loud sound echoed out. Even the dark clouds in the sky dome were shattered, shedding dappled sunlight. But the bizarre thing was, the giant tentacle actually stopped in midair? A mere barbecue ingredient. A cold voice came out. I'd like to see if you can block this savior's punch. The eyes of the crowd instantly almost fell to the ground. What did they see? A golden mecha of disproportionate size, only reaching out with one hand to block the tentacles, steadily and easily. This scene was too shocking. It was as if a mole cricket had grabbed the claws of a giant dragon, under the tentacle. Suhao slowly clenched his mechanical hand and blasted out with a straight punch. Bang bang bang. Dozens of tentacles were sent flying out, then exploded one by one. Flesh and blood flew everywhere, and blood rained down. The coast turned into a scarlet world. Ow. The North Sea giant demon kraken let out a terrifying scream. Su Hao, on the other hand, revealed a faint smile and stomped his feet, shooting out like a cannonball. Rumble. Only hundreds of meters of the North Sea giant demon kraken were kicked and flew to the surface of the sea, and its ugly and grotesque huge body was unreservedly exposed in the air, making all the residents look dumbfounded. As for Su Hao, his eyes lit up with crimson light. The highest power was turned on. The red-hot beam of light was like a ship chopper, slicing the kraken into two hard halves. Large pieces of blood spilled down, covering the golden mech, making Suha like a killing Shura returning from hell. He looked down below. At this moment, whether it was the sea of blood or the mountain of corpses, they all became silent backdrops. Doomsday disaster? In Suha's eyes, it was just a spring tour. Congratulations on successfully surviving seven days. Thank you for protecting the remaining humans in Water City. Thank you for fending off the North Sea Giant Demon Kraken and defending civilization. Trigger Hidden Quest, thanks from the King of Magic. Kill 5, 000 enemies. A series of prompts caused curiosity to rise in Suhao's heart. With such a high level of mission completion, I wonder what rewards would be given. On top of that, being the first mechmaster to open the level 20 level cap would also give a generous reward. When the two were stacked together, even he couldn't help but be excited. Reward 10,000 Fused Crystals Asterisk 30. 000 Magic Girlfriend Mech Drawing Asterisk 1 North Sea Giant Demon Kraken Summoning Scroll Asterisk 1 Magic Lord's Final Masterpiece Asterisk 1 Ice Spirit Weapon Drawing Asterisk 1 Drop Market Coin Asterisk 53853 Vitality Asterisk 1 10,000 Molten Crystals Asterisk 4839 Magic Touch Gun Drawing Asterisk 1 Steel Fork Fragment Asterisk 999 Deep Sea Substance Asterisk 80 Stinking Fish Teeth Asterisk 4666 Magic Girlfriend Mech Drawings? Suhao froze, and then his face was full of exuberance. Could it be the special mecha that is claimed to be? More real than a real person. Never misunderstand. Suhao's sexual interest is normal. And, he was planted on women. But what does this have to do with the mech? Congratulations on completing all the tasks of the illusion of beings, and being the first human in the Blue Star Civilization to complete such a distinction. May I ask, do you want to choose, salvation, or, extinction, of this world? No matter which one you choose, there will be an additional reward. Suhao froze. How come he didn't know there was this kind of choice? Suhao had broken through many copies in his last life, which of course included the illusion of beings. It was just that the option of salvation, perdition, didn't appear. When he was in the intelligence department, he hadn't heard of this situation either. Because I was the first mechmaster in the world to break through the illusion of beings, 
Blue Star defined me as a spokesperson? Su Hao revealed a thinking expression. He knew very well that this was a game of the gods, but it wasn't just a game either. Countless civilizations fought against the gods to the death, with the aim of continuing the fire and keeping knowledge and civilization alive. Regardless of whether or not the market mark would be retrieved by the gods, there was now a need to spread the market mark like a dandelion that would spread to civilizations in all realms. I choose, salvation. Su Hao finally made his choice. Choose, salvation. The ruins pattern will descend after you leave. Your choice will cause changes to the, mystic civilization. Thus rewarding, Salary King's Flame, asterisk 1. Su Hao was startled. Salary King's Fire Seed. This was really a pillow that came when he was dozing off. He was still thinking about what methods there were to obtain, Salary King's Fire Seed. He hadn't thought that it would come directly to his hand now. Salary King's Fire Seed. Type, props, effect, items needed to level up epic and legendary crystals. Description, the old king has fallen. The Salary King inherits. I now understand why the mechs of the Huaxia Mecha Alliance are so strong. Su Hao smiled in his heart. Inside the magic house, the residents came out in a line. They looked at the calm sea where the storm had faded. Their eyes filled with a dreamy look. Su Hao slowly fell down. The disaster is far away. Hope will come soon. You don't need to worry. Will you stay? The mayor and their eyes were hopeful. Incomparably hoping. Su Hao shook his head. I am just a passerby from another world. Perhaps. We will meet again in the future. Live well. Goodbye. Su Hao cupped his fists to them. Using Chinese etiquette. Afterwards, in the incredulous gaze of the mayor and the others, the golden mecha gradually disappeared, as if it had never appeared. Congratulations on becoming a member of the new era. Do you accept? Is this the hope the savior spoke of? The mayor muttered to himself. Immediately, his eyes firm up. We must grasp it. I, Adam, will lead the entire age and repay the savior. I choose to accept. The flame of life did not disappear. It glowed and continued until it blazed. Returning to the blue star, Su Hao looked at the settlement screen, successfully broke through the illusion of beings, your mech will receive two extreme sublimations, upgrade the quality of zero, normal excellent, strong changes in values, all stored experience returned, level 10 level 11, small rise in all attributes of machine zero, life value plus 200, energy value plus 200, armor plus 110, shield plus 240, strength plus 25, defense 25, Speed plus 20. Codename, Machine Zero, Infinity. Grade, 11. Quality, Excellent. Life Value, 6302720. Energy Value, 5202280. Armor, 2801230. Shield, 4201920. Material, Metal, Material, Metal. Attributes, Strength, 357. Defense, 385. Speed, 304. Spirit, 0. The above is the base value not counting the crystal's bonus. Normally, the mecha masters who had broken through the illusion of beings would be given a new mecha slot. However, Su Hao did not. Instead, it gave two extreme sublimations. This was expected by Su Hao. He was fused with the zero, and it was impossible for him to harness another mech. However, two extreme sublimation was unexpected. After elevating the value once, it was elevated again. This was simply exhilarating all right. God closed a window but opened a door for me? Su Hao laughed out loud. He didn't care much about the mecha quota or anything. The number represented strength. This was the key. Congratulations on being the first mech to break through the level cap, hereby rewarding you with Primal Mech Soul, asterisk 1. Su Hao blinked his eyes. There were still experts? Immediately, his expression froze before he reacted. What was given? Primitive Machine Soul. Type, Special Prop. Effects, it can give a mech the soul to think and act on its own, but will always only obey your commands. Description, please treat your mech well. He, she slash it will always be your most loyal backing. The original mech soul of Sun Helming, one of the strongest mechs back then. Su Hao had a dizzying feeling of being hit in the head by a surprise. It was important to know that the primal machine soul was a special prop with a zero explosion rate, requiring a hidden mission to trigger it. Never thought that. In this life, he actually got the primal machine soul early on. I have magic girlfriend mecha. If I add primal machine soul to it, wouldn't that be? Su Hao suddenly had some bad taste. A heterosexual mech that obeyed everything it was told to do would be able to do whatever you asked its slasher to do without a single word of complaint. There was no bride price, no need to coax, not to mention no tantrums, and it would always only be loyal to you. Think about it, all prick chicken. After yyyy for a while, Su Hao gathered his mood. The obelisk tower would open soon. He had to make new weapons and prepare in advance. Before that, devour the two people from the United States of America. Their independent crystals can't be missed. 
While thinking, Su Hao got up and left. Global notification. The Chinese Mecha Master, Dun, broke through the illusion of beings, opening the level cap for all Mecha Masters, no longer subject to level troubles. The decaying stranger's shadow, resources of all of Huaxia increased by 20%, and the rest of the countries increased by 5%. As soon as the news came out, it once again sensationalized the world. What in the world is this, Dun? Why does it feel like it's always been him advancing and fighting alone for our benefit? Impossible. Absolutely impossible. Our United States of America will always be number one in the world. How is it that we're lagging behind Huaxia this time? The, the solo, hot search had already climbed to the top of Twitter. Huaxia was also over the top. Bullish. The, doke, god is truly bullish. I'm going to brush my materials. You guys say, will he be the guardian god of our Huaxia? Never showing his face or publicizing himself. Only to silently guard us? This is the humble romance of our Chinese people. I really want to meet him. He must be very lonely. So he took such a name. Big points on the emo group. Wildly guessing Su Hao's mind. In fact, Su Hao was not lonely. He just didn't have the heart to communicate with others. The current him only wanted to mess with materials and build weapons. Huaxia Mecha Alliance. I want all of, done, s materials now. Huang Dust's eyes were red. And his voice became a little hoarse. He has helped Huaxia many times. He should be recognized by everyone. He was very excited. If such a great god was around, he could definitely create an invincible mecha battle team. Long Jianchuan pinched his brow. His voice low. He calls himself solitary. Doesn't that mean he doesn't want to fit in? At those words, Huang Chen froze, then became bitter. Just at this moment, a corner of the tent was lifted. A person rushed in. His voice surprised. Chief Commander, Sun Helming has come out of the Emperor's tomb. New mechs joined the Huaxia Mecha Alliance every day. Not only could they enjoy platform discounts, they could also exchange what they needed. Mets with high, independent crystal, grades would also be selected as special talents, enjoying a wide variety of rare resources. In addition to this, groups and families could also create mecha teams. However, they must be documented and controlled by the Huaxia Mecha Alliance. Sun Helming awakened SSS ranked independent crystal, elemental affinity, and became the first batch of key cultivation targets. As long as he was there, any copy could be speed passed and was a good hand at leading newcomers. At this time, four people walked into the tent. The leader was a young man in his early to mid-twenties, handsome and tall, with an affable smile. Huan Dust smiled lightly. Past the Emperor's Tomb on hard difficulty? Past. The small monsters on hard difficulty aren't a threat. It's just hard to kill the boss. Sun Haoming's expression was serious. The Emperor's Tomb in the capital is soldiers who are not afraid of life and death plus warhorse charging plus bows and arrows as well as a great general in the back who adds buffs to them. As the difficulty increases, the types of bosses change. A beautiful woman in the group spoke up. I suspect that we might have to kill the emperor in the end. I've read the strategies written by quite a few people, and the higher the difficulty, the more extreme the items that popped out. And some people have even popped out flawless level core crystals. Long Jianchuan snorted. Emperor? Today is a new era. A realist society. Who cares if you're a feudal emperor? Kill and be done with it. Moreover, Experiencing the feeling of killing an emperor seemed quite refreshing. How are your attributes? Huang Dust continued to inquire. Sun Haoming immediately replied. I'm now level 9. Almost level 10. My strength is almost breaking 100. My defense is 90. My speed is 83. And my spirit is 130. Hmm. Your elemental affinity is indeed suitable for the spiritual route. Long Jianchuan pondered for a while. I'll have someone draw up a reinforcement program for you. Remember to exchange your points for resources. The Chinese Mecha Alliance had a batch of enhanced research, independent crystals, that could help well-endowed Mecha Masters draw up a development route. After Sun Haoming finished his report, he asked with a smile, Chief Commander, what were you guys talking about just now? Independence has opened up 20 levels and was discussing how to recruit him to the Alliance. Huang Dust clasped his hands on his arms, his voice low, only, he doesn't have any information. It's hard to get him. Make sure to recruit him. Give him whatever he wants. Suddenly, Sun Haoming became agitated. Huang Dust instantly cried and laughed. Sun Haoming was treating Dun as an idol. Just as Sun Haoming continued to speak, the ground suddenly shook violently, as if it was about to crack. Global notification. About to open up the obelisk tower. The function of crystal decomposition. And I hope that Mets will participate enthusiastically. From this moment on, the global land nutrient loss of 50%. Rumble. The capital city was right in the center. A street resounded with the intense sound of cars honking, interspersed with the screams of people. The ground began to break apart, and black spikes broke out, growing crazily like bamboo shoots after the rain. 
As if they were going to run through the cloud tops, the black building was a full 50 meters in length, and the overall appearance of a dark, lightless, eerie aura was reflected in the eyes of the crowd. Pedestrians exploded at once, taking out their cell phones to take pictures and upload them to the internet. Families, suddenly there is a lower head black tower appeared. Scared me to death. Everyone watch. Subject 2 is jumping like this. Could this be the obelisk tower that was just hinted at? The obelisk tower instantly hit the hot search. In the alliance, after Huang Dust learned about this, he immediately ordered, enter the obelisk tower and explore the rules of operation. Yes, the alliance's mechs bellowed in unison. You really had the foresight to purchase a large amount of grain. Long Jianchuan glanced at Huang Dust, then laughed. Now, those people abroad should be anxious. As expected, as Huang Dust said, the United States of America and the others had already started cursing. Previously, they had dumped their grain to Huaxia and their own stock had been drastically depleted, and now they simply couldn't supply it. Wow. The roller shutter door was pulled up. Su Hao looked at the wide array of food in the private warehouse and revealed a smile. I guess it won't be a problem to eat for a few hundred years. With that, he snapped his fingers. Blank wormhole. A white void emerged. Between the ripples filling the air, all the food was stowed away. With food in space, there was no panic in his heart. The land nutrient loss had only just begun. When level 30 opens, the first global invasion copy will appear, and that will be the beginning of the disaster. However, both disaster and rebirth. At that time, there would be countless geniuses who would emerge from the disaster and enter a phase of high-speed upgrade period, leaving the warehouse. Suha swept up into Madair and hurried to the capital. He was going to devour two people from the White Regiment of the United States of America next, and there, Independent Crystals were Hercules and Rat King, respectively. Hercules, Grade, SS, Effect, 1. Weapon Master, all weapons are able to exert extraordinary power in your hands. 2. Power accumulation, your power will grow stronger as time goes by. 3. Antibodies to foreign conditions, any harmful resistances will be drastically reduced against you. Rat King, Rank, S, Effects, 1. Rat Tide, command lower intelligent rat-like creatures to fight for you. 2. Only Rat, any rat-like creatures affected by the Rat Tide will enhance your attributes. In his last life, the person who owned, Hercules, was called James Harkin. His interest was to leave seeds all over the world. According to statistics, the number of James Harkin's children exceeds 5, 000, and his favorite is, refining copper. But because he is not low in the United States of America, he is still the offensive force in the White Regiment, so even if he condemns it, it is useless, and the Rat King owner is called Tim Jack. Sexual orientation is basically the same as James Harkin. On the top 10 of the list of the most loathed mechs, his ability was useful, both in ordering the rats and allowing them to enhance themselves. Su Hao's goal this time was not only them, but also to enter the capital's obelisk tower. If conditions allowed, he would also hunt the people on the list in the capital. Capital city. Airport. Inside the waiting hall. Many girls let out screams, as if they had seen their favorite beans. Two white Americans walked out. Blonde hair and blue eyes, their bodies strong, holding up their clothes tightly above their muscles. James, what did I tell you? The girls here are easy to get. The short-haired white man took off his sunglasses a hint of derision in his tone. James Harkin laughed out loud. Oh my friend, you're absolutely right. I love it here. Night, a clubhouse in the capital. James and Tim walk out embracing the opposite sex with lewd smiles on their faces. Beep beep beep. The cell phone rings. James picked up the phone and answered. Who is it? Are you there yet? The majestic voice came from the other end. James's drunkenness immediately dissipated most of it, and he hurriedly said, Chief, we're here. Remember your objective to interfere with the Chinese to be the first to clear the obelisk tower. We surmise that the obelisk tower also has a reward for being the first to pass, and the regiment is in the process of attacking it. The cell phone ends solemnly instructed. James nodded heavily. Chief, don't worry, we will definitely complete the mission. After hanging up, he looked to Tim and communicated in fluent English. The team leader instructed us to obstruct the people of Huaxia for a period of time while our group is advancing in the direction of the apex tower. The team leader instructed us to obstruct the people of Huaxia for a period of time while our group is advancing in the direction of the apex tower. Tim grinned. Then it's my turn to make my entrance. James was well aware of just how terrifying Tim's rat king was, enough to cause a rat plague. However, this process was very energy value consuming, especially the greater the range, the greater the consumption. You're on your side. Ever heard of that saying? Just as the duo was about to leave the woman behind, an indifferent voice came from their ears. James and Tim turned their heads, only to see a person standing in the darkness, with eyes that were cold and indifferent, mixed with some ferocity. 
like a killing walker hidden in the darkness. Chinese, get out. James asked arrogantly in an awkward Mandarin. The visitor was none other than Su Hao. The faces of the two people in front of him were similar to what he remembered, but much younger. He nodded slightly, having found them. To find these two foreigners, it was actually very simple. Lustful, tall, or foreigners. It would be hard not to come across them just by strolling around the windy places. Transformation. Su Hao drank in his heart. The market pattern filled the armor, instantly covering the whole body. Even though it was the most common zero, the core of the mecha was like the sun blazing. Seeing this, Tim couldn't help but laugh out loud. Ha ha ha. James look at this little monkey. Still want to dare to make a move with us? Zero? James snorted. Let me see his values. The next second. The market tattoo he had imprinted on his left chest also diffused. A white mecha emerged and wrapped around him. The white mecha's neck was a ring of brown hair. Two two meter long machetes hung from its back. And its mechanical limbs were thick and huge. Resembling a gorilla. Exuding a great sense of oppression. James mobilized his loaded, battle force detection. The smile on his face then became stiff, followed by disbelief, and finally fear. Code name, zero. Attribute, strength, defense, speed, spirit, battle evaluation, do not contact, do not engage. Once encountered, please kill yourself directly. Early death and early relief. James, has he reached a battle rating of five yet? Tim scoffed. James' face changed in shock and he roared. Tim, run. Tim was startled by the roar and didn't hesitate to summon the mech. The market pattern shone, and the gray mech enveloped Tim. A tattered and old cloak danced in the wind, and the mechanical hand held a jewel that gave off an eerie glow. Can you run? Su Hao sneered. After he spoke, a red-colored beam of light stormed out. James, even with his armor, didn't even scream, and was penetrated on the spot. Tim's pupils quaked. He hurriedly urged the gem in his hand. The earth began to shake, and densely packed rats climbed out. Rat tide, this is the ability of the rat king? Su Hao nodded. It does have the flavor of bubonic plague, but it's not enough. He didn't care about the rat tide at all and walked straight towards Tim. Pets, kill him for me, Tim screamed. The rats reddened their eyes and let out gibbering cries, pouncing forward and backward towards Su Hao. However, just as soon as they touched Su Hao, the rats were blown away, as if they were bouncing back damage from something. Needle stabbing geocache. Su Hao was in no man's land. Reaching out and clasping Tim's mecha head. What the hell are you? Tim struggled frantically. Su Hao didn't answer. With a blast from his right fist, he directly penetrated the mech, killing Tim in the cockpit, and immediately drank. Devour. Devour successfully. Independent crystal, rat king, level 0 slash level 5. Grade, S. Effects. 1. Rat tide, summon a legion of rats at your disposal, currently level 0. Consumes 100 points of energy value. Enslaves lower intelligent rat creatures within 1 kilometer. Level 1, 2 kilometers. Level 2, 3 kilometers. Level 3, 4 kilometers. Level 4, 5 kilometers. And level 5, 10 kilometers. Each rat will continue to consume 0. 0, zero 1 of energy value until it runs out of energy value. 2 only rats. The rat army summon will enhance all your attributes. Currently at level 0. Every 1000 rats will enhance 0. 1%. Level 1, 0. 2%. Level 2, 0. 3%. Level 3, 0. 5%. Level 4, 1%. Level 5, 2%. Suha was a bit surprised after seeing the effect of, only rats. The number of rats in his city reaches at least 100. 000. zero, zero or even far more. Suha's eyes flashed with a refined look. Although the value is added less, it can't help but be more. Rats had low battle power and belonged to consumables. However, rats were extremely tenacious and could give birth to five ten of them in a single nest. Nest after nest was born. It was simply endless. He nodded with satisfaction and instantly began to devour James. Devouring success. Independent crystal, Hercules, level 0 slash 5. Grade, SS. Effect. 1. Weapon master, anything in your hands will become a master level weapon. Even if it's a leaf or a twig, currently at level 0. It enhances weapon damage by 40%. Level 1, 80%. Level 2, 120%. Level 3, 160%. Level 4, 200%. Level 5, 240%. 2. Power accumulation, your mech and flesh will get stronger and stronger as you fight, and your desires become stronger and stronger. Post-fight rating, increase power by 1 3 points. Level 1, 4 6. Level 2, 7 9. Level 3, 10 12. Level 4, 13 15. Level 5, 16 20. Three antibodies to abnormal conditions, negative attributes such as bleeding, 
poison, corrosion, magnetism, erosion, fire, ice, etc., will be reduced by 20%, level 1, 30%, level 2, 40%, level 3, 50%, level 4, 60%, level 5, 70%. The overview of Hercules S effects made Suha suck in a breath of cold air. Level 1 and 2 were perverse, but the third alien condition antibody was the demon. All negative attributes were resistant. No wonder he could serve as the white regiment attacker of the United States of America back then. This is absolutely invincible in the future as long as he's not a fool. Thinking of this, Suhao secretly slandered. It seems that the white regiment is also determined to actually send him here. In his memory, James and Tim were here to interfere with the Chinese Mecha Alliance's entry into the obelisk tower. It was also because of this incident that Huaxia suffered heavy losses, but in this life, the ending changed completely. I'm almost ready to enter the obelisk tower as well. Suhao looked at the direction of the obelisk tower and rose up in the air with a thought. Before that, he had to upgrade the crystals further. Do not fight unprepared battles. This was Suhao's life motto forever. An express hotel. Suhao sat on the bed with a pensive face. Any crystal, the more it was strengthened to the back. The Wanrong crystal stones and market coins needed were astronomical. Take the SSS ranked, profanity, for example. It had already been strengthened to level 3 by Suhao. It wasn't that he didn't want to strengthen it, but there weren't enough Wanrong crystals and not enough market coins. Therefore, he could only strengthen other, independent crystals. For example, the independent crystals that he got from Sakura Country's side were all fully leveled. Because it didn't cost much, it was strengthened in passing. Strengthen, Hercules, Rat King, Battle Frenzy, Extreme Force, Steel Bone, First, how many levels can I go up? Maximizing my battle power is the key. Suhao smiled bitterly. It's cool to have so many crystals. But, the burden is also too big. It was worth mentioning. Son of the Sun, was the real king of big appetite. Upgrading not only required massive amounts of Wanrong crystals and market coins, but also Salary King Fire Seed. Even if it was put into the Chinese Mecha League, it was at the level of a big dog. After clearing the obelisk tower, you can exchange things, which can also be considered to alleviate the urgent need. Otherwise, the crystal upgrade plan will have to be temporarily shelved. Suhao breathed a sigh of relief and silently began the great business of strengthening. Codename, Machine Zero, Infinity. Grade, 11. Quality, excellent. Life value, 27201425244 424% bonus to life force. Energy value, 22805928, Kawara 160% bonus. Armor, 1230. Shield, 19203456, Transcendent Shield 80% bonus. Material, metal. Attributes, strength, 357714, extreme strength 100% bonus. Defense, 385770, steel bone 100% bonus. Speed, 304. Spirit, 0. Core crystal, son of the sun, level 1 third. Individual crystals, I transform always, none. Blasphemy, tier 3 slash tier 5. Overclock, tier 3 slash tier 5. Suffocating wormhole, tier 3 slash tier 5. Battle frenzy, tier 2 slash tier 5. Needle stabbing geocache, tier 3 slash tier 3. Taunt, tier 3 slash tier 3. Constant recovery, tier 3 slash tier 3. Child of the wind, tier 3 slash tier 3. Rat King, Tier 2 slash Tier 5. Hercules, Tier 2 slash Tier 5. Subsidiary Crystals, Vitality, Level 3 slash 10. Weak Electricity, Level 3 slash 5. Kaworu, Level 3 slash 5. Transcendent Shield, Level 3 slash 5. Detection Radar, Level 3 slash 5. Energy Conversion, Level 2 slash 3. Extreme Strength, Level 2 slash 10. Iron Bone of Steel, Level 2 slash 10. Fire Escape, Level 2 slash 5. Thunder Escape, Level 1 slash 5. At the end of the day, the 10,000 Rome crystals and market coins were consumed and the materials were clean, but the effect was also very obvious. Suhao could feel that his fleshly body was once again strengthened. A steady stream of power surged from the depths of his body, as if he was transformed into an eternal sun furnace. It was both strengthening the mech and the physical body. I hope the obelisk tower can bring me surprises, and preferably there are still materials for casting weapons. Suhao glanced at the weapon drawings his heart filled with anticipation. Afterwards, he took out the reward from the Mystic Civilization, the Magician King's Final Masterpiece. Magician King's Final Masterpiece. Type, Props, Effect, This is a potion concocted by the Magician King on his deathbed. It can permanently raise one spirit, increasing 200 points of spirit after taking it. Description, I'm a Hogwarts graduate. Great guy, directly increasing 200 points. Sue how couldn't help but be shocked. Worthy of being the reward of a hidden quest. It was just dangling. 
He didn't even think about it and directly smothered the potion in one gulp. Gulp. The potion entered his mouth. The flavor was slightly bitter with a sweet aftertaste. At the same moment, his eyes could see the space in front of him, and there seemed to be elements surging. Water was rushing. Fire was burning. Lightning was bombarding furiously. Intense poison filled the air. The higher the spirit value, the stronger the elemental skill increase. At the same time, spiritual attack resistance was also high. Previously, Su Hao had suffered the loss of low spiritual resistance, and now he was considered to have made up for this shortcoming. Sleep well today and impact the obelisk tower tomorrow. Su Hao gathered his mood and immediately went to bed. The rules of the obelisk tower were clear to him. All he had to do now was to nurture his energy. The next morning, Su Hao took soy milk donuts and ate them while walking towards the obelisk tower. Two foreigners died last night, the appearance was miserable. Not good people at a glance. They deserved to die. Didn't they open their mouths about freedom? It's their freedom to die. The pedestrians on the roadside were all talking. As if he was a nobody, Su Hao walked straight through the crowd and approached the obelisk tower. Within the field of view, a huge black sharp giant tower was in view. There were already alliance mechs guarding the surroundings, and exchanges needed to detect their identities. You haven't joined the alliance yet? The alliance mech was a bit surprised when it saw Su Hao's ID card. Nowadays, Joining the alliance could enjoy preferential policies, as well as platform trading, with many benefits. Su Hao smiled. Something delayed me. I'll go and register after coming out of the obelisk tower. Well, remember to be careful when you go in. The mech artist hesitated. How many levels are you? Don't go in if your level is too low. It's not too late to wait until someone comes out with a raid. Understood. I'm just going in to see what's going on. Su Hao reached out and touched the obelisk tower when he finished speaking. Buzz. The ruin pattern turned into a wave of black light, wrapping around the obelisk and once again disintegrating his particles. Welcome to the obelisk tower. You may leave the current challenge at any time, but only the previous rewards will be retained. Only one person and one mech are allowed to enter the challenge. No crystals or weapons are allowed except for the independence crystals. Weapons, crystals, mechs, etc. will all be randomized, and you are free to mix and match them until the end. Killing monsters will drop essence fragments which can be exchanged for props, materials, crystals, and other items in the obelisk tower. Endless darkness was torn open. Opening his eyes, Su Hao stood in the starry sky, with nebulae flowing around him like eternity. The essence of the obelisk tower is rogue games. How to match the most suitable crystals out of the randomized options is the key to pass the level. Su Hao had long been familiar with the game, and there was no trace of bewilderment on his face. However, familiarity was familiarity, and a little bit of luck was still needed. Full randomization itself carried a component of luck. Moreover, the obelisk tower had a hidden message. The weapons, crystals, and even the mechs inside the obelisk tower were all based on the drawings that appeared in the copies. Let's take a chestnut. Su Hao produced the drawing of the spectral dog mech. Then the obelisk tower would be able to appear the side dog mecha. If Blue Star Earth didn't pop out something, the obelisk tower wouldn't have it. Therefore, the higher the level, the richer the content of the obelisk tower. No more pushing. Let's start. Su Hao stretched his muscles and bones and officially took a step forward. The scene changed. Su Hao stood in a world of purple vines. On the dome of the sky, there was a green bud with a diameter of more than a hundred meters that was slowly dripping thick liquid that corrupted everything from its slits. Please choose a weapon, mad poison, blade of contempt, spores, please select crystal, life force, level zero, transcendent shield, level zero, pilot, level zero, please select mech, none, layer, one, difficulty, easy. Mission, please kill 200 mutant wolves within 5 minutes. With extra rewards, Su Hao immediately chose the Blade of Contempt and Vitality. The Transcendent Shield bonus was too little. Pilot was a 5% damage reduction in mid-air. Not very meaningful. The next second, Zero's hand coalesced into a super giant scythe that was 15 meters long. With a silver-colored grip and a chilling blade carved with cyan light patterns, dancing and emitting a creepy sound similar to a female ghost scream, Su Hao was very satisfied with this. The real world hadn't cast it yet, and it was overkill at the obelisk. Roar. Suddenly, roars resounded regretfully. A large number of mutant wolves were distributed in the abandoned city. Mutant wolf. Attributes, strength 5, defense 6, speed 7, spirit 0, characteristics, powerful bite, hard fur, use weapons well, weakness, copper head, iron tail, tofu waste, evaluation, good dogs don't get in the way. The obelisk tower is perfect for newbies because the number of levels corresponds to the level. Now that it's open to level 20, then there are 20 floors, crystals, with a reasonable mix of weapons, 
can completely cross the level challenge, holding the blade of contempt in his hand, Suha's body flashed, fire erupted from the gaps in his armor, and his advancement speed was as fast as an invisible lightning bolt, the blade of contempt danced, pfffffffff, the blade flashed, as if it was going to cut through the blue sky, one strike, 50 kills, the mutant wolves had their heads broken or their waists cut off, all of them died, kill mutant wolf asterisk 50, gain 5 experience points, Suha shook his head, the level was too low, and the experience was pitifully low, machine zero started up again, between rolling around, 200 mutant wolves were killed on the spot, passing level 1, complete the quest within 5 minutes and have 2 chances to choose a crystal, core crystals, steel scarlet, wanderer, elementalist, subsidiary crystals, kooru, iron spike, transforming eggplant, someone popped out the, elementalist, suhao's eyes lit up, core crystal, elementalist, level 0 slash level 5, quality, excellent, effect, 1, heart of elf, 10% damage increase for all elements, 2, power of tree wind, add 10% wind elemental damage to weapons, description, do you like elves, with the, elementalist, s elf heart, it was already the favorite of countless spiritual mechs, Suha finally chose the elementalist, he himself had an independent crystal called, son of wind, which could increase wind elemental damage, when the, elementalist, loaded the mech, cyan light patterns emerged on the surface of the zero's torso, turning into tassels that floated on both sides of his shoulders, Suha waved his hand, the blade of contempt suddenly erupted with majestic wind elements, breaking the air with a sharp sound and hardening this space, as for the accessory crystal, Su Hao chose, Iron Thorn, Attachment Crystal, Iron Spur, Level 0 slash Level 5, Quality, Ordinary, Effect, Once an enemy approaches, Iron Thorns will extend from the surface of the mech, blocking the enemy, Description, Yes, It's me, The Soft Hedgehog Armor That Killed Yang Kong, Continue, Next Level, Su Hao just made a response, The vision blossomed and the world changed, He arrived at a vast and boundless prairie, Layer, 2, Difficulty, Simple, Task, Please kill the 200 mad grass cows within 4 minutes. No reward will be given for overtime. Rumble. The earth shook. A green tide appeared in the world ahead. It wasn't green grass fluttering, but a group of bison running. Their muscles bulged. Their limbs landed on the ground. And they ran wildly, wrapped in the momentum of a shocking wave. Suhao raised the blade of contempt and swung it towards the front. There was a boom. The blade of the blade of contempt transformed into a fan-shaped green-colored blade. And chopped out angrily. Green grass flew into the sky, along with the bodies and heads of grass cows, and blood spilled all over the ground. 200 grass cows in a second with one strike. Continue. Next level. Su Hao's expression was indifferent. These challenges couldn't cause any hindrance to him at all. Third layer. Fourth layer. Fifth layer. Sixth layer. Seventh layer. Eighth layer. Ninth layer. Each layer was won by Su Hao in a single second. The whole process was not only fast, but also had an artistic beauty. Layers, 10. Difficulty, simple. Task, no time limit. Please kill the mechanical magic cow. This was a steel factory. The blazing heat, the running machines, and the behemoths rising from the magma. Mechanical devil bull. Attributes, strength 95. Defense 105. Speed 50. Spirit 10. Characteristics, as a metal creature. It possesses a fusion core that is strong enough to support this massive body in battle. Weakness, core. Evaluation, bold old man. How dare you insult my brother? I, T Nyo, will cut you down. Li Kue Emotikan. The 10 meter mechanical demonic bulls, with their hands gripping the steel battle axe, constantly spewed out gas from their nostrils, and their scarlet eyes stared intently at Su Hao. They roared and directly chopped down. This strike caused the entire steel factory to shake violently. Su Hao stood still, waving the blade of contempt with one arm, and the green colored sharp edges splashed out in a fan shape. Clang clang clang. The cyan sharp edge collided with the steel battle axe, bursting out with starry fire and streams of light. Splendid and beautiful. Trigger strike gain. 10% strike rate gain. 20% strike rate gain. 50% strike rate gain. Gain 75% strike rate. All attacks can trigger a blitz gain? Suha was suddenly a bit surprised. Battle frenzy could increase the blitz rate and also increase the attack speed. Contempt blade plus wind child plus elementalist could send out dozens of wind blades each time. So, the strike rate was instantly piled up, roar, at this moment, the mechanical demon bull released a roar, its mouth continued to enlarge, combining into a giant cannon with a diameter of more than 5 meters, and the reddish colored light melded with the blue light, erupting a fierce beam of light, destruction beam, Suha came back to his senses and said with a smile, sorry, I forgot you were still there, 
I'll send you to your death now. Clang. The blade of contempt flashed. The beam of light was chopped open on the spot, including the mechanical demonic cow. In unison, without the slightest drag, minus 10,858, a yellow bludgeon number floated up. It's not as high as my own crystal bonus. Su Hao sighed, somewhat dissatisfied with this number. It was worth mentioning. There was no one else here, so it didn't count as Versailles. Congratulations on being the first mech to break through 10 floors. Accumulated Essence Fragments Asterisk 109. Do you want to stop and rest? Challenging the 11th floor. Su Hao directly rebuffed. The challenge. It continued. 15th floor. A high-rise building completely shattered. Glass flew in the sky, glittering in the sunlight. Core Crystals, Ancient Fierce General, Water King, Electric Devil, or choose to upgrade the Core Crystals you already possess by one level. Accessory Crystals, Shoulder Cannon, High Frequency Tomahawk, Flamethrower, or choose to upgrade an already owned Accessory Crystal by one level. Elementalist, Upgrade by one level. Choose, Shoulder Cannon. After thinking for a while, Su Hao made his choice. Ka Ching, a crack appeared on Su Hao's shoulder armor part. After opening it, it was loaded with three red cannonballs, three on the left and three on the right, making a total of six. Attachment crystal, shoulder cannon, grade 0 slash grade 5. Quality, excellent. Effect, can bombard an area of 5 meters, dealing 300 fixed damage. No cooldown, but constant firing will increase heat generation, and the energy value consumed will gradually rise. Description, if you're poor. Tactical penetration. If you're rich, give me a bomb. Suhao chose it because his own energy value was so high that it could completely support the shoulder cannon to bombard for a long time. Moreover, it was solid damage. Fixed damage meant that no matter the monster's defense, no matter how high the resistance was, it was causing 300 damage. But solid damage also had a drawback. It couldn't eat the damage bonus from crystals. However, in the easy difficulty obelisk tower, the shoulder cannon plus 2000 plus energy value can be said to be a cannon wash that no one can stop. Layer 16. Difficulty, easy. Quest, please survive the beast tie for two minutes. Scene change. Inside the large mountain, the ground shook. An oppressive and terrifying aura surged in. Roar. Ow. The roars of wild beasts spread out. A huge tree collapsed. Unable to stop the wave of beasts at all. Survive? These two words should be more suitable for them. Right? Su Hao snorted. After saying that, both shoulders opened. A red cannonball flew out with smoke and flames rising high into the sky before blasting down furiously. Boom 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 boom. The sound of blasting resounded through the sky. The mountain peaks shook. The ground cracked. And the beast screamed. Hardening the beast tide. Minus 300. Minus 300. Minus 300. Minus 300. Minus 300. Pieces of white numbers floated up, mercilessly taking the lives of the beasts. The energy began to drop rapidly as the shells continued to bombard. But at the same time, the beast's dead life orbs were turned into energy values by energy conversion. With the two complementing each other, there was no loss at all. One word, just bombard. Under the baptism of cannon fire, the beast tide was completely blown away after supporting it for less than a minute. Completing the mission ahead of schedule. Obtaining a doubled increase in essence fragments. Level up. 1112. Zero's entire attributes rise slightly. Life value plus 100. Energy value plus 100. Armor plus 80. Shield plus 100, Strength plus 45, Defense plus 43, Speed plus 39, Spirit plus 30. Suho nodded with satisfaction and continued to speed pass. 17th floor, 18th floor, 19th floor, until the 20th layer. Mission, kill the angel from the fallen. In the dark heaven and earth, only a blood-colored sun rotated. A black angel dressed in a revealing outfit spread its wings, its long hair hanging down on its hip, its eyes looking down on Suho with contempt. Ignorant mortal. What a lot of nonsense. Suha was also too lazy to talk nonsense, and his shoulder cannon directly opened up. Rumble. The Black Angel was a copy of the Western world's bottom boss with great difficulty, but now it was blasted by the shoulder cannon, to the point that it couldn't lift its head. Mortal. How dare you, when you run out of power. I'll see what you'll do. The Black Angel's pretty face was chilling. Suha held the blade of contempt in his hand. With a stroke, fan-shaped wind blades danced out wildly instantly decapitating the shadowy creatures on the ground. Energy value converted. Thousands of shells bombarded wildly, not stopping for a moment. In the end, the Black Angel was blasted into dregs. The entire time, it failed to injure Suhao's life value a bit. Congratulations on becoming the mech artist with the highest number of cleared levels so far. Accumulated essence asterisk 210. Due to the gain effect, it is actually asterisk 420. The void store is open. 
due to you being the first one to clear the level, you will permanently enjoy a 20% discount. The corner of Suhao's mouth rose. What was wanted was this kind of result. The void store was also divided into grades. The higher the rank, the better the goods. The commodities in it were not set in stone. Every week would rotate the commodities, and there was no pattern to what was randomized. Therefore, it was easy to get rewards in the early stages of clearing the obelisk tower, because it's not a high tier. In the later stages, when the number of tiers comes up, a lot of commodities will have to accumulate essence fragments. Void shop, easy. Attachment crystals, vitality. Kowuru, transcendent shield. Scout radar. Core crystals, demonic spider. Humble one, small mage. Props, life potion, small. Energy crystal, small. Strength booster. Defense booster. Materials, biomass. Fey alloy. Angel's feather. Demon's saliva. Void shop, normal. Attachment crystal. Core crystal. Props. Material, bandage of the knocker. Void shop, hard. Attachment crystals, stored power. Underworld wave battling. God's lament. Core crystals, iron cloth shirt. Golden bell. Lord's blessing. Props, life potion, medium. Energy crystal ball, medium. Materials, shackled body asterisk 1, essence fragment asterisk 10,000. Only one in the store at the moment. Heart of the Dead Sea. Suhao immediately locked onto the shackled body. The shackled body served as the main material for casting the magical girlfriend mecha. For the rest of the materials, Suhao had a whole bunch of them today. Only the shackled body was missing. 10, 000 essence fragments is a bit expensive. But it's worth it. Suhao smiled with satisfaction. He was looking forward more and more to the fusion of the magical girlfriend mech and the primordial machine soul. Global announcement. Solo, first to clear the obelisk tower. Thus opening the battle for the obelisk tower list. Refresh 24 hours a day. The faster a country passes the obelisk, the more they stay on the list. Those who stay on the list will receive special benefits for their country. This news spread all over the blue planet globe. Only China was cheering, while the other countries were in shock. What exactly is the origin of that, done? Still outputting, he's still outputting. Fark, just how many global announcements does this Chinese person have to make? In addition to the foreign countries being shocked, there was also envy. Having such a talented mech artist would be a blessing for the country. We mustn't let Huaxia snatch the number one spot on the list. The White Corps Commander-in-Chief of the United States of America droned like thunder. The first place will always be our United States of Americas. On the Chinese side, Yellow Dust in the Alliance was also giving serious orders. Everyone who goes to hit the list and can exchange materials, crystals, props as well as experience value must level up. Also, send mechs to surround the obelisk tower. Done, is definitely inside. Huang Dust's face was filled with an excited look. Finally caught you. 24 hours to a refresh. The list is up for grabs. Where are the people who usually clamor above the hub? Let them come over and challenge the obelisk tower. Solo, past? It's indeed strong when put in reality. But in tiger poker? All I can say is that it still needs to be practiced. The obelisk tower was already surrounded. It was overcrowded and the dinosaurs were boiling. Luckily, there were alliance mechs maintaining the scene and opening up the site into four lanes in the southeast, northwest, and north, which didn't cause chaos. Everyone, please ensure that your lives are the benchmark before going to challenge. The alliance will not ban the obelisk tower. Everyone can hit as high as they can to add gain for China. Long Jinchuan's voice was like a bell, clearly reaching the ears of the crowd. Good. Minister Long is all here. Grandpa, you're 70 years old, aren't you? And you're still coming? I just want to enhance my own mech and see if I have a shot for the small days by then. The crowd instantly boiled over. At this moment, the talented mech division that the alliance had cultivated also made their appearance at this moment. At the head was none other than Sun Haoming, with a pair of large mechanical hands holding a staff encrusted with red gems. His rainbow cloak danced with the wind, and as he walked forward, the visual sense of magic plus metal was nothing short of stunning. One by one, they entered it and prepared to climb the tower. A three-dimensional diorama appeared at the top of the obelisk. It was divided into easy, normal, hard, nightmare, and hell. Simple difficulty, solo, huasia, took 36 minutes and 44 seconds. Normal difficulty, none. Difficult difficulty, none. Nightmare difficulty, none. Hell difficulty, none. Demon. Long Jianchuan's mouth twitched when he saw the solo clearance time. More than half an hour to clear the level. How did he do it? One hour later, the list started to change. Easy difficulty, solo, China, took 36 minutes and 44 seconds. Will Smith, United States of America, took 1 hour and 13 seconds. Sun Haoming, China, took 1 hour and 1 minute. Ramesh Sharma, Tianzhu, took 1 hour and 1 minute and 8 seconds. 
Zelena Gazanov, Russia, took 1 hour and 1 minute and 12 seconds. When all is said and done, the United States of America is indeed formidable, actually occupying the second place. Sunhelming isn't weak either. Right behind him in third place. Wide your pig eyes and see who's in first place. Mouths frothed around the obelisk. United States of America. White Regiment Base. The United States of America had several mecha bases. One of them was immediately built around the obelisk tower right after it appeared, isolating others from entering. Want to enter the obelisk? You can. Pay up. Otherwise, wait for the number to be called. Inside the rather sci-fi future base, at a glance, it was all white. Will, can you still mention the speed? Commander-in-chief Aldrich inquired. Will, who was blonde, blue-eyed and robust, nodded. It can be boosted by another 3-5 minutes. There are extremely many types of crystals, weapons, and mechs inside. I can't fully adapt to it for a while. Let the research team do the calculations and match the best clearance program. Aldrich's head was full of gray hair, but as the chief commander he was exceptionally calm and decisive. Make sure to pull that, doke, down for me. Yes, chief commander, the researcher promised. At this time, someone outside walked quickly and gasped. Commander-in-chief. The U Corps says that our monopolization of the obelisk tower is a monopoly. It's a business. It discriminates against American citizens and wants to make a statement to the world. Don't worry about them. This is a time of rapid growth for us. Don't worry about anyone. Aldrich's eyes were sinister as he casually waved his hand. He was a racist, believing himself that white people were the top race in the world and the rest were inferior. Now that the world had changed, it was equivalent to giving the white regiment a chance to be above all races. The uprights? Get out not a hair on their head. Suha wasn't clear about what happened in the outside world. He was busy breaking through and earning essence fragments. The shackled body was very important. He must get his hands on it. As long as the magical girlfriend mech was built, the benefits were very numerous, and it could take care of itself as well as act as a companion when entering the decaying stranger's shadow, which could save a lot of trouble and inconvenience. Layer, 20, difficulty, normal. Task, resist the five waves of attacks from the underground people and guard the fortress from being destroyed. The scene in front of him changed. Suha was in a steel fortress. There was the sound of humans roaring around. Behind us is our home. Not a single step back. People's eyes were crimson, staring angrily at the monster in front of them. Suha, on the other hand, was calm and glanced at his attribute panel. Life value of 3000 plus. Energy value of almost 3000. Armor of 2500 plus. Shield of 4000 plus. Strength, defense, speed and spirit all remained at their original values. Core crystal, western gunslinger, level 5 slash grade 5. Quality, excellent. Effect, 1. Racer, revolver type firearms, increases damage by 75%. Accessory crystals, vitality, transcendent shield, kawuru, fiber body, match, lighter, weapons, burst revolver, windjammer, the zero at this moment was very different from before. Gold lines covered the armor of the mech, and the head wore a mechanical western cowboy hat with a hint of evil. The wide gray robe was windless, and there was a crimson revolver in a holster on the left mechanical thigh, and a half-meter long cyan-colored battle knife on the right mechanical thigh. The completely western style exuded an inexplicable sense of oppression. Rumble. The earth began to shake. Black monsters appeared in front of the steel fortress. They had the appearance of a human but were covered in black. Their pupils were as brilliant as stars and their mouths emitted a beastly low roar. Underground man. Attributes, strength 120, defense 90, speed 88, spirit 11. Characteristics, once an underground man dies, he will transfer the essence of his entire body to his kin, raising the most terrifying synthetics. Weakness, a wave of streams. Evaluation, how black, even to their own people. Suhao narrowed his eyes. Then, the mechanical biped erupted with high temperature and swept out. Clank. The wind wheel blade was sheathed. A green-colored whirlwind swept out, cutting the underground people apart with ease. Su Hao was like a bulldozer, pushing horizontally all the way, crushing all the way. However, black essence appeared in the corpses of the dead underground people, flowing inside each underground person, one after another, as if they were condensing something terrifying. Buzz. The fifth wave of undergrounders fell. A particularly strong wave of darkness was injected into the last underground man. Roar. That underground man's whole body skyrocketed. His pupils became pale, and his muscles bulged high, as if he was a black gorilla, swinging a huge fist and smashing at Suha like a madman. Seek death. Suha raised his eyes instantly, his palm resting on top of the explosive revolver. Trigger fast hand. Increase revolver damage by 75%. Trigger strike gain. Increase 75% strike rate. Trigger weapon master. 
Increase weapon damage damage by 120%. Trigger my blood boiling. Increase attack speed by 20%. Activate mech enhancement. Increase 25% of all attributes. Boom. 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 Suhao's movements were as fast as lightning and the moment he pulled the trigger and then pivoted the hammer. Six bullets wrapped in red-colored flames accurately struck the giant underground man's brow. All six shots hit. Minus 20,000. Minus 21,000. Minus 16,899. 19,000 minus 15,555. Minus 15. 555. Minus 16,784. Yellow bludgeon numbers floated up. Giant underground man. Killed in seconds. Congratulations on clearing the normal difficulty level 20 of Mechamancer. Accumulated Essence Fragments Asterisk 1050. Took 35 minutes and 19 seconds. Level up. 1213. All of Zero's attributes have risen slightly. Life value plus 220. Energy value plus 190. Armor plus 140. Shield plus 210. Strength plus 50. Defense plus 50. Speed plus 45. Spirit plus 39. You are the first mech to pass the normal difficulty. From now on, when you challenge the obelisk tower, you will have one chance to reselect a new crystal. You have also earned a gain for Huaxia, plus 10% experience gain for duplicates within Huaxia's territory. Lasts for 15 days. Opening the battle for the top list? Suhao had a deep thought on his face. In his memory, he had seen organizations such as the Huaxia Mecha Alliance, White Regiment, Wu Regiment, Shadow Village, Saya Combat Clan, Great Pirate Mecha Regiment, Red Su Battle Regiment, Tianju Buddha Armor, and so on, one by one, competing to be the first to fight for the list. During that period of time, it could be called the first Mecha Frenzy of Blue Star Civilization, watching everyone's heart pounding and blood boiling. However, Su Hao didn't think much about it, whether it was playing the list or competing for it. The main tone was strength. As long as one was strong enough, everything was a passing cloud. Let's go out and eat something first then start challenging the difficult difficulty. After making up his mind, Su Hao exited the obelisk tower. Global announcement. Solo, first passes the 20th floor of the normal difficulty obelisk tower, fighting for a plus 10% increase in experience value for Hua Xia. Such a line floated out in front of all the mechs. Then, they froze once again. It was this, done, again. While we're still struggling on easy difficulty, he's already cleared normal difficulty. You guys, do you think we'll be able to see, solo, first pass hard difficulty later? I guess, as long as he's willing, hell difficulty is even possible. At this moment, all the Chinese people's throats were dry, their moods were shocked, and their emotions were ecstatic. Experience value gain. It meant that upgrading would be faster. This was called, one man gets a chicken and a dog. United States of America. Aldrich Grimaced. Must first pass the difficult difficulty before, done. Commander in chief. Just now the White Bear Combat Regiment went in, but all of them failed. The researcher said anxiously. Aldrich lowly roared. Don't mention this to me. What I want is victory. Lose and replace with someone else. The first pass definitely contains hidden rewards. We must take it. Attack the difficult difficulty. One step ahead of, done. The entire base could only hear Aldrich's roar. But soon, he calmed down. Let the u Corps come in, and warn them to stay put, or the base's guns won't be able to see the capital of Sakura Nation. An obelisk was erected. There were countless otaku and geeks surrounded who were taking pictures. However, on top of the surrounding buildings, a number of ninja mechs, pirate mechs, and fighter mechs appeared, corresponding to the Shadow Village, the Great Pirate Mech Corps, and the Scion Combat Clan. Cooperate. It's a fight between nations these days. Sarutobi Sasuke sighed deeply. The leader of the Great Pirate Mecha Corps was a white mecha, cloaked in black but missing an arm. With a battle sword hanging from his waist, vaguely glowing red, the head armor slowly lifted up, a flash of blood light flowed out, and a low voice came out, I'll give you a face, let go of the grudge for now. The third party was an orange colored mecha, their head armor took on the color of gold, and there were golden flames burning on the surface of their armored bodies, one of them let out a laugh, our scion combat clan is also willing to join, Sarutobi Sasuke nodded, his eyes flashed sinisterly, let the world see the depths of the Sakura country. Bear country, a world of ice and snow, countless people were naked, and even though they were frozen red, their faces remained unchanged, bear country is number one, Ola, they roared, they roared, waving red flags and rushing into the obelisk, Hua Xia, the capital city, Long Jinchuan and the others were completely speechless, while they were painstakingly guarding this place, Solo, was frantically upgrading and speed passing, this wasn't like what was promised, minister, 
How long do we have to guard until? A youngster muttered and asked. An older MacMaster's eyes were fierce. Guard until, done, great god comes out. Not even one step away. Long Jinchuan didn't bother with the youngster. His expression was grave, the done, s mech must be very unique, or very noticeable. A super god of this level is definitely different from the ordinary. The others nodded heavily, all paying serious attention, one after another. There were mecha masters coming out of the obelisk tower, either with their heads hanging down or with high aspirations. At this time, a golden battle armor came out from the obelisk tower, causing a burst of screams. The golden battle armor was about 3 meters tall. Its body surface was covered with glazed colors. Its back armor carried two black battle swords, and a fire lotus lingered around its body, reflecting Raleigh into the pupils of countless people. This immediately caught Long Jinchuan's attention. How handsome. Su Hao passed by to take a look and opened his mouth to praise. A laughing voice came out from inside the golden battle armor. Thanks for the compliment. Brother. Su Hao smiled faintly and brushed past Long Jinchuan and the others who were running. The alliance's youngsters saw Su Hao's zero, and their eyes flashed with a hint of contempt. How many mecha drawings have been opened? Still using a zero number machine? Are you the done, great god? When Su Hao walked away, Long Jinchuan stopped the golden battle armor. The golden battle armor spread its hands. I'm not. I'm Yuan Bao of the Jin Lai Fu group. Long Jinchuan's eyes froze. Then he gritted his teeth in hatred. But he was not discouraged. Wait. Continue to wait. The steaming hot food stall. Su Hao ordered a wonton and feasted on it. After speeding through the hard difficulty, I should be able to redeem the shackled body. He chanted in his heart. This kind of scarce material had to be redeemed in a hurry. After leveling up, the number of essence fragments needed would grow along with it. By then, the shackled body would definitely be more than 10. 000 essence fragments. After a few consecutive bowls of wontons were consumed, Su Hao's spirit was much better. Is this the capital city? The godfather I recently recognized lives in the capital. But what a pity. Lin Yi actually died. And thanks to me flattering him before. Cut. Shannon. You. Eh? A disgusted voice rang out from the crowd. Su Hao raised his head. The other party happened to cast a line of sight. It was precisely Chenin and the others from Rice City University. Su Hao's eyes instantly went cold. Recently, he was very busy. Busy with the first pass. Busy with capturing rewards. And almost forgot about this beast. Su Hao. Chenin was also a bit stunned. Then he laughed coldly. Why did you come to the capital? Even if you're afraid of me, there's no need to hide so far away. After saying that, Chenin and the others laughed out loud. Su Hao looked at the group of people in front of him. His eyes were calm, and his lips gently quirked. Rat tied, he was the mech, and the mech was him. The skill of independent crystals was at his fingertips. Instantly, the crowd let out a scream, only to see densely packed rats surging in like a tidal wave. They did not attack anyone, but surrounded Chenin and the others. Chenin and the others went numb. How had they ever seen such a picture? This, Chenin had just opened his mouth to utter a single word. Almost simultaneously, the vast swarm of rats swooped out like a black ocean, completely enveloping them in. The street was plunged into dead silence, whether it was the pedestrians or the mechs. All of them stood in place with shocked faces. They discovered a very strange phenomenon. These rats didn't hurt anyone else, but only attacked the young men. It was as if someone was secretly controlling them. Get lost. Shannon. Do something. Shannon and the others who were surrounded by the wave of rats screamed in terror. Shannon roared. Shatter. Ruin lines filled the air and armor pieces covered it. A mecha that took on the color of broken glass appeared in the crowd's field of vision. However, any rats that approached the past couldn't cause any damage at all, and were directly pierced through their bodies by the broken glass slag. Is struggling useful? Su Hao's eyes remained cold, and he secretly snapped his fingers. Air stripping. A semi-transparent circular shield snapped down. The air of Chen and the others was instantly stripped away. And one by one, they began to struggle madly. At this moment, a wave of rats covered in crazily not on the mechs. In Chen and's fearful eyes, the squeaks of the rats were like a symphony from hell. He could feel his mech being drastically damaged, immediately followed by his own flesh, gnawed by the sharp teeth, blood flowing in pain eating away at his soul. He tried to scream, but found the rat hum rushing into his mouth, biting off his windpipe and gnawing on his throat. Before dying, his eyes stopped at the front. There, Su Hao sat peacefully and comfortably on the chair. Those eyes, cold, brutal, merciless, ruthless. The rat tide came and went in a hurry. In just less than 10 seconds, it ran past Su Hao dragging the corpses. Su Hao smoothly touched at Chan An's corpse, devouring successful. Independent crystal, broken armor, level 0 slash level 5. Grade, A. Effect. 1. Glazed armor, cloak the mech in a layer of broken glass slag. 
10% cause bleeding effect, rebound 5% damage, level 1, 15%, 7%, Level 2, 20%, 10%, level 3, 25%, 12%, level 4, 30%, 15%, level 5, 40%, 20%, 2, burst, fires the glazed armor out. With 5% inflicting a colored refinement status on the enemy, colored refinement inflicts the effect of slowing down the enemy. Level 1, 7%, level 2, 10%, level 3, 12%, level 4, 15%. Level 5, 20%. Anti-injury armor? Not bad. It can be combined with needle-stabbing geocache. Suha was quite satisfied. The broken armor also had a bleeding effect. Although it didn't have much effect on metal monsters, it was a big killer for infected blood meat types. His current target was the obelisk tower. The more independent crystals there were, the more space there was to choose from, and it would help him break through the levels. Please choose the difficulty. Difficult. Suha didn't half hesitate. Difficulty difficulty begins. The enemy's desire to attack will be more frequent. Please be mentally prepared. Core crystals, sacrifice magic cultivator. Sword cultivator. Magic instructor. Spartan. Subsidiary crystals, imperial sword technique. Fireball technique. Healing technique. Summoning technique. Magic cultivation. Summoning technique. Suhao immediately made his choice. Core crystal, sacrifice magic cultivation, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Effect. 1. Blood sacrifice, devouring blood and meat. Infected creatures, strengthen strength and spirit by 0. 1%. But also decreases defense by 0. 1%. Currently level 0. Upper limit is 40%. Level 1, 50%. Level 2, 60%. Level 3, 70%. Level 4, 80%. Level 5, 90%. 2. Magic view, as the number of times it is devoured increases. The appearance of the mech will change, and it is capable of mentally suppressing the enemy. Description, as long as you have no morals, no one else can morally kidnap you. Devour it. Attachment crystal, summoning, level 0 out of 10. Quality, excellent. Effect, summon goblin warriors from the western fantasy world. Currently at level 0. 20 can be summoned. Level 1, 40. Level 2, 60. Level 3, 80. Level 4, 100. And level 5, 150, the more you summon, the more energy you lose, and you are also affected by the basic attributes of the mech. Description, see this goblin crypt? It's useless even if the goblin killer comes. My basic attributes are very high. Going the summoning stream is very favorable. The BD in Su Hao's mind immediately took shape. BD, build, can be understood as a set, or a crystal match that has already been molded. The scene changed. The challenge started again. Layer, 1. Difficulty, hard. Quest, you, as the sex escaped trader, please survive the pursuit of the inner disciples and elders for three minutes. The green hills and mountains were so high that it could be described as a thousand birds flying over the mountains. Suho melded with zero and appeared in a clearing. An NPC wearing robes and a tiara immediately brushed out in front of him. Little bastard. How dare you steal the Tang Sex Rainstorm Pear Blossom Needle. Senior brother Lin. Kill him and go back to deliver. The eyes of a group of inner sect disciples were icy cold. Inner sect disciple. Attributes, Strength 120, Defense 140, Speed 124, Spirit 90, Characteristics, Good at Concealed Weapons, Weakness, Elemental, Evaluation, Do you also want to be put in a 100, 000 year old soul ring? Tang Sect Elder, Attributes, Strength 150, Defense 149, Speed 150, Spirit 120, Characteristics, Covered with Hidden Weapons, Hard to Deal with, Weakness, Elemental, Evaluation, the one who stole the rainstorm pear blossom needle back then has traveled through. Su Hao's expression was without ripples. Summoning technique. In the next moment, a magic formation appeared around him, and a green monster blasted out. A tattered crotch cloth protecting O Jin Jin, and a wooden stick in his hand. They had inherited Su Hao's basic attributes, and each of them had a strong torso. Standing over two meters tall. Living like Mr. Bodybuilder. Yikes. The kobolds roared and swung their wooden sticks to kill. The inner disciples immediately counterattacked. Nay. The monsters were tough and quickly got their heads knocked off. Blood sacrifice. Suhao used, sacrifice demonic cultivation, on the corpse. Red magic light enveloped the corpse and decomposed into blood awnings that merged into Suhao's body. It didn't matter if the basic attributes grew slowly. It couldn't help that there were many monsters. You are definitely not a traitor. Who are you? The inner sect elder was still struggling to hold on. His face full of panic. Suhao's head armor shone with scarlet light. 
like a bloodthirsty berserker beast, smiling lowly, me, a traveling party without blue silver grass and Houtian hammer. After saying that, there was a bang. The elder's head burst like a watermelon. Pass. Please choose the affiliated crystals, life force, kowuru, lightning magic, arcane energy sphere. Change the batch. Suhao said softly. Swish. A new batch of accessory crystals surfaced. At once, the corner of his mouth lifted up a smile. Kind of interesting. Attachment crystals, fresh blood living sacrifice, ice heart technique, sound of vocal music, fuck water. Suha directly chose fresh blood living sacrifice. Attachment crystal, fresh blood living sacrifice, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, flawless. Effects, losing 5% of the mech's life value cap enhances all attributes of the summoned object by 15%. Level 1, 10%. 30%, level 2, 15%, 45%, level 3, 20%, 60%, level 4, 25%, 75%, level 5, 30%, 90%, description, with my blood, summon the devil, blood living sacrifice, plus, sacrifice devil cultivation, plus, summoning technique, equals pass, Su Hao's smile gradually perverted, while everyone was still thinking hard about how to choose, he had already recorded thousands of past BDS in his mind. The obelisk tower was a good place for Suha to quickly upgrade and exchange materials. Layer, 2, difficulty, hard, quest, the world has been invaded. Please defend against the incoming extraterrestrial evil races with the locals. 10 minutes, the scene in front of his eyes changed. Suha's pupils reflected the smoky battlefield, the roars of warriors, the screams of young and old women and children, and the crazy laughter of the extraterrestrial evil race. Kill. Kill all the creatures on this planet. This place will become our nest. The extraterrestrial evil race had wings on their backs, curved horns on their foreheads, the lower limbs of beasts, the upper limbs of humans, and their skin took on a black color, while their eyes were as red as blood, and they were waving the guns in their hands, pulling the triggers continuously towards the bottom. Lasers danced about. The bulky mech was blasted to pieces. Bursting pieces of the mecha wrapped in heavy force kept smashing into the old, weak, sick and young people fleeing in the distance. Boom! Seeing that the old, weak, sick and young were about to be devoured, a thick wooden stick swept across the sky, blasting the roiling mecha fragments into dregs. Slaughter them all! An ice-cold voice came out from inside an ordinary mecha. The magic array continuously shone. A head of green kobolds of about 5 meters came into view. A full 20 heads of giant kobolds, like a steel wall, cut across the entire battlefield. Roar! The kobolds emitted a ferocious aura. They madly swung their wooden sticks and killed the extraterrestrial evil race fearlessly. Bang! 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 A head of the extraterrestrial evil race was blasted into mush, completely losing its previous arrogance. Only a few minutes had passed. The ground was littered with the corpses of the extraterrestrial evil race. People stared blankly at the mech that was so ordinary that it couldn't be ordinary anymore. So surprised that they didn't know how to speak. Completed the quest early and received a gain of doubling the essence fragments. Attachment crystals, knight's glory. Sword Breath, Self-Exploding Infantry, Mafia, or Level Up the Crystals, Level Up. After saying this, Suhao began to devour the flesh and blood. Everything was ready. He opened the next level without looking back. Third Layer, The Fourth Layer, Layer 7, Eleventh Layer, Layer 15, Nineteenth Floor. After breaking through the nineteenth floor, Machine Zero had undergone a strong change. The original Machine Zero was rather radiant in style, but now it was surrounded by crimson armor with a human body like vein writhing on its surface, and a beating black heart at its heart location. The head was no longer mechanical, but an infected dragon head with scarlet eyes, harboring endless violence and killing. Sacrifice Magic Cultivation, Level 5. Summoning Art, Level 5. Blood Living Sacrifice, Level 5. Damage Sharing, Level 5. Flame Enchantment, Level 5. Sword Chi, Level 1. Damage Sharing, which could transfer the damage Su Hao received to the Kobolds. This greatly ensured Su Hao's survival rate. As for the Kobold, all I can say is that it goes peacefully. After leveling up Flame Enchantment to full level, Su Hao stepped into the 20th floor. Layer, 20, Difficulty, Hard, Quest, An Evil Magician is about to rule the entire planet. Please stop him. This place was in the Western Magic style. Holy light swirled, and the White Giant Tower towered into the clouds. The steps stretching upwards were covered with a large number of humans with mute expressions and empty eyes, as if they had lost hope. Surrounding them were knights in armor, holding war spears and threatening the humans to go up. At the top, on the throne, a man in blue vestments sat, with handsome features, holding a staff. His eyes were deep yet cold. Swish, Su Hao appeared in the center of the square. The magician glanced at him, his tone unkind. 
guest from afar. Are you trying to interfere with my promotion ceremony? Quite polite. Su Hao laughed. Then I'll let you die a painful death later. The magician didn't understand what this sentence meant, but since the teasing in his tone grew cold. Knight, kill him. Guardian Knight. Attributes, Strength 200, Defense 220, Speed 190, Spirit 50. Characteristics, Attribute Bonus when in a group. Weakness, Fear of Darkness. Comment, What kind of knight are you? I am a dragon knight. I'm a battle knight. I'm racist. Wizard Ekdal. Attributes, Strength 50, Defense 270, Speed 210, Spirit 300. Characteristics, Good at all types of magic. Evaluation, Wizard, You must be 30 years old. The Guardian Knight had just approached the past when a blood-colored magic formation appeared behind Su Hao. It was precisely the blood-living sacrifice. A battle sword soundlessly crossed out, directly chopping off the Guardian Knight's body, coloring the holy ground red with hot blood. Boom boom boom. 120 super-huge kobolds arrived. They were more than 10 meters tall, no longer had wooden sticks in their hands but wore swords, and wore golden battle armor, like a golden mountain standing in the middle of the square, shocking the eyeballs of all the magicians. At the same time, Su Hao's body diffused 120 long lines, connecting to the body of the Goblin King. Chop that wizard into mincemeat for me. He pointed a finger at the towering wizard. The next moment, the 120 goblins swung the battle swords in their hands. The void shook his sword chi took shape and shot out violently like a crescent moon. The magician hurriedly waved his staff. Angel summoning. The staff shone. Six 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 winged angels descended into the void. They spread their wings and blocked the front of the magician trying to counteract the sword chi, poo poo poo, however, the six angels were torn apart by the sword chi on the spot, the flying feathers and blood in the sky were like a heavenly avalanche, the magician hurriedly cast defensive magic, an impenetrable earth armor appeared on the surface of his body, which barely blocked the sword chi, not bad, but, just not bad, Su Hao smiled coldly, flame enchantment, the energy value was consumed rapidly, the 120 super giant goblin's battle sword lit up with a blazing flame and chopped out once again, that day, the humans in the Holy Land saw the Sky Dome turn into a sea of fire. The magician's pupils reflected it all. He wanted to escape, but it was simply too late, and he was instantly drowned out. Congratulations on being the first mech to clear the Obelisk Tower difficulty, granting casting acceleration roll asterisk 2. Crystal replacement plus 1. Accumulated essence fragments 4200. Gain addition. Real 8400. Level up. 1314. All attributes of Machine Zero rise slightly. Life value plus 250. Energy value plus 150. Armor plus 160. Shield plus 120. Strength plus 50. Defense plus 50. Speed plus 50. Spirit plus 50. Su Hao revealed a hint of excitement that it was possible to exchange the shackled body. Void store, difficult. Attachment crystals, stored power. Underworld wave battling blade. God's lament. Core crystals, iron cloth shirt. Golden bell shield. Blessing of Jehovah. Props, life potion, medium. Energy crystal ball, medium. Materials, shackled body asterisk 1, essence fragment asterisk 10,000. Only one in the store currently. I have 9. 979 essence fragments, plus a permanent 20% discount. Suha was all smiles. Redeem, shackled body. Shackled body requires essence fragments asterisk 10,000. Discounted to asterisk 8,000 due to your 20% discount. The rest of the essence fragments. Exchange them all for one room crystals and materials. Su Hao continued to operate. It was worth mentioning. The void store on easy difficulty had one room crystal stones, which could be exchanged in unlimited quantities. As long as you were willing, soaking in the obelisk tower all day and exchanging one room crystals alone to sell to others could be completely very nourishing. After squandering the essence fragments cleanly, Su Hao left the obelisk tower with satisfaction. It was time to create the magic girlfriend mecha. Global announcement. Chinese mechs, solo, pass the obelisk tower difficulty, all mechs of Chinese people have strength, defense, and speed plus 20 for 7 days, another piece of heavy news exploded in Blue Star, FARC, the United States of America, inside the military base, Aldrich cursed with a gloomy face, how did he do it, the easy, normal difficulties are way ahead, and now even the hard difficulty is cleared within 1 hour, next to him stood a black man, sneering, who told you to block our core from coming in, Otherwise wouldn't we have let the Chinese be so arrogant? The hard difficulty first pass reward is gone. Are you sure you can take the nightmare difficulty? Aldrich's gaze was grim, George. If you dare to talk big, I'll take Susan's shoes and kick your ass hard. Black George was full of disdain. The obelisk tower belongs to rogue mode. 
As long as a powerful core crystal is selected and followed up with the right accessory crystals, it's easy to push all the way across. Nightmare difficulty. We will definitely take it. It's him. It's him again. It's really him. Huang Dust's eyes were filled with excitement. A 20 attribute increase is enough to raise the battle power by one level. Commander in chief. Just now, another person broke through on the difficult difficulty. It's the United States of America. Commander in chief. The Sakura kingdom also made it. The United States of America is attacking the nightmare difficulty. The mecha division came to report. Huang Dust's gaze was grave. They're trying to snipe Solo, especially the United States of America, wanting to intercept Solo as first pass reward. Attention all. Don't let them succeed. Use the latest sets that have been coordinated out and prepare to attack Nightmare Difficulty. Huang Dust immediately issued an order. Inside the Alliance, the Mechs gathered their attention. They began to occupy the easy, normal, and hard difficulty lists one batch after another. It was refreshed once every 24 hours. Each list ranking would give different gains. They didn't want to drag Su Hao down, leaving the Obelisk Tower. Su Hao returned to the Express Hotel, going to buy a house later. He looked around. With a magical girlfriend, she can manage the whole house and I'll have a harbor when I'm tired. Su Hao wasn't afraid of running out of money. There was a huge pile of crystals stored inside the market tattoo, and as long as he sold off a batch of the ones he couldn't use, it was enough for him to spend as much as he wanted. The top priority was to build the magic girlfriend mecha. Enchanted girlfriend, material, flesh and blood slash metal. Required material, biomass asterisk 2000. Fey alloy asterisk 2000. Shackled body asterisk 1. Active flesh asterisk 200. Neural tumor asterisk 5. Market coin asterisk 100. 000. Time, 72 hours. There weren't many materials for the magical girlfriend mecha, but they were all rare materials that would take at least dozens of hours each to brush out. As for the shackled body, it was even more of a thousand gold. It was only perverts like Su Hao who could brush out a set of materials hard. Use the casting acceleration roll. Su Hao had just finished speaking when the casting silo continuously flashed with electric light and a cold aura faintly filled out. Immediately afterward, the void opened up. A brand new mecha slowly walked out from inside. Her whole body was made of flesh and blood metal intertwined with five colors, gold, black, gray, white, and red, and she was sexy and hot. The appearance could be described as absolutely beautiful, with proper features and eyes as bright as rubies, seemingly observing Su Hao in front of her. Next is the primitive mech soul. Su Hao took out the key prop that could give the mech an autonomous consciousness. The primordial machine soul was nothing out of the ordinary, just a slightly glowing ball of light, but it contained marvelous fluctuations, allowing Su Hao to feel the breath of life tangibly. He placed the primordial machine soul in the heart of the magic girlfriend mech. Click. The armor automatically retracted, revealing the core inside and swallowing the primordial machine soul inside. The next moment, under Su Hao's gaze, weird lightning surfaced on the surface of the magical girlfriend mech and crackled, while spasm phenomenon appeared all over the body and the originally wooden features also changed. The entire commotion lasted for more than 10 seconds. Afterwards, the magic girlfriend Mecha suddenly moved. With her long mechanical legs, she cupped Su Hao's cheeks with both hands and spoke softly and tenderly. From now on, you are my master. Worthy of being a magic Mecha, speaking with a western accent, Su Hao cried and laughed a little. Magic girlfriend, quality, perfect, originally excellent, advanced because of the original machine soul, level, 1. Life value, 200. Energy value, 500. Attributes, strength 20. Defense 30. Speed 30. Spirit 50. Core crystal, none. Attachment crystal, archmage, level 0 slash 5. Weapon, none. Weapon, none. Su Hao raised his eyebrows, his face astonished. The basic three attributes of a magical girlfriend were very top notch. Spiritual strength was even more perverse. 50 points. If this was loaded with, fire escape. A level 1 would be able to push through a level 11 or below copy. Moreover, it also came with a Grand Magician Attachment Crystal. Grand Magician. Quality. Flawless. Effects. 1. Magic Mastery. Any crystal that contains an elemental can utilize an additional 50% of its power. Level 1. 75%. Level 2. 100%. Level 3. 125%. Level 4. 150%. Level 5. 200%. 2 Meditation, a mech sheltered by the elements can automatically return energy value. 1 slash S, level 1, 5 slash S, level 2, 10 slash S, level 3, 20 slash S, level 4, 30 slash S, level 5, 50 slash S. 3. Unity of Intent, can merge one spirit with the master and exert 100%. This isn't a girlfriend, it's simply a fighter. 
Su Hao couldn't help but bellyache a sentence. The next step is to buy a house and bring. Er, do you have your own name? He looked at his magic girlfriend and asked. The magic girlfriend revealed a gentle and sweet smile. Trouble master to give me one. Then it's, Yen Afa. Su Hao was a bit mischievous, but quickly got serious. Take a rest first. I'll take you to brush copies to upgrade later. Yen Afa gazed at Su Hao. Her tone gentle. I listen to my master. But my data shows that you are a bit tired. Why don't you let me serve you? The following 100. 000 words are not convenient to display. Please chat privately with the author. Early morning. Su Hao woke up refreshed. Luckily, there are various crystals to increase the flesh. I didn't disgrace the humans last night. He glanced at his magical girlfriend, Yenifa, who was beside him, and shook his head with a smile. Yenifa yawned lazily and sexily, her snow white hair like silver silk falling down her shoulders like a noble golden cat. She stared at Su Hao, then smiled gently. At this moment, Su Hao remembered a famous saying from his previous life. Life is better with a heterosexual mecca. A few moments later, Su Hao and Yenafa went out the door. I don't know if it was because of the western traditional thinking, but Yenifa had to wear a maid outfit. Originally, Su Hao refused, but after seeing Yenifa who changed into a maid outfit, Su Hao agreed. No matter what, it was just too damn appropriate. The materials for the contempt blade are already complete, but the ice spirit and magic touch gun are still missing quite a bit. While brushing the materials, we can also upgrade Yenifa. I remember that there is a decaying stranger's shadow in the capital, just enough to brush the required materials. All along the way, Su Hao was thinking. He had already started casting the Blade of Contempt. It would be completed in 12 hours. Go to Wang Fujing, boarding a cab. Su Hao said. In the car, he said to Yen Afa next to him, You help me sell a batch of crystals. Okay, master. Yen Afa gently agreed. Seeing this, the driver's teacher master hemmed and hawed. Brother, playing with enough flowers. Not bad. Su Hao blinked and couldn't help it. In other people's eyes. They still thought they were playing cosplay, right? Soon, Su Hao arrived at Wang Fujing. This place was still bustling with activity, and mech swearing mechs could be seen everywhere. The decaying stranger's shadow that he wanted to enter was located in the middle of a square, with quite a few people coming in and out around it. You are approaching the Frost Magic Land. Do you wish to enter? Please select the difficulty. Nightmare. Countdown 3, 2, 1. Decaying stranger's shadow build complete. Welcome to the shadow of the decaying stranger. Next second, Su Hao and Yen Afa were particleized and disintegrated, completely merging into the crack. Location, Frost Magic Land. Level, 1. Difficulty, Nightmare. Quest, Kill the Frost Trolls. Description, The Kingdom Collapsed and the World Was Destroyed. Description, The Kingdom Collapses, The World Is Destroyed. And only the tainted monsters are preparing to rule over everything, turning all the opposite sex into hotbeds to raise their offspring. The sky is cold and frosty. The wind and snow danced wildly and whistled. Su Hao stood on the cliff and saw a kingdom that was burning in front of him shrouded in snowflakes. I hope I can burst out rare crystals from the frost troll. It would be better if it's suitable for you to use. Su Hao smiled faintly. Yen Afa obediently said, Master, I'll listen to you all the way. Su Hao redirected his gaze to the kingdom, and the golden core in his chest bloomed, instantly rendering the zero into a golden mecha, like a round of sun dispelling the cold. Frost Goblin. Attributes, Strength 30, Defense 30, Speed 31. Spirit 10. Characteristics, knows low level magic. Can attach frost magic to wooden sticks? Weakness, flame. Comments, the stick in my hand is very cold. Where's my second stick? You ask? Sorry, it's hot as hell. Ice Goblin Mage. Attributes, strength 15. Defense 35. Speed 27. Spirit 30. Characteristics, specializes in ice magic. Weakness, flame. Evaluation, its hobby is to look at a work of art ice sculpture. Ahead. A group of kobolds was patrolling. They spotted Su Hao and were just about to prepare to strike. The next moment, the wind and snow were like standing still. Two scarlet beams shot out violently, turning the frost goblin and ice goblin mage into black ash. Killed in one hit, Yen Afa clapped happily from the side and gained a large amount of experience value. Level up. 1-9. All attributes of Yen Afa's magical girlfriend rose substantially. Life value plus 590. Energy value plus 980. Armor plus 830. Shield plus 990. Strength plus 37. Defense plus 50. Speed plus 49. Spirit plus 120. When Su Hao saw Yanafa's upgrade speed, he nodded his head in satisfaction. This is the right thing to do. Drops 10,000 molten crystals asterisk 288. Frost staff fragment asterisk 55. Goblin's crotch cloth asterisk 103. Deadly freeze asterisk 3. 
Vitality, asterisk 5. Ice Spike, asterisk 1. Seeing these affiliated crystals, Su Hao had a sudden thought. The crystals after his own merged path. Is it for Yenifa to use? If it was possible, Yi Nifa's various values would be able to surge by a large margin. Accessory crystals, fatal freeze, grade 0 slash grade 5. Quality, normal. Effect, increase ice elemental damage by 10%. Description, ice cold. Is my favorite element. Description, ice cold is my only main color. Su Hao completed the merging of fatal freeze, and the ice elemental damage became 11. 5%. Then transferred it to Yenafa. Try to see if it can be loaded. He said. Yenifa held the fatal freeze, accessory crystal in her hand, and under the gaze of Su Hao's expectant and apprehensive eyes, it was perfectly integrated into the body. Beautiful, he exclaimed in surprise. Yenifa's scarlet eyes had fluctuations of feelings, cupped her cheeks with both hands, and shook her waist shyly. Master, if you praise me so much, I'm going to push you down again. Su Hao hurriedly called out, playing a copy. Don't mess around, this one actually has the juicing G attribute, he slandered in his heart but promptly nodded, even more excited, the two continued to advance, along the way, there were no monsters that could stop them at all, frost troll, attributes, strength 50, defense 55, speed 41, spirit 50, characteristics, magic and martial arts, capable of both magic and melee combat, weakness, flame, comment, see my wise brain, gargamel my brother, a behemoth dragging his bloated body was heading towards the palace, he was ugly looking, Drool constantly dripping from the corners of his mouth as he greedily looked at the king's daughter in front of him. Drill the grove with your brother? The king's daughter was shielded by the prince, her face full of fear. Frost troll. Suddenly, someone shouted. The frost troll subconsciously turned his head to look. There was a bang. The frost troll's head was like a watermelon, exploding on the spot as its huge body fell to the ground with a loud bang. 910. Magical girlfriend Yennefa's entire attributes have risen significantly. Life value plus 200. Energy value plus 250. Armor plus 150. Shield plus 200. Strength plus 20. Defense plus 34. Speed plus 25. Spirit plus 40. Dropped 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 500. Blue limit, asterisk 1. Small codex of ice, asterisk 1. Magic sword, drawing asterisk 1. Finally out. Su Hao nodded in relief. Core crystal, blue limit, level 0 slash level 5. Quality, excellent. Effect. 1. Ring of Deceleration, when you choose to open it actively, it consumes 50 points of energy value and lasts for 60 seconds to inflict a 10% deceleration effect on enemies 10 meters around, level 1, 20%, level 2, 30%, level 3, 40%, level 4, 50%, level 5, 60%. 2. Ice Blue Body, with the casting of ice magic, accumulating energy, a new form can be opened, lasting 30 seconds, within 30 seconds. Weapon loading speed. Own speed. Attack speed increases by 50%. Su Hao put the crystal away. At this time, Yenifa revealed a strange expression. Master, I feel a bit off. Su Hao looked at Yenifa. Codename, Magic Girlfriend Yenifa. Original Machine Soul Evolution Value 0. 1%. Still evolving? Su Hao was a bit surprised. Isn't it true that as long as one keeps fighting, or passes through a copy, one can increase the evolution value? As I remember. Sun Helming's primordial machine soul is not of perfect quality, but epic. The more Su Hao thought about it, the more excited he became. He didn't know much about this aspect of information. After all, it was secret information, and he was just a bottom level mecha master at first. Therefore, Su Hao hadn't thought too much about it until now. Don't worry, you are improving your quality. It's a good thing. Su Hao smiled and comforted Yenifa. Yenifa's eyes lit up. Then will I be able to follow my master all the time? Su Hao guffawed. Yenifa's attributes were getting more and more complex. Not only could she juice, but she could also clip sounds. Simply. Perfect. Load these crystals. Su Hao handed over the subsidiary crystals and core crystals to Yenifa. After the level 20 level cap opened, the entire world would see a chaotic beginning. Before that, it was important to raise Yenifa's battle power up. This would be a great help to Su Hao. Fighting in a group would be a 5% boost on the original experience value. For a 4 member squad. It was a 20% experience bonus. The reason why Su Hao didn't want to form a team was that it was too troublesome. Alone, one could leave when they wanted to, and fight when they wanted to. As for Yi Naifa, she completely followed Su Hao's orders and wouldn't be a burden. Today is the day that I, Eglon Regulus, inherit the throne. What frost goblins, goblin mages, frost trolls, all of them are no match for me and will be killed with a single sword. My father, 
my brother, they all belittled me, and I, returning from hell, killed them all in front of my subjects and became the only king of this kingdom, but before I could change this kingdom, an iron monster in golden armor landed in front of me, and aimed something black at my head, unbridled, I am the new king of the iceberg kingdom, how dare you lowly people treat me like this, Eglon was completely shaken, however, the golden mecha in front of him only faintly made a sound, a trash who killed his father and brother is just that, that's right, a cute and absolutely beautiful young girl poked her head out and muttered, bang, gunshots rang out and shrapnel rained down, Eglon, like being shot, sat paralyzed on the broken throne, lowering his head as blood flowed freely, Su Hao lifted up mad venom, his expression indifferent, not uttering a single word, congratulations on being the first to pass through the frost demon land, reward, ice source snow demon, asterisk 1, sword slayer, drawing asterisk 1, drop 10,000 molten crystals asterisk 2000, ice age, asterisk 1, black ruined heart asterisk 1, although it is the first pass, it is not the world's first pass, therefore, the reward was a big difference compared to, infected land, Su Hao didn't think it mattered, he came to, frost magic land, mainly to bring Yi Nifa to upgrade, and the materials and those were incidental, core crystal, ice source snow demon, level 0 slash level 5, quality, perfect, effects, 1, ice treading magic dance, everywhere you walk will freeze and turn into an ice path, walking on the ice path increases your speed by 50%, once the enemy comes into contact, 10% will be frozen, level 1, 60%, level 2, 70%, level 3, 80%, level 4, 90%, Level 5, 100%. To my heart is like ice, freezes self, has invincibility for 3 seconds, cool down 24 hours. 3. Blizzard, consume 300 energy value, can cause environmental changes to an area, enemy speed is reduced by 20%, armor cut by 30%, attachment crystal, ice age, level 0 slash 3, quality, excellent, effects. 1. Ice touch, touching anything will cause a frost effect, slowing down while continuously dropping blood. 2. Ice creation, can utilize the plasticity of ice to mold into any shape, the larger the volume, the higher the energy value consumed, inflicts 500 fixed damage plus 20% damage bonus, level 1, 30%, 2, 40%, 3, 50%, use it for now, Su Hao handed the ice age to Yennefer and assured, I'll get you a better one later, Yennefer didn't say anything, her eyebrows were full of Su Hao, and she nodded her head obediently, leaving the frost magic land. After Su Hao counted the materials, he started forging the ice spirit and magic touch gun. Master, I put up your crystals on the trading platform. It's already been swept away. Yi Nifa said. Su Hao picked up his cell phone and there was a transfer message on it. Total amount, $50 million. Buy a house in the morning. Move in in the afternoon. Su Hao was satisfied. Go, take a look at our new house. In his last life, he could only bitterly nestle in an old and broken apartment and had to be verbally abused by his wife and children, in this life, those bad things were completely gone, a big house, precious crystals, and a magical girlfriend mech that does everything she says, all of them are available, Chinese mecha alliance, Long Jinchuan is reporting, there are 23 S-class, 8 SS-class, and 1 SSS-class who have recently joined the alliance, not bad, the publicity work is paying off, Huang Dust nodded in satisfaction, then his tone sank, what about, done, no news for now. Long Jianchuan also had a hint of helplessness. Obviously, he was a Chinese hero, but he chose to conceal his name. It was the first time he had encountered it. Report, a large batch of crystals are being sold off in the market. The number is over 1. 000. A female mechmaster came in and said in a deep voice. Huang Dust's size changed slightly. To be able to sell off a large amount of crystals at this time, it's only him. Give me the information immediately. Long Jinchuan stood up and was about to leave the office. Huang Dust instructed, Remember, don't ever piss him off. Don't worry, for the unsung heroes who help China at all times. Would I be that stupid? Long Jinchuan smiled and led his men away. Beijing, Qingcheng District, Block 16, luxuriously decorated villa with both front and backyard, green grass, the home that how many people want to work hard to get in their whole life. Su Hao bought some vegetables and prepared to play hot pot with Yi Nifa. Coming, suddenly, his smile tightened, as if he sensed something, both sides of the road, a figure walked out, one of them was Long Jinchuan, he laughed and said, done, first time meeting, but it's like thunder, at those words, the other mechs were filled with horror, he was, done, this was too young, I know the purpose of your coming, Su Hao carried a plastic bag and seemed to smile, I can give you the answer directly, 
you please speak. Long Jianchuan felt that Su Hao's eyes were strange, as if they saw through him. Su Hao looked straight at them and slowly spoke. I, for one, refused to join the Huaxia Mecca Alliance. The Mecca era was coming. If one had the Huaxia Mecca Alliance as a background, it was the same as having a life guarantee, as long as the alliance was there. Props, crystals, drawings, etc. could be exchanged at will. Therefore, when Su Hao said two words of refusal, Long Jianchuan really couldn't think of a reason. Please be sure to think about it. Long Jianchuan took a deep breath and spoke in a deep voice. No matter what you want, the Huaxia Mecca Alliance will support you unconditionally. 10,000 Rome crystals? Here you go. Flawless, perfect grade crystals? Here you go. Take whatever props you see fit. The Mets hearts thumped when they heard these words. In their place, they would have already accepted it. This could be said to be the entire alliance at one service. Among them, a female mechmaster stared at Su Hao closely. She felt that Su Hao's voice sounded familiar. He's the one who saved me. He's the Dun who shocked the world. Zhang Yao was excited inside. Su Hao carried the bag with a smiling expression. The alliance never does a losing deal. Of course, Long Jianchuan didn't show off and directly said, we hope that you can coach the mechs and pass on the knowledge and skills you know to inform them down the line. To further strengthen Huaxia, the chief commander and I have speculated that the market ripple descending may not be a heavenly gift, but a means to cope with the disaster. Hearing this, Su Hao's eyes changed slightly. It was worthy of being an alliance that could survive a great event. In these aspects, the quality of the top level was evident. Your guesses are not wrong. Su Hao nodded, but I don't have time. When I have time, I will mail some knowledge just to you guys. He knew deep down that mechs could not be used as a means to resist the gods. He himself, however, could unite machine and flesh, and was not limited by the market pattern. Therefore, being strong on one's own was the only way out. As for why he didn't cooperate with the alliance, Su Hao also had multiple aspects. One was that his heart was resistant, and the other was that he was temporarily unavailable. The heart's resistance was that before he was reborn, the alliance had indulged Linny in bullying the weak and doing nothing. However, at that time, the alliance had already existed for decades, and was internally rotten, with all sorts of collusion. Not being available for the time being wasn't a figure of speech. Now that it was pre-awakening, every minute and every second was incredibly precious. He didn't want to waste his time in the Huaxia Mecca alliance. The Mets revealed their disappointment. As the owner of, Dun, Su Hao had created countless myths. Of course they wanted to get close to such a legend. As for mouthing off, that was purely not wanting to live. Long Jianchuan also sighed inwardly, but quickly revived his spirit. Mr. Su Hao, the door of the alliance is open for you at any time. No matter what you need, you can mention it at any time, and you don't need to join the alliance. Zhang Yao and the others were dumbfounded at the words, not a member of the alliance. Yet you can access the alliance's resources at will? The only one in the world. Just call me Su Hao. Su Hao smiled. Let them go first. I'll say a few words to you. Long Jianchuan nodded repeatedly and waved his hand for Zhang Yao and the others to go and wait in the distance. Next, I will sprint the obelisk tower hell difficulty for the gain effect. When I rise to level 20 and break through the illusion of beings, the world will be in for a great catastrophe, and that will be the beginning. All you have to do is, raise the level of the mechs as soon as possible. At the same time, purchase high firepower crystals and mech drawings from Russia. The quality doesn't have to be too good. Ordinary, forbidden mechs, will do. Su Hao stood by the riverside, and every word he said caused Long Jianchuan's pupils to contract. His expression horrified. How did you know? He asked in a hurry. Su Hao naturally didn't tell the truth, and vaguely said, with more first passes, I always know some information. Long Jianchuan nodded indistinctly. The market ripple suddenly descended. Where did the market realm come from? The answer to all this naturally had to be sought from the source. The wool came from the sheep's body. Therefore, he didn't doubt Su Hao's words. I'll recommend someone to you. Su Hao suddenly said. You please tell me. Long Jianchuan humbly asked for advice. Jiang Yao. Su Hao directly said. Long Jianchuan frowned. He knew Jiang Yao. SS rank, independent crystal, good talent. But the growth rate was too slow. Moreover, Jiang Yao had to have a mech that was easily worn out. And it was time consuming and laborious to repair it. Which was really a bit of an insult to the SS rank talent. Don't give her an ordinary mech. It should at least be of excellent quality. Su Hao glanced at Jiang Yao in the distance, seemingly smiling, she definitely won't live up to your expectations. You have been in contact with her? Long Jianchuan was filled with fog. This person was too mysterious, as if he knew everything. What I should say, I've said it all. Su Hao put his hands in his pockets, turned around and left. As he left, he suddenly said, Minister Long, 
If someone comes to you for cooperation, remember to look at the top. Above, Long Jianchuan raised his head and only saw a bright moon. Shit. Mysterious. He cried and laughed a little, but still kept the words in his heart and walked slowly back to the team. Minister, what did he say? The mechs asked anxiously. Long Jianchuan waved his hand. Next he's going to sprint through the hell difficulty to gain for Huaxia. Great. The crowd was ecstatic. Long Jianchuan dropped his gaze on Zhang Yao. His expression became gentle. Xiao Yao, when you go back, you go apply for excellent quality mechs. Just say that I arranged it. Ha! Huh? Zhang Yao froze for a moment. The others were also shocked. Was this still devil instructor Long Jianchuan? How come he spoke so gently? Also, how come he wanted to train Zhang Yao? Long Jianchuan didn't explain much and said in a deep voice. Go back. Something big is going to happen next. Inside the villa. Wearing a maid outfit and humming a small song. Yi Nifa was helping Su Hao cook. Master, you seem to be very resistant to them. Yenifa asked casually while cutting potatoes. Su Hao leaned against the sofa and stared blankly at the ceiling. In the early days, there was nothing wrong with the alliance. But from the beginning of the great catastrophe, it gradually turned sour. Have you thought about changing them? Yenifa asked rhetorically. Su Hao's expression stared. This one hadn't thought about it himself. Maybe, halfway through, he shook his head no longer thinking about it anymore, and instead brought up another matter. Tomorrow, I'll break all the records of the obelisk tower, and you go brush the 10,000 fused crystals and crystals to further strengthen them. Okay, master. Yenifa pinched the corner of her skirt and slightly squatted down, saluting in a cute and playful manner. Su Hao smiled, his originally tense mood gradually relaxing. New home, new family, everything is steady to good. Russia, Su Hong launch base, one by one. The researchers stared with wide eyes, too surprised to speak. In front of them, there was a huge screen. Inside the screen, a Russian in a mech was walking on the moon. Several void cracks had actually appeared on the gray and pitted surface of the moon, and were filling it with bizarre colors. It was clearly the decaying stranger's shadow. General, decaying stranger's shadow has been discovered on the moon. The market ripple is not only affecting Blue Star, but outer space as well. The researcher picked up the phone and hurriedly informed. The roar of excitement immediately resounded on the other end of the phone. Ula, early the next morning, Su Hao woke up from his sleep. Yanafa had woken up long ago and was cooking breakfast. This picture, it was ordinary. Su Hao, however, experienced the happiness of the ordinary. After getting up, Su Hao swept the attribute panel and couldn't help but sigh inwardly. His strength had broken a thousand. This was mainly attributed to Hercules. The second skill of Hercules was called power accumulation. As long as it went through a battle, it would automatically be scored. A high rating would grant 9 points of strength. With a low rating, it would give 7 points of power. Sometimes 8 points. After Su Hao got Hercules, he went through 60 battles in the easy, normal, and hard difficulties of the obelisk tower. And every rating was full. 60 times 9 is equal to 540. A permanent increase of 540 points of strength. This made Su Hao's strength directly break a thousand. As long as you keep fighting, you can keep getting stronger. And this, is just the beginning. Su Hao gazed at himself within the mirror with a joyful smile. The more battles, the higher the value. The higher the value, the stronger the strength. This was a perfect cycle. After having breakfast, Su Hao and Yi Nifa separated. This was the benefit of the original mech soul. Mechas possessed independent consciousness, thought on their own, and were basically no different from humans. Even, they could help their masters brush materials, props, drawings, etc. Saving a lot of time. Obelisk Tower. This place is always overcrowded. Su Hao didn't make a sound either, silently lining up in the crowd. At this time, a young mech artist hurriedly came over. Great God, the minister has opened a passage for you. Please follow me. Good. Su Hao wasn't stubborn, smiling and nodding as he walked over. The said young mecha master was actually at the age of 23 or 24, a few years older than Su Hao. But at this moment, he was so excited that he didn't know what to do. This was the, done, great god, Huaxia's hot unsung hero, how could he not be excited? Great god, can you give me some pointers? I always feel that there's something wrong with the crystal match. He gathered his courage, his voice trembling a little. Su Hao glanced at him and smiled. Can't talk about guidance, just giving some suggestions. Great god is modest. My name is Zhang Bai Ren. The youngster was so excited that his hands and feet were sweating. The smile on Su Hao's face froze, turning his head to look at the youngster. Interrupting. Your name is Zhang Byron? Endure as in endure. Hundred as in thousand? Yes. Great God. The youngster nodded repeatedly. Su Hao quickly returned to normal. 
but he was secretly muttering in his heart. He vaguely remembered that Zhang Bai Ren's independent crystal was called Hundred Refined Steel. It was said that Hundred Refinement into Steel needed to be like a red hot iron block, constantly pounded and forged before it could become a material. His independent crystal is likely to be a growth type as well. Su Ha began to pay attention to Zhang Bai Ren and asked, What grade is your crystal? Zhang Bai Ren hurriedly said, Grade F, Hundred Refined Steel. There is only one effect called, I am the furnace, and the description is eight words, a blazing fire, burning my remnant body. The corner of Su Hao's mouth twitched. Why was this independent crystal still playing dumb riddles? You wait here until I come out. Su Hao didn't think too much about it, just going along with it. Good. Zhang Bai Ren nodded excitedly. He looked at Su Hao who walked into the obelisk tower, his heart surging. Old mom, you'll be able to see them soon. Zhang Byron took a deep breath and looked into the sky as a flash of hatred flashed by, inside the obelisk tower. Su Hao looked at the list with a somewhat surprised expression. Nightmare difficulty, Paul LeBlanc, United States of America, took 2 hours and 35 minutes to arrive at the 19th floor. Sun Helming, China, took 2 hours and 37 minutes to arrive at the 18th floor. Lin Lei, China, took 2 hours and 40 minutes to arrive at the 18th floor. And Swirling Mizamon, Sakura Country, took 3 hours to arrive at the 17th floor. Starting to tackle nightmare difficulty? Su Hao smiled, the corners of his mouth grinning. Then let's give you guys a little speed pass shock. His power had already broken a thousand. As long as he picked a good core crystal, he could completely sweep through. Please choose a core crystal, swordsman, cavalry, ninja core, viral witch doctor. Please choose an accessory crystal, life force, kowuru, weak electricity, sonic wave, change. Su Hao decisively changed a batch. Please select core crystals, fierce tiger fist. Electromagnetic Core, Nano Armor, Demon Hunter. Please select subsidiary crystals, Shockwave, Kawarabi, Power of Water Walking, Blazing Flame, Fierce Tiger Fist Technique plus Shockwave. Su Hao immediately made his choice. Core Crystal, Fierce Tiger Fist Technique, Level 0 slash Level 10. Quality, Excellent. Effect, 1. Fierce Tiger Fist, Inflicts 50 points of fixed damage. And at the same time, you can get a 10% bonus to the mech strength and bludgeoning rate. Increases by 10% each time you level up. 2. Tiger Step, like a tiger leaping over a stream. Jumping power is increased by 10%. Increases by 10% each time you level up. Attachment Crystal, Shockwave, level 0 of 3. Quality, excellent. Effects, 1. Diffusion, any attack is accompanied by a vibration wave that spreads out to 3 meters in the surrounding area. Level 1, 5 meters. Level 2, 10 meters. And level 3, 20 meters. With the two crystals loaded. Zero immediately produced a change. Only black tiger stripes emerged on the surface of the armor, and the tattered and old hood morphed into golden tiger fur, resembling a mechanical humanoid tiger, filled with a marvelous style collision of sci-fi future and metaphysical world. Looks pretty good. Su Hao smiled, then said in a deep voice, Challenge Nightmare Difficulty. Layer, 1. Difficulty, Nightmare. Mission, please protect your princess. She is being hunted from another country. Escort her to a safe location. Scene change. What came into Su Hao's eyes was the noisy street with killing sounds, as well as chickens and ducks clucking and quacking. My knight, may I ask what are we going to do? The princess with blonde hair and blue eyes, wearing a long pink dress, wanted to cry and grab Su Hao. Su Hao glanced at the enemy chasing behind him. Flame warrior. Attributes. Strength 250. Defense 260. Speed 210. Spirit 30. Characteristics. No simple magic. Good at sword play. Evaluation. Wherever the sword points. It is the truth. They wore red-colored armor and moved as fast as lightning, their icy eyes staring at the carriage, their hands pressing the hilt of their swords, ready to strike. Grab the rope. Su Hao handed the rope to the princess and said seriously, don't let go no matter what. After saying that, Su Hao directly smashed the roof of the carriage, and the moment he landed heavily on the ground, his two fists were like oil-filled pistons, wildly blasting into the old street. Bang, bang, bang. The iron fists landed on the ground erupting with terrifying fluctuations. As the speed of the fists became faster and faster, the range of the street shattering became bigger and bigger until houses collapsed one after another and the earth trembled crazily. Trigger blast gain. Trigger my blood boiling. Blazed armor. Explosion. Armor strengthening. The buffs stacked. Su Hao bellowed. And the moment his heavy fist smashed the ground with fury, the earth directly collapsed. The flame warriors didn't even have time to chase after the princess. One by one. They tumbled down and were directly killed alive by the shockwave. 10,000 fists in one, directly killed in seconds. As for the princess, she was still foolishly pulling the reins, looking at Su Hao with a strange glint in her eyes. Sorry, 
I don't have a beard, and I don't have the habit of going through the sewers. Su Hao returned to the princess, reread the mission requirements, and then, he raised his leg and kicked the princess directly out. Just like this, the princess, even with the carriage, fell heavily to the outside of the city with the perfect arc of a parabola. Mission accomplished. Please select an accessory crystal, fiery flame, ice cold load, half moon chop, or upgrade the crystal. Upgrade, fierce tiger fist technique. After Su Hao made his choice, he opened the next level without stopping, breaking through the tenth level. The weapon option appeared in front of Su Hao. Please choose a weapon, mad poison, explosive bitterness, serpentine sword, bronze fist gloves. Su Hao chose bronze gloves, bronze gloves, weapon type, melee, weapon type, gloves, attribute, strike rate, 30%, strike multiplier, 2, 7, total damage, 150, impact, slot crystal, none, special effect, a fist attack on the ground can produce an effect that paralyzes the enemy's legs for 0, 5 seconds, layer, 11, difficulty, nightmare, mission, find out where the mother of insects is, a world in disrepair, a building full of holes, covered with insects, some insects can stand up like a man, with forelimbs like blades, there were insects that looked like patrols flying around, holding insect structured firearms in their hands, like an army, swish, Su Hao just appeared, in an instant, all the insect warriors stared at him dead on, letting out eerie cries while pouncing, the target is the mother of the insect race, Su Hao dodged sideways with a calm expression, the place with the most bug warriors is where the mother of bugs lives, after saying that, the armor on his back split, there was a whirring sound, powerful firepower gushed out, and Su Hao's entire body rushed out, bang bang bang, the insect warriors were instantly knocked apart, there was no way they could withstand Su Hao's meat and egg onion chicken, but it was normal, with the power of 1042, who could block it, die, Su Hao looked at the continuous stream of insect warriors, raised his bronze gloves high, and blasted the ground the moment they approached, not one punch, but 10,000 punches, with the punch, the faster the speed, the faster the attack, the higher the blast, boom boom boom, thousands of insect warriors were like candles in the wind, instantly going up in smoke, after killing them, Su Hao didn't leave, but stood still, waiting for a new bug warrior to attack, with so many experience packs, he couldn't afford to waste them, the experience of a single bug warrior wasn't much, but they were strong in numbers, and once they came, they were a large group, this was winning with quantity, of course, this kind of move was only what Su Hao, a pervert, dared to do, if it was an ordinary mech artist, he would have been drowned out long ago, it didn't take long, the second wave of insect warriors came again, fist movement, all destroyed, third wave, fourth wave, fifth wave, five consecutive waves of insect warriors became Su Hao's experience value, leveling up, 1416, machine zero's entire attributes have risen significantly, life value plus 500, energy value plus 400, armor plus 400, shield plus 600, strength, defense, speed plus 100, spirit plus 90, all of zero's attributes have risen slightly, life value plus 260, energy value plus 150, armor plus 180, shield plus 210, strength plus 46, defense plus 40, speed plus 43, spirit plus 44, that should be about right, looking at the empty city, Suha clapped his palms and casually grabbed his hand into the ground, directly grabbing the mother of insects out, the mother of insects looked at Su Yun stupidly, as if saying, where is this pervert from, take a deep breath, a little pain is normal, Su Hao smiled faintly, after saying that, he blasted the head of the mother of insects with one punch, mission completed, please choose an affiliated crystal, poison water, electric shock, source capture, life force, or upgrade one crystal, upgrade, fierce tiger fist technique, after making his choice, Su Hao immediately stepped into the next level, 13th layer, 14th layer, 15th layer, 16th, 18th, layer by layer, the levels were easily crushed by Su Hao, soon, the 20th layer arrived, layer, 20, difficulty, nightmare, mission, please destroy the destroyer and his infected ones, Su Hao returned to the initial starting point, the infected land, there sat the god he was familiar with, my old friend, meeting again once more, Su Hao grinned with a self-conscious look, the destroyer stared at Su Hao with dead eyes of disgust, for some reason, I feel a trace of nausea from you, an ant, that's right, because, I'm here to kill you in seconds, Su Hao just finished speaking, powered up and instantly appeared in front of the destroyer, swoosh, the speed of the fist was as fast as the wind, as if it didn't even take time, it descended in front of the destroyer, trigger blast gain, 
Trigger my blood boiling. Trigger mecha enhancement. Trigger weapon master. Activate glazed armor. Minus 15. 0 0 0. Minus 16. 0 0 0. Minus 17. 123. Minus 24,500. Minus 30. 0 0 0. A series of yellow bludgeon numbers probed out. Before the destroyer could react, he was blown away. Unbridled. The destroyer finally couldn't hold back. He probed out two claws and directly grabbed at Suhao's chest, only to be blocked by a thick layer of glazed armor. Suhao laughed. If you can knock off my shield, count me as a loser. Burst. In the next second, the glazed armor turned into crystalline glass shards and shot out violently. Trigger black blood. Trigger needle stab Jizo. Trigger glazed armor counter injury. Suhao gathered the glazed armor again. The double anti-damage stacked. The harder the destroyer hit, the worse the counter injury became. God? Suhao raised his tiger fist high and bellowed. It's God that I'm killing. Rumble. A fist that looked like a nuclear explosion landed on the destroyer's head, instantly shattering into pieces within dozens of meters around him. Level up. 1617. All of Zero's attributes have risen slightly. Life value plus 200. Energy value plus 160. Armor plus 175. Shield plus 265. Strength. Defense. Speed plus 45. Spirit plus 50. Congratulations on being the first mech to pass the obelisk tower on nightmare difficulty. We will now change your discount. From now on, you will permanently receive a 30% discount at the void shop. Get 12. 000, 000 essence fragments. Replace them all with 10,000 roan crystals. Suhao waved his hand. Although the nightmare and hell difficulty void stores would have swiped out a lot of prop drawings and other rare items. Right now, Suhao urgently needed to strengthen himself. The 20 level cap was about to open. He had to make all preparations. Global announcement. Chinese mecha master, done, first passes the obelisk tower nightmare difficulty. The drop rate of duplicate drawings within China is increased by 15%. The world was in an uproar. A new round of shock resounded through Blue Star, especially the United States of America. They boasted of being the Blue Star's overlord, eyeing everything, but they didn't expect to be stepped on by Suhao once again. How is this possible? Powell was a black-skinned soldier. At this moment, his eyes were glaring like bronze bells, full of disbelief. Solo, it took 32 minutes. Any country, including China, would need at least 2 hours to touch the nightmare difficulty level 20. And that's just touching it, not including clearing it. On the contrary, Doke, passed the level in just half an hour? The disparity here was simply downright amazing. Hang on. This, Doke, is definitely hanging the wall. George, the leader of the U Corps, was so angry that his eyes turned red. He had stayed up for how many big nights, and now that he saw this scene, he simply couldn't accept it. Aldrich, the leader of the White Regiment, also had a headache. This was so fucked up. This was trampling on Eagle Sauce's dignity. Powell stared at the name, Dunn, his voice carrying a grim, Can, you assassinate this, Dunn? These words made Aldrich and George's pupils quake. They looked at each other with a heartfelt look. I'll try to contact them. Aldrich nodded. He was glad that he had planted two pawns in China early. Do, 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 do. The phone was never able to connect. Aldrich's face slowly turned gloomy. In the end, his entire face was as black as a pig's liver, and the corners of his mouth were twitching madly. Aldrich and George's faces also sank. James Harkin and Tim Jack. One was S rank and the other was SS rank. Mets of this level must have been mixing it up in China. How did they suddenly lose contact now? One should know that they went to the capital, not cheap city. It shouldn't be. Mobilize international public opinion. Our people are missing in China. Let them give an explanation. Otherwise, compensation must be made. We want to speed through the obelisk tower nightmare difficulty raid. The lives of the Wu Tuan are lives too. George walked back and forth, gritting his teeth in anger. Aldrich took a few deep breaths. Get Sakura Nation and Silla Nation to help out together, and use public opinion to attack Huaxia. This day, the international community strongly condemned Huaxia. It was obvious that the whole of humanity could progress together. So why did they have to hide the Speed Pass Obelisk Tower Raider? At the same time, two important talents of the United States of America disappeared for no reason and must be compensated. The Silla Nation directly said that Huaxia was engaging in monopolization and demanded international arbitration. Huaxia Mecha Alliance Huang Dust just ruffled his ears when he heard the news. Compensation is required for disappearance? He snorted as he listened to his subordinate's report. I'll compensate your mom's stinking high. Cough. Long Jianchuan hurriedly coughed. The commander-in-chief should pay attention to his personal qualities. Isn't it just jealous that we, Hua Xia, have a brush gain? Huang Dust was still outputting. Old Long, 
Tell Su Hao that the alliance will give him whatever he wants, and break the fucking hell difficulty. Fucking United States of America, it's a new era now. If you're not happy, go to war. He continued his violent output. Long Jianchuan laughed bitterly, calm down, don't make everyone's blood boil. Chief Commander, the priority is to upgrade, don't waste a great time because of them. Sun Haoming couldn't help but persuade, because of the gain effect brought by Su Hao. In the same amount of time, Huaxia could be far ahead of other countries. The score, for sure, had to be counted. But to count it now, it would be too much of a loss. Huang Dust also knew this. After he finished venting, he picked up a teacup and drank some water. Su Hao said that there is going to be a great disaster when the level 20 cap opens. You guys go and pacify the army first, and after the game time, we'll settle the scores one by one. Yes. Long Jianchuan immediately nodded his head. Chief Commander. Minister Long, is it true what, done, great god said. Sun Haoming swallowed his tone. He wasn't doubting Su Hao. He was just a bit skeptical. I believe him. Huang Dus looked straight at Sun Haoming, his tone unquestionable. Time and time again. He brought gains to Huaxia, time and time again. He didn't ask for returns. He, why was he skeptical? Huang Dus stood up and looked at the base with a deep gaze. Other countries believe in the divine right of kings, but only our Huaxia. Since ancient times, it has been rumored that man can win over the heavens, whether it's a gift or a disaster. As long as we have enough strength, we can defend our homeland. Long Jianchuan and Sun Haoming looked at each other, then nodded heavily. Yes, Commander-in-Chief. At this moment, the Huaxia Mecha Alliance was united as one, with only one goal in mind. To escalate with full force, Su Hao came out from the obelisk tower. And the first thing he saw was Zhang Biren, as well as Long Jianchuan standing next to him. He asked, something happened? The United States of America has launched an international condemnation. Long Jianchuan's eyes were a bit gloomy. The commander-in-chief said that Huaxia will fully support you and break through hell difficulty as soon as possible. Hell difficulty is not difficult. Any time. Su Hao shrugged. Zhang Banren's blood boiled as he listened. Speed through hell difficulty? Who in the world today dared to make such a wild statement? Only, done. No one doubted it. Seeing that Long Jianchuan's expression was a bit complicated, Su Hao shook his head and smiled. If you guys want to help, help me find the Salary King Fire Seed. Long Jianchuan's eyes immediately had a light, and he nodded repeatedly. Okay, as long as we find it, we will immediately send it to you. By the way, you can take this first. After saying that, he took out a sheet of gray crystals. Homemade crystal, Su Hao was surprised. Long Jianchuan's heart shook. How did he know that? but he quickly collected his emotions. Yes, this is called, 10,000 words translation, a crystal independently developed by Hua Xia. Su Hao held the, 10,000 words translation. His mind retraced his memories and suddenly thought of a person. That person was called Chu Feng, possessing a SS grade independent crystal, smart brain, specializing in researching crystals at the back of the alliance, pioneering mecha reinforcement routes, and other work. He was also one of the main helpers that allowed the Chinese mecha alliance to remain undefeated stabilizing the fundamentals 10000 words translation quality none effect can quickly translate the language heard into chinese and then translate the language spoken and pass it on to others thanks su hao directly loaded it long jianchuan hurriedly said you're welcome this is all what we should do su hao smiled then looked at jiang biren who immediately tensed his whole body full of stiffness not daring to breathe a single breath summon your mecha out su hao directly said Zhang Byron immediately grasped the market pattern and summoned a silver light-colored mech. The style of his mech was very much like Iron Man, with a streamlined body that looked like flesh and blood, but was actually metal, emitting a faint metallic luster. Other than that, there was nothing special. Long Jinchuan's eyes lit up. Was this helping to dig up talent for Hua Xia? Hold back, Su Hao said, then opened his palm, and ferocious flames shot out like a shocking wave. The red flames covered. Zhang Byron was enveloped in it. One second. Zhang Byron's mech became crimson, and it was as if he was going to be roasted, but he gritted his teeth to endure it without making a single sound. Long Jinchuan was taken aback, but, he did not make a sound. Like Huang Dust, he trusted Su Hao unconditionally. Dash 10 dash 10 dash 10, dash 9 dash 9 dash 9, dash 8 dash 8 dash 8, dash 7 dash 7 dash 7. The damage endured by Zhang Bai was slowly decreasing. This indicated a resistance. The corner of Su Hao's mouth lifted up. I guessed right. After saying that, Su Hao retracted his palm and threw a life restorer towards Zhang Byron. Swish, the red bottle landed and spread. A scarlet mist enveloped Zhang Byron and began to restore his life value. Look at the level, Su Hao said. Zhang Byron froze for a moment. 
He looked down and then trembled with excitement. Great E. Long Jianchuan was a bit puzzled. Was Great E worth being so happy? Which play is this? Take him back and subject him to flame baking every day. Then match him with a pure armor plus pure life value crystal set. Su Hao patted Long Jianchuan's shoulder. In the future, he'll be the alliance's great wall, the kind that won't fall. Also, his independent crystals can grow infinitely. After saying that, Su Hao revealed a meaningful smile and lifted his step to step into the obelisk tower. As for why he used fire, the reason was simple. A blazing fire, burning my remnants. It can be understood literally. As for whether he will be burned to death, that belongs to the aftermath. Long Jianchuan watched Su Hao disappearing in front of his eyes, not moving for a while before he came back to his senses, his voice dry. That means the alliance is going to have another SSS class? After saying that, Long Jianchuan twisted his head to look at the unimpressive Zhang Byron, and the more he looked at him, the more he looked at him, the more he liked him. In the end, he, who was usually unsmiling and known as the devil instructor, grinned at Zhang Byron and said in a warm voice, where does the young man live? Does he have a girlfriend? Layer 1. Difficulty, Hell. Quest, please survive 5 waves of monsters. Core Crystal, Blade Runner, level 0 slash level 3. Quality, excellent. Effects. 1. Bastard Blade, a blade that builds up power and deals 100% damage, which can be complemented by the power of the mech. Level 1, 150%. Level 2, 200%. Level 3, 250%. 2. Blade Shield, if you kill an enemy, you can extract a shield from the corpse that is 15% of the enemy's life value. Level 1, 30%. Level 2, 45%. Level 3, 60%. Attachment Crystal, Kawaru, Level 0. At this moment, Zero was wearing a straw hat on his head and a battle sword brought by the Blue Blade Runner, Core Crystal on his waist. Even though it didn't have any special bonuses, it was enough. To a blade of grass, a grain of sand and dust. In Su Hao's hands it could turn into a peerless weapon. Roar. The beast's cry was like thunder. Echoing out. The monster that came running in front of them looked like it was wrapped in metal. Succeeding the maddened rhinoceros. As if it wanted to destroy everything in front of it. Iron Rhino. Attributes. Strength 350. Defense 400. Speed 200. Spirit 50. Characteristics. Thick skin. Thick flesh. Weakness. Asshole. Evaluation. Oi. I'm traveling to the other world in a rhino chariot here. So crash it, naughty. The values of the monsters on hell difficulty are simply too scary. It's higher than the fucking infected land destroyer. Su Hao didn't say anything. His tattered and old cloak danced slightly, and his hand fell on the hilt of his sword. Just like a nameless swordsman walking in the world. Bastard blade. The zero was in front of the steel rhinoceros herd as if it was the difference between a baby and an adult. But in the next moment, the blade light cut out horizontally like a sparkling galaxy. PFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFFF
With a lift of his hand, silver lightning stormed out like a giant dragon. Boom! The lightning was instantly split apart, and the force from the feedback shook the Sky City Lord's torso, and a minus 5,000 damage number floated above his head. All of you so-called gods are in such a hurry? Su Hao snorted. Core Crystal, Blade Runner, Level 3. Subsidiary Crystal, Chuan Lu, Level 5. Dark Force, Level 5. Blade Drawing, Level 3. Landing Roots, Level 5. Weapon, Embroidered Spring Blade, Sky City Lord. Attributes, Strength 450. Defense 530. Speed 500. Spirit 500. Characteristics, Control of Lightning. Weakness, Weak Corrosion. Evaluation, I should have known better than to save Celia. And, damn it, Kyrie. Attributes are really high, Su Hao secretly said. With this attribute, no one in contemporary times could definitely break into this place except for him. The Sky City Lord's crystal-like eyes revealed some surprise, airs a bit of something. But that's about it. Killing you is enough. Su Hao spoke coldly, his palm gripping the hilt of the embroidered spring sword. Buzz. In an instant, the space was vibrating slightly as if all the elements were absorbed into the blade. Feeling the crisis, the Sky City Lord pointed to the sky and said indifferently, accept the judgment of thunder. Rumble. Angry thunder exploded the sky, turning into a rain of thunder and lightning that poured down, splitting towards Su Hao below. This moment destroyed the sky and the earth. However, the more fiercely the thunder struck, the more numbers floated up above the Sky City Lord's head. Glazed armor plus needle stabbing Jizo. Trigger abnormal condition antibody. Su Hao didn't care about the shattered shield, nor did he care about the flowing life value. The moment he raised his eyes was the instant of death. I'm bleeding? Wounds appeared on the Sky City Lord's cheeks, constantly dripping blood, looking shocked. I, the god of the sky, am actually bleeding? Triggering the bleeding effect of the glazed armor, continuously deducting blood. Clang! The sound of the sword was like a dragon's roar. Su Hao slightly drew out his embroidered spring sword, but it contained darkness inside and raised his eyes to look at the Sky City Lord, draw the sword and destroy the enemy. Boom! The black blade light decimated the colors of the sky, and only darkness descended, drowning the Sky City Lord. Level up! 1719. Machine Zero's overall attributes have been increased by plus 250 life, plus 180 energy, plus 170 armor, plus 200 shield, plus 50 strength, plus 50 defense, plus 50 speed, plus 50 spirit. Machine Zero's overall attributes are small. Life plus 300. Energy plus 150. Armor plus 200. Shield plus 260. Strength. Defense. Speed. Spirit plus 60. Congratulations on becoming the first mech to pass the Obelisk Tower's hell difficulty. From now on, you'll receive a 50% discount in the Obelisk Tower. Permanently. As the first mech to pass all difficulties, you are hereby rewarded with casting acceleration roll asterisk 5. Salary King Spark asterisk 1. Primal Machine Soul Asterisk 1. You have secured several gains for Huashia. Accumulated Essence Fragments 25. 000. The gain is doubled to 50. 000 in real terms. Giving Primordial Machine Soul again. Su Hao is shocked. And the Salary King Fire Seed. Primordial Machine Souls. Such rare props that could be encountered but not sought. In his memory, there were no more than 10 of them worldwide. And by himself, he had already monopolized two of them. Build another Magic Girlfriend mech? Su Hao snuffed out the thought just as it surfaced. The waste was important. The great cause of upgrading was important. It's better to build a powerful mech to further enhance the battle power. As for the 50, 000 essence fragments. Let's first see what good things the void shop and hell difficulty has. While thinking, Su Hao looked towards the void store. At the same time, the outside world had gone completely crazy. Global announcement. Chinese mecha master, done, past the obelisk tower hell difficulty. He is also the first person to pass the five major difficulties, so China will receive the following gains. 1. All Chinese mechs will receive plus 30% of all attributes. 2. All resource drop rate plus 20% for duplicates in China. 3. Plus 10% of the experience value gained in Huaxia. 4. The casting time of the Huaxia casting warehouse is shortened by 50%. When the news came out, it shook the world. The Huaxia Mecha Alliance was even more appalled. Long Jianchuan swallowed his saliva the corners of his mouth harder to suppress than AK. He didn't expect that Su Hao's words about speedy passes really did it. Four types of gain. Huang Dust was ecstatic, worthy of being the number one mecha god of war in China. Sun Haoming, Zhang Yao, and Zhang Bainu were also shocked after learning the news. Afterward, each of them was as exuberant as if they were pumped with chicken blood, with a great god in front of them to open up the frontier for them. They couldn't drag their feet. Commander-in-Chief, 
Russia is requesting to contact us. At this time, someone came to report. Juan Dust nodded. Connect. A stereoscopic image surfaced in the mech's palm, and a group of people, the Russians, emerged. Soon, the two sides engaged in discussions. Eventually, cooperation was reached. Russia is willing to send us high firepower crystals, and we agree for them to enter Huaxia to upgrade. Juan Dust smiled broadly. Originally, he was ready to exchange crystals or buy them with other props, but Suhao's first pass gave Huaxia the backbone to directly whore out Russian crystals for nothing. By the way, Russia wants to share with us the highest intelligence on the moon. Juan Dust's tone suddenly sank. The other's hearts shook slightly. Is something wrong with the moon as well? Long Jianchuan had to sigh. Russia is really obsessed with off-earth. Bring the resources and go to the obelisk tower to wait for, done. Juan Dust didn't say any more. Changing the topic and urging. As long as he sees fit, give it all. Long Jianchuan nodded and immediately complied. There were more and more countries that were dissatisfied with Huaxia such as the United States of America, the Cherry Blossom Nation, and the Scylla Nation. Especially the global announcement of the first pass on hell difficulty made them even more indignant, gee, angry, do. They don't put us in their eyes at all. Did you see the news? Russia has cooperated with Huaxia. Shameless. Simply shameless. They want to take this opportunity to surpass our number one power. The United States of America? Goodness gracious. The White Regiment and the Upright Regiment were infuriated. Aldrich was even so angry that he pounded the table. Then let them know the wrath of the world's number one power. Suha wasn't clear about how the outside world was doing. He was still browsing through the void shop on hell difficulty. Void store, hell. Attachment crystal, calling the wind, epic, asterisk 90, 000, zero, zero essence fragments, clear sky, perfect, asterisk 50, 000, zero, zero, heavenly army descent, epic, asterisk 180, 000, zero, zero essence fragments, core crystals, void assassin, epic, asterisk 100, 000, zero, zero essence fragments, planet devouring behemoth, asterisk 150, 000, zero, zero essence fragments, heavenly dragon, asterisk 200, 000, zero, zero essence fragments, Props, Ancient Howler Asterisk 5000 Essence Shards, Summoner, Group Healing Potion Asterisk 5000 Essence Shards, Restore Life Steal, Mother Slayer Blade Drawing Asterisk 50000 Essence Shards, Ice Father Blade Drawing Asterisk 50000 Essence Shards, Materials, Market Coin Pack Asterisk 10, 000, 000 Essence Fragments, Can Randomly Open 1, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000 to 10, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000 Market Coins, One Lone Crystals Pack Asterisk 10, 000 essence fragments can randomly open 10 000 to 50 000 one rune crystals heart of destruction and hell dispensers firearms materials suha wasn't the least bit surprised by the essence shard prices of these things it was just that these things didn't do much for him epic crystals were tempting however suha didn't have that many salary king's fire seeds to upgrade them this made it seem like a chicken rib as for who these epic crystals would fall into he didn't care Epic crystals were not infinitely redeemable. If anyone went through all the trouble and labor of squandering an entire country in exchange for an epic crystal, that was purely foolish behavior. Market coin pack for 4. 10,000 fusion crystals pack for 6. Suhao spent all 50. 000, 000 essence fragments. Open the market coin pack and obtain 10 million market coins. Open market coin pack. Get 10 million market coins. Open marketplace coin pack. Get 8 million marketplace coins. Open the pack of coins and get 9 million coins. Open one room crystal stone pack and get one room crystal stone asterisk 50. 000. zero, zero. Suha was very lucky. The 10,000 room crystals pack open 300. Zero, zero, zero tons. The market coin pack opened nearly 40 million. Enough crystals to upgrade a part of it. He smiled faintly and left the obelisk tower satisfied. Outside the obelisk tower, there were countless mechs coming in and out. And Suha was one of them. As soon as he came out, Long Jianchuan greeted him. Why are you looking for me if you're not going to upgrade? Su Hao wondered. Didn't I get you guys a bunch of gains? Long Jianchuan smiled dryly. Wanted to ask to see what you need? Salary King Fire Seed. Do you have it? Su Hao reached out. Long Jianchuan was even more embarrassed. No, but I brought you 200. 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000 fusion crystal stones. Okay, I'll take it. Su Hao collected it very decisively. If people sent it to the door, wouldn't it be a fool not to want it? Seeing Su Hao accepting it, Long Jianchuan was in a much more comfortable mood and asked in a low voice, What are your next arrangements? Brush the obelisk tower to level 20? Su Hao looked at the attribute panel. Over a thousand strength was currently okay. Defense and speed were about to break a thousand. The only thing that was low was spirit. This was his current shortcoming. 
Is there a new, decaying stranger shadow, recently? Su Hao asked. Long Jianchuan immediately replied. Yes, there is a, general's mansion, that appeared on the east side of the capital. There is a, peach party, in the warehouse of Parkway Supermarket. And there is a new, group challenge, in Wangfujing. Good. Su Hao had a goal for, grouping challenge. And sent a message to Yin Nifa, let's meet in Wangfujing. Okay, master, Omega. Yan Afa quickly replied. There was an accessory crystal that Su Hao wanted in, grouping challenge. Which was just right for strengthening the spirit. Attachment crystal, soul grinding technique, level 0 slash level 3. Quality, flawless. Effect, increase spirit by 30%. Level 1, 40%. Level 2, 50%. Level 3, 75%. Description, young warrior. Want to try the bizarre ascension of metaphysics plus mecha? The crystal effect is simple and crude. The drop rate is low though. Only 5%. But with the gain, it shouldn't be difficult. Great god. Go for it. Long Jianchuan looked at Su Hao's lonely back and couldn't help shouting. Su Hao didn't turn around and waved his hand. Hurry up and upgrade. I'll challenge, illusion of beings, directly after I reach level 20. Looking at the distant back, Long Jianchuan's mood was heavy. How suffocating it must be to have the security of an entire nation, country, and even the globe pressed on one person. Do your best. Long Jianchuan's gaze grew heavy. No, it's do your best. The first week of the obelisk tower ended. As long as they were on the list, the country would gain. Of course, other countries were far from being as crazy as Hua Xia. To put it bluntly, it was also that Hua Xia was strict with the green book. You switch to the beautiful great lighthouse. It is estimated that the walls are now torn down. And you can't wait to ruthlessly increase a batch of colonizers. Ahem. Far from it. Wang Fujing. Bustling streets. Noisy crowds. Su Hao smoothly met up with Yenifa. Yenifa brushed the map by herself and had already leveled up to level 18. And the loaded crystals were also upgraded together. Which could be considered as very hassle-free. What a beautiful mech. Could this be a fake? It's just like the model. No way. It's the mech. I wonder what kind of drawings it is. Yenifa's face and body were simply too hot. Coupled with the fact that she was wearing a maid outfit. She instantly caused countless people to crowd around. Su Hao ignored the passersby's comments. And took Yenifa to sit down at the open air cafe. Preparing to upgrade a wave of crystals before entering the group challenge. Master. Yenifa held her chin and spoke with a smile. You said. Are we a pair? Yes. Su Hao replied flatly. Yenifa's cheeks blushed and she smiled even more happily. Whoa ga ga. Is it so simple to please your boyfriend as the internet says? Oh, 108 poses that make your boyfriend inseparable? Look. She pulled out her cell phone and secretly poked and studied. Su Hao shook his head and smiled bitterly, but didn't stop it. Don't get me wrong. He had always believed that knowledge was the only way to change one's fate. Yi Nifa likes to study. That's a good thing. One should unconditionally support it. N. Whether it's mentally or physically, one will support it fiercely. Between thoughts, Su Hao called up the attribute panel and prepared to strengthen it. Whether or not to strengthen, son of the sun. Choose yes, to strengthen to level 2. Loss of 10,000 Rome crystal stone asterisk 2 million. Market coin asterisk 5 million. Salary king fire seat asterisk 1. Whether to strengthen, blasphemy. Choose yes, strengthen to level 4. Loss of man young crystal asterisk 88,000. Ruin coin asterisk 2800000. Whether to strengthen, battle frenzy. Choose yes, strengthen to level 3. The loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 15,000. Market coins asterisk 1 million. Whether to strengthen. 4. Hercules. Choose yes. To strengthen to level 3. The loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 40. 000. Market coins asterisk 1. 500. 000. Whether to strengthen, overclocking. Choose yes. Strengthen to level 4. The loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 30,000. Market coins asterisk 2 million. Whether to strengthen the suffocating wormhole. Choose yes. To strengthen to level 4. The loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 75,000. Market coins asterisk 2500000. Whether to strengthen the rat king. Choose yes. Strengthen to level 3. The loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 15,000. Market coins asterisk 1 million. Whether to strengthen the broken armor. Choose yes. Strengthen to level 5. Loss of one Rome crystal stone asterisk 80. 000. Market coin asterisk 2. 000. 000. 000. 000. A series of data spikes made Su Hao very satisfied. This time, the 200, 0001 fusion crystal stone sent by the alliance was a relief. Otherwise, the upgrade really wasn't that smooth. Let's see if, group challenge, has any good mech drawings, and send them some when the time comes. Su Hao had an arrangement in his heart. 
he would remember when others treated him well. The opposite was also true. Suha walked all the way and explained everything with his actions, rested for a while. Afterwards, the two of them left the cafe and entered the heat group challenge. Location, Kuniing Challenge. Level, 2. Difficulty, Hell. Mission, please win the top spot in the challenge, as well as suppress the group. Description, this is a corner of the Xian Ming continent, and it's even time for the annual sect fight. Lone wolves are allowed to participate in the challenge, but the success rate is extremely, extremely low. However, the sects here are not willing to see a lone wolf take the top spot, and it seems like they would be furious. Wow, Su Hao and Yi Naifa landed firmly on the ground. What hit them was the stifling heat and clamor. This place was like the metaphysical world of web novels, ancient, simple, and at the same time so savage and direct. Every cultivator wore strange attire, highlighting their different origins. Brother, what kind of armor is this, can you let me have a look? Su Hao and Yi Naifa naturally became the object of others' observation, and immediately someone asked with a smile. Su Hao's heart moved and said with a smile, All right, come to the grove, I'll show you a big treasure. Yenifa covered her mouth and snickered on the side. The two entered the grove. There was a clanking and banging, and then calmness returned. When they came out, Su Hao and Yi Nifa were both draped in long black robes, covering their faces with hoods. True black robe. Su Hao laughed, slandering in his heart. Yi Nifa immediately picked up, killing and setting fire. Essential for home. It had to be said that one person and one armor had a tacit understanding. Even the bad taste matched perfectly. At this time, the powerhouses of the major sects gathered. The annual group challenge is about to begin. The eventual winners will receive prizes jointly funded by our major sects. I hope all of you will participate enthusiastically. The path of martial arts lies in not advancing and being courageous. A middle-aged man stood out, dressed in purple robes, his voice like a bell. Since this is the case, then let me grab the first prize. A long whistle rang out. The crowd only felt their ears roar, like thunder flying by. Looking at the ring again, a stout man stood. He removed his robes from his body and hung them around his waist, revealing a bronze-colored muscular body, with lightning still tumbling and surging on his body surface. It was clearly a physical cultivator. Heavenly Thunder Sex Lei Hong. It is said that he killed a second-ranked ferocious beast with his physical body. It's truly terrifying. Physical cultivators, they specialize in wheel-to-wheel -wheel combat, and they don't strike lightly. The casual cultivators exchanged words. Lei Hong sneered and looked around. What? No one is coming up? As soon as the words fell, a figure clad in black robes landed on the ring and let out a low laugh. Can you kill someone? Where did the fool come from? The crowd roared with laughter. Lei Hong snorted. Fists and feet in the ring have no eyes. Killing deserves it. That's what you said. The black-robed man raised his head. And what was reflected in Lei Hong's pupils was a scarlet beam of light. Pust. The scarlet beam of light was fleeting. In the next moment, Lei Hong's head was silently penetrated. A hot gas rolled up and the brain was instantly roasted. This scene was comical, but everyone was silent and filled with horror. Killed in seconds, the jaws of the great sex, as well as the loose cultivators, were staggered. They looked at Lei Hong, who fell to the ground with a loud crash, and were slow to make a sound. But soon, the heavenly thunder sex patriarch stood up with a face full of iron, his gaze cold as he looked down at Su Hao. I don't mind if you guys go together. Su Hao smiled faintly. However, you guys have to be prepared to be killed by me. Where did this strong person appear from? Did you guys see how he struck just now? It seemed like a ray of light. It was too fast. The scattered people collected their shocked emotions and kept talking. Su Hao looked at the senior members of the major sex and provoked. If no one else makes a debut, then I'm the winner. Take out the prizes. Too arrogant. Whoever kills him, my heavenly thunder sect is willing to let him or her view the secret book. This son must die. Otherwise where will we put our faces? The sect executive's gazes became even more sinister. Where did that bastard come from and dare to act recklessly here? Suddenly, a violent shout rang out from the crowd. Along with it, there was a sharp sword chi, vast and powerful, blasting towards Su Hao. However, Su Hao stood motionless in the ring, letting the sword chi blast on top of the zero shell. Rumble, tremor fluctuations filled the air. The person who made the shot was spitting blood from his mouth, and fell to the ground with eyes full of disbelief. Obviously, I was the one who made the move, but I was injured myself instead? Inner Disciple. Attributes, Strength 200. Defense 300. Speed 350. Spirit 300. Characteristics, Sword Cultivator. All sword type weapons can exert great power in his hands. Weakness, Flesh. Weak Corrosion. Weak Poison Gas. Evaluation, Little Karami. An NPC that doesn't even deserve a name. Su Hao Sked. As his words fell, his figure flashed, 
resembling a thunderbolt cutting through the sky. In the eyes of countless casual cultivators, Suhao's figure could not be seen at all. There was only a silver-colored lightning streaking out. Puff, a muffled sound came out. That inner disciple's head exploded in response, looking at Suhao again. He stood still and didn't move, as if he had never made a move. Only the warm blood staining his arm silently told of the bloody killing just now. I don't have time to dilly-dally with you guys, Su Hao said indifferently. Go together. Don't waste time. Big words. You're simply looking for death. The patriarch of the heavenly thunder sect pointed at Su Hao and rose indignantly. He was just about to make a move. The next moment, snowflakes kept falling from the sky, and the temperature plummeted. Yi Nifa was like a fairy from the nine heavens falling into the mortal world. Her slender jade hand pinched towards the void, gently holding a splendid staff. Blizzard. Ice creation. The cold wind pierced the bones, and the snowflakes danced wildly. A sharp ice prism coalesced out, like ten thousand arrows firing in all directions. Poof poof poof. All the cultivators were pierced through by the ice prongs and wailed. They wanted to escape. They wanted to dodge. Nay, in the realm of the blizzard, their speed plummeted, and their actions were comparable to that of a snail. There's actually a demoness. Someone couldn't help but roar angrily. At those words, Yennefa's beautiful face turned cold. She waved her hand violently, and two ice walls instantly coalesced, one on the left and one on the right, crushing dozens of casual cultivators into meat paste on the spot. She was absolutely beautiful, she was gentle, and she was loyal and faithful to Su Hao, never betraying, but when it came to her enemies, she was cold and merciless, never soft, do it all, kill, kill them. The group of sovereigns glared angrily and launched a general attack at the same time. In a flash, sword chi, blade light, Astral Chi, Elemental and other attacks surged towards Su Hao as if they were endless. Wouldn't it have been less trouble if I had done it earlier? Su Hao made a slanderous remark. A layer of colorful and gorgeous crystal armor surfaced on his body, along with a layer of white hairs, like silver needles, absorbing all the attacks in and feeding back out. Trigger glazed armor. Trigger needle stabbing Jizo. Counter injury. In an instant, several sovereign powerhouses spurted blood furiously. They were filled with horror completely unaware of why they were injured. Looking at Su Hao again, he transformed into a blood-soaked golden shura, clasping one person's head with one hand, and the instant of collision, thick blood mist sprayed out, coloring the void with a hideous, scarlet red, fire escape, rolling red flames gushed out from his palm, slowly condensing into a fireball with a diameter of a hundred meters, like a second sun in the sky, reflecting vividly on the terrified faces of all the cultivators present. Destroy it. Su Hao gently snapped his fingers. At that moment, the giant fireball landed on the ground. Berserk flames swept out, and those sovereign powerhouses didn't even have the qualification to resist, and were instantly incinerated and killed. The trees were burning, a sea of fire. Flying snow rustled down, pale and powerless. The lament of ice and fire was being staged. When the last wail ended, only Su Hao and Yi Naifa were still standing in the same place. On the ground, there were only corpses. It was a hell of killing Shura. Desecration. Su Hao's mind moved and started to harvest. Drop 10,000 Rome crystals asterisk 893. Thunder body asterisk 2. Storm thunder finger asterisk 3. Alchemy asterisk 1. Yuan recovery pill asterisk 25. Blood concentration pill asterisk 30. Dropped 1 Rome crystal stone asterisk 549. Market coin asterisk 25333. Soul grinding technique asterisk 3. Dragon snake sword drawing asterisk 2. Body cultivators chi source asterisk 11. Sword Cultivators Sword Guts Asterisk 15 Drop Market Coin Asterisk 39 999 Underworld Technique Asterisk 1 Green Ox Fist Technique Asterisk 2 Nason Sword Drawing Asterisk 1 Drop Demon Spirit Triple Change Asterisk 1 Su Hao looked at the series of drops. The Soul Grinding Technique even exploded three of them. Luck was really good. But what surprised him the most was the Demon Spirit Triple Change, which was actually touched out by Desecration. Attachment Crystal, Demon Spirit Triple Transformation, Level 0 Slash Level 3. Quality, Perfect. Effects. 1. Underworld Inflammation, the flames released by the mech can cause sustained blood loss of 100 solid wounds, with a loss of 50 energy value, lasting 30 seconds. Level 1, 200 solid wounds. Level 2, 300 solid wounds. Level 3, 500 solid wounds. 2. Underworld, Devour the Underworld Flame. Transform into a Butcher from the Demon Realm. Loss of 1000 energy value. Enhancement of all attributes by 20%. Level 1, 30%. Level 2, 40%. Level 3, 50%. 3. Pupil of Death. When Stygian Inferno and Cyanization are activated, 
your pupils possess a 0.1% probability of killing the enemy instantly. This effect is null and void for creatures 10 levels beyond your own instant death type skill. Su Hao's eyes lit up slightly, but then, a bitter smile surfaced on his face. 0.1% probability, too low. Moreover, there was a level restriction. If, pupil of death, can ignore the level, it's at least epic quality. Su Hao smiled and pocketed it. Level up. 1920. Zero's entire attributes rise dramatically. Life value plus 500. Energy value plus 500. Armor plus 500. Shield plus 1000. Strength. Defense. Speed. Spirit plus 100. Level 20. The soul grinding technique was also available. Su Hao's purpose of this trip had been achieved. It was complete. Go. He was about to tell Yenifa to leave. Just at this moment, directly in front of the field of vision, a line of crooked fonts surfaced. It read, Civilization collapsed. All worlds fell. Please break through the level cap as soon as possible. A sudden paragraph caused Su Hao's eyes to freeze. None of the decaying stranger's shadow that he had challenged before had a similar text surface. Today, after Su Hao upgraded to level 20, it unexpectedly appeared. Was it because of the eastern copy? Or was it the reason for the upgrade? There was no hint when I upgraded to level 10 either. Su Hao's eyes flashed brightly. It's not because of the sake of the upgrades, but the game of gods has changed. He had seen the eastern group of immortals and the western 10,000 gods fighting against the old gods, but that too had been a blue star stranger, and there was no chance of redemption. Su Hao observed this passage, and the inner fog was quietly dispersing. Since it's a game, there are rules in order. Just like raising a pet and watching it grow in order to have positive feedback, the faster we break through the ceiling, the more power the gods of the blue star to which we belong will have to defend against the old gods, he guessed in his mind. But soon, Su Hao had a new worry. Would the eastern group of immortals just really be united against each other? Infighting was a delicious dish that had to be eaten. Don't think so much for now. At the very least, right now, the eastern group immortals and the western 10,000 gods are grasshoppers tied to a rope. Su Hao shelved his thoughts in his mind and looked at Yenifa. Let's go. Yes, master. Being out of the decaying demonic shadow. Huasha Mecha Alliance. Two large, thick hands held each other, as if connecting to each other's contract. Thank you very much for your willingness to let us enter Huaxia. A Russian-faced man revealed a smile. Juan Dust nodded. The only way to survive in this chaotic world is to join forces. It wasn't long ago just now that an agreement was reached between Huaxia and Russia. Russia was willing to provide high firepower crystals, drawings, and other items as a qualification to enter the territory of Huaxia. Today, the entirety of Huaxia was the meat and potatoes of Blue Star. Materials doubled. Experience doubled. And other buff additions. Who wouldn't want to come in? Right now, only our country and Huaxia are committed to carrying out the off-planet world. Alexander Blue Pupil is all serious. Human cannot stick to a star place. Should ride the universe star river. Nowadays, we don't know enough about the market realm and the market ripple. Huang Dust did not catch the sentence, but instead said, rashly throwing down the blue star to cling to the outer planets. Easy to pick up sesame seeds and lose watermelons. What sesame and watermelon? I'm talking about the universe. Alexander frowned. Huang Dust smiled and waved his hand. Foreigners didn't understand Chinese proverbs. Sending the Russians away. The deal between the two sides would also be concluded immediately within a day. Soon, Long Jianchuan entered with the plans. Do we really have to do this? His voice was low. We are now an open group. And the Mets of clans and the like are free to form. And can still be held. If you issue a proclamation of city, county, and village mecha freedom, it will be very dangerous. And could easily turn into a warlord melee. The market realm had descended and shattered Blue Star's peace and development. If it was not regulated and controlled, it would only become more and more chaotic. Huang Dust stood up and pointed at the map on the wall. If our country is strong, it can naturally deter the curmudgeons. Special times require special policies, with special treatment. The reason for opening up the rights and interests of the nation to freely form mechs is to ensure domestic security. Nowadays, the technology is not yet mature. We can't rescue the whole country in the first place. The only way to open it up is to let them have the time to resist to support the arrival of us. Long Jianchuan looked at Huang Dust's back. There was worry and urgency in his eyes, but after closing them slightly, when he opened them, they were already firm in color. Yes, old Zhang used his blank history, independent crystal to project that something might be about to happen in the near future. Huang Dust stared intently at the map, combined with Di Shun Su's warning. We must make a decision as soon as possible. Understood. Long Jianchuan was clear and immediately had Chief Commander Huang Dust sign off on it, informing the entire country at the fastest speed possible. Yang Chang, as a city near the sea in China, 
It was at this moment, but it was also filled with mechs, as if there was invisible smoke filling the air. Where's the Vulcan? Mayor, 24 hours of production time. Where's the Thunder Wall? Mayor, we only have three acceleration rolls in our library. Do we really need to use them? Poverty of thought is the worst. As long as it exists, we'll be able to keep getting it. Use it. Dark clouds pressed down. The distant sky rumbled like a dark giant wave surging towards the city. Countless mechs in the sky stared. The policy of the Huaxia Mecha Alliance was immediately implemented. Gaishi County. Freshly awakened mechs can come and receive the accessory crystals. Free of charge. No one is allowed to use your weapons on your own people. Especially the elderly and children. Suppress them if found. A county level city. After receiving the help of the policy. Began to form a local mecha force. Clear white mechs. With heavy steps. Appeared in the streets. Mountains and other places. Far east village. Dum dum dum. Someone struck a gong. Making a dull ringing sound that echoed out. The village chief was one armed. Blind in one eye. And his demeanor was overflowing with ferocity. Anyone with the surname Qian. All come here. We will never stay here for the rest of our lives. Support the village chief. Village chief leads us to break out of this broken village. The villagers roared with excitement. The coming of a new era meant many changes. When the new policy was awarded, Huang Dust was slightly relieved. But a man in a suit came from the alliance with an ugly face. Commander in chief. Look at what they're saying in the United States of America. The man gritted his teeth. The video played. And after Huang Dust watched it, his eyes were cold and terrifying like ghosts and monsters in the dark night. Damn, the title of the video. China's unwillingness to share land and provide resources to the world is discrimination. If we don't give a perfect answer within two hours, we will have to use force. United States of America. Aldrich smiled mockingly as he saw the international public opinion was festering. With enough time, the world is America's. Contact the Cherry Blossom Kingdom as well as the Scylla Kingdom, and tell them to, within a short period of time, gather their armies. Wasiao will definitely not agree. Their hardened bones are world famous. Yutuan George snorted. That's right. With our original combat power plus the mechs, we would have pushed across the world. Why bother to cover up? Remember, the first time we enter China is to kill. Doke. There was hatred in Aldrich's eyes. If it wasn't for, Doke, all resources wouldn't have to favor China. In a battle between countries, there was bound to be big damage, and it would also naturally affect the subsequent development. That's right. It's all China's fault, Aldrich inwardly said. Otherwise, there's no need to tear the skin so early. A storm of public opinion that had already unfolded. Huaxia's international public opinion intensified. In this, a large number of countries were involved. The Philippines righteously asked why Huaxia didn't open up the country for people to enter. Tianju said it could replace Huaxia and become the new P5. And at that time, open up the area for the whole world to enter. Huaxia. Discrimination. Exclusive. How can a big country be so narrow-minded? For the sake of world unity, please allow all countries to enter the sacred evolution. One news item after another sprang up like a rainbow, gaining huge attention among the major platforms. Some people smelled the smell of gunpowder and went crazy, wanting to leave their nationality and take this opportunity to become foreigners. For a while, it was as if Huaxia was food that had been put on the stove and roasted, and anyone who wanted to cut a slice would want to take a lick. In reality, the flashbulbs lit up quickly. A reporter from the United States of America stood up, cutting off other countries from entering Huaxia at this time. May I ask if it is your country's ambition to conquer the globe? Huaxia has not cut off its international ties. Instead, it has recently entered into friendly exchanges with Russia. Yi Qing maintained his smile, planting evidence as a characteristic of certain people. No need to pay attention to it. Yi Qing was about 40 years old, but already had gray hair, but his eyes were shining. A reporter from the Silla Kingdom followed with a question. This time, when the market ripple descends, Huaxia is the biggest beneficiary. It must be opened up to the whole world to help all of mankind move towards a higher evolution. Huaxia advocates peace, and will not take the initiative to attack others. There was a smile on Yi Qing's lips, but the light in his eyes was suddenly sharp. The reason why we benefit is that we have strong people. So when it comes to the enemy, there will always be only cannonballs. Such a domineering declaration really shocked many people on the scene. As for opening up, it's still up for debate. Yi Qing collected his aura. The market ripple market realm is not yet clear. Opening it up will have unknown accidents. Saying so much, it's actually you, Hua Xia, who are secretly developing and wanting to conquer the blue star. The reporter from the United States of America sneered. This reporter turned to face the other peers and said loudly, if it were the United States of America instead, all of you would be welcomed instead of being so petty like Hua Xia. They are destroying human evolution with this practice. 
If any disaster happens in the future, it will be China's responsibility. Yi Qing looked down at the American reporter, and when the latter looked back, his righteous expression was convincing. Only his eyes flashed a touch of mockery. It was to push Huaxia to the top of public opinion, to arouse the jealousy and hatred of other countries. At that time, it would no longer be public opinion, but war. The dawn of a new era was bound to start a conflict. Yi Qing looked at the aggressive reporters from various countries, his gaze sinking slightly. Trouble. Bang. The table fell apart and the information fell to the ground. Sun Haoming retracted his fist with a face full of anger. Huang Dust's face turned blue and his voice roared low. Bastard. Playing this kind of tactic is really despicable. The United States of America, Cherry Blossom Kingdom, and Silla Kingdom have set sail. Long Jianchuan's eyes were also bloomy. It's really worthy of being the two dogs of the United States of America. They are involved in everything. Commander in chief. Let's go to war. Sun Haoming took a deep breath and his attitude was decisive. I'm willing to lead a mecha unit to fight them. If there is plenty of time, when we have our defenses in place, we are not afraid. Huang Dust's expression was solemn, but how could those countries not know the time of the casting barn and specifically pick this juncture to exert their power on us? Long Jianchuan, Sun Haoming and the others felt the pressure. This is to deal with the war power of three countries at the same time. Difficult ah. Suddenly, Huang Dust slapped his hands on the wall and his tone snapped. It's a bit short, but when it comes to fighting a war, Huaxia never fears death. Fight. Whoever dares to step into the territory of Huaxia, kill. A stone stirred up a thousand waves. Sun Haoming roared as their blood filled their pupils. How did you beat the United States of America? Cherry Blossom into fear and retreat back then. Repeat it again now. Long Jianchuan's voice was stern. The Chinese Mecca alliance was incomparably united at this moment. But at this time, an indifferent voice came from outside, not allowed to fight. Huang Chen sank down inwardly, knowing who was coming. The Lin family, one of the top three families, was also one of the largest shareholders of the Huaxia Mecca Alliance. It could be said that this Mecca Alliance had the full support of the top families, otherwise it couldn't have taken shape so quickly. A middle-aged man walked in, black-haired suit, wearing gold-rimmed glasses, with a thin face and ghostly eyes. Lin Hong, the Lin family's spokesperson to the outside world. People are about to hit their doorsteps, and we're still not resisting? Sun Haoming was confused. Lin Hong glanced at him indifferently hooking his finger towards the next mech and then pointing at the chair. Sun Haoming gritted his teeth and clenched his fists. The mecha master sighed and pulled back the chair, and Lin Hong sat down. After eating so many buff additions, it's all the more important for Huaxia to be on par with the international scene. Mecha. Market tattoo. Market realm this is like a gift from God, implying that we need all humanity to be common. Don't be so narrow-minded in your vision, connecting with the international standards. Moreover, you can open up the trading channel and get foreign crystals. Drawings. Lin Hong spoke eloquently. This is international convergence? This is being a dog for the foreigners. Huang Dust kindly laughed. Lin Hong was speechless at their hot-blooded, brainless recklessness. Use some brains. Don't use force to solve everything. The problem is that people have threatened and forced us to use force against them. Long Jianchuan calmly retorted. We don't resist? Just foolishly let people enter the country and destroy our country? Who let the Yi family's Yi Qing not know how to speak? So stupid since he was a child. Lin Hong snorted. Huang Chen looked at him coldly, but in his heart, he understood. The three great families were not as harmonious as they appeared on the surface. Instead in the dark they were tit for tat, hating each other to all die and merging all right afterward. Pulling these grudges into the national level was extremely foolish in Huang Dust's opinion. Lin Hong stopped talking about the Yi family, his eyelids lifted lightly, hitting Huang Dust, remember. Without our three great families, it's impossible for the Mecha Alliance to get up, so you have to listen to what you're told. No conflict is allowed. This matter must be treated peacefully. Don't let people abroad think that we Chinese are barbarians. Understand? No one at the scene answered him. They all looked at him with a disgusted and cold look. Lin Hong was indifferent and thought of something after he got up. Right. Don't ever contact, done. The Alliance doesn't need people who don't listen. Sun Helming was really close to resisting the urge to beat him up. Huang Dust Long Jianchuan and the others also felt suffocated. You can't resist when others are punching you in the face, and you have to make peace with them? Obviously. Huaxia had multiple buffs, and given enough time, these bandit countries still dared to come? If they don't beat the shit out of them, count them as having a clean poop. Commander-in-chief. The great god is here. Zhang Byron suddenly ran in from outside, his face full of excitement. The great god? Huang Chen immediately understood who had arrived. It was great god Su Hao. Quickly invite in, he hurriedly said. Lin Hong next to him raised his eyebrows. This person really couldn't help but chant. And once he did, he came. 
He wanted to see what kind of three heads and six arms this, Doke, had. Su Hao came. His purpose of coming to the Chinese Mecha Alliance was simple. To inform that he was about to enter the environment of all beings and break through the level cap. Su Hao wasn't sure how long he would stay in it. So he asked the Alliance to lead the mechs to upgrade as fast as possible in order to deal with the next disaster that would come. Welcome. Huang Dust was very enthusiastic and took the initiative to shake hands with Su Hao. Su Hao shook hands. Chief Commander Huang. I'm about to enter the environment of all beings, so you guys need to speed up your pace. When these words came out, the hearts of the mechs present shook. This was also too fast. All of a sudden, there was not only the pressure from other countries, but at the same time, they had to deal with the crisis after breaking through the level cap. The pressure had multiplied. Su Hao knew this as well, but the game of gods and the level cap had a closely related factor within it, so it had to be fast. Thank you for your notice. Great God, we will fully cooperate with you. If you need anything, just order. Huang Dust was full of seriousness. Long Jianchuan picked up the conversation from the side. Even if we don't have it, we will find a way to get it for you. I only need the Salary King Fire Seed. It's certainly good to have it. If not, you guys just take care of yourselves. Su Hao smiled faintly. Only he knew clearly how rare the Salary King Fire Seed was. At this moment, Lin Hong, who had been observing in the dark, stared wide-eyed, his face full of disbelief. So young, just 18 years old, right? It's simply perverted. Soon, he calmed down. No, we can't let him get involved in this. Lin Han was even more certain that he couldn't let Su Hao participate in the fight between countries. Young people were prone to hot-bloodedness. As Su Hao was about to leave, he inadvertently saw Lin Hong and thought that this person looked a bit familiar, but couldn't remember how. Great God. Sun Haoming clenched his teeth and spoke against the pressure of Lin Hang's eyes. The United States of America, the Silla Kingdom, and the Sakura Kingdom have directly used force against us. Su Hao was naturally very clear about this matter. However, he was busy with the environment of beings right now and didn't want to care, nor was he too lazy to do so. If he was asked to help with everything, then what else did he need the Huaxia Mecha Alliance for? So Su Hao was ready to reject it directly. Just as he was about to open his mouth, Lin Hong intervened horizontally. Su Hao, right? Lin Hong pushed his gold-rimmed glasses, his expression indifferent. Don't worry about this matter. The Alliance and the three great families will take care of it. You who? Su Hao asked without hesitation. Lin Hong, a member of the Lin family and one of the Alliance's founders. Huang Dust explained. Su Hao suddenly realized, the corner of his mouth lifting into a cold smile. So it was Lin Hong. The reason why the Huaxia Mecha Alliance was corrupt and infighting in just a few decades was because of the presence of such a group of black-hearted businessmen. Until finally when someone broke through level 70, it ushered in the bug invasion that destroyed the world. Because there was no distribution of resources, causing the entire battle force to be uneven and heading towards destruction. Of course, this is only one of the reasons. One of them, this Lin Hong, although already gray-haired, was still glowing, traveling between countries to serve the foreign lords, but treating people in the country with a stinky face and everlasting disdain. This kind of sheepdog, Su Hao despised from the bottom of his heart. As a member of the Huaxia Mecha Alliance, following orders from the Alliance, this is the first guideline. I understand that young people are hot-blooded, but they should also be clear about the situation at hand and befriending other countries is the primary goal. I've heard that among the United States of America that came this time, there is a SS class with incomparably powerful strength. As for you, upgrade well, break through the level cap, and leave the rest alone. Lin Hong still thought that Su Hao was a member of the alliance, one word at a time. It seemed like a plain conversation, but in reality, the threat flavor was extremely heavy. Great SS? Su Hao captured the word, and immediately became interested. Words, I understand. Then I, roll your mom, he smiled faintly, then his face stormily changed abruptly, his right leg seemed like a chariot, heavily bombarding Lin Hang's chest, bang, under everyone's jaw-dropping gaze, Lin Hong let out a wail and flew out backwards hitting the wall, sliding down with both knees on the ground, his patella shattering on the spot, his mouth and nose seeping blood crazily, also mixed with pieces of internal organs, the crows were silent, you, Lin Hong was as breathless as a swimmer, trembling and pointing at Su Hao. Su Hao sneered. Old me is not from the alliance. Do you know the gold content of, Dun, idiot? Lin Hang's eyes rolled over and fainted. Sun Haoming and other mechs almost shouted out, looking at the great god excitedly. Look up, how many of the people coming from the three countries are famous? Su Hao looked at Long Jian Chuan. Also, get rid of this sheepdog. Don't get in my way. Huang Du slowed down and hurriedly had someone get rid of Lin Hang. As for whether the latter was dead or alive. 
It was unclear. Long Jinchuan quickly got the information. The United States of America has come with a black man called Usul, SS class. The Sakura country is Abe Jinjo, S class. And the Silla country is Park Inmung, a class. Usul, Abe Jingu, Park Inmayan? Su Hao went through it inside his head. Was his own hunting list. Usul's full name was Usul Lando. And the name of his independent crystal was, Iron Machine. Any steel-like substance touched by him is able to be fused into his mech, which can show terrifying battle power at the initial stage. And the later it gets, the stronger the battle power becomes. Abe Jinjo is an S-class independent crystal, mecha multiplication. And, mecha reinforcement, a word difference but the function is very different. Inclined to the function of the sharp weapon, can be a part of the mecha multiplied to increase the size, and then summoned from the door of the machinery. Park in Mayan. On the other hand, was an A-rank independent crystal, weapon soul. A crystal that fused perfectly with a weapon. I'll make a trip and settle it soon. Suha touched the market pattern and casually said. It was as if the oppressive feeling of three countries seemed fake to him. Huang Dust's face tightened. And he hurriedly asked. Great God. The Chinese fleet is also ready. And will support behind you at any time. Well, I guess it won't be used. Su Hao thought of something and turned his head to gaze at them. An alliance with four minds won't go far after all. If you want Huaxia to go far and steady, you have to take power yourself. When another country invades our land, what they think about is not resistance, but fawning and flattering. How do such people deserve to be called Huaxia people? After saying that, Zero covered Su Hao's torso, gradually flooding with golden color, like a sun god of war. Great god. Then if it's you, what to do? Huang Dust's heart trembled. But he also quickly asked with firm eyes. Su Hao's tone was calm, kill. After saying this, Zero floated in the air, shaking the sky, like a meteor cutting through the sky. Just one word made Long Jianchuan feel suffocated. He turned his head to look at Huang Dust. Huang Dust's eyes changed as he lightly exhaled. It's time to make a decision. Above the vast sea, the fleet sprawled across the sea, and Mech stood on the decks. In the sky, fighter jets whizzed by. The fleets from the United States of America. Cherry Blossom Kingdom, and Scylla Kingdom had already stepped into the waters of China. Ha ha ha, so what even if it's Huaxia, can it still stop us at the same time? Remember, attack towards the coast of Huaxia, don't skimp on the cannonballs. Yossi, the three countries, all of them laughed coldly, but someone in the channel suddenly screamed strangely, look everyone, why are there two suns in the sky? The bright light of the sun shone on the sea at this moment, the god of slaying arrived, there were two suns in the sky shining brightly and reflecting into the fleets of the three major countries, making them look especially bizarre. One of the suns was rapidly approaching at the fleet of the three countries in a fast manner, shaking the sea with booms and waves. It was a mech. Its body was golden yellow, as if it was made of poured gold, and there was a golden source surging in the chest armor area, as if it was an indestructible force, guiding the mech to spread a terrifying aura. Chinese waters, no country is allowed to step in. Those who step in, die. The cold and piercing voice echoed in the waters of Huaxia. This was a warning. It was also a warning to other countries. And it was even more of an indication that the killing was about to begin. However, the United States of America, the Cherry Blossom Kingdom, and the Scylla Kingdom laughed coldly. What are you? How dare you stand in our way? Kill him for me. Baka, shoot him. Oh, artillery fire blast him. The three countries didn't care who the visitor was. Even if it was that globally renowned, Dok. He had to die. Boom boom boom, the fleet's artillery bombardment, close defense cannons, and other attack implements broke the tranquility of this sea in an instant. The cannons were connected into pieces in the sky, and the thick bullets were like a flock of eagles flying, densely packed like a curtain of bullets that instantly surrounded the golden mech. Under the coverage of such dense and horrifying firepower, no matter what mechs were going to be destroyed, shoot well, send these images to the world, let them see the resistance against the United States of America. Ah, the commanding officer of the United States of America laughed, but his expression froze in the next second. Minus one, 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 minus one. Minus one 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 minus one. Countless numbers of injuries instantly floated up above the golden mech's head. All of them were only one point. This scene was indeed released to the whole world and completely shocked all of humanity. What the hell is this mech? These words resounded in the hearts of almost everyone. At the same time, the artillery, close defense cannons, 
and other attacking implements that bombarded the golden mecca all burst apart, roiling the sky with brilliant flames of light. What's going on? The commanders of the three countries all roared in exasperation. It's unclear. It seems to have broken on its own. The fleet soldiers were also anxious, triggering the anti-injury effect of the glazed armor. Needle stabbing geocache. The Filipino troops. Retreat the fuck back. Don't get into the mess. Done, has appeared. Roll back. The Filipino country stormtrooper regiment leader wanted to get a piece of the action, but he panicked after seeing the live broadcast. Black continent. The blacks wore blood-colored hats. It was the blood hat that was established after the market realm descended. They were also watching the intermittent live broadcast. Don't mess with Hua Xia. Be friendly with them. The blood hat's manager's eyes flashed with light as he ordered. The other countries that were originally dumbfounded. At this moment, all pressed down their greed. With the power of one person, the whole world was blocked. Above the sea, the smoke slowly dispersed, revealing the golden mech without any sign of breakage. Su Hao gazed at the fleet and gently spat out a word. Kill. Boom. The Zero broke away from the gravity suppression of the Blue Star and swept out as a golden meteor. Rushing towards the first warship, Rumble, the warship burst into flames, and screams continued to ring out. Su Hao didn't use any crystal ability at all, and with the hardness and strength of his body alone, he rushed to shatter the warship. Monster, this is simply not the strength a battle armor should have. Harness the mech and kill him. On the deck of the warship of the United States of America, a group of troops harnessing mechs appeared. The Zero's facial armor shone with a ruddy light, getting brighter and brighter and more blazing. Solar flare. The beam of light, like a ship chopper appeared in the sea, cutting a warship hard from the center, splitting mountains and breaking the sea. Rumble. The clouds in the sky were even chopped in half. The sea was boiling. The soldiers were screaming. And the warship was blasting. A mecha was as fragile as a cookie at this moment, completely unable to block Su Hao's strike. Done. A roar rang out. A black mech came dancing its wings like a fallen dark angel from the western world, but its arms were carrying giant artillery, which was rapidly fusing up into a giant black cannon with a diameter of more than 50 meters, Ursul, steel machine, boom, the sound of the stone-breaking cannon collapsed the surrounding islands, and the sea was even violently churning, which was especially terrifying, a super-huge cannonball whistled out, wrapped in explosive elements, and heavily bombarded Su Hao, it's Ursul, the United States of America was ecstatic, Zero's arm armor wriggled and changed into mad poison, slowly turning sideways and pulling the trigger. Bang. Only to see the super huge cannonball fragment halfway under the berserk poison shrapnel, transforming into an intense circle of flames that blossomed out. How is it possible? Ussel was incredulous. The flames dissipated. And the one who appeared in front of the operation panel was Su Hao. He had come. That man was carrying the mad poison, aiming his pitch black and ice cold muzzle at Ussel. Bang. Dense numbers rushed up into the sky and included was Ussel who was killed by a single shot. The golden hand armor pierced through the black mech and held Ussel, devouring it without hesitation. Devouring successful. Independent crystals appeared in Su Hao's hand, coldly smiling, directly mating. Withdraw. Retreat. The United States of America, the Scylla Kingdom, and the Cherry Blossom Kingdom were already like lost dogs when they saw the situation, roaring angrily and commanding the fleet to return. Can't fight. It's impossible to beat them. The damage was useless. The other side can easily kill you in seconds. That's no way to fight. But Su Hao didn't intend to let them go, setting his sights on the Scylla Kingdom as the mecha blasted the air and descended on the deck, nearly toppling the entire warship. Shiva, the mech of the Scylla Kingdom's fleet blood filled his pupils. Put, Zero shot out a crimson laser, cutting all of the Scylla Kingdom's mech masters at the waist, bleeding all over the place and dying immediately. Su Hao swept a glance and was also a bit surprised that Park Runmeng was mixed in and died. Devour. He picked up the corpse. The second independent crystal entered his hand. Zero took off, blasting the fleet of Scylla Kingdom to pieces in the process. Among the fleeing fleet, Su Hao swept in the direction of the Sakura Kingdom. However, after approaching the past, a white mecha hand suddenly held a Najinata and blasted out from a combined mechanical gate. The white mecha hand was about 15 meters long, and the Najinata was multiplied and enlarged, chopping at Su Hao with a whistling sound. However, Machine Zero only stretched out its golden hand armor, and collided with its unequal size Najinata. Bang! The sky shook like thunder. Machine Zero did not move at all, but the Najinata trembled wildly, and a layer of colored refinement spread on its surface. Colored refinement, the second ability of broken arms, slowing down the enemy. The five fingers of steel penetrated the Najinata and crushed it hard. Su Hao immediately locked onto the white mech below and stormed down, stomping down hard. Completely crushing Abe Jinjo as well as the mech into crumbs. 
he indifferently devoured at the pile of trash and obtained the third independent crystal. Baka, the fleeing Sakura nation fleet saw Ape Jinjo's death. All of them were grief-stricken. Suho glanced at them coldly. And, Solar Flare, fired. Breaking through the light of the sea and killing the fleeing Sakura kingdom fleet. Not a single one was spared. Nothing else, just hated Sakura country. At this moment, the world was shocked. The power of one man, taking in the power of three nations. The so-called crises were all trash in the face of absolute power. Great God, is it over? Huan Dust's voice trembled a little as he contacted Su Hao. Su Hao looked at the Sakura Kingdom soldiers still drifting in the sea, his eyes flickering with a cold aura, it's not over yet. When Huang Dust and the others heard this, their pupils all shrunk. What was the meaning of these words? Could it be that there was still a pursuit to be done? Doesn't one need to pay a price for allowing others to step into the waters of the Chinese nation? Call out the fleet of China. Follow my footsteps, and pursue the Cherry Blossom Kingdom. From this moment onwards, the position of the Blue Star hegemony will change shape in offense and defense. Su Hao's voice was firm, and at the same time particularly domineering. Sun Helming and these young people heard it and their blood boiled even more. Is the dream of many years actually going to be realized at this time? Great God, I know this is exciting, but what if other countries support? Huang Dust's heart pounded and he couldn't help but inquire in a low voice. Su Hao's tone was indifferent, they don't dare to come. If they come, they will die. Huang Dust's eyes changed quickly, and he received calls from the Yi, Lin, and Zhao families at the same time. Secretly shutting down, Sun Haoming, he droned lightly. Sun Haoming gave a jolt. In, lead the troops to rendezvous with the great god, and only follow the great god's orders. Everyone else, ignore them all. Huang Dust gritted his teeth. Su Hao was right. One alliance, four minds, was ultimately wrong. Yes, Sun Haoming was excited and immediately ordered people, because no one could refuse a single page of the genealogy, because no one could refuse the horse treading on the cherry blossoms. All fleets target the Cherry Blossom Kingdom and follow the Great God's orders with full authority. Long Jianchuan similarly issued an order. On the sea area, Su Hao looked at a Chinese warship appearing on the distant sea and revealed a smile. The reason why he targeted the Sakura country was not just loathing and hatred, but the memory that the Sakura country had colluded with other civilizations. At that time, Su Hao was in a humble position and knew very little information, and this was only known by mentioning it internally. I can't destroy you this time, but I'll also make you suffer greatly. Su Hao looked into the sky with a sinister gaze. Soon, the Chinese fleet and Sun Haoming's troops arrived. Su Hao waved his hand and led them to start setting sail, treading the cherry blossoms, United States of America. Aldrich and George were grimacing. The mighty warship of the United States of America failed miserably, still defeated by the hands of one person. Shame. It's a disgrace. Aldrich roared and pounded the table. Commander-in-chief, the Chinese warships are heading towards the Sakura country. The information officer hurriedly inquired. Should we provide support? Support my ass. In front of, done. Any more numbers are nothing more than sending them to their deaths. George cursed in exasperation. Have the White Regiment, and the Mecha Division of the Wu Regiment quickly upgrade and go brush up on powerful crystals. Aldrich's eyes were red. The World Lighthouse will never go out. Sooner or later, we'll make Hua Xiaopei. Silla Kingdom. The first announcement released by the Silla Kingdom after the warship suffered a devastating blow. Our country and Hua Xiao will always be confidants and friends just like the feelings we had during dynasties such as the ancient Tang dynasty, and will always be on good terms. The Chinese netizens who were able to go out over the wall saw it and burst out laughing on the spot. At Guardian of the World S Best Snow White Thrower, are you sure we'll always be good friends? Do you know from which dynasty the stick was passed down? At FK Man, please 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 restore your previous untamed appearance. At Flavorful, no need for extra salt, back to recognize your father? We don't recognize you as a two-faced good great son. Shilla Kingdom's announcement drew a swarm of ridicule, anxious and angry, almost choosing to close the announcement. Sakura Nation. Saratobi was the person jointly launched by the Shadow Village, the Great Pirate Mecha Corps, and the Scion Combat Clan, and belonged to the person in power on the surface. But now he panicked. How terrifying, Doki's combat power was had been seen on the live broadcast. Within 20 minutes, if no one comes to talk, we default to Sakura Nation accepting the shelling. The dull voice echoed over Sakura Country. Saratobi's legs were shivering and cold sweat was pouring down, looking at the people underneath who were doing the same, terrified, go, move, when they rode their mechs to the shore of Sakura country, a behemoth of a ship straddled the sea, giving an extremely terrifying sense of oppression, warships, in the early stage, still had a terrifying oppressive power, except for Su Hao, who was ineffective as a pervert, aren't you Chinese not afraid of international accusations, Saratobi called out in a trembling voice, 
Su Hao floated in midair like a god on earth, coldly overlooking the Sakura countrymen, you can send a distress call to the whole world right now, and see who dares to come? Such a domineering remark, if it was uttered by someone else, it would definitely be mocked. But who would dare to mock the words uttered by, Dun? What exactly do you want? Saratobi swallowed his saliva and asked in fear. Su Hao gazed out over the island. Compensation of 2 million million fused crystals, 10, 000, 000 crystals, and 10, 000, 000 drawings, limiting you to delivering them within 30 minutes. Over time, shelling the island, life and death, ice cold and piercing words, such as the wind of winter, blowing Sarutobi wood in other people's body and mind. No, Sarutobi glared. This kind of quantity was almost like emptying out the entire Sakura country. Timing starts. Su Hao didn't bother with him. Sun Haoming's troops as well as the warships stood ready to leap into action. Hurry, get the stuff together. Sarutobi roared. It only took 25 minutes. But finally, Sakura Nation was able to get a large portion together. But there was still a portion missing. The 10,000 fused crystals were almost half a million short. And the drawing crystals were in line with the quantity. Is it okay to wait for us to compensate for the rest of the vacancy later? Sarutobi was on the verge of crying with anxiety. Su Hao gestured towards Sun Haoming, who sneered and took everything, which was not a bad idea. I know that your Sakura country is indeed quite difficult. Su Hao sentenced Saratobi sighed in relief, but the words that followed directly collapsed. The remaining 500, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000 fusion crystal stones will be returned later. Let's shell you guys for 5 minutes first. I'm also very kind. Boom boom boom. As soon as the words fell, a deafening sound of artillery rang out from the Huaxia warship. The artillery washed the ground. Boom boom boom. The earth shook. Smoke filled the air. And turbulent shockwaves swept through the entire Sakura country. Flames annexed the vile and dark country. Saratobi and the others reflected the firelight in their pupils. So desperate. So sad. Their eyes were moist. And two lines of tears slowly flowed. Crocodile tears. Su Hao snorted. Then looked into the depths of Sakura country. The Shadow Village. The Great Pirate Mecha Corps. And the Scion Combat Clan did not show up quite capable of hiding. Su Hao didn't choose to destroy Sakura country, not because of lack of strength, but because of the disaster that he had to deal with next. If Sakura country was there, the pressure on the Asian side would be a little less. As for losing these resources, whether the Sakura kingdom would not be able to hold out, it would depend on how lucky they were. Go. Su Hao waved his hand and led the troops and fleet far away. Not long after the Chinese fleet was far away, nearly half of the Sakura country was in ruins, with fires and screams in the sky. The Shadow Village, the Great Pirate Mecha Regiment, and the Scion Combat Clan took the stage. Looking out at the far away, Doke, those eyes were filled with hatred, anger, and resentment. Doke, this hatred and resentment. I, I will return a hundredfold. Return to Huaxia. Long Jianchuan was already waiting, to greet their gods and heroes of Huaxia, but the only ones who returned were Sun Haoming and the others. Where's the great god? Long Jianchuan was stunned. Sun Haoming said mysteriously. After the great god took away the 10,000 Rome crystals, he said he was going to enter the illusion of beings. Long Jianchuan's eyes glazed over. The great god is in such a hurry. We can't drag our feet. All of us upgrade quickly. The top of a building. Su Hao finished contacting with Yinaifa and directly touched the market pattern. Open the realm of beings illusion. Entering. Learning that Su Hao had already entered the illusion of beings, Huang Dust also felt the urgency. After he thought about it, his voice was low, warn the other countries that a disaster will be coming soon, please take precautionary measures. Commander-in-chief, Yu, Long Jianchuan was filled with surprise. Huang Dust's eyes had a starry depth, this is a big event that concerns all of mankind. Appropriately put down your short-lived hatred and tied over the immediate difficulties before saying so. Yes, Long Jianchuan sniffed and sighed secretly. He actually did not agree with this approach, and only wished for Huaxia to rise alone and become the absolute hegemon of the Blue Star. The only way to be respected by others was to be powerful. Location, Corrupted Kingdom. Tier, 2, Tasks, 0 slash 2. The ultimate ascension will be achieved by completing the task. 1 survive for 15 days. 2 choice, please choose the camp to carry out the mission later. 1, Evil. 2, Hypocrisy. 3, 3 acquire 5 types of exceptional crystals and equip them. 4 kill 0 out of 10. 0, 0, 0 zombies. Description, The virus spreads, permeating the globe. Corrupting the will of creatures to become slaves to blood, violence, ferocity, sex, harshness, meanness, viciousness, hypocrisy becomes synonymous with this world. Never trust the person standing behind you. Mecca, awakening, is the only one you trust? 
Please enjoy the despicable nature of humanity at the end of the world. You can quit at any time and there will be no penalty, but there will be a one minute countdown. This place was an unreachable desert, where the wind and sand rolled and whimpered, obscuring the line of sight. Su Hao appeared here, and after looking around, he began to check the mission requirements as well as the depiction of the environment. Zombies? Mecha? Awakening? Still quite a flavorful tag pairing. He smiled slightly. At the same time, he noticed that the third option for camp choice was a question mark, which made Su Hao think. Evil? Hypocrisy? Is there still pure goodness? According to the description, there is still pure goodness existing in this world? Su Hao asked himself. He knew very well that every choice you make in the illusion of beings, the rewards given in the end would be different. However, Su Hao still had that idea of completing all the tasks and taking the best rewards. Suddenly, within the range of the detection radar, a red dot was rushing madly. Boom! The sand and soil collapsed, and a giant worm about 20 meters long swept out, with layers of skin and flesh, the surface covered with purple tendons, intertwining and stacking into a bizarre human face, as well as a bloody mouth, covered with densely packed fangs, spewing out a red liquid, devouring down towards Su Hao, blood poison killer insect, attributes, strength 250, defense 300, speed 180, spirit 20, characteristics, any attack is highly poisonous and can make blood boil, weakness, ice, comments, it would be nice if you didn't have any teeth in that mouth of yours, bared, red liquid covered the surface of the zero, constantly turning up white smoke, dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 dash 1 numbers spiked up, but at the same time, they were recovering rapidly, and couldn't break the defense at all, the devouring of the blood poison killer came along with it, but Su Hao raised his arm and yanked a fong, easily holding it in mid-air, no matter how much it struggled and swung, it was of no use, he raised his cold eyes and threw a punch, bang, the sky was filled with blood mist and shattered flesh like a light rain, dirty fireworks, Su Hao commented, he left, going to look for places that possessed human traces, Spitfire City, a small city made of abandoned cars, and clutter, the cluttered iron walls carried fire breathers, along with many spiked defenses with hideous zombies hanging from them, and flies buzzing around, inside Spitfire City, it was loud and chaotic, engines roared endlessly on the streets, two meatworms in the alleys vented their doom and gloom, and the taverns were noisy as well as smashing, Su Hao was sitting on a chair and was observing the surroundings, however, a pair of eyes in the tavern wandered over him, with greed, lust, mockery and so on, so tender, it's been a long time since I've seen such a superb piece of cargo, I think you're really hungry, the locals were whispering, Su Hao didn't care, instead, he stared at the deal in the corner, there was a cage place there, about half a meter high, but covered with a black cloth, and low roaring sounds could be heard from inside from time to time, boss, when the bison gang next door was fighting the zombies, we robbed a zombie, the one-eyed little brother smiled sorrowfully, the boss of Spitfire City was called Dog, fat and strong, wearing a long black coat, from time to time he took his hand and scratched his lower body, those small eyes narrowed, picking up the black cloth to take a look, he was suddenly horny and kept licking his lips, well done, I didn't expect female zombies you have gotten, Dog nodded in satisfaction, allow you to roll in bed with my nine wives, the one-eyed little brother was surprised and kept kissing the boss's toes, Su Hao was speechless, had the world become like this, since this was the case, then Su Hao felt that he should follow the customs, after he got up, he set his eyes on the cage, since many hidden quests were needed to trigger, Su Hao didn't intend to give up any details, kid, this is our boss's territory, get lost, seeing Su Hao approaching over, dog's little brother scolded fiercely, he he he, leave boss dog to us, I can already visualize him screaming, what the hell, the people inside the tavern all laughed cruelly, but soon screamed, the black tide flooded the entire tavern, and the lights were blocked, with only sparse broken light seeping out, reflecting in everyone's fearful eyes, Su Hao looked down on Dog, holding the gem of the Rat King in his palm, darkness enveloping him, his eyes evil, like an existence at the root of disaster, causing those present to panic, friend, I, Spitfire City, am a secondary force belonging to the skeleton gang, it's not sensible to make a move here, Dog continuously swallowed his saliva, his pupils vibrated, and his muzzle was astringent, eat them, Su Hao was indifferent, ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah, uh. Bleak screams instantly pierced the sky above Spitfire City, and tons and tons of rats gushed out, like an erupting black fountain. Dog let out a roar of terror, and his hair all over his body went crazy, hard and long, resisting the gnawing of the rat tide. So this is the awakening of the rotten kingdom, Su Hao said in his heart, but he didn't pay any attention to it. Instead, he reached out and lifted the cage, 
turned around and left the tavern, riding the endless tide of rats like nobody's business. What was the most terrifying in the end times? There was nothing more terrifying than the rats that lived in the darkness, wrapped in viruses and countless numbers. Here, the rat king was the king. Rumble, rumble. Mechs burst in vehicles shattered in Spitfire City, causing bursts of smoke and explosions, but Su Hao never looked back. Trigger mission. Descendants of the corpse king, whether to kill or stay, please make your own choice. At night, the cold wind blows. A bunch of bonfires whimpered in the wind and kept burning. Su Hao glanced at the cage, revealing a thoughtful look. The hidden quest is actually the offspring of the corpse king, he said darkly. However, this was also considered the fun of sandbox games. For example, if you manipulate Arthur in Wilderness Dart 2, there are countless contingencies, and the rewards given vary. The black cloth was lifted, and Su Hao gazed at the female zombie, his eyes flashing with surprise. The female zombie was not unclothed, but was wearing slightly old jeans and white short sleeves, more like a modern person dressed up. Her facial features were exquisite, but only her eyes were pale, and the blood veins around her eyes were rippling, constantly emitting a low roar that seemed to be threatening Su Hao, kind of like a human. Su Hao was slightly surprised. He guessed, could it be that the offspring of the corpse king had already started to evolve in the process? The world of the kingdom of decay was a construction of Mecha plus Doomsday plus Awakening, which meant destruction and evolution. The zombies were no exception, keeping it might have an unexpected harvest. Su Hao slapped the cage and made a good decision. Taking advantage of nightfall, he upgraded the independent crystals he just got. Of the one, five million million fusion crystals compensated by the Sakura country. Suha took 1 million and gave the rest to the alliance. Independent crystal, iron machine, level 0 slash level 3, grade, SS. Effect. 1. Metal overlord, any item belonging to metal can be fused with the mech. The larger the volume, the higher the energy value consumed. And once the fusion is completed, it will continue to lose energy value. The. 2 steel coat, fusion metal, can provide temporary shield and armor for the mech. Currently level 0, provides 50%. Level 1, 60%. Level 2, 75%. Level 3, 100%. Individual Crystal, Artifact Soul, Level 0 slash Level 2. Rank, A. Effect. 1. Absolute Control, able to achieve the most perfect fit with any weapon to bring out the strongest combat power. Currently Level 0, gain 10% kill. Level 1, 20%. Level 2, 30%. 2. Splendid Soul, every weapon has a soul that belongs to them temporarily deducting 75% of the mech's energy value limit to conjure up the soul of the weapon. Independent Crystal, Mecha Multiplication, Level 0 slash 5. Rank, S. Effect. 1. Multiplication, can multiply parts of the mech to enhance them at a cost of 20% energy value. The higher the multiplication, the higher the loss. 2. Multiplication of implements, can multiply weapons. Currently level 0, 10% increase. Level 1, 20%. Level 2, 30%. Level 3, 40%. Level 4, 50%. Level 5, 75%. Suha was also slightly surprised after seeing these three independent crystal functions, because few people were stupid enough to make their abilities public. There was bound to be a hiding. The only way to realize how powerful it was was to really touch it. The steel machine and mecha multiplication were good, but the most unexpected was the second ability of the artifact soul. Grade A? This has to be considered S rank anyways. Su Hao looked at the splendid soul, but for the first and middle stages, deducting 75% of the energy value cap is really a big problem for the mech. For example, if 100 energy value is deducted by 75%, there are only 25 points left, and with various accessory crystals, core crystals, it is impossible to fight. That's why, artifact soul, was still justified as an A rank, but Su Hao didn't care. He had a high energy value. His energy value was as high as 4760 so feel free to deduct it. Suha was happy to have both market coins and Wanron crystals, and directly upgraded, whether or not to strengthen the iron machine. Select yes, to strengthen it to level 3, with the loss of Wanron crystal stones asterisk 44,000, market coins asterisk 1500000, whether or not to strengthen the soul of weapon. Choose yes, strengthen to level 2, the loss of Wanron crystal stone asterisk 8,000, market coins asterisk 500,000, whether to strengthen, mecha multiplication. Choose yes. Strengthen to level 5. Loss of one lone crystal stone asterisk 125000. Market coin asterisk 2000000. Upon seeing the crystal level increase, Su Hao had a satisfied look on his face. Just love the thrill of watching the values change. With 800, 
000 or so million million fusion crystal stones left. Su Hao upgraded the other independent crystals without hesitation. Desecration. Full level. Mecha reinforcement. Full level. Rat King. Full level. Suffocating wormhole. Full level. Battle frenzy. Full level. Soul grinding technique. Full level. Hercules. Level 4. The 10,000 fused crystals were squandered. There were still more than 20 million ruin coins, but now there were only a million or so left. Comfortable. Su Hao overflowed with an evil smile. What 10,000 roan crystals and market coins were all vanity. The only thing that was the only king was crystal enhanced growth mechs. Just as he was immersed in the blissful atmosphere, a strong roar sounded in the distance. Roar. A beast-like roar echoed in the night sky, along with the sound of guns discharging. A blood-colored eye in the darkness of the night was filled with violence and ferocity, constantly tearing at the mecha. Damn damn damn. Retreat quickly. We haven't died blood, and we haven't provoked the zombies. So how come we're besieging over here? Friend, can you help? We will be grateful. The besieged people saw Su Hao and hurriedly begged for help, but even if they didn't need to ask for help, the zombies didn't seem to intend to let Su Hao go, and surged madly. Split Skull Zombie. Attributes, Strength 210. Defense 280. Speed 90. Spirit 0. Characteristics, Infectious Virus all over the body. Can be transformed into the same kind when it touches the wounds of the living creatures. Weakness, High Temperature. Evaluation, I still like Resident Evil's Jill. Zombie. Attributes, Strength 130. Defense 100. Speed 50. Spirit 0. Characteristics, Same as above. Weakness, High Temperature. Comments, Anti Wang is the most beautiful. Clanging, The zombie hissed, Flung his arms, And swept in a storm of trembling torsos. The crack skull zombie pulled its scalp with both hands and was able to see the blackened brain matter inside, letting out a growl and pulling hard on its scalp, shooting out black liquid. Transformation. Su Hao touched the market tattoo, and the golden mech was like the embrace of a god, covering the flesh and turning into a round of sun, shining through the darkness. He held mad venom and used, iron machine, artifact soul, mecha multiplication, energy value, 4760-1190, temporarily, boom. The mad poison began to change, converging into a weapon soul behind Su Hao's back, a humanoid monster in a black mech with a wildly flailing cape, exuding a haughty and overbearing aura, and rapidly expanding as it raised its muzzle as if it wasn't really a shotgun, but more like a super giant mega cannon. Metal overlord plus multiplication technique plus splendid soul plus apparatus multiplication. The trigger was pulled. Bang. The stone cold sound of gunfire echoed like thunder within dozens of miles at this moment, rumbling for a long time. Dense shrapnel was more like an iron gate splashing out, turning into terrifying kinetic energy and chopping all the zombies in front into pieces. One shot. Exterminating all the zombies. The mecha team that called for help was horrified to the point of being unable to stop themselves when they saw the scene. One shot destroyed all the zombies. What kind of terrifying power was this? So strong. The mecha team's boss exclaimed in a trembling voice, but a thick greed surfaced in the depths of his eyes. As for Su Hao. He looked at the pieces of zombies on the ground and was slightly surprised. Not only had they gotten bigger, they had also gotten more powerful. The mecha team, about 30 people, harnessed doom type mechs and slowly descended from above, bending down towards Su Hao to thank him. Thank you, Lord Strongman, for your rescue. By the way, Su Hao's tone was indifferent. He was indeed just doing it by the way, testing the match of his new ability. My name is Wei Chang, the leader of the mecha team of Linjia village 5 kilometers away. The middle-aged man at the head introduced himself. Su Hao nodded, not intending to introduce himself, but he could ask them about the situation of this world. Wei Chang was very happy, and immediately had people take down supplies from the Doomsday Mech. There was wine and meat, only it was rat meat or something like that. The location we're in is called the Red Sand District, dominated by the Skeleton Gang, which collects protection money from the people living around it every month. If you don't pay, you'll be eliminated on the spot. So we go out for long periods of time to hunt zombies and infected creatures to make a living. Wei Chang spoke eloquently. At this time, someone smiled and handed over a broken wine glass, which had cloudy wine shaking inside, and there seemed to be some sediments. Su Hao took a look, expressionless. Wei Chang smiled and said, My lord, this is brewed with mutant fruit. The others hurriedly nodded their heads and then stared closely at the wine cup in Su Hao's hand. Su Hao suddenly laughed and said in his heart, Is this the hypocrisy camp? He drank it all in one go. Paralyzing toxin detected. Triggering abnormal condition antibody. In the corrupted kingdom, there were not only villains, but also hypocrites. It was just that Su Hao didn't expect to encounter it continuously in just one day. What a lovely world. 
Seeing Su Hao finish the glass of wine, Wei Chang's smile became even more intense. My lord, I'm sorry, we just want to live. Your mech seems to be stronger than us, I want to keep it for myself. As the saying goes, it's better to have a father and a mother than to have it for yourself, don't you think so? We'll put up a monument to you after we die. Wei Chang's smile seemed so hypocritical. Just because of the treasure, he poisoned his benefactor in the twinkling of an eye. Working with you hypocrites is not something I like very much. Su Hao spoke words he only understood. The expressions of Wei Chang's crowd froze. Is he alright? Su Hao coldly looked at them and lightly snapped his fingers. Air stripping. A semi-transparent circular shield descended. Within 75 meters of the space, all the oxygen was instantly extracted. Wei Chang clenched his neck with both hands, his expression agonizing. Their skin became blue and purple, and their eyes puffed out of their sockets, along with blood spurting from their mouths and noses. In the end, a group of people knelt on the ground and showed a dead dog-like begging gaze towards Su Hao. Su Hao's expression was indifferent, watching this group of people suffocating to death. All evil people. He smiled and shook his head. In the end of the world, everyone brutalized others for themselves, saying that there was no way out. But in fact, they were just a bunch of hypocrites and villains. After air stripping was withdrawn, the thick blood began to spread out, very easily attracting the attention of the zombies. Not only zombies, but also infected creatures. The blood was like a drop of oil that fell into the water. Su Hao didn't care. Kill as many as came. It was just right to fill the number of ten. Zero 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 zombies required by the mission. Boom boom boom. Abruptly, the flame tail light in the night sky dragged the stars, accompanied by the strong sound of artillery bombardment. A shell bombarded towards Su Hao's position without hesitation. The earth exploded and shrapnel flew about. Roar. The hissing sound echoed. The zombie horde, not knowing whether they were sniffing blood or something else, ran wildly. At the same time, the crunching sounds of mechanical operations were interspersed among the zombie hordes revealing their true colors in the firelight. Sticky liquid flowed down with the cracks of the mech, dripping in the desert and spreading a foul odor. The huge body was more like a combination of flesh and machinery, permeated with a bizarre and absurd sense of immediacy. The surface of the skin and flesh was constantly expanding and contracting the parts of the mech, giving people a feeling of a flesh and blood machine. Some zombie mech's lower bodies were tracks, while others were mechanical feet, constantly running towards Su Hao. Zombie mech. Attributes. Strength 400. Defense 400. Speed 200. Spirit 50. Characteristics. A combination of flesh and blood. Two methods of operation in the body. Both strength and defense. Weaknesses. Heat. Electricity. Evaluation. Flesh and blood are weak. Machinery is soaring. Roar. The zombie mech wrapped in the fishy wind and blood gas. Raised his right arm. But it was fused with the flamethrower. And all of a sudden a flame ray that broke through the darkness like a fire dragon erupted. Suddenly. The fire ray constantly shone with brilliant glazed colors, and then exploded, spreading in all directions. The zombie hordes that were originally coming at a rapid pace were all covered in color refinement, slowing down their speed. Broken armor, glazed armor, flames, that's how it works. An indifferent voice came out as Zero slowly stepped out of the flames, the mechanical arm raised, and the fire escape raged with monstrous flames, but under the suppression of the powerful spiritual power. A giant fireball with a diameter of over 100 meters shone. Boom. Su Hao's eyes were indifferent, holding the giant fireball in his hand and smashing it down, like a nuclear bomb exploding. The sand and dust danced wildly, becoming crystal clear, and at the same time there were zombie groups and zombie mechs, which instantly perished. Drops zombie liver asterisk 433, million fusion crystals asterisk 291, poisonous saliva, asterisk 11, drops, flamethrower, drawing asterisk 3, one Rome Crystals Asterisk 222. Tank Track, Drawing Asterisk 4. Zombies Blood Asterisk 108. One Rome Crystal Stone Asterisk 340. Z Virus, Asterisk 1. For these harvests, Su Hao only glanced at them, because as a ton-ton rat, one doesn't care at all what is exploded, but one must hoard it, and there must be more of it. This was what made a qualified tundan rat. At this moment, a large number of red dots surfaced in Su Hao's scouting radar and shook his head. It's not over. Bang. The cannon went off, and the missile blasted at Su Hao's facial armor. But Zero's arm flashed, and his five fingers tightly clasped the missile, crushing it on the spot. Eh? Su Hao was slightly surprised. Corpse King. Attributes. Strength 790. Defense 850. Speed 600. Spirit 300. Characteristics. Leader of the zombies. Can unite the zombies in an area. Terrifying battle strength. Possesses self-healing. Weakness. Ice. Evaluation. Zombie King. I. Fong Tin Yao. Am not convinced. 
If the previous zombies were noisy, the zombie group that debuted now was eerily quiet. The leader of the zombie king's blood eyes are filled with ferocity and tyranny. Oriental face, long black hair to cover the five senses, but has a strong and robust body. Not like a doomsday zombie, more like a person. Suhao put away the mad poison and replaced it with the blade of contempt that had long been cast in the casting warehouse. Holding the scythe in his hand added a demonic touch, just as he was about to do it. The operating panels, 10,000 words translation, began to slowly translate a passage. Return. My. Daughter. To me. The 10,000 words translation could actually translate zombie language. This made Su Hao surprised. However, he quickly realized that it wasn't translating all zombie words. It was only limited to the corpse king. It seems that so many zombies suddenly popped up tonight. Not because of me, but her. Su Hao's heart was clear. Only to see the corpse king cloaked in hair. The blood pupil from the hair layer is full of tyrannical ferocity. But there was also the flavor of human affection. Su Hao gazed at the corpse king, then put away the blade of contempt and carried the cage towards the front. Here, the corpse king caught the cage and let out an anxious low roar towards the inside. The female zombie quickly responded and opened the cage door, like a reunited father and daughter, embracing each other tightly. Complete the hidden quest, corpse king's offspring. Su Hao listened to the information transmitted, his face expressionless. This task, whether it was to keep the corpse king's offspring, or to kill it, could be completed. The key was the development of the subsequent mission. That was the most important. The reunion was complete. The female zombie was protected by the zombie mech and stared at Suhao in death. The zombie king, on the other hand, let out a low roar. Thank you. Please walk with me. Translation by 10,000 words translation. Good. Suhao did not refuse. Open the third camp, zombies. Hearing the information report, he was shocked in his heart. The first camp was evil. The second camp was hypocritical. He thought that the third camp was pure goodness, but he didn't expect that it was actually zombies. Interesting, too interesting. The corner of Suhao's mouth raised in an arc. Choose camp, zombie. This was a city half covered by the desert, with wrecked cars, collapsed coffee houses, and so on everywhere. The zombie king's residence wasn't as dirty and messy as one would expect. Instead it was neatly organized. The zombies obeyed the corpse king's orders and were willing to do anything even if they were told to commit suicide without hesitation. This world is rotten to the core. Ever thought of letting the zombies rule? Suhao sat down and asked right to the point. The corpse king's stiff features twitched slightly. Why do you want to help me? A choice is just a choice. Suhao smiled. He had the idea before he met the corpse king that he should either choose a random camp and finish it off by opening the level cap as soon as possible. The appearance of the corpse king gave Suhao a new idea. A brand new world of zombies plus market tattoos. What kind of chemistry would be combined? It was very exciting to look forward to. Suha knew very well in his heart that the only way to go against the old gods was for many civilizations to survive and keep opening the level cap. The corpse king didn't know why Suha did this, but his intuition was sharp. The human in front of him was dangerous. Extremely dangerous. He could kill himself anytime he wanted to. There was no need to waste words. I will only stay in this world for 15 days. Within 15 days, I will clear this area. Skeleton gang is the primary target. Su Hao thought clearly. As soon as the corpse king heard the skeleton gang, his blood pupils flashed. The boss of the skeleton gang is called Red Dragon, S-Class Awakening, not showing his face for a long time, and causing great harm to my clan. Su Hao nodded his head. It seemed that the corpse king had a high spiritual intelligence and expressed his thoughts more and more clearly, then unify all the zombies here to resist the skeleton gang. He spoke flatly. The corpse king shook his head. It's not that easy. The other zombie groups also have corpse kings. Although they are not as spiritually intelligent as me, they are more or less mutated. Well, then let's settle it tonight, and then go and exterminate the skeleton gang. Su Hao indifferently got up. He had a request of 10, 000 zombies that he had to fulfill. Help the zombie camp unify the zombies in the area of the skeleton gang. Eradicate the skeleton gang. A new task appeared. The zombie king hurriedly stood up, and Su Hao asked when he summoned the mech, Do you have a name? No. From today onwards. You'll take my surname and be called Su Ritian. Blood, broken flesh, entrails, and darkness became the dominant color here. The white bone cages imprisoned humans, most of which were predominantly female. They were thinly dressed. Some were even unclothed. Their eyes were hollow. And their bodies had a large number of scratches as well as scab marks. And some even had bulging abdomens. When the zombies walked by with a low roar, they sniffed the odor of their bodies and did not choose to gnaw on them. Rumble. Abruptly. The building shook and kept collapsing, startling out hundreds of zombies. The ghostly moonlight sprinkled down the street. 
A golden mech stood proudly, holding the blade of contempt, a giant scythe that was 15 meters long. When the golden armored finger lightly touched the blade of contempt, splendid soul, evoked, a black robe, covering the sky and the moon, holding a giant scythe with a skirt that danced with the wind, as if it was a god of death that had come from the underworld, floated behind the golden armor. Key, the god of death's black nails scratched across the blade of the blade of contempt, emitting a piercing sound similar to chalk scraping against a blackboard, instantly causing the zombie horde to fall dead silent. The blade of contempt has the effect of lowering the enemy's mental value. Next to the zombie king, Su Ritian looked at the soul of the blade of contempt and didn't know if he was stupid or had forgotten to express it. Roar! A roar shook the sky and earth. A giant shadow swept out from the zombie group. Extremely majestic flesh, like a cyber abstract muscle man, injecting gasoline, alcohol and other items towards his muscles, causing them to become weirdly larger and at the same time monstrous. But this zombie king is covered with purple tendons, and holding a dead woman in his arms, dripping with yellow liquid. The scene was once chaotic. Tank zombie. Attributes, strength 1000, defense 1000, speed 300, spirit 20, characteristics, good at ramming, weakness, ice, comments, is that you, survival road 2's tank, well, judging from the attributes, it's indeed a bit harder, Su Hao nodded slightly, the tank zombie's voice was like thunder, running from zero distance at a speed that was truly like a discharged cannonball, wrapped in a horrible sense of oppression and power, crushing, Su Hao gripped the blade of contempt, the golden mech was rendered mysterious by the death behind him, the torso floated, and with a bang like a fighter jet breaking through the sound barrier, swept out, poof, cold light flashes, the tank zombie from the crotch to the head was directly cut in half, the body surface is covered with green pulp, constantly smoking white smoke, the blade of contempt was paired with a corrosive effect, commonly known as a universal oil, suitable for most battles, corpse king Su Ritian looked at the tank zombie that died in seconds, his heart shook dramatically, and he was glad that he didn't fight with Su Hao, otherwise he would have died long ago, you control half of it, give me the remaining half, Su Hao shouted, Su Ritian hurriedly did as he was told, controlling half of the zombies to follow him, the blade of contempt became a sharp weapon to harvest life in Su Hao's hands, a head flew up and killed on the spot, dropped Wanrong crystals asterisk 1578, zombies blood asterisk 940, zombies liver asterisk 755, market coins asterisk 1000000, Drop attachment crystals, zombification, normal, asterisk 12. Poison fong, normal, asterisk 9. Poison blood, excellent, asterisk 5. Drop drawings, corpse roar revolver, asterisk 1. Female corpse shady scream gun, asterisk 3. Drop drawings, corpse roar revolver, asterisk 1. Female corpse shady scream gun, asterisk 3. The normal zombies drop didn't surprise Su Hao, and he glanced at the tank zombie while, desecration, was on at all times. Drop core crystal, super mega, excellent, asterisk 1. Mutant muscle, flawless, asterisk 1. 1 excellence, 1 flawless. Su Hao was quite satisfied. As he cleaned up the scene, he walked into the residence of the tank zombies. The place was fishy and stinky, and there were still many humans under siege, but all of them had their minds crumbled. When Su Hao gazed at their lower bodies, his face was expressionless, and he twisted his head away, while his hand armor retracted and the fireball engulfed them. Perhaps, death was the relief. To live, there was only suffering. After a day and night of killing, most of the zombies in the area of the skeleton gang either died out or were collected by Corpse King Su Ritian. 10, 000 10, 000 zombie kills have been completed. Equipped with 5 types of excellent grade crystals of the corrupted kingdom. Do you choose to break away from the rotten kingdom? No. Su Hao rejected on the spot. The quest of, illusion of beings, gave very generous rewards. Unless the survival time was up, then it must be crazy gripping. Do you guys need to rest? Su Hao asked casually as his facial armor retracted, revealing his face. Su Ritian shook his head. Ever since I turned into a zombie, I don't know what fatigue is. Quite good. Then you will have more time to study. Su Hao smiled. At dusk, attack the skeleton gang. For this plan, Su Ritian didn't have any opinion, or didn't dare to. The one day and one night battle had shown him Su Hao's terrifying battle power, which was simply more perverted than a zombie. All kinds of abilities came out endlessly as well as the bottomless amount of blood. Su Hao looked at the gradually setting sun, observing the five newly loaded excellence level crystals. Attachment crystal, super giant, level three thirds, quality, excellent. Effects, after loading, the size of the mech will increase by 100% and the speed will decrease by 50%. Accessory crystal, mutant muscle, grade two slash grade two, quality, spotless, quality, flawless, effect, after loading. 
the size of the mech will increase by 100%. Effect, when loaded, the mech strength will increase by 80%. Gain muscle armor effect. An increased shield value by 50 hundred points. Attachment crystal, corpse cannon, no effect. Quality, flawless. Attachment, corpse cannon, unrated. Quality, excellent. Effect, loads the mech with a new offense with toxin. Dealing 50 points of fixed damage to enemies. Once infected with the toxin, it continuously deducts 3 points of blood every second. Attachment crystal, corpse cannon, unrated. Attachment crystal, bone blade, grade 3 slash 3. Quality, excellent. Effect, transforms a mech's arms into razor sharp blades. Accessory crystal, B virus, grade 2 slash 2. Quality, excellent, effect, can be turned into a blade for each mech's arms. Effect, when selected, it will restore 1 point of blood every second by deducting 1 point of energy value. These 5 new accessory crystals were not what Suha wanted. They were purely for completing the mission. Bide your time and get ready to go. Skeleton Gang Headquarters. This place seemed to be built in the style of the 70s or 80s. A black fortress assembled with abandoned cars, train fragments and missile remnants, and even tank shells, constantly filling the sky with black smoke as if it was working on something. With layers and layers of connecting cargo crates, inhabited by people of different shapes and sizes. Some wore steel-studded leather armor, some were naked, and even more were covered in armor, highlighting the grotesqueness of the place. On the ground of the skeleton gang, there were train tracks that led to the outside, but there was no trace of any train at all, which was strange. As the line of sight went upwards, one could only see that the skeleton gang's minions were rushing to the main center, the boss's place of residence. The hides of various mutated monsters were spread out on the ground in a spacious setting, and one individual was kneeling on the ground, facing none other than the skeleton gang boss, Red Dragon. Red Dragon was cloaked and seated on a throne cast from scrap iron. The glass he was shaking in his hand was not wine, but milk. Tasting a mouthful revealed an obsessed expression but his eyes were incomparably stern, is the situation of the destruction of Spitfire City understood clearly? Boss, Spitfire City was completely wiped out, not a single one came out alive. From the traces, it looks like it was besieged by rats, the junior brother hurriedly replied. Red Dragon frowned deeply, rats, nonsense, dog is an awakened no matter what, would he be besieged by rats? Not only Spitfire City, strange things happen today as well, another junior brother hurriedly said. Many zombie territories were suddenly wiped out, and judging from the scene, it looked like they had been cut by some sharp weapon, and all of them were killed in a single blow. The shaking goblet stopped, and Red Dragon's eyes were deep. It looks like an outsider stepped into our jurisdiction. To be able to manage such a large crowd, as well as establish the skeleton gang to become the regional overlord, Red Dragon was definitely not stupid. Da da da. Suddenly, footsteps rang out sharply. Boss, outside, outside. The little brother in steel studded leather armor gasped. The zombies are surrounding us, looking for death. We couldn't find them, but instead we sent them to the door ourselves. The skeleton gang minions kneeling on the ground laughed angrily. With a wave of his hand, Red Dragon told his minions to go outside first, and after waiting until only he was left, he walked towards the side door of the room and opened it to see a body of flesh hanging inside, seemingly extracting something. No one can take them away. Red Dragon's eyes showed hostility as he slammed the door and left. At this moment, the skeleton gang was surrounded by a mountain of corpses and a sea of zombies, and the densely packed rotting heads emitted a foul odor. However, the zombie horde was awfully quiet, not making any sound. Where is Red Dragon? Let him come out. Suho stood at the front, his tone indifferent. The skeleton gang members looked at each other with shocked eyes. Never had they seen a mech like this before. Greed surfaced at once. Red Dragon appeared, holding a glass ball-like eye in his hand which he had dug out from some awakened person and made into a prop. He was smart enough to connect the recent events with the person in front of him and understood. Extreme danger detected. Bang! The glass eye exploded on the spot. Steam fire dragon. All enter battle stations. The red dragon's face changed in shock and roared. Su Hao. No. Who the hell is the boss? Woo woo. At that instant, the headquarters of the skeleton gang let out a hooter, and a large piece of steam rose into the sky, coloring the dusk with a blur. The earth shook, and steel constantly flew down from the skeleton gang, smashing the zombies into puddles of flesh. Under Su Hao's gaze, mutilations, steel fragments, and so on strangely connected together, producing drastic changes. Train. Oriental dragon appearance of a dragon train. Rumble. The train track carried the dragon-shaped train and instantly rushed out angrily, crashing towards Su Hao. Re Tian. Order your zombie group. Su Hao looked at the rushing dragon train with cold eyes. Kill all these people. Bang! In the next second, a stone-breaking loud sound echoed out, and the originally charging dragon-shaped train, 
wrapped in terrifying power, seemed to hit a huge mountain, crumbling inch by inch, its speed dropping abruptly. Zero blocked in front of the dragon train, his feet were only knocked back a few meters. Su Tian went from stupefied to slowed down in just one second, then let out a roar. Roar! The zombies were out in force, all pouncing on the dragon train, engaging in a fierce battle with the skeleton gang's headquarters. Red Dragon was located at the very top of the dragon train, his pupils quaking and his voice trembling. What kind of monster are you? You can call me savior. Or, Su Hao's mecha body was integrating into the dragon train, and suddenly smiled evilly. Call me the world destroyer. Metal overlord plus multiplication technique. The front part of the dragon train was changing into a black tank with a heavy shifting muzzle. The caliber was justice. Also, killing. When the red dragon driving the dragon shaped train saw the cannon's muzzle, his pupils contracted violently and he let out a roar. Fire dragon cannon. The dragon-shaped train quickly changed, forming a giant cannon in the shape of an oriental dragon, choosing to collide with Su Hao head-on, because he knew very well that defense would definitely not be able to block it. It might as well be a hard collision. Maybe there was still a chance. Boom! The black tank made the metallic sound of loading shells and exploded. A shell wrapped in smoke and angry flames, blasting towards the red dragon. Boom! The dragon cannon blasted furiously, and the shape of the shell fired was an orb synthesized from various steel debris but it differed too much from the tank shell in size. Rumble. The two cannonballs shook heavily together, emitting a deafeningly loud sound. However, cracks appeared on the surface of the steel orb until it finally blew up and affected the tank shell. The tank shell blew up as it did, turning into extremely forceful debris that swept through the entire skeleton gang dragon train. Poof, poof, poof. Countless skeleton gang members were instantly smashed into pieces, sending blood and flesh flying, including zombies. Red Dragon was counted as having better luck. Half of his scalp was cut off and blood flowed. An arm and a leg burst into pieces, causing him to howl in pain. Immediately afterward, the top of the black tank emerged as Su Hao, who was piloting the Zero, with mad poison in his hand, aiming at the Red Dragon. As a mission boss, you are indeed not qualified. His tone was flat. Red Dragon kept spitting out blood, his eyes terrified. Please, put. Before the words fell, the gunshot swept the sky. The wildly poisonous shrapnel was sprayed out like a storm, and the red dragon was shattered in an instant. It was like, a watermelon falling to the ground, with no bones left. The leader of the skeleton gang died, and the remaining men all panicked at the sight. We surrender. I have an old man at the top and a young man at the bottom. I beg to be spared. Big brother, I know everything. These scum trash raised their guns and surrendered, or harnessed their mechs and knelt on the ground. Seeing this, Suha looked down with cold eyes. All of them come out. Then kneel down. The people from the skeleton gang hurriedly did as they were told. Su Ri Tian, either kill or assimilate. Make your own decision. Su Hao's face was expressionless, his voice cold. The next second, miserable screams rang out continuously. Corpse King Su Ri Tian led the zombies to assimilate all of the skeleton gang. Core crystal dropped. Doomsday dragon amazing. Asterisk 1. Su Hao was slightly surprised. Did this desecrate the red dragon's awakening? Or was it some other crystal? Core Crystal, Doomsday Dragon Amazing, Level 0 slash Level 3, Quality, Epic, Effect, 1, Transform into a Dragon, Deduct 20% Energy Value, Drastically Change the Appearance of the Mech and the 4 Major Attributes, Currently Level 0, Enhanced by 70%, Level 1, 80%, Level 2, 100%, Level 3, 150%, 2 Starfire, Consume 200 Energy Value, Within an hour to reply to its own life value and that of its companions within 100 meters. Currently level 0. Reply speed is 50 slash S. Level 1, 200 meters. 75 slash S. Level 2, 300 meters. 100 slash S. Level 3, 500 meters. 300 slash S. 3 dragon patrol in the sky, ignores gravity, flies freely, and can mitigate 75% of any damage in midair. 4. Ancient Dragon Vein, anyone belonging to the Dragon Mech can enhance strength, defense, speed and spirit by 20% beside the holding Doomsday Dragon Amazing Mech, while the mech itself can get 0, 1% increase from the Dragon Mech, with no upper limit. When Su Hao saw the quality and introduction of, Doomsday Dragon Amazing, he couldn't help but suck in a breath of cold air. Extremely pure auxiliary epic core crystal, this damage reduction is so perverse, does it reduce when you fly? F asterisk CK. Ancient Dragon Vein? Uncapped? Shit. Even though Su Hao already possessed the epic level core crystal of, Son of the Sun, seeing, Doomsday Dragon Amazing, was still shocking. Epic level was so terrifying. What if it was legendary? Su Hao's breathing became rapid. 
It was imperative to get his hands on the legendary grade crystals, but I can't afford to raise a second epic level core crystal right now, he still sighed. One, son of the sun, had already drained Su Hao dry. 10,000 fusion crystals and market coins weren't a problem. The key was that the Salary King's fire seed was hard to get, have eradicated the skeleton gang, helped the zombie camp unify the region. Extreme sublimation condition March 4th. Do you choose to leave? No. Su Hao directly refused to leave. Wait until 15 days later. It had to be perfect. My lord. All assimilation is complete. Corpse King Su Ritian walked over. Very respectful. Su Hao nodded slightly. From now on, this place belongs to you. My lord. Can I ask why you want to help me? Su Ritian's crimson eyes were puzzled. A choice. After I leave, the market ripple will descend. And you will make good use of it then. Let's go. I'll take advantage of this time to give you some drawings. Su Hao didn't explain too much. Who knew if the Rotten Kingdom would survive? This game of God's Blue Star wasn't the only one. There were other civilizations that were opening their level caps. Moreover, civilizations could be invaded. The 15 days stipulated by the mission soon arrived. Su Hao was not idle during these days. Gifting the drawings he swiped out to Su Ri Tian, allowing him to have a higher start than others. My lord, if needed, I will repay you one day. Su Ritian gazed at Su Hao with a decisive tone. He didn't expect Su Hao didn't mind his zombie identity, but instead taught a lot of knowledge and gifted many crystals, drawings and props. This great favor would be hard to repay for eternity. Su Hao smiled. Maybe we can still meet. Congratulations you have survived 15 days. Rewarded with 10. 000 fused crystals asterisk 25. 000. Congratulations on killing 10. 000 zombies. Rewarded with market coin asterisk 5000000, corpse bone asterisk 10,000, corpse king spiny rib asterisk 900, corpse heart asterisk 500, choose the zombie camp, complete a series of quests and gain perfect favor with corpse king Su Ritian, rewarded with extreme drought demon mech drawing asterisk 1, trigger the hidden mission, descendant of the corpse king, rewarded with subsidiary crystals, berserk corpse demon armor asterisk 1, equipped with the required 5 crystals of excellence or above, Rewarded with Poison Sack Flying Dagger Weapon Drawing Asterisk 1, Skeleton Spike Gun Weapon Drawing Asterisk 1, Su Hao's pupils shook, what mech drawings were given, Extreme Drought Demon, the Drought Demon, the horrible zombie that existed in Chinese mythology, was even able to turn into a mecha, in Su Hao's previous life's memory, there was no information about the Extreme Drought Demon, he, the first possessor, code name, Drought Demon, quality, epic, material, infection, flesh and blood, Evaluation, half mechanic, half zombie, perhaps a new beginning, epic mecha. Su Hao's heart jumped when he saw the simple introduction of the drought mech. A look of ecstasy quickly climbed on his face. Su Hao happened to still have a primordial machine soul that he hadn't used. If it was used on the extreme drought demon, it would become a terrifying battle power in a short period of time. He was still settling in his joy, and he had already turned into a bit of starlight and disappeared without a trace. Su Ritian looked at Su Yun as he left and a mechanical voice emerged in his mind. Congratulations on becoming a member of the new era. Do you accept? Yes. Su Ritian's voice was deep. After saying that, the market ripple descended. A brand new civilization was born. Global briefing. Global notification. Chinese mechs, alone, have broken through the illusion of beings, opening up the level cap for all mechs in the blue planet. All mechs in China will have their resources increased by 15% in battle, and other countries by 5% for two months. From now on, the pet system will be activated. Anyone who gets a pet's gene or egg can hatch and become a mech's right-hand man. Warning, warning. A copy of the global invasion will land on every corner of Blue Star in 30 minutes. Please find a shelter or set up a defense device as soon as possible to avoid death. This series of global notification messages spread throughout the entire Blue Star in an instant. Engraved on every mech's operation panel, including being visible in the decaying stranger's shadow. Ward Law has, Solo, already broken through from the, illusion of beings, a mecha master from the United States of America spoke in shock online, Shiba old man, Dok, is simply a tumor, what's the point of opening the level cap so quickly, disaster is coming, Mets from the Silla nation spewed wildly, Baka, Sakura nation only suffered a blow from China and the effects of the market realm, and then another disaster, the Sakura nation Mets despaired, the level cap opening was truly a source of joy for some and sorrow for others, Adding to the pain was the fact that the disaster would come in 30 minutes. The sudden panic eroded every human's heart and mind. Huaxia Mecha Alliance. All mechs in Huaxia. Please guard your respective areas. Once you encounter an intruder, don't hesitate and kill them immediately. Please contact the local mecha organizations. Protect the elderly and children. Don't let them suffer any harm. 
Comrades, the time has come for the country to test us. Don't give up. Don't be discouraged. Huang Dust's powerful and decisive voice spread throughout the years of the entire Hua Xiamets. This moment was the moment for the Hua Xiamets to stand up and guard their homeland. Never to be cowards. Pre-war mobilization could drum up people's hearts and boost morale. 30 minutes might be short for some countries, but for Hua Xia, it was more than enough. Because the Hua Xia Mecca Alliance listened to Su Dishin and purchased high firepower crystals, Mecca drawings, and other supplies from Russia, while already casting them all, every city, coast, border and other places had already built a steel wall, carrying powerful high firepower defense measures, specifically to deal with the next disaster. Boom boom boom. The sound of heavy mechanical operations rang out, and the white mech was presented in the eyes of Huang Dust and the others, 8 meters high, white outer armor quite a sense of vision of the 90s, rib armor is clearly visible lines in the faint shine, operation walking mechanical arms swing like a giant warhammer, shoulder armor can be seen in the high rate of fire device, when shaking the head armor can be seen in the blue light reflecting the color of the operation of a little bit of the back armor from time to time auto detection can be seen on the back of the orange lightsaber as well as a 5 meter long white shield. Code name, Guardian Mech. Quality, excellent. Core crystal, self-contained guard, level 0 slash level 2. One light shield, holding the shield. It can form a particle light shield, or it can be interlinked with other forbidden mechs to form a larger and thicker light shield. 2. Penetration, behind the particle light shield. Attacks belonging to oneself or friendly troops can penetrate to hit the enemy on the other side. Mecha drawings similar to the forbidden guard mecha haven't appeared within China yet. It's a good thing we traded with Russia. Huang Dust sighed. This proposal mentioned by Su Xin is really good. For dealing with the next disaster. The Forbidden Guard mech is the first choice. When the Alliance Procurement Department said that it was a large-scale procurement of Forbidden Guard mech drawings, it was still a bit reluctant. Because it wasn't like there weren't any good mech drawings in the Chinese, decaying stranger's shadow. Why should they make a deal with Russia? But only after really looking at it did he realize that Su Xin was far-sighted. The Forbidden mechs could attack and defend and could also cooperate with each other. Most importantly, the materials needed could be easily brushed without having to go to any dangerous copies, making it the best basic mech to use in the early stages. Su Xin should be back. See if you can contact him. Huang Chen commanded. Long Jianchuan immediately complied, returning to Blue Star. Su Hao stood in a high-rise building, looking at the gloomy sky, and a global briefing surfaced on the operation panel, successfully broke through the illusion of beings. Your mech will receive two extreme sublimations. Upgrading the quality of the zero. Excellent superior. Strong changes in values. All stored experience returned. 2021. Machine zero's entire attributes have risen dramatically. Life value plus 500. Energy value plus 500. Armor plus 500. Shield plus 500. Strength. Defense. Speed. Spirit plus 100. Codename, machine zero, infinity. Level, 21. Quality, excellent. Life value, 63002520. Energy value, 52602104. Armor, 42351694. Shield, 58852454. Material, metal. Attributes, strength, 15436172. Defense, 10234092. Speed, 9363744. Spirit, 8133252. The above is the base value for extreme sublimation. Without the addition of crystals, Suha closed his eyes and felt that his flesh was undergoing a strong and drastic change, as if an endless power was glowing out from his body, and the raised corner of his mouth was even harder to press than AK. And in the end, he directly did not press it anymore. He opened his arms to meet the gale. Ha ha ha, that hearty laugh came out of his mouth, declaring his pleasure and excitement. For a level 21 mech to have 20, 000 plus life and energy values, it was simply not too crazy. Then if it broke through level 31 and had two more extreme sublimations, wouldn't it be nearly 100, 000 life values by then? Who is the biggest boss in the world? It's old me. The pet system was open along with the global invasion copy. So I already have a target then. Suho collected his emotions and looked deep into the distance. There was a cat type pet called Magic Die, an extremely rare pet that was only possessed during this period of the global invasion copy, and it was not an offensive type, but a supportive type. The reason why Su Hao chose it was that in his previous life, the magic dye was obtained by the Lin family of the three great families, and the person who acquired it was named Lin Xiaofu, who instantly became one of the top mechs in the global ranks. It was enough to illustrate how terrifying the magic dye's additions really were. Must get it, Su Hao's eyes were fierce. 30 minutes have arrived. Global invasion copy, billions of devils open. Rumble. As the tone fell, bursting sounds rang out from the skies all over Blue Star. 
as if the firmament was about to break apart. The devil race descended, and the sun lost its color. Darkness cracked and bloomed across the globe. Disaster came and kicked off. Rumble, blood and thunder exploded, like a bloody dragon breaking the tranquility of the blue star, shining with panic-inducing colors. Immediately afterward, a portal cast of blood and white bones of varying sizes appeared in the sky, earth, and other places all over the world. Connecting to the world of the demon race, grrrrr, fresh blood, fresh meat, I smell the flavor of life. Children, go on a killing spree. In the next second, a maniacal laughter emanated from the demon gate. Blood gushed out like a spring, spraying out from the portal while bringing out batch after batch of demonic monsters. There were even more demonic monsters that were more than 10 meters tall, as if they were born from the portal, wrapped in large swathes of blood that stained the ground red, causing gales of screams. Demon Soldier, Attributes, Strength 290, Defense 250, Speed 200, Spirit 90, Characteristics, Strong Flash, Good at Screaming, Weaknesses, Flames, Toxins, Comments, Does the Demon Soldier have a girl? I'd like to order a monkey wine. Demon Centurion, Attributes, Strength 350, Defense 400, Speed 150, Spirit 100, Characteristics, Good with Weapons and Melee Combat, Weaknesses, Flame, Toxin, Electricity. Evaluation. Press the FFFF button furiously. The devil soldier had wings on his back and held a black steel fork in his hand, with a fierce face, horns on his forehead, and red pupils, as if he was a wild dog that had eaten human flesh, exuding a sense of violence. The devil centurion is more than 10 meters tall. His body is bloated. His arms and legs as well as his chest and back are covered with black armor. One arm is holding a wolf's tooth stick. His face is green and fangs are fangs and his lower jaw canine teeth are long and slender, almost sticking into the flesh of his cheeks. The smell of sulfur is constantly spewing out when he is gasping for breath, and his roar is like that of a tiger, which is shocking to people's heart. The demonic invasion covered the globe, not only the wilderness, even places such as a certain toilet in a high-rise building in a big city, an office room, or even a shopping mall downstairs. Demon gates also sprung up. Ah, run, take the kids and run. Baby, come over to mommy and daddy's side. In a shopping mall, demon soldiers crashed through the walls, emitting ear-piercing screams, causing people to panic. In a flash, the crowd panicked, and it wasn't that they didn't want to run away, it was that every place was very dangerous right now, even at home. Not to mention that for 30 minutes, they were out and about. So what could they do when they got the news? Bang! Suddenly, a mecha in the form of a zero was half shattered by a demon soldier steel fork, revealing the cockpit, which was no match at all. Because even when the market ripple descends, there are still people who are afraid, unwilling to go to, decaying strangers' shadow, worried about death, and more willing to guard their wives and children. But in the face of an invasion by a foreign enemy who wanted to take his wife and child captive, this father went forward defiantly. Yes, he understood that he would die, but, with his wife and child in front of him, he would die to guard them. Ha ha ha. The demon soldier laughed wildly, his arrogant and insane appearance reflected in the child's fearful pupils a lifelong nightmare. Fuck this, come out big old men. When the Hanyu saw the child being grabbed, they glared, touching the market tattoo and summoning their mechs. Kid, close your eyes. In the next second, a cold and clear voice rang out. The grabbed child violently closed his eyes. The temperature in the mall suddenly rose, along with a mind-shattering chirping sound. Fire flashed like a meteor crossing the street, pinning the demon soldier in place. A wide and gentle steel arm held the child in place facing the hissing demon soldier alone. Kill. The flames dispersed, revealing a red-colored mecha. The female voice cold and merciless. Boom. The top of the mall shattered, and the forbidden mech presented an encircling situation to fall down, enveloping the demon soldiers, with the left hand of the breacher, infected appearance of the MP5, and the right hand of the shield, supporting the particle light shield. Kill. With a command, gunfire erupted. Bullets rained down, storming out. Dozens of demon soldiers roared with rage, crazily impacting the particle light shield, but just like a turtle in a jar, they were killed by the bullets running through their entire body, turning them into experience and materials for the alliance's mechs. The red-colored mecha mech was none other than Zhang Yao, who returned the child before healing the injured man. Clean up all of them, Zhang Yao ordered. The disaster had just begun. United States of America. Cries, screams, gunshots and so on were intertwined as if it was the twilight of the gods as said in the ancient western scriptures. The gods died and the world was in chaos. God, please save us. An old white woman knelt on the ground with her dead partner lying beside her, old tears streaming down her face as she kept bowing. In the store ahead, 
Black screened and rode mechs to grab food, TVs, game consoles, and other things, practicing zero-dollar purchases. Ah! Suddenly, some Asians, whites, and blacks were grabbed by the demon soldiers and demolished their whole body mechs, unresisting, and were directly taken away, not knowing where they would be taken to. Sakura Country, experiencing the destruction of the market realm, the shelling of Huaxia, and now the invasion of billions of devils, the Sakura Country can be said to be hurt by a thousand holes. Boom! The huge wolf tooth stick swung and collapsed the houses of the Shadow Village, but the next second, a number of ninja mechs appeared in midair, hands quickly forming seals, flames, ice, wind and other elements infested the demon centurion, and combined their efforts to surround and kill, but the devil soldiers like locusts swept through the entire Sakura country, everywhere in the dead, at the same time, whether alive or dead, will be taken away by the devil soldiers, seems to have some great use, Hua Xia, a scream filled with sadness and anger echoed out, before the global invasion copy came, Hua Xia had also warned Russia, Black Continent, Batai and other countries, which they took to heart and also minimized all the losses in the first place. As for the other countries to listen or not, that was their problem, and Huaxia didn't have the time to take care of it anymore. And just six hours after the invasion of the billions of demons, the dome of the sky suddenly changed with thunder and lightning, attracting the attention of mechs around the globe. What's going to happen again? A river of blood emerged from all over the world, surging towards the ever-spinning vortex of black clouds, as if summoning something. Bang! Bang! The sound of a strong and powerful heartbeat was like thunder stirring away, shaking the hearts and minds of all humans, the blood-covered supergiant embryo, as if it were a baby conceived and born in its mother's body, was growing strong as the river of blood poured in, and vaguely, one could still see the life forms that were gradually taking shape inside, demon emperor embryo, attributes, characteristics, weakness, the sudden embryo caused the mechs around the globe to feel pressure, like the powerlessness of a child facing an adult, Chinese mecha alliance, Huang Dust rode his mech and also saw the demon emperor embryo with a heavy heart. If he was allowed to hatch, would Blue Star still be saved? Su Xin is here. Long Jianchuan walked in and whispered. The haze in Huang Dust's heart instantly swept away most of it, and hurriedly invited Su Hao in. Su Hao walked in, followed by Yi Naifa, who also saw the forbidden mecha along the way and was satisfied. Su God, that devil emperor embryo. Huang Dust is a little worried. Su Hao waved his hand. Don't worry about him. You can't get him dead in a short time anyway. Now, team up to brush pet jeans or pet eggs, and get the pet out as soon as possible. In a short while, the duplicate quests will appear. That's when it will be the most intense. His gaze was like electricity and his voice was resounding. Just started the game and you think it's hard? It was still early. Huang Dust savored the flavor of Su Xin's two sentences and hurriedly asked, Isn't that what will happen after the invasion of the billions of demons? Long Jianchuan and the other's pupils shrunk slightly as they gazed at Su Xin. 24 hours after the billion demon race appears, there will be a global raider replica quest to gain all of humanity, all of the mechs. We only have 18 hours left now. We must brush out the pet genes and pet eggs in this time period. It will be even tougher next. The demon race hasn't completely attacked yet, and the pressure will be even higher then. But as long as there are pets, no matter what kind is cultivated, it's an enhancement to oneself. Su Hao looked at Huang Dust with a deep gaze and nodded slightly. 18 hours. It was as if a huge stone was pressed on the hearts of the crowd, and they seemed to be a little short of breath. Give me the message. How many, decaying stranger shadows, have been opened in China recently? Su Hao was as steady as a mountain. His voice calm. Long Jianchuan quickly replied. There are, 10,000 beasts, near Yangchang. Dragon and Tiger Scramble, in Gan province. And, Great Train Scramble, in the three eastern provinces. Enough to read that there were 15 new appearances, decaying stranger shadow. Minister Long, Sun Haoming. Yinifa and I will go to the 10,000 beasts in Yangchang. Su Hao didn't care about anything else. 10,000 beasts, appearing was the answer. Huang Dust was about to speak when Su Yin turned around and looked at him. Chief Commander, are there drawings of Black General and Female Grievance in the Alliance? There are drawings for Black General, a zombie mech, and Female Grievance doesn't have any, but it can be brushed. Huang Dust immediately agreed. Su Hao nodded. Remember to look at the reward order of the Obelisk Tower for me and notify me once the shackled body appears. There is one in the alliance. Do you want it now? Huang Dust hurriedly said. Hearing this, Su Hao didn't feel the slightest bit surprised. This was the time when the alliance had a lot of talents. It was normal for someone to change out the shackled body. Want to? Su Hao waved his hand. This was because the materials required for the extreme drought demon that he was going to make were complicated. Code name: extreme drought demon, required materials, 
shackled body asterisk 2, black general, mech asterisk 1, female grievance, mech asterisk 1, biomass asterisk 10, 000, contaminated flesh asterisk 5, 000, zombie blood asterisk 20, 000, yin and yang dan asterisk 1, marketplace coins asterisk 5, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000. shackled bodies are limited in number and not always available yet, depends on the rewards for each weekly rotation, black general mech, excellent level, female grudge mech, excellent level, the rest of the materials, they weren't in the way, Su Hao himself had them himself, Yin Yang Dan, this only came out from one place in the early days, and that was the 10,000 beasts, and the probability was extremely low, it was said to be only percent zero, zero nine, pet genes, pet eggs, and Yin Yang Dan can all be brushed at 10,000 beasts, which is why Su Hao chose it, at the same time, Su Hao also wanted to get the magic die, which was even more difficult, departure, Su Hao explained everything and took away Long Jinchuan, Sun Haoming, and Yi Nifa, Huang Dus looked at the faraway foursome, and his eyes became more and more determined, Sheep City, Chinese Mecha Sub-Alliance, as the commander of the Sub-Alliance, Chen Tang was so excited that he was covered in apprehension when he learned that the Yi Solo, Great God was coming, boom, it was as if one could hear the sound of a fighter jet breaking through the sky, the next second, the group of four landed at the entrance of the Sub-Alliance, and the Mecha Guards were quickly alerted, Unique, Great God, Minister Long, Chen Tang hurriedly came out and reached out his hand. Su Hao and Long Jianchuan shook hands with him and also explained the situation. Asking Chen Tang to mobilize the Mechs and go to 10,000 beasts, to brush things when they had free time. Chen Tang expressed his understanding, and behind him, Sun Haoming looked at the time display on the operation panel. His jaw dropped, and even took his hand and clapped it, indicating that it was right ah, the capital is more than 2, 000 kilometers away from Yangchang and it's more than half an hour away, he was stunned, this is damn near more than twice the speed of sound, Sun Haoming looked at Su Hao's back, worshipping him more and more, Yinifa's red eyes gazed at her master's back and couldn't help but lick her lips, her beautiful face revealing a pure and lustful smile, location, 10,000 beasts, level, 3, difficulty, simple, task, kill 500 ferocious beasts within 3 hours, description, the heart of the demon king has been taken away, is it a conspiracy or a coincidence? The ancient god mountain range has become a place where demonic beasts gather. In the wild mountains, the roars of the beasts were earth-shattering, shaking up the flying birds in the sky. In the lush mountain forest, the figures of Su Hao, Sun Haoming, Long Jianchuan, and Yi Nifa appeared. I'm going to explain the speed pass technique now, Su Hao said. Sun Haoming, Long Jianchuan concentrated. Yi Nifa, focused on looking at her master. Pet genes, pet eggs will become easier to obtain as the difficulty increases. When you guys familiarize yourselves with the process, you can increase the difficulty. 1. With the Black Demon Mountain as the center point, the Winged Tiger Colony will appear to the east of it, killing it will have a probability of dropping it. 2. After killing the Winged Tigers, move north and you will encounter the Demon Clan troops that have come to scout. There is a probability that multiple types of pet genes will appear. 3. Finish off the Demon Troops and set off towards the west. There will be traces of being trampled on with a very small probability of getting a complete pet egg. As Su Hao taught the techniques, he also led them forward to check them out. Any of the techniques he uttered corresponded with each other and the scene in front of them without any mistakes. Sun Haoming listened attentively and raised his hand to ask a question. Great God, how many can I obtain when I come down to simple difficulty? One to two with luck, no gain with bad luck. Su Hao replied. Long Jianchuan's heart was slightly shaken, and he couldn't help but ask. God Su, how do you know all this? The more contact I have, the more I can know some. Su Hao made up a sentence. Am I going to tell you that Laozi is a reborn person? Long Jianchuan gulped his saliva, worthy of being Su God. He knows so much. Su Hao turned his head to look at Yi Nifa, his gaze a little tender. Yi Nifa smiled faintly. Master, I've memorized everything. We've memorized it too. Long Jianchuan and Sun Haoming spoke in unison. Su Hao moved his torso and stretched. Good. Then quit the mission. Eh? Long Jianchuan and Sun Haoming revealed husky intelligent eyes. I don't play easy difficulty. Su Hao smiled mysteriously. Sun Haoming's throat was dry. Great God, you won't be going. Nightmare difficulty. Su Hao looked out at the clear sky and smiled coldly. If I don't blow this place up, the demon king here will still think that he's on the same level as me. Exiting. Location, 10,000 beasts. Level, 3. Difficulty, nightmare. Mission, kill 12 demon kings. Time limit 5 hours. Description, Demon Kings gather to fight for the heart. Rumble, 
The Black Demon Mountain shook violently, spewing out magma while wrapped in boulders, like a destructive catastrophe, spreading out in all directions. The forest was on fire, burning, causing a burst of animal roars. The sky was dim, and the demonic aura was rampant, giving a terrifying sense of oppression. And in the surroundings of the Black Demon Mountain, twelve demon kings were gathered, with different forms and ferocious battle power. The four of them, Su Hao, showed up, other than Su Hao himself. The remaining three felt the pressure multiply. Great God, how to battle. Sun Haoming tried his best to keep himself calm, but his voice was still a bit shaky. Su Hao spoke calmly. Let's see if we can take twelve demon kings in seconds. Seconds, Sun Haoming Long Jianchuan was dumbfounded. Are you serious? Immediately after, Su Hao's head armor flashed with red light, just like a heavenly blade that ruled for heaven. Blasting out. What do you see in the eyes of Long Jianchuan, Sun Hao Ming, and Yi Nifa? Black Devil Mountain. Exploded. The entire Black Demon Mountain seemed like a lit cannonball, completely exploding at this moment. The sky burst into flames and firelight shot up into the sky, smashing down huge stones in all directions, causing a roar. Among them, five of the demon kings died instantly, without pain, and went particularly smoothly. The remaining seven demon kings were more or less traumatized. All of them showed a look of horror or fury, staring straight at Su Hao. Long Jianchuan's jaw dropped, and his mouth seemed to be wide enough to stuff an egg into it. Sun Haoming was dumbfounded, rubbing his eyes frantically, suspecting that what he saw was an illusion. Yi Nifa happily applauded. Master is awesome. Su Hao's expression was calm as he was aiming at the Black Demon Mountain, thinking that he could take the Twelve Demon Kings away by the way, probably overthinking it. Don't get too far away from me, or you won't be able to eat the experience. He reminded. His mechanical arms combined into a blade of contempt, and he rose into the air, swept out like Superman. Soul Splendor. The blade of contempt was evoked with the soul of the weapon, transforming into a god of death floating behind Su Hao and the aura of death instantly eroded the seven demon kings. Small generation, do you really think that you can kill us with your puppet art? A demon king with a goat's head in a human body held a walking stick, and his voice was like a loud bell as he rebuked. Noisy, Su Hao sounded indifferent and waved the blade of contempt. At this moment, blood-colored traces appeared in the void, resembling the god of death coming to harvest lives. Roar, the tiger king roared, and sound waves visible to the naked eye surged like waves. However, the sound waves were too small in front of the blade of contempt, slicing through it on the spot. Plop, the sheep king, and incidentally the tiger king had their heads severed by the awe-inspiring cold awnings, cavorting blood three feet high. The head flew up, and the god of death transformed two cold awnings and chopped it into smithereens. The remaining five demon kings had their livers and guts split. What kind of monster is this? Trigger weapon master. Increase weapon damage by plus 200%. Trigger strike gain plus 150%. Trigger my blood boiling. Attack speed plus 35%. Trigger absolute control. Damage gain plus 30%. Overclocking activated. Armor strengthening. Strength. Armor. Shield plus 50%. The buff stacked. The zero emitted brilliant colors in the void. Dancing like a golden meteor. Holding onto the blade of contempt. The apparatus was growing stronger with the naked eye. Doubling technique. 15 meters 30 meters. The giant scythe of death. Coming to collect life. The demon king fell, and the world was at peace. Long Jianchuan and Sun Haoming, who saw the scene not far away, no longer knew what expression to use. Too perverted, too demonic. If Sushin fought like this in every battle, it would be impossible to catch up. I've upgraded. So fast. Sun Haoming felt the changes brought about by the mech and was shocked beyond compare. Long Jianchuan's eyes were now producing changes when he looked at Su Hao. It was fortunate that this kind of pervert was born in China. 2122. All attributes of zero rise slightly. Life value plus 500. Energy value plus 500. Armor plus 300. Shield plus 400. Strength. Defense. Speed. Spirit plus 300. The higher the quality of the mech, the more attributes it would have after upgrading than before. At this moment, materials, drawings, and props kept popping out from the Demon King's corpse. Desecration. The ghost lay on the corpse and kept licking it. Explode again. Explode again. Drops one Rome crystals asterisk 822. Market coins asterisk 100000. Demon King's heart asterisk 5. Iron heart water and fire stick weapon drawing asterisk 1. Biomass asterisk 300. Demon breath asterisk 2100. Drop core crystals, goat king's power asterisk 1. Overlord tiger asterisk 1. Drop subsidiary crystals, vitality asterisk 9. Might asterisk 5. Martial art asterisk 8. Flowing fire asterisk 3. Drop props, cat gene asterisk 1, 
Canine gene asterisk 2. Pet egg asterisk 1. Suha was not surprised by the number of pet genes that popped out. This is still a drop bonus of desecration. If you do it differently, this level would not dare to challenge the nightmare. Pure and simple looking for death. Two core crystals Suha blanced at. Core crystal, power of the goat king, level 0 slash level 3. Quality, perfect. Effect. 1. Demonic art rotation, contains 18 types of demonic art. Each has a level high and low. The higher the harder it is to trigger. Inflicts damage related to the elemental probability of the mecha. Currently level 0 inflicts, 20% plus elemental probability. Level 1, 35% plus elemental probability. Level 2, 50% plus elemental probability. Level 3, 100% plus elemental probability. 2 Mad Sheep Bloodline, using any kind of element will deepen the mecha's madness value. And when it breaks through the value of 100, it will cause pain to the brain. But at the same time, the bludgeoning rate will increase with it, increasing the multiplication rate with the pain 1 colon 1. Core Crystal, Overlord Tiger, level 0 slash 2. Quality, perfect. Effect. 1. Gilded Tiger Stripe, consumes energy value continuously. 3 slash S, maintains golden markings all over the body. Can increase strength by 30%, level 1, 50%, level 2, 100%. 2 Tiger Whistle, consume 150 energy value, can cause short-term unconsciousness to the enemy, 300 fixed damage, 3 Tiger King form, change the operating form of the mech to meet the enemy in a beast-like posture, enhance strength, speed by 40%, reduce defense, spirit by 40%, at this time, Long Jianchuan and the others also came over, and when they looked at the densely packed drops all over the place, they were numb, usually brush copies, basically after passing the level to take rewards, even if it is to kill monsters burst out of the things, cannot be so much, but this situation seemed to be quite habitual in front of Su Xin, Hao Ming, this one is for you, Su Hao threw something, Sun Hao Ming hurriedly caught it, and his breathing became ragged after inspecting it, this core crystal simply fit perfectly with himself, he was SSS ranked, elemental affinity, and pairing it with the Sheep King's power, was the best choice at the moment, independent crystal, elemental affinity, Grade, SSS. Effect. One elemental holy king, all elements will become your loyal slaves. With 10% triggering a double effect. Two elemental favored child, you are the most favored child of the elemental god. And triggering any element will increase by 100%. 3. Elemental blessing, using any element will increase the temporary shield. Stacking indefinitely. When Suhao saw Sun Haoming's independent crystals, he sighed. Worthy of being the main force of the Chinese mecha alliance. Elemental affinity, is so perverse. It could be said that as long as Sun Haoming's energy value was sufficient, he was completely in the form of an Inquisitor FA master. The tricks are told. Leave the newcomers to brush pet genes or pet eggs respectively. Su Hao said as he exited the copy. As for himself, he was even going to single brush the hell difficulty, 10,000 beasts. Facing the gods here. Sheep City. Chinese Mecha Sub-Alliance. Hurry up. All gather and wait for orders. Chen Tan called out the awakening level C and above, with mecha levels between 15 and 20. All of a sudden, outside the rainy and cloudy sky, a mecha stood proudly, the rainwater hitting it and making metallic sounds. Long Jianchuan, Sun Haoming, and Yi Nifa led three people into the 10,000 beasts, respectively, and after familiarizing themselves with it, the others would then distribute them down, brushing out genes and eggs in as short a time as possible. Location, 10,000 beasts. Level, 3. Difficulty, hell. Quest, face the demon father head on. Description, finally. He has been revived. The combined efforts of the demon kings to surround him did not cause him to fall asleep or die. But instead, he was devoured. He, who is about to kill everything in sight. Su Hao looked at the description. His demeanor indifferent, oh, then you're very brave oh. I'd like to see if you can give me pleasure. Revenge. I want to take revenge. Let those people or demons who would set me up, besieged me, and hurt me. All pay the price. Magma continuously erupted from the broken black demon mountain, and a figure slowly stepped out from it. Purple skin, covered in scales, with a subtle and profound pattern from his chest to his back, just as the bloodline was slowly being awakened. Slender figure, well proportioned muscle distribution, blood hair like a waterfall, like Ashura returning from hell. The moment he lifted his eyes, his killing intent was like the sea, tyrannical and terrifying, shattering all the scenery for dozens of miles in front of him. 10 Commandments Demon Sovereign. Attributes, Strength 2600, Defense 3000, Speed 2300, Spirit 2900. Characteristics. 1. Heavenly Demon Shadowing Technique. 2. Arousing the True Self. 3. Thunderbolts. 
Fort Demon Returning to the Origin. Comment, you're not the hero of a revenge novel, give it a rest. I am the embodiment of revenge. I'm also the true essence of disaster. Everything that is, I want. Sorry to interrupt, but can I put a bullet in your head? The last god was generous enough to let me crash a shot. The Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign was in the middle of issuing a declaration when he heard an untimely voice, and instantly looked up into the firmament. His eyes as cold as ice but violent and abnormal. The golden mecha hovered in the void, both hands holding the mad poison. The solar core of his chest was like a nuclear reactor constantly rotating, granting a powerful momentum. Mortal, how dare you be in front of me? I will tear you to pieces. The Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign had been consumed by the flames of vengeance. His pupils were crimson, and his roar shook the heavens. Rumble, the dark clouds crumbled piece by piece, falling down like fragments in a bizarre manner. In the next moment, the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign rose up in the air, and when his arms unfolded, demonic aura spread across the sky, and a sense of oppression that covered the sky filled the air. The sky was dark, as if it was caught in an endless cycle. Suddenly, a bizarre purple light shone, transforming into a demonic beast head that was over a hundred meters in diameter, emitting screams that pierced the eardrums and tore the soul. Heavenly Demon Sky Shading Technique I like bosses like you that are direct. Su Hao sneered. The Zero's head armor was filled with a ferocious red light, blasting out violently. This red light was truly like a ship chopper from beyond the starry sky, shining through in all directions. Boom boom boom. The heads of the demonic beasts exploded apart as much as they could, and the solar flare's momentum did not diminish as it rushed down at the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign. Thunder Treasure Code. Thunder Beast Blade. The Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign roared. Purple thunder rumbled around him and emerged, thick as a dragon coalescing in his hand to transform into a thunder blade that was about 20 meters long. When he swung it, wind and thunder swept across the sky, stirring up chaos in the sky dome. It was amazing. Boom. Thunder beast knife shattered on the spot. Solar flare, terrifying and carrying high temperatures, drowning the Ten Commandments demon Zoon. Minus 232,992. Suhao looked at the numbers floating up above the Ten Commandments demon Zoon's head and felt his own scalp numb. One shot of, solar flare, 230. 000 damage. He just wanted to try how the damage of full power was. How did he know that he directly spiked the god of hell difficulty? Do you believe me when I say I didn't do it on purpose? Su Hao walked towards the front, looking at the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign that had already turned into charcoal, and gave a kind smile. Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign, do you think I can still answer you? You should know that this damage is purely a bonus from, Son of the Sun, and the rest hasn't even been counted yet. Sufficient light, all attributes plus 500%, plus solar flare, fire elemental 500% damage, plus own attributes. With this value, no god is good enough. Drop 10,000 fused crystals pack asterisk 1. Demon sovereign's blood asterisk 1. 10 commandments remnants asterisk 5. Sable pet gene asterisk 2. Drop core crystal, dragon slayer asterisk 1. Drop subsidiary crystal, heavy sword giant blade asterisk 1. Don't look at the few things dropped by the 10 commandments demon sovereign, but it's actually still touching out by, desecration and they're all good things, 10,000 molten crystals pack, type, props, effect, after use, there is a probability of obtaining 503,000 wanron crystals, core crystal, dragon slaying demon, level 0 slash 3, quality, epic quality, epic, effects, 1, demon suppression, all dragon mechs and dragon monsters will receive an additional 30% damage, level 1, 50%, level 2, 75%, level 3, 100%, 2, Epileptic Sword, sword stained with the blood of the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign, can confuse the spirit of a creature and turn it into a madman, deducting 1, 0, 0, 0 energy value, lasting 30 minutes. 3 Demon Spirit, any souls left behind by the dead can be collected and later enhanced by 20% spiritual strength. Level 1, 30%. Level 2, 40%. Level 3, 50%. Evaluation, Dragon Slayer finally becomes a dragon. Attachment Crystal, Heavy Sword Giant Blade, Grade 0 slash Grade 5. Quality, Excellent, Quality, Excellent. Effects, Loading to Melee Weapons increases the weapon's attack range by 3 meters. Level 1, 5 meters. Level 2, 8 meters. Level 3, 10 meters. Level 4, 15 meters. Level 5, 20 meters. Evaluation, I'll let you run 19 meters first. The Core Crystal of the Control Burst. Suha looked at the, Dragon Slaying Demon, Crystal and directly threw it into the warehouse. Even epic core crystals actually had a difference between high and low. However, this measurement depended on the individual. Suhao's basic attributes were too high nowadays. There was no such thing as field control, just burst, and high battle power crystals were enough to add to it. 
the son of the sun was the best choice. However, its burst rate was too low and too low, and there was only one for Su Hao globally. Besides, even if someone else had a burst of luck and got it, could he afford to raise it? Keep brushing the hell difficulty. Su Hao exited. In other people's eyes, hell difficulty is fighting for your life with death. In his eyes, hell difficulty is just a bit more boss blood. In the twinkling of an eye, Su Hao came back. The Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign was yelling again, but after seeing Su Hao, his voice was low, Griffin, you disgust me, I'm in a hurry, Su Hao rode the zero, the void exploded, the sound barrier blasted, and crashed into the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign, there was a bang, the Ten Commandments Demon Zune was held by Su Hao's head, and Mad Poison took advantage of his inattention and stuffed him inside his mouth, pulling the trigger, shrapnel burst, Trigger Weapon Master plus Blast Gain plus My Blood Boils plus Soul Splendor plus Absolute Control. Minus 12,978. Minus 24,846. 12,978 minus 24,846. Minus 35,555. Minus 12,978. In an instant, a large swath of yellow numbers mixed with some orange numbers and a very small amount of red numbers shown on top of the operation panel. The Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign's head blossomed and he didn't even manage to survive for more than 5 seconds, drop 10,000 fused crystals pack asterisk 2, market coin asterisk 50, 000, vitality, flux, ignition asterisk 3, drops demon sovereign's blood asterisk 1, cat pet gene asterisk 3, canine pet gene asterisk 2, pet egg asterisk 1, still a mutt? Suha looked at the dropping of different types of pet genes and made a casual remark, in, 10,000 beasts, both pet genes, pet eggs, and Ian and Young Dan, as well as 10,000 Rome Crystals packs could be said to be a very comprehensive copy at the moment. Can't brush it out? Then completely brush burst. Location, 10,000 beasts. Tier, 3. Difficulty, difficult. Mission, kill the demon army that came to gather at Black Demon Mountain in a time limit of 3 hours. Description, there seems to be a change in Black Demon Mountain. The demon king has a bad feeling, but hopes to be wrong and sends an advance army to observe. Boom boom boom. What should have been a clear white sky became dim at this moment, as meteorite after meteorite with a diameter of more than 50 meters bombarded irregularly towards the bottom. The starlight shone brightly, the earth shook, and a thick and terrifying magical aura filled the air. In the void, a colorful mecha wearing magic robes and a magic cap swirled with mysterious light, shaking the skeleton scepter in its mechanical hand. Vaguely, an illusory goat pattern emerged from the back of the magical mech, and the constantly dripping blood of the goat's pupils exuded madness. Trigger crazy goat bloodline. Insanity value plus 10 plus 10. 100. Arcane divine light. A gritted and dull low roar came from the magical mech. The skeleton scepter was raised high. Minus 8000. Minus 6500. Minus 9100. 9100. Minus 4444. Minus 5666. All of a sudden, the sky was dark, and the only thing that could be seen were 18 purple arcane rays falling from the sky carrying a terrifying pressure that blasted the demon army below, all of them, into dregs. The three alliance rookies carried by Sunhelming felt the thrill of soaring experience, as well as the rewarding feedback from the absorption of the ruin pattern. Is this what it feels like to be carried flying? They murmured. Rank, 22. Codename, 7 colored magic mecha. Quality, flawless. Life value, 5000. Energy value, 8000. Armor, 4500. Shield, 9500. Material, metal, attributes, strength 150, defense 1300, speed 921, spirit 1900, core crystal, power of the goat king, level 3 thirds, independent crystal, elemental affinity, full level, subsidiary crystals, life force, chuan flow, transcendent shield, arcane magic, minor meditation technique, fire mature, mystic mature, ice mature, soul grinding technique, lord sun helming. You should be the first person in the entire alliance. The alliance rookie patted his ass. Sun Helming sniffed, but couldn't half smile. I'm the number one? What do you take Sushin for? Don't say such words in the future. Sun Helming's voice was deep. Remember the point you just made, and brush your pet jeans immediately after going out. Yes, the alliance rookie didn't dare to ask more questions. Trembling with fear, Sun Helming looked into the sky with a heavy heart. The billions of demons descended for almost 24 hours. I wonder how Sushin is doing. Never resting. I don't know how it is with the hell difficulty kill. Can't drag Sushin back. I want to become the first person under the strongest and help him again. Sun Helming willed himself firmly. How many times was this the hell difficulty? 
Su Hao himself had forgotten. Anyway, the Ten Commandments demon Zun was killed by him, and either he was seconded, or he was beaten to the point of wailing with broken blood, without the dignity of being a demon Zun. Weapon Master plus Blast Game plus Multiplication Art plus My Blood Boils plus Absolute Control plus Splendid Soul plus Apparatus Multiplication. The volume of the Mad Poison crazily skyrocketed, and the energy value was also decreasing crazily and sharply at the same time. Until finally, a shotgun with a height of over 10 meters was aimed at the Ten Commandments Demon Sovereign, practically jamming its entire muzzle against his skull. There was a bang. The shrapnel that was fired was more like an iron gate, whistling out, wrapped in heat and white smoke drowning the Ten Commandments Demon Father. The earth exploded and smoke rose into the sky. Another second. Out. Suhao finally smiled. Dropped 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 422. Demon Sovereign's Blood asterisk 1. Ten Commandments Fragment asterisk 3. Yin Yang Dan asterisk 1. The Yin Yang Dan was one of the main materials for crafting the Extreme Drought Demon. One was enough, and the burst rate was really low, and various additions as well as the profanity, which was also brushed for a long time before it came out. He glanced at the results of more than 10 hours. One Rome Crystal Stone Pack Asterisk 20? Market coins over 5 million. Demon Sovereign's Blood. 10 Commandments Fragments. Two rare materials number over 100. And a variety of pet genes also over 100. Pet Eggs 50. In terms of crystals, there are more than 200 core crystals and subsidiary crystals. With Ordinary and Excellent occupying 70%. Excellent and Flawless occupying 20%. And Perfect Epic occupying 10%. For drawings, there was a good amount of mech and weapon drawings, ready to be given to the alliance, which he couldn't use anyway. There were also pet drawings, codename, creepy cat, life value, 150, attributes, strength 10, defense 10, speed 20, spirit 20, pet crystal, guile cane, self crystal, effect is stealth, level 0 to 5, codename, sonic sable, life value, 100, attributes, strength 5, defense 25. Speed 20, Spirit 5, Pet Crystal, Sonic Shield, comes with Crystal, Effect is Stealth, Level 0 out of 5, Pet Crystal, Tone Shield, comes with Crystal, Effect is to increase Shield, Level 0 to 5, Code Name, Guard Dog, Life, 300, Attributes, Strength 30, Defense 30, Attributes, Strength 30, Defense 30, Speed 10, Spirit 0, Pet Crystal, Deterrence, comes with Crystal, Effect is to Fear Enemies, Level 0 to 5, these pet drawings, Su Hao couldn't even look at them. His goal, there was always only one, and that was the demon Dai. Code name, Magic Dai. Life value, 1000. Attributes, Strength 50. Defense 50. Speed 50. Spirit 200. Pet Crystal, Devil Emperor's Blessing, comes with a crystal that has a probability of the following effects appearing, level 0 slash level 3. One bludgeoning forced lock, will bludgeoning chance forced lock at 200%, lasts 5 seconds. 2 doubling of resources and experience, doubling the amount of resources and experience gained for 5 seconds. 3. Unlimited bullets, any firearms and weapons, no need to change bullets, lasts 3 seconds. 4. Spiritual infection, host becomes bloodthirsty, 100% mental enhancement, lasts 10 seconds. Unlimited energy, any crystal no longer consumes energy, lasts 5 seconds. 6. Death whisper, any crystal effect can be released in seconds, lasting 3 seconds. This was the reason why Su Hao wanted to get the demon die. The self-contained, demon emperor's blessing, pet crystal was too scary. It's almost time. He exited the copy. Huasha Mecha Sub-Alliance. The 10,000 beasts, copy had been completely surrounded by the alliance's mechs. Coming in and out, specifically to brush pet genes and pet eggs. When Long Jianchuan saw Su Shen appear, he hurriedly greeted him. Su Shen, 24 hours are almost up. I know. Su Hao was calm. Trade with me. Done, applied to you for a trade. Accept or not. Accept. Trading boxes appeared on the left and right sides of the operation panel. But in the next second Long Jinchuan's eyes almost stared out. Epic grade core crystals 5 sheets. Perfect grade core crystals 8 sheets. Weapon mech drawings. He read with a shivering mouth. At this moment, Long Jinchuan's heart set off monstrous waves. Epic grade core crystals were rarely found in the entire blue planet. Not to mention the Huaxia Mecha Alliance. Sushin had 5 of them in one shot. This is simply not fucking human. Su Hao's idea was simple. If you treat me well, I will treat you well. Besides, if you can't use it, give it to the alliance, so that they will think about their own goodness. And when the time comes, anything good will be the first choice as him. Countdown begins. 29 59. Billions of devils copy mission opens. In 30 minutes, 
the billion devils will conduct their first wave of large-scale attack. At this moment, the global disaster had truly begun. The scene was noisy, but only Su Hao and the others were particularly calm. Hao Ming remember to hatch the hud dog. It's hard to discipline, but it also depends on the character. But it belongs to a kind of guard dog, and at the same time it can replenish the energy value for you anytime, anywhere. Remember one thing, if you want extreme output, choose a cat type pet. If you want to pass the level steadily you can choose a canine type pet. Other pets have their own characteristics, offensive, auxiliary, and balance three types. If you can hatch one, then don't hesitate. You can still hatch the others later anyway. Su Hao's majestic voice echoed out, suppressing the panic instantly. The crowd immediately did as they were told, following Su Shen's orders. After arranging it, Su Hao held Yan Afa's hand. Cold. Yan Afa, I have a pet drawing of the ice and fire iron eater here, and the jeans as well, so you make it. Okay, master. Yan Afa revealed a sweet smile. Codename, ice and fire iron eater. Life value, 500. Attributes, strength 300, defense 500, speed 100, spirit 0, pet crystals, 1 iron eating, eat any substance and take 50% of the value back to the owner's mech. 2 ying yang conversion, ice and fire iron eaters have two forms, can be used in close combat or long distance combat, attribute, power 300, defense 500, speed 100, spirit 0, pet crystal, 1. Yanafa didn't hesitate to comply with her master's order and incubate the pet egg in the casting bin. Su Shun. Didn't you hatch it? Long Jianchuan saw that Su Hao was looking into the distance and asked in a low voice. Su Hao waved his hand. I'm not in a hurry. Besides, the ones suitable for me haven't been brushed out yet. Long Jianchuan stopped asking. He knew very well how terrifying Su Hao's battle power was. And Nightmare and Hell difficulty said pass. There was no need for them to worry about it at all. Su Hao's pet target was always only one. And that was the magic dye. A large number of infected mechs were needed to be injected into the pet egg. Paired with the magic dye drawings to produce mutations, the casting process could lead to death, so the success rate was horribly low. Otherwise, there was only one case of success in the last life. Countdown 5 seconds, 4 seconds, 3 seconds, 2 seconds, 1 seconds, 0. Officially opening the Billion Demon Race Copy Mission. I hope that mechs around the world will actively participate. Current progress. 1 Global Demon Raider progress, 100%. 2 Devil Race Leaderboard, 32 Devil Generals, 8 Devil Marshals, 1 Devil King, is showing up with time. 3 special rewards can be obtained by killing the strongest demon race members on the leaderboard. In 1 minute, the Billion Devils will launch the first wave of large-scale attack on Blue Star. Countdown 59 seconds. Prepare for battle. Chen Tang protect the hospital and other places. Don't let the demons take people captive. All concentrate. Long Jianchuan's gaze instantly coalesced and his voice roared out like a bell. Yes. The mechs revealed a resolute look at the words and droned in unison. Su Hao was calm and composed. Have everyone change into virus attributes? Most of the demon race are physical combatants. Good. Long Jianchuan agreed. Freezing plus toxin equals virus, can inflict additional 50% damage to flesh. When Su Hao and the others walked out from the area of 10,000 beasts, the sky had already changed color. The devil emperor embryo was bathed in rivers of blood irrigated from all over the world. And the wind and clouds changed color to scarlet. Deeply shocking countless people's hearts and minds. Billions of demons attack. Boom boom boom. All of a sudden, the sky and the earth were filled with thick and heavy demonic chi, converging into a demonic gate that connected the terrifying worlds, and a large number of demonic soldiers emerged. The densely packed numbers were like locusts, covering the sky and earth, flooding half of the city in an instant, wrapped in terrifying oppression, eroding everyone's spirit. Open the thunder wall. Vulcan, kill me. Chen Tang's eyes filled with blood as he roared. There was a buzz. Golden lightning surfaced above the city. And on closer inspection it was actually chains strung together. Intercepting all the demonic soldiers swooping down from the sky. Immediately after that, the high firepower devices on the steel city walls shifted their direction. Firing bullets furiously at the demon soldiers. Poo 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 poo. The demon soldiers were shot by the Yi Vulcan in an instant. And thousands of them fell down. Blood and flesh flying around like a rain of blood. The pressure was relieved for a short period of time. However, the demon soldiers that kept emerging from the demon gate were defiant and tried to tear the thunder wall apart with their flesh. This made Chen Tang and the rest of them look on in horror. Actually not afraid of death? They would rather sacrifice than tear apart the defense. Report report report. A large number of demons have appeared outside the city walls. And there are some different ones. Suddenly, an anxious voice came. Leave it to me. However, a more reassuring voice came from that golden battle armor. Suha took Yanafa and teleported to fly towards the sky. 
falling towards the city wall location. As he flew, he could still hear bursts of cries coming from below. Mom and Dad, where are you guys? I'm so scared. Quickly follow the uncles. Don't ever come out, okay? Go to the hospital. It has become a temporary ambulance. The Alliance was transferring the old, the weak and the sick. Only the cries on the way were heartbreaking. Even with advanced precautions, it was still impossible to stop some of the deaths. Master. Yanapa seemed to feel his master's mood swings. Su Hao's voice grew cold. Killing all the demons is the best result. Rumble. The big waves overturned the sky. Fierce as thunder. Slapping the city wall and shaking it continuously. A gate of the demon race presented itself and stood above the sea. From which demon race monsters continuously swept out. Some monsters were born with human heads. Lion heads. Wolf heads. Ten meters tall. Holding large swords in each hand treading on the waves, roaring and shaking the steel city walls. There were also demonic humanoid monsters, holding staffs, descending absolute freezing between shakes, freezing the sea in front of them, providing a combat zone. When the frozen sea formed, a heavy sound was emitted from within the gate of the demon race, and a massive rotting monster, tugging on giant instruments, appeared in the eyes of the defending mechs. The giant instruments were similar to siege cannons, but they used all the power of the demon race converging into a ball of black flames with a diameter of more than 50 meters, burning the sky and flying towards the city walls. This was the battle of extermination against the human race. If you are strong, you will be strong. If you are weak, you will die. Rumble. The black flame ball smashed into the steel city wall, emitting a stone-breaking loud sound, and the thunder wall even shook slightly, seemingly about to disconnect. Kill. The mechs filled their pupils with blood and began to kill the demons. The guns fired in unison and the cannons were firing. Boom, boom, boom. The black flame ball cut through the sky, like a heavenly disaster, falling from the sky, causing the defending mecha division to reveal a hideous expression. Destroy it. Gunfire fired and poured into one of the black flame balls, scattering it on the spot. However, the other black flame balls were still coming in strong. Heavenly meteor fire blade. Abruptly, a mecha wearing a green robe swept towards the sky dome, facing the falling black flame balls and drew its blade to face them. Clang. The light of the blade shone brightly, dissecting the black flame ball directly from the sky, shocking countless mechas with their jaws dropping. Clang! Another knife, roaring, the black flame ball was directly sliced into four petals, the power suddenly reduced. But when the saber mech still wanted to kill the rest of the black flame balls, it was already too late. Chop! Suddenly, the blade seemed like a galaxy, blasting out. All the black flame balls instantly turned into two halves, followed by shattering apart, instantly dissolving into difficulty. Unique, God, the mechs were surprised. Suha looked down at the incoming demons and laughed coldly, comparing numbers with Miha. Rat King. Logged on. On top of the steel city wall stood Suha's golden mecha. Next to it stood Jinaifa who looked like a proud snowfrost, holding a staff, her blood pupils gradually cold. Looking down on the demon race, the knife guest mech waved its left hand, shooting out hook claws, returning to the city wall from midair, and letting out a respectful voice. Solitary God. Blade guest, suits you well. Su Hao nodded slightly. He knew who this person was. The number one mecha master in Guangdong province. Feng Xin. Feng Xin was awakened to the S-class, King Blade Master. And with only a blade, without using any long-range weapons, he killed his own path of mechs in the invasion of hundreds of millions of demons. You specialize in killing demon centurions. The weapon drawings dropped on it are very suitable for you. Su Hao made a suggestion. Feng Xin's eyes changed color slightly in the cockpit nodding his head in response, yes, soul god, anyone with melee combat ability, all of you leave the city, what's the point of harboring inside, also, fighting for numbers, I've never lost, Su Hao's tone was calm, giving the mechs a strong self-confidence, in the next second, the rat king, gem appeared in his mechanical hand, the earth shook, very slightly, but soon became heavy and dense rustling sound spread out, the rats in the city came into contact with the brainwaves sent out by the rat king, and followed, Rat wave, fog weed, the mechs couldn't help but burst out. The tide of rats came out, wave after wave like a black ocean, appeared at the steel walls and rushed out without hesitation, covering the frozen sea and killing the demon race. Kill. Su Hao gave an order and took the lead to storm out. Immediately after, Feng Xin followed closely behind, obeying the words of the soul god and killing the demon centurion. Kill that golden thing. The demon centurion opened his mouth and spat out sulfur breath as he roared. However, all of the attacking demon races were surrounded by a wave of rats, and the attack was immediately curbed. Seeing the situation, the mechs went out of the city to kill the enemy. Zero shoulder suddenly cracked, 
presenting a cannonball loading device, but the cannonball was presented in the shape of flesh and blood, precisely the corpse cannon. Bang, bang, bang. The flesh and blood cannonballs discharged, delivering a furious blast to the bottom. The moment it exploded, it wasn't a shockwave or flame, but a thick green liquid that corrupted the demon soldiers, the demon centurions. Miserable screams resounded. Su Hao transformed into a mobile turret, hovering in mid-air. Corpse cannons bombarded indiscriminately, blowing up the demon race with countless deaths and injuries. It was simply not too scary. On the city wall, Yennefer's sexy and voluptuous half-machine, half-flesh body shook slightly, summoning frost, blizzard plus ice creation. The icy wind whistled. Wrapped in it was not a snowflake, but a blue ice dagger that harvested the lives of the demon soldiers in a cutting manner. Clang clang clang. The sound of trembling daggers resounded, along with a brilliant blade light. A large number of black rats were wrapped around the demon centurion's body, gnawing at the flesh and blood and injecting viruses, and he roared in anger as he swung his wolf tooth stick, but with a flash of blade light, the arm fell off, blood stained the ice, and the second blade took off the head, decapitation, drops blood devouring demon blade weapon drawing asterisk 1, phone xin glanced at it and his heart trembled, this was too strong, but the ensuing drop rewards shook him even more, drop 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 2301, Demon Soldier's Flesh and Blood Asterisk 4772, Demon Centurion's Heart Asterisk 333, Market Coin Asterisk 500222, Misty Grass, Letter couldn't even help but explode, what's going on, the world copy is bugged, but when he stared he realized to the top of each corpse, there were ghosts and monsters licking it as if they were desecrating it, whose ability is this, Phone XIN looked left and right, and finally landed his gaze on the one god, he was the only one who was truly invincible. Drop 10,000 fusion crystals asterisk 8888. Market coins asterisk 999999. Bloodstorm gene asterisk 13. Drop core crystal, bloated fat, excellent, asterisk 3. Magic blood, common, asterisk 15. Drop subsidiary crystals, vitality asterisk 213. Chuan Yu asterisk 195. Drop drawings, bloodthirsty demon armor mech drawing asterisk 4. Wolfsbane weapon drawing asterisk 6. Thousands of demon soldiers died one after another but under Su Hao's desecration, they dropped resources like crazy. This kind of global copy was also different from Decaying Stranger's Shadow. The Decaying Stranger's Shadow was a group of up to four people with experience bonus, but in the global copy it was one person killing the enemy, and all mechs within a certain range could enjoy the experience value, but the person who killed enjoyed 80% of the experience, and the remaining 20% was spread out to everyone. However, a very good thing about the global copy was that the drops were personal drops. With Su Hao around, there was no lack of materials, no lack of Wanrong crystals, and no lack of market coins. He is the resource creator. The so-called first wave of billions of demon invasion was nothing more than experience and resources delivered to Su Hao's door. Being on the road to Goat City, there were similarly demon soldiers blocking the way, and they were fighting with the forbidden mechs. Bang! Suddenly, a dull sound rang out, like flesh hitting an iron wall. In a flash, blood and flesh spattered and bones flew about. A light gray mecha was incomparably heavy, and when it danced with its hands, it was able to fuse with the particle light shield of the forbidden guard mecha, forming a harder shield that blocked out the demon soldiers. The light gray mech could also fight alone, with its mechanical hands clenched. A light shield was condensed in front of it, charging out ferociously, and crashing the demon soldiers into mush. Zhang Bai Ren, block. A chorus of voices came from the forbidden mecha. Yes. Zhang Bai Ren resolved the demon soldiers in front of him and immediately retreated to strengthen the particle light shield. Rumble. Abruptly, the flames burned, burning the demon soldiers into ashes. The red-colored battle armor came and went freely amongst the demon soldiers, like a phoenix, beautiful and powerful. Every move, elegant to the extreme. Zhang Yao, since receiving the funding from the alliance, her battle power had skyrocketed, and she had become one of the alliance's top newbie mecha masters. When the demon soldiers on this side were resolved, the forbidden mechs and other existences immediately rushed to Goat City for support. Who the hell arranged this, making me run so far? Wouldn't it have been better to just let me hold down the capital? F asterisk CK. Among the troops, there was also a third mech of a different color mixed in, emitting sounds of discontent. This mech was particularly gorgeous in appearance, streamlined similar to Iron Man, but moved lightly like it was held by a gust of wind. The gradient-colored glazed armor showed gold from the head, then red from the waist, and blue from the legs down, with a beastly gunblade magnetically absorbed from the back, dual-wielding cold 380 Newton versions. Xiao Rin you shut up, go wherever you're told to go, think the alliance is your home? Jiang Yao chided coldly, 
Zhang Biren didn't say anything, just twisted his head to look at the man. Jiang Yao reprimanded Xiao Ren. The latter didn't dare to talk back. But by what right did Zhang Biren, a B-ranked waste, look at himself? Idiot, if you dare to look at me again, I'll waste you. Xiao Ren came closer and lowered his voice to curse. What kind of person was he? A genius who had awakened to the SS rank. Moreover, before he set off, he had received funding from the Lin family. At the end of the global copy, his own status would rise again and again. Bottom dregs like Zhang Biren would have to be beaten to death like a dog just by looking at himself. Zhang Biren was speechless and rushed silently. The first wave of demonic invasion ended, but it was only a beginning. Outside the steel city walls, corpses were strewn everywhere, and similarly there were mechs broken and falling to the ground, intertwined like a mountain of corpses and a sea of blood. But at this time, the rat tide was quietly receding, completing the mission this time. Those who should upgrade their crystals should hurry up and do so. This is just the beginning. The second wave will come at any time, Su Hao said calmly. The surface of the golden battle armor was stained with broken meat or blood, but it turned on the auto-cleaning mode, restoring its golden appearance. Long Jianchuan, Sun Haoming, Yi Nifa, Feng Xian and the others immediately did as they were told. 2223, all of Zero's attributes rise slightly. Life value plus 500, energy value plus 500, armor plus 500, shield plus 450. Strength and defense speed plus 400. Trigger power accumulation. Permanently increase power by 299. The experience required is now increasing. But don't worry. These demons appearing is experience anyway. Su Hao never thought about his level. Anyway, the more copies he brushed and the more demons he killed, the level would naturally go up. No need to be deliberate. Just go with the flow. Su Shen, the alliance's people have arrived. Long Jianchuan landed next to Su Hao in his green red mech, panting slightly. Su Hao saw dozens of blue light dots suddenly appear on the detection radar and looked up towards the steel city wall, led by Zhang Yao. The forbidden guard match such as Zhang Bai Ren and Xiao Ren came into view. Su Xin, among them, Zhang Yao and Zhang Bai Ren were the most excited to see their benefactor. To Zhang Ban Ren, Su Hao was the favor of knowing him. To Zhang Yao, Su Hao was the favor of saving his life. You guys listen to Minister Long's arrangement. Su Hao's voice eased a lot. Yes, Zhang Yao nodded repeatedly. Xiao Nong hugged his mechanical arm, not wanting to greet him in the slightest. He had already accepted the funding from the Lin family, and he had even heard that this, done, had kicked Lin Hung into the intensive care unit, and without any surprises, he would only be able to live on machines for the rest of his life. Therefore, Xiao Run was hostile to, done, but he couldn't reveal it. People even dared to directly kick the Lin family's top management. Wouldn't they be looking for death if they messed with it? Bai Run, Xiao Yao. Take the forbidden guard mechs to the people's hospital. Guarding the place is enough. Long Jinchuan gave the order. Jiang Yao understood, but gazed at Su Xin for several seconds. There were so many things she wanted to say. Jiang Byron scratched his head. Su Xin, I want to tell you some good news. I'm B-leveled. Not bad. Growing quite fast. I look forward to your play. Su Hao was surprised. Then smiled. The global copy is also a stage. Go show your skills. Yes. God Su. Jiang Byron. Zhang Yao and the others drank excitedly. The encouragement of China's number one mecha god of war worked better than any stimulant. Long Jianchuan cried and laughed. This alliance senior of his own was not as good as a single word from Su Shen. The forbidden mechs left to guard the people's hospital in Yangcheng. The second wave of the massive demonic attack will appear in four minutes. Countdown. 359. The voice that rang in their heads made everyone's hearts hang in the air. The waves will only get stronger and stronger. And at the same time, the demon gates will not only appear outside the city, but also inside the city. Su Hao's voice was low. Then if we can't block it. Some Mech's voices trembled slightly. The mood of the crowd was heavy. The color of Su Hao's eyes was as if they could be projected from his head armor. Cold and firm. This is a disaster. But also a sublimation. Survive it, and you'll be even stronger than you are now. The Mech took a deep breath. Fuck it. At this moment, the People's Hospital in Goat City had completed its defense installations while expanding outwards to accommodate more local residents. And the mechs were guarding it. But in such a stormy world, a black viscous liquid appeared on top of a building, while a gradient color appeared, going from black to red and taking on a human form. His bare chest could clearly see his pectoral muscles, wearing a black and red cloak and a black robe. His black hair like ink hanging down on his shoulders. Those bright red eyes contained extreme tyranny, overlooking the entire metropolis and his handsome to demonic face had a caracal evil smile. I, the blood sacrifice demon general, will turn this world into an earthly purgatory. His palm gushed out blood, which was filled with a ferocious factor. 
and he did not hesitate to strike the sky. After doing so, the blood sacrifice demon general smiled grimly and vanished. The moment the countdown ended, a demon gate reappeared, wrapped in a fishy storm of blood and rain and impacted. However, there was an even taller and more ancient demon gate in the city that tore through space, standing at a height of about a hundred meters, permeating array of terrifying fluctuations and giving countless people a mental oppression. Ancient Demon Gate Description, a sacrifice from the blood sacrifice demon general. Within it are two great demonic clusters that are in the process of destroying Goat City completely. The demon generals have made their appearance. Suhao's mood sank when he took a look at the description of the demonic gate in the city. In his last life, the invasion of billions of devils had dealt a devastating blow to the globe, and many cities within China had fallen, killing and injuring countless people. Moreover, the time of the demon general's debut was not overly described or documented, so it was indeed troublesome. Boom boom boom. At the same time, outside the steel city wall was also the reappearance of the demons, to completely flatten the city wall that was blocking them. Minister Long, Hao Ming, Yi Naifa, you guys guard this place. Su Hao gazed at the gate of the ancient demon race. I'm going to crush it from the inside. Saying that, the golden battle armor rose up into the air, making a shocking sound that broke through the sound barrier as it powered up. At this moment, the golden meteor was the brightest, reflecting into the pupils of countless people. Roar! A 20 meter tall demonic monster with wings on its back and scales covering its entire body, resembling a western dragon, spewed out black dragon flames, burning Goat City into a sea of fire and rendering the sky eerie. Bang! But in the next second, the golden flash boomed, blowing the entire head of this demonic monster apart, sending blood and flesh flying, the huge body even flew backwards, falling into the gate of the ancient demon race. I'd like to see what kind of thing your so-called demon race's gate is, Su Hao laughed coldly. The words, experience exclusive, fierce swipes of devil died drawings, in front of everyone's eyes, Zero rushed into the gate of the ancient demon race, Jia Jia Jia, children. The time to enjoy the blood meal has come. Remember to contribute the blood food energy obtained to our emperor. Rampant and tyrannical laughter like a demon's ravings reached the ears of Jiang Yao and the others. Rumble. Houses collapsed. The earth shook. And a vomit-inducing odor filled the air. The old people, children, and the injured and disabled who watched the scene in the hospital couldn't help but shiver. Fire in unison. With a roar from the demon centurion. Blood-colored rhizomes capable of walking upright emerged from behind his back and the flowers at the top opened up, spewing out blood spikes that ran through the hospital like endless bullets. Block! The forbidden mech shouted, and the particle light shield bloomed out, enveloping the entire hospital. Zhang Baiyun merged into it, strengthening the defense of the particle light shield, and topped it at the front. Bang! 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 A blood spike bombarded the particle light shield, emitting a heart-stopping bursting sound. Kill! Zhang Yao's beautiful eyes were cold, and she took the brunt of the vanguard. Blood-sucking demon stem, grade, 23, attributes, strength 300, defense 300, speed 110, spirit 280, characteristics, any attack carries blood-sucking, evaluation, it's a shame you don't serve in a hospital, evaluation, it's a shame you don't serve in a hospital, blood alchemist, rank, 24, attributes, strength, 10, defense, 120, speed, 260, spirit, 400. Characteristics, the backbone of the demon race, able to reply, assist, and attack, evaluation, all are bulls and horses, evaluation, they're all bulls and horses, why do you know everything, don't roll, Zhang Yao in the cockpit saw the blood refiner at a glance and killed it first, the blood refiner looks similar to a human, but with black skin, wearing light blood colored robes, there are men and women, slashing their arms and kneeling down to chant, blood shield enhanced, the demon monsters within 30 meters of the surroundings were all covered with a layer of blood-colored armor, adding 3,000 temporary shields out of thin air. Kill the blood refiner first. Zhang Yao droned out in the channel. Yes, the mechs who followed closely behind answered. Whether it was melee weapons or gun weapons, all of them were aimed at the blood refiner. However, the opposite demons were no fools, and quickly protected the blood refiner. Burning Lotus. Zhang Yao's mechanical hand propped up towards the left and right and the mecha pieces combined into a red lance, still with spikes hanging from it, and the whole body was ablaze with burning flames, killing the demon race and nailing the blood refiner to death with a single shot. As soon as she turned around, the red spear blasted out, a red lotus with red flames bloomed into bloom, there was a boom, smoke filled the air, blowing up as many demon race soldiers as possible. In the front, not only Jiang Yao and the others were killing and blocking, in the back, Zhang Bai Ren cooperated with the forbidden mechs and the guns shot through the particle light shields and killed the demons, 
Zhang Bai Ren's gray mechanical hand gripped the Ye three man. The appearance showed a light blue color. The muzzle of the gun was a slightly open shark's mouth. Every time he pulled the trigger, he was able to shoot three bullets, basically able to hit the enemy's head, belonging to the long-range weapon with a low base damage, but the rate of the bludgeon bludgeon damage was considerable. On the other hand, Xiao Ren's equipment was much stronger than Zhang Bai Ren's, and even Jiang Yao couldn't compare to him. Code name, Spectral Gunner. Quality, Flawless. Life value, 4,300. Energy value, 3,000. Armor, 3,900. Shield, 6,000. Material, Metal. Attributes, Strength, 788. Defense, 1,200. Speed, 900. Spirit, 500. Core Crystal, Eagle Eye, Full Grade. Quality, Flawless. Effect, 1. Headshot damage, when a firearm hits the head, it will increase the damage by 100%. 2. Eagle's Aim, equipped with sniper-type firearms. It can be expanded 20 times to enhance the damage by 200%. Independent Crystal, Professional, SS Level. Effects. 1. Aiming Lag, when your scope or machine aiming at the enemy's head, there will be a lag phenomenon. Convenient Aiming Head. 2. Full Automatic Headlock, each bullet will automatically lock on the enemy's head, but will lose 1000 points of energy value. Attachment Crystals, Life Force, Continuous Flow, Bullet Conversion. Energy conversion. Skateboarding shoes. Aviator. Carrying weapon. Battle Falcon. Similar to AK-47. Shaoren harnessed the Lin family funded Phantom Gunner and carried the War Falcon. Shooting a bullet through and through the incoming demon race. Pulling the trigger. Bang bang bang. A single bullet was fired. All of which basically shot through the heads of demon soldiers. Even demon centurions. With a headshot rate of around 80%. Killing them on the spot. It could be said that the effect of aim lag was really good. Basically. With a one-way shield in front of you, it wouldn't be a stretch to call it invincible. Other people couldn't hit you, but you were able to hide behind a particle light shield and shoot the enemy. Wasn't that cool? Making a big deal out of it. This kind of trash actually wants me to take a shot. Xiao Ren scoffed as he carried the battle falcon. But Jiang Yao's voice came out from the channel. Xiao Ren, the position you're guarding is very important. Don't let the demons attack in. What a nag. Xiao Ren snorted as he picked at his ears in the cockpit. He turned his head and glanced at the hospital building. At this moment, a birth was taking place inside, and it was also a big trouble. Suddenly, the demons began to gather. This human is able to punch through our heads every time. Kill him first, this guy looks like he's been slacking off. At my command, assault, among the devils, a burly creature stepped out, five meters tall, wearing black armor, dual wielding battle axes, a human with a bull's head, and a torso covered with lightning runes, Staring at Xiao Ren with a fierce smile. Demon Chief, Chi Fox. Level, 25. Attributes, Strength, 1800. Defense, 2000. Speed, 600. Spirit, 100. Characteristics, Battlefield Commander. One of the strongest of the demon underclass. Evaluation, Minotaur Ben Cao. Mu. Chi Fox raised his battle axe high and let out a deafening cow roar. Turning into a layer of light red waves spreading in all directions. The combat power of the demon soldiers. Demon centurions, blood sucking demon stems, and so on skyrocketed, launching the war bull order. Anyone who benefits from the demon race will have their strength increased by 10% and their defense increased by 10%. At this moment, the demon race turned into a torrent of blood and charged towards Xiao Ren's position. Assaulting, Xiao Ren, attack, the mech master of the forbidden mech roared angrily. Xiao Ren snorted, What are you screaming for? One shot second goods. After saying that, he lifted the battle falcon. The machine sight unleashed an aiming lag as it aimed at Officer Nyo, and immediately pulled the trigger. Clang! Sparks splashed and bullets shattered. Officer Nyo blocked the battle axe in front of him, not afraid of this so-called self-aiming at all. Rumble! The first wave of charge, impacting the particle light shield flashed madly. Minus 100,100. Any forbidden mecha mechs that were impacted grunted, but the second wave came immediately after. Xiao Ren! The forbidden guard mecha practically roared out in a tone that was about to kill. Xiao Ren was confused at this moment. He hurriedly utilized, full auto lock, and locked on towards Officer Nyo. The moment each bullet discharged, rendered with eerie colors, it involuntarily shot towards Officer Nyo's head as if it had grown eyes. Rubbish. Not only was Officer Nyo not afraid, instead, he let out a furious laugh. The burly flesh extracted power from the ground and extended the black armor, wrapping it around the whole body. Even the head was wrapped in a thick layer. Clang clang clang. The flame sputtered and could not break the defense at all. Bang! The particle light shield was rushed again. The mech's eyes were desperate. They couldn't retreat. And it was hard to block. Xiao Ren panicked. He used all his means. 
but it was useless, if the defense is broken, he himself would not be able to avoid death. At this moment, Xiao Nong's pupils slightly contracted, his trembling feet pulled back, his mouth shivering, I can't die, I'm an SS class, it's fine if as many of you E rank F rank losers die. Under the gaze of the crowd and the anger of his companions, Xiao Rin ran backward in a frenzy and burrowed into the hospital. He would rather be a deserter than die here. Ha ha ha, the vile nature of humans. Officer Nyo laughed maniacally and led his men to blast out the strongest strike, like a shocking wave that instantly flooded the particle light shield in front of him. The mecha division's faces were livid, unable to attack while unable to retreat to set up the particle light shield, because if they retreated and the attack blasted into the hospital, countless people would die. Shield of the Great Wall. A sudden engine roar consolidated and even strengthened the originally shaky particle light shield. Bang. The stone crushing roar sounded like a thunderous tremor, frightening countless masses into trembling crouches, but the particle light shield did not shatter. It only dimmed a bit. A light gray mecha topped the very center, slowly raising its head armor, and it was none other than Zhang Byron. Humans can have more than just despicability. There is also the bloodthirstiness of being willing to take responsibility. Zhang Byron arrived at the support position and held back the demon race's charge. The pressure on the forbidden mecha's mecha division plummeted, and he roared. Out with your swords. There was a buzz. Orange lightsabers popped out from the back of each of the forbidden guard mechs and landed steadily in their hands, penetrating through the particle light shields and penetrating through the torsos of the demon soldiers, demon centurions, blood-sucking demon stems, and so on, shattering on the spot. The drops were sucked up by every mech warrior, along with experience points. Mu, seeing that his attack was actually blocked, Chi Fox's pupils were crimson, and he raised his voice to the sky, swinging his battle axe to slash at the particle light shield. Do you really think that our Chinese mechs have no one? A cold shout resounded, wrapped in a strong flame of anger stormed in. Wherever the musket went, the flames were monstrous, covering dozens of meters down around them and burning a large number of demon soldiers to death. There was a clang, the battle axe was blasted by a huge force and the location where it fell became the outer side of the particle light shield, splitting the ground as it collapsed and cracks appeared. Zhang Yao returned to defense and stood in front of Zhang Bai Rin and the others, but the situation was not optimistic either. Nearly 40% of the red-colored mech was in a broken state, while blood continued to flow out of the cockpit, which was enough to show that Zhang Yao was also under immense pressure at the front. Seeing this, Zhang Bai Rin took out five bottles with different colored liquids shaking inside. He did not hesitate to throw them on the ground. Yellow Earth Potion Bottle, Increase Body Defense by 20%, Sea Water Potion Bottle, Restores 20% Energy Value of the Mech, Flame Potion Bottle, Increases Mech Strength by 20%, Wood Essence Potion Bottle, Maintains Automatic Life Value Recovery for 5 minutes, 5 slash S, Gold and Iron Potion Bottle, Increases Mech's Damage to Weapons by 20%, The Mechs Within Range Received a Bonus, Zhang Yao's Mech was recovering rapidly, with the function of the potion and the bonus of her own crystals. She looked back towards Zhang Bainu and nodded slightly, keeping a close eye on Officer Nyo. Charge! Chief Nyo roared with rage, dual wielding his battle axes. The demons charged again, and this time, it was even more so as Chief Nyo took the initiative to lead the charge, vowing to break through the particle light shield. Hundred endure! Zhang Yao softly droned, also choosing to attack head on. The forbidden mechs nodded silently. Zhang Byron followed Zhang Yao closely behind her, opening up protection for her at any time. Officer Nyo wielded his battle axe, a blood-colored whirlwind filling his body, the ground being scraped to pieces as he swung down ferociously. Blood wind strike. However, Zhang Yao didn't even think about dodging. Her eyes were firm, as if she understood that this strike would definitely be helped by someone. There was a boom. The red spear blazed up like blood, not an ordinary flame, but a blood flame. Phoenix blood. As the spear stabbed out, loud and clear phoenix chirps echoed out, penetrating towards Officer Ox's head. Just as the battle axe was about to fall and split the crimson mech, and countless people in the hospital were shedding tears and covering their mouths, the power unit behind the gray mech erupted, and his arms transformed into a steel shield, blocking it. Bang! The steel shield was split to pieces on the spot, but soon the second steel shield coalesced, directly giving the battle axe a jam, but the gray mech also fell to its knees, looking for death. Officer Nyo roared, and when he tried to struggle, the gun had already arrived. Plop! The entire head burst open like a watermelon, and the huge body fell to the ground with a powerless rumble. The moment the blood flames bloomed, it expanded like a circle of flames, incinerating all the surrounding demons. Bull! A torrent of roars issued from within the hospital in an instant. This was because how many people were on the verge of despair after seeing Officer Nyo's attributes? Thousands of attributes. Who could withstand this? 
Once Officer Nyo died, their pressure also slowed down quite a bit at this moment. However, the pace of the demons was not stopped by this. They did not fear life and death. Phoenix Blood loses all energy values and explodes 300% damage. Jiang Yao gasped fiercely, but still revealed a hint of a smile. But being able to kill is a success. Bai Run. She just wanted to call out to Zhang Byron, but suddenly saw a brilliant red dot appear without warning in the detection radar. Her pupils contracted steeply, and before she had time to be alerted, the entire mech flew out upside down as if it had suffered a full trailer truck ramming into it. Blood was spilled in the air. The body armor gradually burst, reflected in the pupils of the people as well as the mech division. It was so horrified and terrified. Xiao Yao. Zhang Bai knew endured the pain and tried to go and catch her. Air is indeed tough, but still not enough. A cold and indifferent voice rang out. Immediately after, Zhang Banren's huge body took a heavy blow and tumbled to be caught by the Forbidden Guard mech. However, the Forbidden Guard mech was directly flipped over. Unable to withstand the force, on the corpse of Officer Nyo, there stood a humanoid monster with arms above the knees, a slim and slender figure that looked to be 5 meters tall. His body was wrapped in black bandages, even his mouth was wrapped. The only thing that was exposed was his dense black hair as well as a pair of bloody pupils coldly looking down at the hospital. Demon wannabe, spellcaster. Level, 26. Attributes, strength 1000. Defense 2000. Speed 1000. Spirit 2400. Characteristics, every attack carries a curse attribute. Extremely difficult to deal with. Evaluation, can you curse someone for me? Curse my company into bankruptcy, and a fucking transfer for a clear day. When the mech saw the attributes of the cursed trickster, they all revealed ugly expressions. 2400 spirit and it was still carrying a debuff attack. One of the toughest monsters. Life weakened. Defense weakened. Spirit weakened. The spellcaster's voice was low. His slender arm flicked on the ground, and waves of dark light spread out, attaching itself to the demon's weapon. Triple debuff. Attack. The forbidden mechs maintained their particle light shields, holding out no matter what. Hold on. Minister Long and the others are detaching their mechs to return to defense, a mechmeister said anxiously. Zhang Bai Ren was struggling to steer the gray mech. The operation panel in the cockpit was stained with blood, but he didn't say a word as he went up to strengthen the shield value of the particle light shield. On the other hand, Jiang Yao, who had just been blasted away by the trickster spellbinder, was standing up in a weird way at the moment. The entire head armor was seeping out blood, enough to show how badly she had been injured, but this blood was slowly burning. Plus 2, plus 5, plus 7, plus 10, kill. Jiang Yao's consciousness was blurred but her mouth full of blood reminded her that she was in combat, and she relied on her subconscious to shout out this word. She rode the tattered crimson mech to kill. The guile spellbinder's blood pupils narrowed. His figure shifted and killed like a ghost, his slender hands gripping his battle sword, killing Jiang Yao as she retreated, her wounds getting worse and worse. Bang. Once again, Jiang Yao fell, but immediately afterward, she kept igniting blood flames and stood up again. Even the cockpit could already be seen. This scene was firm and tragic. The people inside the hospital couldn't help but tear up when they saw it. Why did you stand up? The trickster didn't understand. You're supposed to be dead. There was a boom. On the other side, the particle light shields built by the forbidden mechs were broken, and they all fell down. However, only one person was still standing. Zhang Byron. Roar. The demon centurion roared. The wolf tooth rod smashed him as he kept retreating. His mechanical legs kept bending, but he just desperately pushed forward. Zhang Baiyun had a crazy color in his eyes constantly crushing the props he had juggled from the copies, relying on himself to transform into a new particle light shield, blocking the front of the demons. Why are you guys a bit different from the other humans? The corner of the trickster's eyes twitched. Zhang Byron recalled what the man had said to him and smiled lowly, because, he said that I am the future Great Wall of China. Zhang Yao's consciousness was gradually recovering, her blood-stained features revealing a smile. You foreigners will never understand what it means to be bloodthirsty. The Great Wall of China. The bloodiness of Hua Xia, Zhang Yao, Zhang Bairen could be said to have embodied these two points to the fullest. The Chinese Xia people were the most unafraid to fight. All hardcore. Whoever dares to slaughter their species, even if they die, they will bite off a piece of the other party's flesh. The forbidden mechs and the mechmasters of Goat City sniffed, their breathing instantly ragged and blood filled their pupils. Fuck you foreigners, it's not just death. Come, kill, kill all these beasts. Child, watch this, this is how the knife is used. My old son's daughter-in-law is in labor inside. You think you can kill me? Roars of rage came out from one of the wrecked mechs, moreover rendering everyone in the hospital emotionally agitated. Son, see that? That's your father. He's not only protecting you, he's protecting everyone. 
a pale-faced woman, holding her recently delivered child in her arms, whispered through tears, cheer up, mechs, go for it, kill them all, the voices in the hospital were noisy, but full of hot-blooded feelings, Zhang Biren looked through the particle light shield at the demon race that was charging again, but he did not take a step back, and his eyes were filled with madness, mom, it may not be possible to take revenge, but as I who have guarded the people of China, you should feel honored, he did not retreat, but in the next second, a dozen mechs rushed out from behind the particle light shield, their chests all lit up with light, seemingly burning their mech cores, Yang Changhua Gang, Wei Guasheng of Gan Province, Chen Chang of Lu Province, a roar was accompanied by an explosion, hardening the demon race's charge to a halt, to die to make their will clear, blocking the enemy's attack with death, just to be able to buy time so that Long Jinchuan and the others could have time to return to defense, Uncle, Zhang Byron finally couldn't hold back his tears when he saw one of the people who had blown himself up and died, the one who had taken care of him in the alliance, from the moment the billions of demons invaded, human lives were like grass, however, their lives could become as brilliant as shooting stars, the spellcaster blasted Jiang Yao away once more, his eyes cold and with mockery, self-exploding to death, to die to make your will clear, it's just the struggle of a mole cricket, the weak will always be weak, how can you break this game by relying on you guys, perishing is your only choice, his words were mockingly drawn out, but they were indeed reality, boom boom boom, the long range attacks landed on the particle light shield, Zhang Byron only felt his spirit was disintegrating, his strength and defense were also decreasing sharply, and it could collapse at any time, but he just wouldn't retreat, when the body couldn't carry it, the will would carry you out to kill, wretched weaklings, the trickster spellbinder just stood straight in front of the particle light shield, coldly staring at Zhang Baiyun, Zhang Byron's eyes kept blurring, but as if he was hallucinating, he saw that the gate, of the ancient demon race cracked, he laughed, laughed wildly, laughed without a care in the world, did you know that we still have a god of war in Huaxia? Zhang Byren laughed maniacally. The tricky spellcaster frowned, but for some reason, there was suddenly a kind of death enveloping the soul, as if death was accompanying him. Rumble, blood thunder surged wildly, and shining colors illuminated a golden mecha dyed red with blood appeared behind the guile spellbinder. The head armor was able to see those eyes, cold and terrifying. He didn't make a move, but crossed over to the trickster spellcaster. Zhang Byren finally couldn't withstand it. His particle light shield dissipated and he slowly fell forward, only to be caught by a mechanical arm. Su Shen. Fortunately, he muttered. Su Hao's eyes were filled with relief. Well done. These four words were the best compliment Zhang Byron had ever insisted on. Who are you? The blood pupil of the trickster cursed color continuously, and as he spoke, he was already wielding his two swords, chopping at Su Hao's head. Countless people screamed in shock. Clang. However, the dual sword slashed at Zero's head armor but a number that left people dumbfounded floated up slowly, minus 15, put, instead, the trickster spellcaster himself continued to crack, his black bandages exploding and bleeding as he looked at the man in front of him with a face full of horror, trigger needle stabbing Jizo, glazed armor, trigger abnormal condition antibody, Su Hao held Zhang Bai Rin in the crook of his mechanical arm, slowly turning around to look at the trickster spellcaster without a single word, what responded to him was only that beam of red light, solar flare, buzz, an extremely terrifying beam of light was like a chopper, blasting up from above the earth, and wherever it passed, all monsters were turned into ashes, buildings collapsed, houses were destroyed, even the grey night sky was chopped out of a thousands of meters long gully, vaguely able to see a round of blood moon hanging behind the dark clouds, such a shocking scene was deeply imprinted in the eyes of countless people, only one strike, that guile spellcaster who had caused countless people to despair was instantly killed in seconds, rumble, immediately afterward, the gate of the ancient demon race collapsed down, preventing the demon race from reinforcing it. Want to compare who has more people right? Su Hao's tone was terrifyingly cold. Rat King plus Rat Tide. Desecration plus Army of Undead. Endless rats surged out from the sewers, stinky gutters, broken walls, and other places, as if they were a black ocean, causing the demon race to have what was called despair for the first time. Even the demon soldiers, demon centurions, demon thousands, demon ten thousand and other existences that had originally died, all reared up, one person, 10,000 troops, those who still have battle power, all stand up for me, I will lead you all to upgrade, take you all to revenge, kill, Suha took a deep breath and his drink spread out, how many people blood filled their pupils and roared to join the camp, even those disabled people in the hospital summoned mechs with less than level 10 and mixed in, for no other reason, to avenge their loved ones, rumble, the rat tied, the undead, 
and the Mets turned into a torrent to counterattack all the invading demons. Sun Haoming, who had originally broken free from the steel city walls, was filled with horror when he saw the scene. Misty Grass, fighting in a group without me. Right. He shook the skeleton scepter and summoned the destruction swarm. The second wave of demonic attack was completely ineffective. By the time the crowd returned to the hospital, the mechs who had healing crystals were tending to the injured, and there were crystals that could also repair damaged mechs, reducing the expenditure on materials. Zhang Bai Rin and Zhang Yao had already awakened. Only their injuries were so severe that it was fortunate that they didn't die. I've been promoted to A class. Zhang Bai Rin shook inwardly when he saw that his independent crystal had changed. Shouldn't it be burning with fire? Well done. I'll have the alliance reward you afterward. Su Hao came and nodded slightly. He couldn't help but sigh. Fortunately these two were there. In his memory, in his last life, this point in time, Yan Chang had already fallen, and all the mechs were retreating to protect the people of Huaxia, fleeing to the established alliance fortress, because once the people in the hospital died, countless mechs lost the courage and goal to fight on, losing again and again. But now, with Su Hao's intervention as well as letting Zhang Bairin Zhang Yao and the others grow up in advance, it started to stop the route of Huaxia. Solitary God. Someone is a deserter. Zhang Yao's red lips lightly bit. Her eyes filled with hatred. Su Hao raised his eyebrows. Who? Xiao Ren. Zhang Bairin muffled his voice. Hearing this name, Su Hao, sitting in the cockpit, smiled instead. The hunt list had him on it. And it was also familiar. His crystals, I like them a lot. Su Hao smiled. The name Xiao Run was too familiar to Su Hao. A collection of beasts, meanness, bullying, and obscenity as one of the dog beasts. There were two others from the same department as him, and their offspring were even better. Xiao Ren, Sun Gan, Zhou Yan. These three are all independent crystals above S-class, that naturally are favored and cultivated by the alliance and the family. With status and position, they naturally regard themselves highly and feel that others are inferior to them. Passing dogs are kicked twice by them. And Su Hao, is that dog? When Xiao Ren came to the intelligence department to talk about things, Su Hao was pressed to the ground by his lapdogs because he was slow in handing out tea, and those two pairs of dirt-covered grass roots stomped on his face. At that time, that feeling of humiliation was still not forgotten. Su Hao couldn't even move to anger, and could only accompany the smiling face to be knocked out of his front teeth, and then was shouted at by the minister of the intelligence department to get out before the end. Later on, it was heard that the children of the three Sha Nones were bullying others in the mech school, and even abusing them to death with extremely cruel means. At that time, when Su Hao saw this news, he felt unbelievable, to be so cruel in their teens, wouldn't it be a scourge if they didn't shoot them down and keep them? However, Sha Nong's children were not old enough, and because they kept giving the alliance high-level crystals, the matter was finally left unsettled. Su Hao, who was sitting in the intelligence department, was cold, and the sense of suffocation made him almost gasp for breath. A corner of the people's hospital, Xiao Nong had long been hiding, and at this moment, he was even trying to dial the phone, hoping to contact the Lin family. Do, 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 aren't you in Yang Cheng? A playful sound rang out from the other end of the phone, as well as the sound of diving, which seemed to be very enjoyable. Along with the man's majestic voice, Xiao Ren knew that he was in big trouble. His voice trembled slightly. Jun, something's wrong. He spoke out the cause and effect of the incident. Lin Jun couldn't even help but grunt when he heard it, and was also extremely displeased with this kind of desertion behavior but there was no way around it. Xiao Ren was now a subordinate of the Lin family, while his independent crystals were indeed very useful. Don't worry, I can take care of this matter. Lin Jun's voice grew cold. If you dare to run away again, even I will find it hard to protect you. Understand? Yes, yes, Brother Jun is awesome. Brother Jun is right. I won't dare again. Xiao Ren was greatly relieved and finally revealed a smile. Guarantee? With me around. What qualifications do you have to bail? Suddenly. A cold and sneering voice sounded behind Xiao Ren. Xiao Ren's smile instantly stiffened as he slowly turned his head to see the golden mecha looking down at him coldly. Who? Lin Jun in his cell phone drank deeply. Bang! The golden mech's right fist blasted out, and the spectral gunner's entire head armor set heavily into the wall. Xiao Ren in the cockpit screamed and rolled down, roaring in fear. You can't kill me. I'm a member of the alliance with the Lin family behind me. However, Su Hao ignored him and directly grabbed him, then easily broke open his mouth. One tooth, one tooth was broken off. Every time he broke a tooth, a large amount of blood gushed out, causing Xiao Ren to scream and convulse in pain. A whole twenty-eight of them were placed on the ground in a neat and orderly manner. Eat it in. Su Hao's face was expressionless, and his voice was even colder than ice. Xiao Ren's fear was extreme. 
His trembling hands cupped his teeth and stuffed them into his mouth. The pain when he cut his gums caused him to sweat coldly, and he swallowed it into his stomach with a grunt. Swallow all of it. He opened his mouth full of blood, begging pitifully for survival. Su Hao had a cruel smile on his face, smacked him to the ground, and then stomped on his face with a mechanical big foot full of blood and mud, as if it could be stumped with a single force. Smoothly, he picked up his cell phone. Who the hell are you? Lin Jun questioned. Su Hao's eyes were indifferent. What are you barking at? I'm telling you, let the alliance judge what mistakes Xiao Ren has made. You're not allowed to use lynching. Lin Jun's tone grew cold. Not really sure who was on the other end of the phone, and keep your mouth clean, or I'll make it impossible for you to stay in Huaxia. Su Hao snorted, uttering the nationalism towards the phone. Stupid. Click. The cell phone burst and the sound broke. Lin Jun. This person, Su Hao also recognized. DUI drove on the sidewalk, hit and killed a dozen people, and was finally sent to a certain, decaying stranger's shadow, for management. In fact, it was just a change of place to continue enjoying happiness. Then there was a bug invasion, and it was even more heinous when he sold 100, 000 people for his chance of survival. It's time to give you an answer. Su Hao sneered and dragged the half-dead shower and away. People's Hospital. After a short rest, a new wave of demon attack was about to start. However, Su Hao brought one person with him. Dog. The Mets of the Forbidden Mets were furious. At that time, if there had been Xiao Ren's, professional, it wouldn't have been possible to collapse so quickly. And it wouldn't have been possible for someone to blow themselves up to stop the demon attack. Deserters. Shameful. Even more deserving of killing. How many people had hatred and anger in their eyes as they stared at Xiao Ren in death? I'm not a human. I'm a dog. I'm sorry everyone. The toothless Xiao Ren cried out in pain. Kneeling and kowtowing towards everyone. At this time, Long Jianchuan came and spoke in a low voice. Su Shen, the alliance called the satellite phone, saying that someone is coming to take Xiao Ren away. Xiao Ren heard it and his eyes fluttered. There was still salvation. Su Hao looked around. His tone was calm. When crimes can't be heavily punished, and when there is merit but no reward, do you think this civilization still needs to exist? Actually, I also agree with killing him. Long Jianchuan suddenly laughed. Not killing is not enough to get rid of people's anger. Just some people are going to be upset. At this point in time, the law was already hard to work. Therefore, the chaotic world used heavy punishment. By the way, I'm not the Huaxia Mecha Alliance. Killing him is purely my personal behavior. Su Hao also laughed. His big mechanical hand clasped Xiao Ren's head, and the latter struggled madly, even touching the market pattern and trying to summon the mech, which was instantly destroyed. The next will be brutal. Please close your eyes automatically. Su Hao reminded a sentence. Fire escape. The blazing flames filled up and wrapped around Xiao Run. The miserable scream sounded like a vicious dog howling. The skin of his whole body was burnt black. The blood was turned into a thick stench. And the struggling amplitude was rapidly decreasing. Until finally there was no sound at all. Click. With a gentle pinch. Xiao Ren turned into black ash all over the place. Devouring success. Professional player. Level 0 slash level 3. Level. SS. Effect. 1. Aiming lag. When any firearm weapon is aiming. Once the aiming star is near the vicinity of the enemy's head, a lag effect will appear, making it easier to aim. 2. Full auto headlock. When turned on, every bullet is able to automatically aim at the enemy's head. Currently level 0 consumes 300 energy value to add 50% damage. Level 1, 500 energy. 75%. Level 2, 750 energy. 100%. Level 3, 1000 energy. 150%. The console games handle assisted aiming as well as the FPS games Hang Brothers self-aiming. This is really a hanging wall. Su Hao couldn't even help but sigh in his heart after seeing the description of the professional player. The best weapon to match with, professional player, was nothing more than a sniper rifle. He had to find the drawing of a sniper rifle and get one. Three minutes later, the third wave of the demon races attack is about to begin. The billion demon invasion was a global copy, and the more demons killed, the progress bar would gradually drop. But while it was dropping, more powerful and terrifying monsters would continue to be released. When Blue Star experienced five waves of demon attack, it was finally a chance to catch its breath. The demonic attack has ended for the time being, and there will be a 24-hour buffer period. At this moment, the metropolis was already in ruins, filled with smoke, blood flowed everywhere, and corpses piled up like purgatory appeared on earth. 2324, all of Zero's attributes have risen slightly. Life value plus 500, energy value plus 500. Armor plus 500. Shield plus 500. Strength. Defense. Speed. Spirit plus 480. Su Hao glanced at the upgraded attributes. 
Then at the drops from these five waves, drops 10,000 fused crystals asterisk 391232, market coins asterisk 20003214, drops fiend blood asterisk 27777, wraith meat asterisk 13333, biomass asterisk 8999, bluing crystals asterisk 5435, magic roots asterisk 6884, dropped core crystals, troll plasm, excellent, asterisk 6, blood thunder body, excellent, asterisk 3, Magic Spectral Mastiff Body, Flawless, Asterisk 4. Drop Subsidiary Crystals, Life Force Asterisk 332. Chuan Yuyu Asterisk 154. Basic Shot Asterisk 291. Drop Weapon Drawings, Ghost Howling Fish and Lance Asterisk 3. Magic Suction Asterisk 8. Demon Bow Asterisk 4. Trigger Strength Accumulation. Permanently Increase Strength by 1301. Magic Die hasn't been brushed out yet. It's really hard. Suha swept a glance and was a bit depressed inside. He felt if his method was wrong, the Mets guarding Goat City were even more exhausted, panting hard, and were completely soaked when they walked out from the cockpit. Su Shun, 24 hours buffer. Does that count as giving us a chance? Long Jianchuan's face went white, and he couldn't help but inquire after eating something to feel better. Su Hao nodded slightly. Take advantage of this time. The casting should be cast and the matching crystals should be fast. The buffer period is not only for us but also when the demon race starts to see the emergence of demon generals and even demon marshals. Long Jianchuan almost didn't choke, and hurriedly called up the operation panel to check. Global demon rating progress, 95%. His pupils vibrated. Such a grueling battle had only consumed 5%. Or is it that other countries suffering from demonic invasion didn't even have time to fight back and were destroyed? Because this was a global raid together. This degree of progress was problematic. Su Hao thought that it was quite normal. All the ones killed now were small caramels, the more to the middle and late stages of the raid, that's when the battles kept on coming, don't sit still, cast your weapons and mechs, the market mark is what we rely on, Long Jinchuan immediately ordered, the mechs moved into action, rely on, when Su Hao heard this, he didn't know whether to laugh or be silent, at this moment, Yinifa gently held the bend of Machine Zero's mechanical arm, revealing a sweet smile, master, I have something to give you, uh, what? Su Hao's voice also became gentle. But when Yenifa traded it to him, her face was stunned. And then she became ecstatic. Pet drawing, magic die. Required material, cat gene asterisk 50. Demon tumor asterisk 50. Biomass asterisk 2000. Demon bone asterisk 2000. Ha ha ha. Love you Yenifa. Su Hao happily hugged Yenifa. He never expected that the magic die drawing would be swiped out in Yenifa's hands. It looked like, sometimes even with the existence of, profanity, it was hard to stop the existence of Oh Huang. Feeling her master's happy emotions, Yenifa became more excited herself. Lying down on Zero's head armor, she whispered in a delicate and flirtatious voice, Master, I don't want anything, I just want to serve you well. Cough cough. Su Hao sniffed and coughed twice. If it wasn't for the unsuitable venue with many people, he would directly put her on the spot. There's no way. Such a virtuous humanoid mecha who is dedicated to you and is good in bed. Who can't love it? When Yenifa was put down, Long Jianchuan came with a satellite phone. Su Shun, the commander-in-chief is looking for you. What is it? Su Hao connected his voice to the operation panel. Huang Dust, thank you for guarding Goat City. You're welcome. Just remember to give rewards to those who guarded the city. Su Hao replied flatly. Huang Dust, don't worry. Not a single one will be missing. I came to you because the second shackled body has been exchanged from the obelisk tower. And mechs such as Black General, Female Grudge and so on have been cast. Su Hao's eyes flashed with a hint of excitement. Double happiness. Good. I will go to the capital as soon as possible to get it. Su Hao smiled. Huang Dust, there's still another problem. Strange changes have appeared in several places within Huaxia. For example, a big mountain suddenly lit up a blazing fire, and the flames took on a light blue color, but there was no temperature. There was also a situation of fratricide within a mountain village, and when the forbidden Mecca arrived, it was too late to rescue them. Su Hao furrowed his brows. The demon general made his appearance. If the devil attack was a small copy of the siege, then the devil general was a special NPC existence. The devil generals themselves had very high values, all level 30, but after killing them, they would get a special crystal with various functions. Very complicated. They will mess up the rear, affecting the judgment of each country, leading to insufficient support and then the destruction of the country. As for those special crystals, Su Hao had to get them, never let go of any opportunity to enhance himself. Old Zhang's, blank history, projected that something is going to happen in Dongta village of Gan province. You see? Huang Dust spoke with a tired voice. Old Zhang? Blank history? Su Hao felt unfamiliar. 
but also had to sigh. This was definitely a talent that had been hidden extremely deep by the alliance. The intelligence department didn't even have any information. He shook his head. I'll make a trip over there, solve the problem, and go to the capital on the way. 24 hours should be about right by then. Thanks. Hanging up the satellite phone, Su Hao spoke briefly. Long Jianchuan nodded slightly. His eyes were thinking. Su Shen, do you think it could be the demon general or the demon marshal who messed up? Yes, nothing else but them. Su Hao smiled coldly. Then he looked at Yi Nifa. It is estimated that in a short while, the mechs here will be in an infected condition. You take down the infected substance. I'll be useful. Okay, master. Yenifa obeyed obediently, but was a little lost being separated from her master. Su Hao whispered a few words in her ear, making her immediately emotionally active. Let's go. Su Hao nodded towards Long Jianchuan and the others, and the golden mecha rose into the air, breaking through the sound barrier and rushing to Gan Province. Gan Province. Dongta Village. This mountain forest was actually not the only East Pagoda village, but four villages with simple names. East Pagoda, West Pagoda and so on. However, since the invasion of the billions of demons, the four village heads had corresponded with each other, saying that they had to gather in order to be able to fight against it. Jia Jia Jia. Blood food. The devil soldier issued a grim laugh, but before it could finish, a cold aura flashed, and the head of the energy gun ran its head through, swaying from side to side and shattering on the spot. Within the mountain forest, a huge figure slowly walked out, trespassing in the East Tower village, kill without pardon. In the gloomy dense forest, a cavalry slowly appeared from it, grayish dark colored mecha lower body extended armor parts, combined into a mechanical warhorse, strong and huge body type to give a sense of visual impact. Walking out of that kind of active armor piece wriggling, more a kind of inexplicable sense of technology, horse pockets on both sides of the placement of melee weapons and long range weapons, coming out from the other side were not only cavalry, but bull riders, the black bulls wore mechanical armor, the gas spewed out when they gulped and their breath smelled of sulfur, riding on their backs were light red mechs, bare upper body armor, while the lower half of their bodies were wrapped in rags, holding twin swords, coldly staring straight at the demon soldiers and would directly strike at the drop of a hat. Kill. Bring the village together. The mechanical cavalry and bull cavalry shouted in unison, charging out ferociously. The demon soldiers roared lowly, and likewise killed out fiercely. The killing between the two sides was exceptionally intense. Even if the massive attack of the demon race came to an end, there would still be demon gates appearing, invading every corner of the globe. The Wu clan from the East Tower village was heading to the gathering place under the leadership of the clan leader Wu Gong. As for what exactly was going to happen behind them, they would wait for the meeting. Mom, I'm hungry. Baby bear with me more. Maybe there will be food in other villages. Matriarch, is there any more food stored? Give me a bite. Shut up and hurry up. Even if there is, the children will eat first. The mechanical cavalry bull riders escorting the women and children right in the center were also whispering. They hadn't eaten for a day. And after multiple battles, they had long been starving. Soon, the four villages finally met up. Most of the mechs stained with blood and flesh. Old Wu, how is your food? The demons came and directly burned down the entire East Tower village's granary with a single fire. What about the Zheng family? The same, now the children are starving. Worried. What about the Wang family? There's nothing to say. They're starving. Ask the Wei family. Ask my ass. We drank water all the way here. After the four villages exchanged information, there was complete silence, with no food at all. The only way to go at the moment was to leave the mountain village and head towards the towns, hoping to be rescued. We fetched the water, drink more and get ready to leave. The young and strong mechs brought the water. The thousands of people in the four villages had no choice but to drink their fill. Once a person experienced a fasting situation, they could survive for about 14-30 days if they only drank water, also taking into account personal factor reasons. But if there is a water and food break, then shock will occur in about 3 days, followed by death. Besides, Adults can survive, but not children. So now the people in the village were particularly anxious. And if they couldn't, they would gnaw on the leaves, vomit. Suddenly, a child who just drank water for less than half an hour, lying on his mother's lap, vomiting occurred. Immediately afterward, other children also vomited, accompanied by a high fever. No good. There is something wrong with the water. Patriarch Wukong's expression changed in shock. It was fine before, but now there's a problem. These beasts of the demon race did this. Fuck. The others cursed even more angrily. Those mothers or fathers holding their children were on the verge of crying. Quickly, quickly, hurry out, go to the town where there is a doctor. The patriarchs made a snap decision. Although they also felt some discomfort in their bellies, they were able to endure it. 
The four tower villages in the southeast, northwest, and north were like migrations, traveling through the mountains and forests. A tall old tree in the mountains, with a vague and twisted outline at the top, suddenly had a face emerge, revealing an evil smile. I will never forget the taste of despair. It is so delicious. The phantom demon general loved to watch others despair and kill each other, devouring the scent of despair to please himself. Obstruct them. The phantom shadow demon general smile was too bizarre. The corners of his mouth rose upwards presenting a right angle of 90 degrees. At that moment, a fight immediately broke out within the mountain forest, as well as the roar of the mechs. Time and time again, the obstruction slowed down the progress of the four villages all of a sudden. The children's high fever wouldn't go away, and as they passed out in their parents' arms, their consciousness was beginning to blur. Mommy, I think I see grandpa. A little girl had yellow water dripping from the corner of her mouth and her tone was weak. This mother was instantly anxious. Youngest child, look at mommy, don't fall asleep. Abba, a small boy murmured indistinctly in his father's arms. That father hurriedly put his ear to the past. Debeo you say, daddy listens. Mommy, mommy said she doesn't want to go. She wants to die for me. The little boy mumbled. The father's eyes were red. His wife was killed by the demon soldiers not long ago, and even the body was dragged away. The hearts of the people around him broke when they heard it. Kill, kill out for me. We old things can die, but not these children. The four village elders filled their pupils with blood and charged out with their mechs. They had already lived for 50 to 60 years, and the children were not even considered youthful. They absolutely could not die here. But as they resisted more strongly, the frequency of the demon soldiers appeared higher, and all of a sudden the casualty rate skyrocketed. Gradually, they felt a sense of powerlessness, until finally it was despair. There was no way to escape. It was like a big net covering them, as if they were trapped. How many young and strong mechs in the village were tired and constantly gasping for breath, coupled with the fact that the water source was undrinkable and there wasn't even any food? They began to experience dizziness and lightheadedness. Suddenly, a part of them stiffly turned their heads, staring their eyes straight at the children being held in the arms of those parents, their throats sliding up and down. Village chief, you've heard of the easy child. One of the mechs from Wang village stood up and said sorrowfully, the pupils of the Wang village's Wang clan chief contracted, followed by a furious rebuke. I've never heard of it, and put your mind away. The others even raised their heads and looked at the Wang clan member who made the shocking declaration. Easy son? Crazy. That Wang Gong who proposed to feed his son in exchange for food had long been starving with a belly full of fire, and sneered, we're about to die anyway, we might as well make us whole. In this chaotic world, surviving is king, their deaths in exchange for our lives. Isn't that right? Brothers, do it. Wang Gong roared, at once. A portion of the people stood up and went to snatch the children in the arms of those parents. Wang Gong, Zhang Pei, Wu Huan, Wei Xian have you all gone crazy? Stop pretending. I know you guys are hungry. You can live if you eat them. Why don't you eat them? There was already an external danger from the demon race, but now there is even more internal instability. Organic armor masters directly made a move to snatch the children. A father was beaten and bloodied. Hard to hold the child and not let go. Unbridled. It doesn't matter if we... The patriarchs, speak anymore. The four matriarchs of Wukong were green in the face, trembling with anger. As the end times descended, the meanness, darkness, and filth of human nature were infinitely amplified at this moment. Bang. Suddenly, the sound of a sound barrier blasting resounded high in the sky. Immediately after, a golden mecha landed in the mountains and forests, shocking the four villages that were in the midst of a big fight. Are you people from the East Tower village? The people who were still arguing and fighting stopped their hands and looked at the golden mecha. Excitement surfaced in Wu Gong's eyes. Is it the alliance that came to save us? Yes, yes, yes. They are East Tower Village. I am West Tower Village. The other three matriarchs also responded in a hurry. Su Hao looked at the situation in front of him. Especially the children's physical condition was dropping very badly. Their lives were in danger at any time. He also noticed at the same time that a part of the villagers' mechs were snatching the child. And their eyes became indifferent. Was this situation normal? Normal, but not normal either. The easy child in disaster had already appeared long ago in the ancient times of China. Moreover, during the years he stayed in the intelligence department, Su Hao saw many things recorded down, and felt creepy and cold at the back of his head. The last life was not like the present with Su Hao as the Yi soul, lining. On the contrary, the war situation was extremely tragic. If it wasn't for other civilizations coming to aid in the middle, Blue Star might have been even more miserable. However, Su Hao overheard that it was not a civilization that came at that time, but two, and both made Blue Star pay a huge price before they were willing to help. This was also one of the reasons that led to Hua Xia's quick route in the face of the bug invasion. 
Again, going back to the situation after the invasion of the billions of demons, at that time, there was a shortage of food, and the land had suffered severe nutrient loss, and there were literally people eating people everywhere, and quite a lot of it, even, in order to live. There was a period of time when there was human trafficking as food. It wasn't until the Chinese Mecca Alliance took control of everything that these were slowly eliminated. Those years were unbearable. I have some food here, as well as medicine. Su Hao spoke softly before taking out items from the spatial wormhole. Many thanks, my lord. Thank you. Thank you so much. It was all just some compressed cookies as well as water. But to them, it was agar and delicious food. The children's temperatures were also slowly dropping due to the medication. Many thanks for the food, my lord. Wang Gong was also anxious to come and collect the food, but as soon as he approached the past, he felt a terrible sense of oppression. Su Hao looked at him coldly. All of you, all of you are not qualified to eat. Roll to the side and stay there. Upon hearing that there was no food for them, Wang Gong and the others were instantly hostile and were about to grab it. Cursed horse, really think you're a god. They cursed. The words just came out of their mouths as the golden mecha fist soared as they swung blasting out angrily from a mechanical gate. Bang. Even the people with their armor were blown away in one punch. The people who were just grabbing the child. None of them survived. All of them died cleanly. When Wu Guan and the others saw this, they were first shocked. Then they nodded heavily. Deserved. I never kill people. I only kill animals. Su Hao flung his mechanical hand and snorted. For Wang Gong and their group of beasts, no amount of killing was too much. Devour. Cortical armor. E-grade independent crystal can cover the mech with a layer of cortical armor, reducing the damage from heavy weapons. Flash, D-rank independent crystal, the mech's head can emit a light that stuns enemies. Taming, D-grade independent crystal, can calm the agitation of normal animals. Taming, D-grade independent crystal, can calm the agitation of normal animals. Lightning lightning pattern, C-grade independent crystal, consumes 200 energy value, can briefly increase speed. Animal tattoo shield, C-grade independent crystal, consumes 200 energy value coalesces into a shield. Chef, B-level independent crystal. Mecha cooks, injects energy value to cook, can quickly restore life value and energy value, slow down the fall of sand value. Optical camouflage, grade B independent crystal. The mech can blend into the surrounding scenery and objects, continuously deducting energy value, to the point of not being detected by others. Dozens of independent crystals were loaded up by Su Hao on the spot, and although most of them were not useful, there were still surprises. Optical camouflage was simply a weakened version of stealth, needing to rely on the terrain to hide themselves. It couldn't be said to be ribbed, but only useful. When Wu Gong and the others all filled their stomachs, the child's fever also subsided, and he was grateful to Su Hao. Kneeling down to Kowtow, Su Hao waved his hand, tell me about the situation. Wu Guan and the others explained everything that happened. The devils were destroying the granaries of the four villages with a purpose, polluting the water source and cutting off the food when they were about to move to the town hindering their slow progress and causing infighting to happen constantly and frequently. Sure enough, it's a demon general, Su Hao said in his heart. Although the intelligence department didn't describe the appearance of devil generals too much, some devil generals every move was recorded. Some devil generals liked to destroy the environment. Some were willing to watch humans kill each other, and some even tortured humans to please themselves. Demon generals were the psychologically twisted perverts of the demon race. My lord, I'm a level B awakening, pigeon's pupil. A youth who was just 18 years old chewed on a compressed cookie and spoke in a muffled voice. You can freely scale the mech's perspective far and near, and you can see up to 800 meters away. At that time, I saw a face floating in the sky, but it disappeared after blinking, and I thought I was hallucinating from hunger. I wonder if this intelligence is useful to you. Su Hao handed him a bottle of water. Very useful. Face floating in the sky? A magic general with stealth ability? He he. Stealth is just useful to me. Su Hao sneered in his heart. This was because he was not only going to hunt demon generals next, he was even going to violently kill demon marshals, and he wasn't even going to let go of the demon king. However, there was still one more part of this, and that was the other civilization stepping into Blue Star. He didn't count on letting the mechs of these two civilizations go back alive. Su Hao spoke to Wu Gong and the others in a low voice, and the latter's eyes changed slightly, but then they gritted their teeth and nodded. Let's go. After Su Hao finished speaking, he turned into a golden meteor breaking through the sound barrier and disappearing into the dark sky. The Lord just abandoned us. Then why did he come? Fuck. Rely on ourselves. These alliances are unreliable. The four villages cursed, and after packing up, they were ready to set off again. The eerie face floated on the trees in the distance once again. 
and the phantom demon general squinted his eyes as well, but was only relieved when he sensed that Suha was far away. Humans actually have this kind of terrifying existence, the spectral shadow demon general whispered. I'll have to inform the demon marshal afterward, but before that, I'll let you guys exude some more despair. He laughed coldly and continued to have the demon soldiers block the advance of the four villages, unbeknownst to him, on the mountain about one, two hundred meters or so away from the spectral shadow demon general. There was a phantom silhouette that swayed with the wind, and gradually a bow appeared. The great demon bow, specialized in getting it with casting acceleration rolls. Su Hao didn't go. He was just using the villagers to trick the phantom demon general out. Moreover, the reason why he didn't choose the ghost howling fission rifle was because the sniper rifle's blitz rate was the lowest among all sniper type weapons. Only 1%. Shame on the sniper rifle. Bow type weapons were different. High bludgeoning. High base damage. Silent. The only drawback was that it could only fire one shot at a time, and it had to store power. However, it didn't matter to Su Hao. He had self aim anyway. Release full auto headlock. Tactical eyepieces emerged from Zero's head armor, and the red collimator immediately and instantly locked onto the phantom demon general's head. Your head will find my arrow. The moment the bowstring was loosened, the arrow did not make any sound, but shot out like lightning. No matter how the spectral shadow demon general's face fluttered, the arrow was always able to swing with it and lock on completely. Suddenly, the spectral shadow demon general perceived a wave of inexplicable fear constantly eroding his heart and bizarrely twisted his head. Poof! The black arrow pierced through the spectral shadow demon general's head, and the terrifying force yanked his entire torso up, flying backwards towards the back. Bang! 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 A giant sky-high tree simply couldn't withstand it and was broken on the spot, whole dozens of them, turning into wood chips or floating leaves in the sky. There was a boom. A mountain peak in the distance was seen bursting apart in an instant, shooting off in all directions, like a thunderous explosion, echoing in this mountain forest. When the people in the four villages saw this scene, their jaws dropped. This was too terrifying. Vaguely, Suha was able to see a line of numbers floating up slowly from that mountain peak. Minus 524,555. 50 W plus damage from one arrow. Stealth plus headshot. With this stacked buff, no one would be able to top it. Suha glanced at the great demon bow and revealed a smile. Demon bow. Weapon type, bow. Trigger type, stored power. Attribute. Strike rate, 50%. Strike multiplier, 2, 0. Magazine capacity, 1. Ammo reserve, 72. Damage attenuation, no attenuation. Total damage, 500. Current slot crystals, basic shot. Rapid buildup. The demon bow belonged to the deadly weapon of sneak assassination. And with the headshot and stealth buff additions, the power of an arrow would definitely not be low. Not to mention a super perverted independent crystal fusion like Su Hao. At full power. He didn't even dare to imagine how terrifyingly powerful he could be. Let's hope you can give me some surprises. Su Hao smiled faintly and flew over. In the rolling rocks of the mountain peak, he found to the phantom shadow demon general who had already been killed by a headshot. An arrow exploded his head. And he didn't even have time to have any conflict with Su Hao. Desecration. Just as soon as he got close to the past, a crystal was sucked away by Su Hao. While the elevation of the spectral shadow demon general was being licked by the ghosts and monsters transformed into heresy for a secondary reward drop. When Su Hao checked the crystals he got, he first showed a satisfied look, and then his brows furrowed. Attachment crystal, hidden demon, level 0 slash level 3. Quality, alien demon, unique. Effect. 1. Void stealth, consume 1000 energy value, can make the mech enter stealth state, able to perform any attack without destroying the stealth state. Currently level 0, lasts for 20 seconds. Level 1, 30 seconds. Level 2, 40 seconds. Level 3, 60 seconds. 2 senseless light and shadow, any weapon held by the mech will enter the stealth state, regardless of volume. 3. Stealth kill, stealthy state and the enemy's unawareness of the situation, can cause 50% direct bludgeon bonus. Level 1, 60% bludgeon bonus. Level 2, 75% bludgeon bonus. Level 3, 100 bludgeon bonus. Evaluation, since I was a child, I have had a dream, that is, to get the ability to be invisible. As for what to do, we all know, perverted lick lips, but just when Su Hao was watching, hidden demon, a crystal of foreign demon quality, a line of strange text suddenly surfaced on the operation panel, which he immediately checked with, 10,000 words translation, embryo descends, devil emperor is born, all things are buried for it, invincible on the surface, invincible within, translated it was just such a strange piece of vocabulary that seemed to illustrate the condition of the demon emperor's embryo, and it wasn't complete. Su Hao frowned. In his memory, 
Blue Star hadn't actually faced the demon emperor embryo, or the embryo had been weakened by other civilizations and fetal death without hatching. So in this life, Su Hao wanted to try to see if he could get rid of the demon emperor embryo, and what kind of rewards he could give. Maybe it would be beyond imagination. Because of this, those two batches of other civilization mechs, he wanted to exterminate all of them, even if it meant offending other civilizations. Perhaps, getting crystals of other alien demonic qualities can see more messages. Su Hao thought in his heart. Once again, he went to hunt the demon generals. Global notification. Chinese mecha division, done, takes the lead in killing the spectral demon general. Thwarting billions of demons. The mechs belonging to China have increased their experience gain by 20%, and their attributes have increased by 50 points. The rest of the countries have increased their experience gain by 10% and their attributes by 20 points. Global demon raiders, 91%. In a flash, the world shook. The done that had happened miracles time and time again was firing again. When Su Hao himself heard it, he was actually a little bit embarrassed. It was also globally notified, as if the police uncle came to the class to praise him after doing a good deed. However, his reward was not globally known. Reward casting acceleration roll asterisk 5, perfect grade healing bottle asterisk 5, drop heavenly demon blade weapon drawing asterisk 1. Su Hao froze, his eyes gradually revealing a color of ecstasy. Misty grass, the drawing of the sky demon's blade, he couldn't help but shout out in his heart. Heavenly demon blade, this was a weapon that could be ranked in the top 20. It wasn't actually a traditional melee weapon, but rather a combination of both near and far. But more often than not, Mechs used it as a throwing object, throwing it towards the enemy and detonating it directly in the end. Ever seen a nuclear bomb thrown from hand to hand? This is. However, for the heavenly demon blade to be ranked in the top 20 it had to have a special crystal to add to it. Otherwise, with its panel, it would only be able to be ranked in the top 1000. That crystal was called the Black Gap Crystal and it was also called the weapon's independent crystal. The black gap crystal could instantly change a seemingly toy-level weapon into a hot, hot weapon. There were even people who specialized in this kind of resale work and made a fortune. I didn't expect it. The heavenly demon blade was actually desecrated from them. Su Hao looked at the corpse of the phantom demon general and shook his head. He casually destroyed the corpse of the spectral shadow demon general and rose up in the air, swept in the direction of the four villages. Wu Gong and the others also settled the demons in front of them. While waiting for his lord to return, I still have things to do. Escort you guys to the vicinity of the town. Go. Su Hao thundered. The four villages were pleasantly surprised and hurriedly followed behind. At least they didn't have to be scared. Leaving the big mountain, they walked along the road. Demons could be seen everywhere, but there were also mechs out for hunting. Soon, the mecha troops from the nearby town tried to enter the mountain out of fear, not having expected to encounter them here. Dakugumi, the leading eagle mech saw Su Hao and saluted hurriedly. Su Hao nodded slightly. These are the villagers of the four tower villages. Hurry up and arrange people for treatment and psychological counseling. Yes, don't worry Dokurakami. The mechs of the eagle mech didn't dare to be negligent. All the villagers were moved and kneeled down to Kaudao. This was a great act of kindness. However, when they looked up, Su Hao was already gone. Busy, commander in chief. Where did the burning mountain happen? Min province, western Fujian. Well, I'm going over. The hunt for the demon generals has not yet ended. Min province, western Min. If one were to come on a normal day, the environment was beautiful. The grass and trees were lush. The birds and flowers were fragrant. And it was a place that one must visit once a year when traveling. The landscape scenery, exactly as depicted in the poem, made people unable to help themselves and fall deeply into it. However, the current western Fujian is surrounded by mountains. The entire sky is even more by the light blue flame rendered demonic and gorgeous. But half the temperature is not. Instead, there is a kind of soul-cold feeling. The spread speed of the light blue flame with the naked eye, in fact, is not very fast, but it is also already devoured nearly 30 kilometers of the area, so that the local subunion is very desperate. This was because this light blue flame could not be extinguished at all, unlike the usual fiery flames, and it was a headache to touch, like a fire. Quickly, quickly plan out the isolation zone for digging and logging. As long as it doesn't touch other trees, it can definitely be stopped. Yes. The mecha troops of Minchi were struggling to dig, but while digging, they also needed to deal with the demon race from the dense forest of the Sea of Fire. What was the mission of the demon race? To stop them from digging out the quarantine zone. Battle after battle erupted at this moment, especially intense. Those who are hurting stand back. There were also armored units in the back that specialized in healing, constantly shouting. Their mechanical hands were seen clasping each other tightly, and a sacred and solemn golden light spread over their bodies. 
spiraling down to the traumatized mechs. Healing technique, there were also mechs holding books, the pages of which flipped rapidly, swirling with arcane colors and erupting with thick and heavy fluctuations, covering the mechs with a thick layer of clay shields, clay armor cover, well-organized combat, but it was only able to fend off the invasion of the demon race. Headmaster, the progress of the quarantine zone is too slow. Someone came back with a helpless expression. Principal He, who was originally the principal of a university in western Fujian, was temporarily appointed because of his high moral standing in hopes of extinguishing the fire. Principal He was even more headstrong. Once the isolation zone was formed, no matter how much the light blue flames burned, they couldn't ripple out, and the key was that the demon race came to interfere, and the process was greatly reduced. Boom. Abruptly, the void exploded, and one could even see the sound waves that shook away. The golden mech landed on the ground. Who's running things here? The iconic golden mecha, with chest armor and sun-like patterns and reactors, made Principal He and the other's eyes light up. Solitary God. Me. Principal He hurriedly replied. Dope God. Why have you come to Western Fujian? Came to get rid of some stuff. Su Hao swept a glance. Nothing looked familiar, but he also saw the beginnings of a quarantine zone. I'll help you guys out later. Then do the aftermath myself. Okay. Thank you Dokurakami. Principal He and the others were grateful. When they were ready to move, Su Hao asked a question. See any strange places inside this sea of fire? No. It's just this blue fire that keeps spreading out. Principal He thought about it and only shook his head. Su Hao nodded slightly. It seemed that he would have to look for it himself. The zero rose up into the air. Its head armor flashed with a reddish light, as if it was the sanctioned blade that fell from the sky, blasting down violently towards the location of the isolation zone. Rumble. The ground shook as the sky cracked and the ground shook, while thick white smoke vaporized. However, any demonic race that touched the eat solar flare, instantly went up in smoke, simply bearing it. In a flash, a deep and spacious gully was reflected into the eyes of many mechs, and they immediately revealed jaw-dropping expressions. Crap, is this fucking humanly possible? The Doctor God, I said who is it? So it's the Doctor God. The mechs looked at the departing figure with adoring gazes, admiring it to the extreme. After Su Hao casually messed with the isolation zone, he was holding the great demon Bao in his hand and swept into the sea of light blue flames, and was observing if there was anything strange. The light blue flame was weird, writhing like it had a soul, constantly eating away at the trees, seemingly refining the life essence in it and returning it to the main body. When Su Hao went to touch the light blue flame, his head had a very slight pinch state, not affecting the physical body and attaching spiritual damage. Abruptly, the sea of fire surged, like a monstrous wave, rushing up to the sky to cover Su Hao down. Su Hao floated in mid-air, coldly looking at the blue fire enveloping him. Trigger needle stabbing Jizo. Glazed armor. Trigger abnormal condition antibody. Dash 11111111111111. Plus 1 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 plus 1. As if it was stuck in a bug, the moment it dropped blood, it automatically returned blood and replenished the lost life value, reaching a strange balance. However, in Su Hao's eyes, he saw a burst of numbers that would go around floating up in the distance. Dash 5000 dash 4500 dash 3900 dash 4200. Without any half-hearted hesitation, he pulled open the great demon bow and shot towards that location. Bang! 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 A large tree collapsed down, and even the ground slid out a tens of meters long gully. A demon general lay in it, his body burning with blue light flames, and a number floated up above his head. Minus 71,888. However, he wasn't half afraid. Instead, he was staring dead at Su Hao who appeared. Cold Flame Demon General. Level, 30. Attributes, Strength 2000. Defense 3955. Speed 1894. Spirit 4000. Characteristics, Once a Sea of Fire is formed, all injuries sustained will be taken by the Sea of Fire. Comment, Is this the Do Chi Continent? Why do I see the ancient spirit cold fire? Is that you? Medicine Old Man. Su Hao was a bit surprised when he saw the characteristics. No wonder nothing happened after eating his arrow. Surprisingly, it could transfer damage. Human, I smell a familiar flavor on you. The cold flame demon general spoke sorrowfully. He was at least about 5 meters tall, wearing blue-white armor. His appearance was covered by blue flames, bald and with a pair of white eyes, which looked weird but could be felt staring at Su Hao to death. Su Hao laughed coldly, not planning to answer him at all. He picked up the big magic bow on his back, changed his left and right mechanical hands, took out the blade of contempt, and a huge black shadow also filled his back. Wearing a hood on his head, it was impossible to see his real face, but his withered and white bone hands gripped the giant scythe, and his windless and tattered black robes exuded a hint of desolation and death. Soul Splendor, 
the artifact soul of the blade of contempt appeared. I've wiped out this forest of yours. What qualifications do you still have to shift harm? Su Hao snorted. The cold flame demon general was just about to taunt, but he instantly froze in the next scene. Clang. Only a trembling sound echoed out. The cool death-like weapon soul waved its giant scythe. And the jungle trees in a circle of thousands of meters were cut off at the waist. The trees that floated up were chopped into pieces in an instant. The shock of power that came from the tremor further silenced the mets outside the isolation zone. The big brother started. Suhao swept and moved to completely decimate the sea of fire that was dozens of kilometers away. The god of death waved his scythe, which was supposed to harvest life, but it turned into cutting trees. The blade was brilliant and cold, and wherever it passed, any grass and trees were turned into powder, including the light blue flame attached to it. Because of the cold flame demon general's flame, as long as there was no carrier, it would be impossible to continue burning. Because of this, the cold flame demon general was instantly anxious. Human. Let's make a deal. He roared towards Su Hao's back. Su Hao didn't pause for a second when he heard this, and continued to let the contempt blade artifact soul wield the giant sickle. And one after another blue flame dense forest flew up into the sky. No time. Besides, your demon race has nothing worth trading with me. He said without looking back. The demon race. Cruel and despicable. And at the same time a race that didn't keep its word. Why bother with him? The cold flame demon general was able to sense that his power was decreasing drastically and was anxious. Don't you want to think about why we came and why we want to plunder the humans? To give the devil emperor embryo nutrition. As Su Hao spoke, he had already cleared out nearly 80% of the fire range. The cold flame demon general shuddered. How did you know that? Ha! Su Hao snorted. As for why he didn't ask to see the foreign devil quality crystals, he didn't think that was necessary. As long as the demon general killed enough, he could get the information from other foreign devil quality crystals. No time wasted. Just do it. Humans, the cold flame demon general touched the wall many times, revealing an angry face and reaching out towards Su Hao. Rumble, the blue light flames rose up to the sky, rotating like a roulette wheel, surrounding Su Hao. The constantly rotating blue light flames quickly gathered towards the center, erupting into a shocking wave of might. However, these were all mental injuries, but Su Hao directly ignored it. The blood dropped was not as fast as his own recovery, so he hurriedly resolved it and went to the capital to get the shackled body. Instead, the cold flame demon general was counter-injured, and he grabbed his head in pain and howled, looking at Su Hao with horrified eyes. What kind of monster is this? There was a boom. With the last chop of the god of death, the blue flame was completely extinguished. Su Hao slowly turned around, gazing at the cold flame demon general who ran out wildly, calling out the great demon Bao. Let's let you run a few hundred meters first. He muttered to himself, then mechanically pulled the bowstring full. The arrow flew out and locked onto the back of the cold flame demon general's head. Before the cold flame demon general even had time to react, an arrow pierced through his brain with such force that it yanked the body and stuck it in a mountain peak. The two major demon generals died the same way. Attachment crystal, blue flame fury. Quality, alien demon. Effect. 1. Fire devil's rage, consume 500 energy value. Trample on the ground. Spread out the blue flames can drop the enemy suspended in midair, causing 2000 fixed damage. At the same time, the mech will also enter the state of spontaneous combustion. But in the state of spontaneous combustion, the longer the persistent drop in blood is maintained, the fixed damage will gradually increase. The range is linked to the spirit of the mech artist. 2. Immortal Underworld Phoenix, once the mech is about to enter the state of death, it will be automatically triggered, instantly restoring all life values, energy values, shields, and eliminating all negative statuses at the same time. There is a 72-hour cooldown time. Comment, Blue Flame Rage? Is there a blue god of war? I love it. It's a bit interesting. Level less. And the second effect also allows for infinite resurrection. But there's a cooldown. Su Hao was surprised. It was worthy of being a foreign devil quality crystal with all sorts of strange effects. It really opened his eyes. Once this crystal appeared in the market, it would surely be a mad rush. Who wouldn't want to have a crystal effect that could revive infinitely? Of course, Su Hao wouldn't be that stupid. This kind of uniqueness crystal was either to be used by himself, to be kept in a box, or to be given to an important person. Sell it? What grade are you buying from me? The ghost was licking the corpse of the cold flame demon general, and immediately burst out rewards. Drop demon potion asterisk 2. Demon potion. Type, props, effect, drastically changes the appearance of the mech. Enhances all attributes by 300%. Lasts for 1 hour. Evaluation. Wilgong is just Wilgong. What's the name of this devil's potion? 300%. It's really worthy of a demon general's reward. Suhout sked and shook his head. 
The Son of the Sun's light sufficiency was only a 500% increase. After collecting the Demon General, he was suspended in midair, heading in the direction of the capital. The extreme drought demon was already castable, so if he brought it to leveling, it would definitely become a capable warrior. Principal he and the others saw the sound of a sound barrier blasting in the sky, and the doctor god was already far away, truly worthy of being the number one mecha war god of our China, doing what he says and leaving when he says he will. Thunderous, a pillar of Huaxia, take the doctor god as a role model. The level of worship of the Mech's Max, the Huaxia Mecha Alliance, inside the oversized warehouse, the resources of the entire alliance were stored for public use. Hu Ming, as the warehouse administrator, was also carefully controlled. Just a short while ago, he had just learned that his wife and child, who were far away in Yangchang, were fine, and he had finally put down his lifted heart. Thanks to the One God, thanks to the Alliance, Hu Ming clasped his hands together and respectfully bent towards the surroundings. Tu Ting. Soon after, there was a phone call. Hu Ming took a look and picked up to answer it. Hu Ming. I've heard about the shackled body in the Alliance warehouse. Hurry up and have someone send it over. On the other side of the phone, a frivolous voice came. Vaguely, there was also the sound of many girls giggling. When Hu Ming heard this, his face was ugly. Young Master Zhao, the Alliance has a rule that no matter if anyone exchanges items, they need points, and you are no exception. Cut the crap. Hurry up and send the items. Do you really take yourself as an individual? Zhao Mingxian was a bit irritated. Just what the hell is a broken administrator doing justice? Bring the stuff first. I'll see about giving the points later depending on the time. Hu Ming had a stern look on his face. The rule is to exchange it with points. Besides, this material has already been reserved by someone. Don't be so shameless. Who else can compare to our Zhao family? Even if a dime falls from the sky, it's still our Zhao families. You're nothing. Zhao Mingxian cursed profusely. Hu Ming was expressionless, but in his heart, he was also cursing. This Xiao Mingxian was the young master of the Zhao family, treating the strong with a nod and a bow, and treating those who were lower ranked than him and had a humble status. Then he was arrogant and domineering, with foul language and profanity, and even used his connections to suppress them. The reason why Hu Ming was related to him was that he had once stayed in a university. Is Hu Ming here? Suddenly, the warehouse door was pushed open, and a golden mecha walked in and inquired. Hu Ming looked at the doctor god and his expression immediately came alive with excitement. In, in, in. I'm here, he hurriedly nodded his head. Su Hao opened his mouth. I've come to get the shackled body. There, grass mud horse Hu Ming. Hurry up and give this young master a call back. He heard the voice coming from his cell phone, cursing, but it was also accompanied by the diving student as well as the girl's playfulness, and the crisp clanging sound when he pushed the cups, and he suddenly showed a cold light in his eyes. Hu Ming was embarrassed but didn't know how to explain, but the next second Su Hao took his cell phone. Shackled body send it immediately or this young master will have you sent to the front line, Zhao Mingxian threatened grimly, Su Hao laughed, really, it seems that you big families are still living too well, and you even dare to touch my things, who, Zhao Mingxian suddenly had a bad premonition, Doke. this word had a special magic all over the world, both powerful and terrifying, done, when Zhao Mingxian heard this word, he almost didn't throw his cell phone inside the swimming pool in fear, he had heard that Lin Hong had been kicked on the spot and admitted to the intensive care unit just because he had said a few more words in front of the doctor god, turning him into a vegetable and only able to live in bed from then on. Who would dare to offend such a powerful person who acted in an unpredictable style? Who did what he wanted and was not bound by any constraints? Probably only the alliance or the patriarchs of the three great families would dare. Soul god, I didn't know that the shackled body was yours. It's my fault for not having eyes. Zhao Mingxian instantly conceded and smiled apologetically. Feel free to take it. If there are any more commands, I will definitely follow them. He was absolutely unwilling to become the second Lin Hung. For this person, Zhao Mingxian, Su Hao naturally recognized him. Typical male child. Brainless, relying on his own father as well as the Zhao family's prestige. Besides the alliance, Lin family, and Yi family, there was really no one who dared to offend him. Moreover, during the time when Huaxia was frantically resisting the billions of demons, he was enjoying a happy life in the back accompanied by wine, meat, and beautiful women every day. Doing all this, even if it is not enough, the key is still in the back of the yin and yang, blowing to the morale of many people. This kind of person, one should screw him hard, listening to my orders right. The corner of Su Hao's mouth raised in a weird arc. Then I'll give you two choices. Zhao Mingxian hurriedly replied. You said you said. The shackled body. I can give it to you. Su Hao's eyes were eerily cold, but his voice was like a demon from hell. But the entire Zhao family must rush to the front line. 
from the age of 80 to 18, if one is missing, I'll kill one, it'll just be a waste of food anyway. Hearing these words, Zhao Mingxuan's face instantly paled, as if his blood had gone cold, he yelled into his cell phone, I'll choose the second, the second, the second choice, the shackled body you are not qualified to take, but you must send half of your Zhao family members to the front line for me, Su Hao sneered, Zhao Mingxuan's scalp went numb, and he seemed to understand that he was in trouble, half of the Zhao family members, then if all of them died, and the global copy ended, how could the Zhao family still resist the other two families, as the words came out, Zhao Mingxian couldn't wait to slap himself twice, staring viciously at his hooked jaw, this vermin, the reason why he wanted the shackled body was precisely because someone had contributed a mech drawing called Phantom Sable, it was no different from a real person after casting it, and even more enjoyable than a real person, after little head controlled big head, Zhao Mingxian wanted the shackled body, which caused such a scene, dope god, dope god, he still wanted to beg for forgiveness, but he realized that the opposite party had already hung up and couldn't help but roar in anger. Inside the warehouse, Su Hao also got the shackled bodies from Hu Ming's side, and still two of them, along with the finished mets of the black general, the grieving woman, and the other materials he had himself, so he didn't ask for them. Solitary god, thank you. Hu Ming was so excited that he directly fell to his knees. This kneeling was only after hearing about the doctor god's strong combat in Goat City, guarding countless people, his own wife and son among them. Su Hao immediately helped him up, don't be like this, in his last life, he had a pretty good relationship with Hu Ming, a true man who was loyal to the alliance and to Huaxia, however, when Hu Ming was at level 50, he offended Lin Yi and ended up dying of exhaustion alive on his way to paint a copy, as for why he was a true man, the reason was that Hu Ming often did good deeds, saving people who had committed suicide, rescuing teammates who had almost died many times in their duplicates, a truly good big brother and he even didn't want anything in return. However, Su Hao did not agree with this kind of move of doing good deeds without reward. Doing good deeds must be rewarded. Otherwise, who will do good deeds in the future? It must be greatly rewarded. For example, Hu Ming had once brought him to brush the perfect level core crystals, giving him a chance to grow. Brother Hu, you can shout at me if there's anything. Su Hao rarely showed a gentle look, and this core crystal load up. What are you doing? Dope God, just call me little Hu. Fold me. Hu Ming's heart pumped in fear, being addressed as brother by the number one mecha god of war in China as well as the strongest man in the world. Hu Ming was so scared, but the next time he saw the core crystals within the transaction box, he almost went into cardiac arrest. Core crystal, dragon slaying demon, epic, solitary god, I can't take this, what can I do? Hu Ming didn't dare to take it and was so anxious that he was about to cry. Su Hao smiled and said, I have a bunch of epic core crystals, and I don't intend to ask for them back when I give them away. Finally, he persuaded Hu Ming to put the crystals away, which made the latter's face turn red with excitement. Epic grade, there would definitely be some around the world, but there was definitely no ordinary person who had gotten one ah, talk sometime, you and I are not strangers. Su Hao was in a good mood, Hu Ming nodded repeatedly, soul god, are you leaving now, you think the Zhao family will be obedient? Su Hao sneered a bit grimly, if we don't make a big mess, these assholes won't do anything, after saying that, Zero left from the warehouse in big strides. Hu Ming looked at that broad back and froze out for a long time. Capital city. Sun city. Anyone who was able to stay in Sun city was either rich or noble. And even money could not necessarily buy a residence qualification here. Inside one of the villas, there were even warblers and swallows. Seemingly out of place in today's chaotic world. Zhao Mingxian was nervous, but was praying that the one god wouldn't really come. Outside the villa, there was even a regiment of mecha troops faithfully guarding the security of the place, the highest was at level 23, and the lowest was at level 20, and all of them were not bad in battle power, worthy of being our big brother, finding such an easy and lucrative job, that's for sure, big brother knows the big families, can he still not have a doorway, he he, with this lineup of ours, the demon race will have to kneel even if they come, there's no way to break in hard, the mecha troops exchanged within the channel, very relaxed, but the next second, the speed of sound stirred, Su Hao stood in front of the villa with Zero, his eyes cold, and walked forward. If you guys block me for a bit, I will directly kill all of you before going in. The ice cold voice made the Mech's present shudder. A few seconds ago, they were still bragging about who dared to break in hard, now Su Hao's entrance slapped their faces, and they didn't even dare to retort. Soul God, please come in. They all stepped aside, nodding their heads and harnessing their Mechs to make a bending and waving motion, like a welcoming doorman. Bang. With a loud bang. The villa's specially cast alloy door blasted away on the spot, 
crumbling the entire wall. The atmosphere that was still playful was instantly silent, and the men and women stared blankly at the doorway until the golden mecca stepped out of the smoke and the pupils contracted steeply, especially Zhao Mingxian, who nearly peed his pants in shock. Unique god, you have to give me time. I'll pack up and head to the front line. He was sweating coldly, but he revealed a smile that was worse than crying. Su Hao pointed to those men and women. All of them are sent to the area with the worst demonic disaster right now. Pull back if they die, and talk about it later if they survive. Everyone is out there fighting to the death and guarding the land of China. And you are here enjoying your happiness. I'd like to see who can actually save you guys out today. At this moment, he was truly enraged.